Welcome to the sun-drenched tropical paradise of Isle del Pino. We're so pleased to welcome you to our beautiful home. Come enjoy a natural wonderland to which we've added the world's finest resort facilities, a spectacular amusement park, and succulent seafood. Oh. All this and more await you on Isle del Pino. Come relax and let us refresh your body and spirit. Good afternoon, everybody. My name is Cameron. And I've got a GameCube and a capture card. So when you take GameCube plus capture card plus nostalgia of being a young boy again, playing video games in your parents' living room while your brothers watch you, or perhaps when you're watching the brothers, you get streaming video games. Duh. Specifically, Super Mario Sunshine. I love this game. I love it so much. And as soon as I remembered that my parents' house had a capture card, I was like, you know what? I gotta get this thing running. Speaking of capture cards, if I may offer an unsolicited review for the Roxio Capture HD. If you're playing on an Xbox 360, maybe a PlayStation 3 or something, I'm sure you're just fine. But if you were trying to get an old system like a GameCube, to work with Roxio in OBS, you should spend your money elsewhere. Don't get me wrong, I didn't pay money for this. Somebody else did, like, seven years ago. So the fact that I'm just I'm just using what I've got. So there will be issues no matter what. But, uh, God, it's taken me at least a couple days just to get this thing started. Just to get it running. There had I had to put in video delays and audio delays and converters and stuff. And honestly, I'm going to wind up spending 40 bucks on something on Amazon to make this easier for myself it's ridiculous anyway i can only i can only vamp on game capture cards for so long so i'm just gonna get started this is just a test file over here this is this is irrelevant we don't need it we don't need it we don't want it i just want to feel that nostalgia again every once in a while i get that urge just to play this game again and i'm like you know what this today today's the day you'll also notice that i am looking in a different direction well that's because this monitor actually Actually, I was going to say, it can't capture this, but yes, it can. I was going to say it can't capture it because I was using the component, but I don't have to do that. 
what you know what happened? i'll fix that another day who cares i go with it over here so i'll be looking in this direction for the stream oh no look at all the goo the goo is taking over Isle delfino what do we do what do we do about the goo spoiler alert that's bowser jr it's okay, this game has been out for, what, how many years now? I can explore whatever I want to. Well, this cutscene gets itself over with. How was your day? How have you, how have you done your day so far? I got up at 11 o'clock. Well I decided to sleep in on a Saturday, because I felt like I needed it. My poster, de oh, my poster session went wonderful yesterday. There was one lady who popped in and tried to grill us about sleep apnea and stuff like that, but alas, it went well. Mario, be careful! Got a bad feeling about this! Okie dokie. Hey there, princess. Hello, princess! A princess. Uh, hello, Goo. Hello, Goo. Ooh. I love this game so much. It's bringing me back so much nostalgia. Let me go get some Flood. Hi, Flood. What's up? But the po poster session went well. I think our reviews came in rather nicely. I haven't seen them yet. I turned in my literature review last week. That was fun. I've probably done well with that too. Scanning and classifying subject data. Subject identified as Mario, resident of the Mushroom Kingdom, data storage complete. I am Flood, a Flash liquidizer ultra dousing device. I hope to be of assistance. Flash something ultra dispersion device thing. I actually never knew what Flood stood for. I probably should have listened, but I did not. Oh, we know how to control. Do we know how to control? I know how to control. Oh, okay. I guess we're not skipping the tutorial then. That's fine then. And despite the fact that it's 1.30 in the afternoon, I don't think I'm awake enough, so I actually made myself some coffee this time in the French press. And I love coffee in the French press. It comes out a little less acidic, which is uh, good for me. Um, I think it tastes quite nice too. This is a regular coffee blend that I've got. Anytime I run out of coffee, I just take whatever grounds that I have and just throw them into the same Folgers container. And then we get coffee. A special Cameron with an X blend of God knows what. I don't know what's in it. Instructions complete. Proceed. We shall proceed as soon as I'm done pouring my coffee. Oh, that wasn't a full cup. The Keurig duped me. The Keurig duped me with how much coffee it was going to give me. Do I want to hear the explanation again? Nah, it's fine. We're good, we're good, we're good. Try washing off that M. I'll try washing off that M. Get in, get in, get that coin. Get that coin. I had mentioned before that there's an incredible amount of delay between what I'm seeing on my screen over here and what I see over here, and I think that's just because of Roxio attempting to encode things and whatnot, like, I would do, and it's just, there's no need for it. There's just, there's just no need. Anyway, once I spend that money months on a better capture card, I won't have to deal with this delay. What I'm seeing over here is at least, like, three or four seconds behind what you're actually seeing on the screen. So, I've got my audio synced up, though. But, um, yeah, that's, that's about it. I want this. I'm gonna get the goo. Uh oh. Big ol' goo! Big ol' goo! Piranha plant thing! This is just the easy one. I've always loved the colors in this game. Maybe, maybe it was this game in general that inspired my love for colors. I like colors. I think one of my favorite color schemes in this game is in the, um, what is it? It's in the hotel level, um, uh, Phantom Manta. And it's got, like, the blue, like, the aquamarine blue and the yellow, and it's just a incoming pun. It's an electrifying color combination. Woo! Get some shine spread. Number one of many. Now, my intent would be to do a full playthrough of this game. That'd be cool. But, uh, we shall see. I don't really know yet. It's, it's like 1.30 on a Saturday. I'm just gonna wing it. We're just gonna wing it. 
Everybody's so happy. And then, and then the bad boys come in and they're just like, Hey Mario, you asshole, why are you gooping up our whole town? And you're like, I'm not gooping up your whole town. What are you talking about? I'm not gooping up no town. Wait, Mr. Pianta people. I didn't goo up the town. What are you talking about? Just because I, do you not realize that there's a significant color difference between me and the guy who you've been seeing gooping up your town? What if it's possible? that piantas don't see the visible color spectrum what if they only see like just just bare levels of brightness or whatever or maybe 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 bowser jr's little cloak thing his magic paintbrush likes to emit a light in a visible range for the piantas that kind of looks like Mar I, I don't really know but like i certainly wouldn't get shadow mario mixed up with regular mario I mean, if I looked at myself in the mirror and I was just blue and goopy goo and metallic, I'd be like, that's, I mean, it looks like me, but like, it's not me. But maybe it's me in like some really awesome, like, morph suit. That's pretty cool. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> that's our Mario guy. You can tell, you can tell it's our Mario guy because he's got the M on the top of the head. Like, <laughs> you can tell, you can tell, you can tell. It's very, very easy to tell the difference. If he had, like, let's say, like, an L on the top of his head or something like that. Speaking of an L on the top of the head, I'm going to bring that down for later use. This Mario is very, very different from this, from this, uh, from this Lugie. From this loogie that I've got, it's my loogie hand puppet. This guy is an insensitive son of a bitch, so we don't take him out unless he absolutely deserves it. Isn't that right, loogie? Uh, still not respecting the wishes of animals. Uh, of course. It's just an animal. I love my Luigi hand puppet. I'll vamp more on that later. I love my Luigi hand puppet. I think I got him at like, who is it? There was like a ShopRite. Not, not ShopRite, not ShopRite. Uh, Toys R Us, I think, that was just going out of business. And so we went in and there was just a bunch of sales going on. I got my Frozen guitar there, like Frozen, like Disney's Frozen little play guitar. I got a Luigi hand puppet. Probably got something else. I'm not exactly sure what else it was. I found my Frozen guitar, by the way. I know I couldn't find it a couple weeks ago, but it was underneath my couch. It sounds like it's sort of kind of- it's definitely not in tune. The strings are made of plastic and it's difficult- I found it's difficult to tune a piece of plastic. Plastic reacts so much differently to thermal expansion than does metal, so it's just kind of like- and it's got a bit of a like twang sound to it. But I guess that's kind of what a guitar is known for. Do I want the explanation? No, that's fine. We don't need that. No, look, come on, Mario. You gotta clean up the town. You gotta go clean up all the goo and stuff. You got that. I don't know where you got that big host thing on your back from, but, like, you gotta take that and you gotta clean up the town. Okay, cool? Cool. All right, you gotta clean up the town. That's how we're gonna do it. That's how we're gonna do it. Is that clear? Delfino Plaza. Also, the fact that the goo is oftentimes, like, you know, in the shape of something. Like, that thing over there was a little bit of an octopus going on, and, you know, we all appreciate that. Hey there, sir, can I take this pineapple? I'm gonna take this pineapple. Thank you. Thank you. This is my friend Pineapple. Uh, his name's Gilbert. Gilbert the Pineapple. I actually did have a pineapple of my own one time. It was in my AP Bio class, and, um, what had happened was... We were doing a, uh, a class experiment on, or um, let's see, a lab on, I think, enzymes. Specifically, I think, bromelease and how it can break apart certain types of other molecules and stuff. I don't know, I'm very, I'm very vague on it. Anyway, what had happened was my teacher, my AP Bio teacher, uh, bought way too much, to, like, at least one too many pineapples. And so she's like, yeah, yeah, after the lab was over, I was like, you know, why do you still have one of those pineapples? I thought we were your last class of the day. And she's like, yeah, I mean, I, I bought, I thought I would need more. As it turns out, I did not need more of the pineapple. So I'm just going to go return this to the store, honestly, and get my money back. And I was like, doctor, can I buy the pineapple from you? I, I, got, I got eight bucks in my pocket. I, you know what? You can make a profit on this. I'm going to buy the pineapple from you. And she's like, I don't know if I can do this take money like that from my students for extortion but you want the pineapple i'll give you the pineapple here you go and i gave her the money like five bucks or something and uh i had a pineapple and i carried this pineapple around with me at school that day all around school and um well people were either not surprised that 
Cameron was carrying a pineapple, or was like, who's that kid who I don't know carrying a pineapple? Let's go get to the princess! Oh, where did I go? Oh. Oh, we went this way. Come on, get some water on you. Get some water on you. Yeah, little shadow boy. Ow, 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 not fair. Completely unfair. You shouldn't be allowed to use tools like that. Bye, bye. But I'm gonna, but I'm gonna do it anyway. He's heading for the square. Go get him. Or, or he's heading for the square. Go get him. Because that's a, that's a. Hey, hey, pal. Can I, can I help you? Can I help you, sir? Would you like to be a little cleaner? I'll be down here. Oh, you guys, you y'all seem a little dirty too. Want to be a little less dirty? Get that goo off you. I always thought, you know, young, crazy, crazy kid mind that the goo that was on them was actually like feces or something or chocolate. Probably just chocolate. No, it's just paint. It can be whatever you want it to be. Where'd he go? Where'd you go, buddy? Oh, pff, there you are. <laughs> there you are. <laughs> he laughs at me. You laugh at me, you little bitch! Don't you go and paint magical graffiti on statues and stuff like that? Oh, it's at least in the shape of the M. Hmm, he escaped into the graffiti. Shall we go after him? We shall go after him. As any good Mario would do, Bianco Hills to the windmill. I'm gonna fight a big old piranha thing, plant, whatever. Adjust this camera a little bit. There we go. That feels much better. The road to the big windmill in Bianco Hills. We are continuing. Here we go. I think after you get like, what is it, 50 shine sprites, you can come back to this guy and get sunglasses? Hey, I think you're in need of a pair of my special sunshades. Oh, well, then again, maybe you're not ready. You need to spend a bit more time here on Isle Delfino. Come on back when you think you're ready for a pair. See ya. Lucky for me, I don't need that Pianta's permission to wear my sunglasses. I can wear as much sunglasses as I want to. Because I, I have sunglasses. Anyway, I'm gonna put those sunglasses up. It actually makes it more convenient to see because I've got that light over there that's just shining into my eyes, slowly making me more and more blind. Hey, pal. Yeah, no, no thank you. You know what really sucks about the audio delay and video delay? In OBS and stuff like that with the stupid Roxio. I can't sing along to the music because then it's not in sync. Ugh. Oh, nope. Don't want that. That makes me sad. I'm gonna sing anyway. I'd say sorry, not sorry. Because I'm sorry. But also not sorry. Ba -ba. Oh, stop. <laughs> Send myself right into the goo. I need to clean up more of the. Oh, stop. It's fine, it's fine, it's fine. Everybody likes it. Everybody likes it. You like it, we like it. Don't hurt me. <laughs> well, you like it, we like it. It's a big old goo monster. Everybody's a fan. Alright, just gotta get it in the mouth. We've been here before. We know how to do this. We're all familiar. We're all familiar with how to shoot water into some evil goo being's mouth. We've all been there, right? We've all been there. I've been there. Have you been there? Not in real life, silly. In the Super Mario Brother universe. Can I have many different opportunities to just spurt your stuff everywhere? Water. That big ol' H2. Whoa there. Oh, where'd the coin come from? Coin? Coin? There's a coin that popped up somewhere. I don't need it. I want the shine sprite. Oh, woo! <laughs> You know, I just thought, I have bright yellow colored filament. I should totally print myself a shine sprite. That would be so cool. I know I can get like gold fil uh, filament too. That could be really, really nice looking. Would this, would the shine sprites be more appropriately gold or just a bright neon yellow? You know what? I could, I could do some work with that. That could be fun. A little shine sprite like this big fit in my hand. I could be like, bam, shine sprite when I got one. That could be fun. Anyway, time to go back inside. I'm still not done in Bianco Hills. I need to fight Big Boy. Big Boy PD Piranha. There's just so many aspects about this game that just, so it's, it's cute, it's fun, 
It's childly, it's nostalgic. So many wonderful things. The, all of the little riffs that we're hearing right now, even the Shine Sprite theme, just, it's in that part of my head that's like, oh yeah, this goo, this real good. And it makes me feel very wonderful. It's a, ni it's a nice feeling. It's a, it's like Nostalgia Saturdays. And, uh, maybe I'll do more of that. Now that I actually have access to be able to use this capture card, or literally anything, it doesn't even have to be this capture card, but I can play on the GameCube, I can play on the Wii. The Wii's not working right now, though. The Wii is outputting in black and white, and that's... Well, that's not stream quality. That's not stream quality at all, so I wouldn't subject anything to that. Only the highest premium quality content. Only premium quality content we showcase on this channel, on this Chanel. Or as premium in quality as we can get. It's not like top top quality, it's premium quality. And as you may not be aware, premium quality is about the second to lowest quality on our quality scale. It's like, it's like quality quality, premium quality, ultra quality, supreme quality, mega ultra supreme quality, and then, and then, I don't know. Jeff. Jeff will be at the top. Jeff is the top quality you can get on these. We're not even there yet. We got like seven levels here. We're only on premium quality content. That's only level two. Hey there, pal. What do you got? <laughs> Could you help me around with this big-headed creature up there? You're the only one we can ask to lend us a hand. I know it's a pain, but hey, you think you can handle it? Oh, that must be weird, because as I read the text on the screen, it appears almost like I'm saying it before it pops up over here. Well, we can all deal with that. We can, we can deal with that. Yes! First blue coin of the season. Oh, I want to get up there. Yes! Yes! No. I'll catch the next one, then. Beep. Vibe check. Check, check this windmill, bro. Yo, check out this windmill, bro. Nice. Ignore those scary, spiky tendrils. They're just... It's windmill time. <sighs> lovely. What a lovely vibe. Hello, PT! I want your sign sprite. Nope. Okay. Roar! How dare you take my sign sprite away from me? <laughs> Yeah. You're regretting screaming now, aren't you? You're in your fat body on top of this. I honestly, that the top of that hut is made out of, like, straw, so how is it cracking? It's crazy. That didn't make no sense. That didn't make no sense. Hello. Hello, world. Would you... You got, you got something to say? Got something to say, pal? No, no, no. No, no, no. No, I don't. Ah, uh, you want some water, don't you? You're thirsty, boy, huh? You're thirsty, thirsty, thirsty. He's thirsty, all right. Let me just, well, spit it right at him. He's like, come on, get it together, Petey. Getting yourself a messed up over a little bit of water. Slap space. Go. Oh, come on now. There we go. Sort of the sounds he makes too, like the um, uh, the sound when he's actually drinking the water, like that sounds. Like that just disturbed me as a child, and I mean to a certain degree, it still does. All right, that was the perfect amount of water. That's that, my friend. Interesting how he also turns to goo. You know what they say, from dust to dust, from goo to goo. That's just... That's just Super Mario everything for you, pal. From goo to goo. Dust to dust. And sometimes from dust to goo and then back to dust? Or from dust to goo and then forever goo? Shine Sprite. Yeah. That's another one! That's... Every, every five shine, shine sprites, I'll have uh, the Luigi hand puppet come out and give some words of wisdom for those who are insensitive bastards just like he is. Regular Luigi's just fine. I've never met the guy, but I'm sure he's wonderful. But the Luigi hand puppet, of which I have control over with my right or left hand, or potentially both, 
is an asshole. He has absolutely no empathy for any living creature. The Luigi hand puppet is a... Oof. Madman. The hillside cave secrets. I think one of my favorite parts about this game is all the, the the secret levels. The secret levels are just, I love those. As well as the theme that goes along with them. You know the one. You know, that's that. I'm gonna go after this little... Oh no! I don't wanna do that. I wanted to go after the big red M over there. Oh well, alas. I'm heading that way anyway, I gotta go up this windmill. Woo! I'm gonna wipe off this little, uh, little goo here. A little goo of the M. For a little blue coin! I'd like to say that I remember where all the blue coins are. I don't. I don't think I've ever 100% of the blue coins. Shine sprites? I don't know if I ever actually did that either. I don't know if I've ever actually 100%ed Super Mario Sunshine. I'd like to think that I did. But, uh, probably not. Oh, I'm in the water. That's okay. Mario can swim. Maybe a little, uh, a little bit of nozzle in. Oh, come on, you can do it. You can do it, Mario! Get up on top of the little thingy. Nope. Okie dokie. There, we can just do that instead. And oh my god, I go this way! Actually, are there any blue coins out in that direction? Free camera? Was there a way to free camera in this? Oh, that's how I go to the menu, the Z button. I'm actually using, I'm actually using, like, a GameCube controller. Because I'm actually playing on a GameCube. Some would say that's a... Quality. Some would say that is a, that the, the way to play is on the original system. I honestly didn't know whether or not I'd be able to get this uh, capture card thing to work, and if, it, and if I wasn't able to, I was going to revert to ROMs or um, attempt to get it on the Wii first. But Wii was the first uh, idea. That didn't work because black and white. Then the GameCube, which we got, and then the Roxio was causing troubles and stuff, but whatever. What the? Ooh, wow! I forgot that I don't have blood in these levels. I almost, almost messed myself up. Hello. Hello! Oh, did I just... Did I? Did I? Did I? Ah, I did it, I did it. I got messed up behind the cubes! The cubes have always been a source of frustration for those like me and for many others. These are not necessarily cubes over here, these are rectangles. And I did it again. Nobody said I was good at this game. I didn't say I was good at this game. I just said I'd like to play it. How many lives have I got left? Yeah, alright! That's what we're gonna do. It's gonna be Super Mario Sunshine, but only one life, always. Nah, but I could just... One of these, uh, one of these nails probably got a little, uh, one-up in there. There's the one-up nail! There's the nail with the one-up! How many ups? Only one. I do not want to be hit by that one. But I do want to... Woo! There we go. And then the stars. And a little, uh... No! <laughs> oh, dear. It's okay. That just means this last one's gonna be the one. I was feeling real confident for a while there, you know? Feeling, like, real confident in myself, being like... I'm the pro. I came back after all these years to play my game, my Super Mario Sunshine again, but alas, nope. Can I get more one-ups over here? Probably. Another one! See, I can just play this, I can do this forever. I can just play this game forever. And ever. And ever. And ever. And ever. And ever. Woo! Anything else noteworthy on this side of the... Nope. There we go. There we go. Jump on star. There we go. Be careful on star. Maybe wait till... There we go. Maybe get a little... Come on, get the... Yes. 
Get the up that is one. Get the sprite that is shine. Oh, you did it. Get the shine that is sprite, sprite that is shine, and coins that are blue, and continues that are save, and... Oh. Words. Words, words, words. My GameCube... My GameCube is actually over near where the bar setup would be. And it's currently sitting on a... It's currently sitting on a drawer. Very haphazardly. So if I pull on this GameCube controller too much... Uh, probably not very good for me. But I wouldn't. Newsflash! D-E-B-S alert! This just in, nobody cares. We're going back to Bianco Hills. Nobody cares about the news report. Deal with it. Ugh, I was waiting for someone to make me consume some more coffee. Hmm. Oh, that's good. That's good, good coffee. It's a little cool right about now, but... That's okay. It's still my coffee nonetheless. If I run out of coffee, I might have to drink the ground straight from the French press. <laughs> that would not be very pleasant. But we're not here for pleasant th Nobody came here for pleasantness. Nobody came here for things that were pleasant only for me to do. Clearly not. That's not the kind of show we run around here. Red coins! Coins that are red. Can you tell? The coins that are red. Because you, you couldn't already tell. Those other coins. Uh oh! Can I get myself up on that? Yeah. Go over here. I don't have the rocket nozzle yet. Unfortunate. Oh, hi there. Oh, it's a good thing I fell, or else I wouldn't have remembered that one was there. Another one. Another coin now. Graphics 10 out of 10. Yeah, I mean, it's a standard definition GameCube game that's been scaled up to HD, so... Not much... Not much can do about that one. That's what we gotta go with. I could just make the image smaller. But now that wouldn't be too cool. Technically, I feel, feel like... I actually tried to see if I could actually scale this up to HD for realsies. Because uh, I have a converter that goes from component to HDMI, and there's an option for 1080p. And I was like, oh, does that mean I can just... I can just do that thing? No, it uh, makes the screen look really weird, and then I can't even see it, so... It don't work that way. Whack. Whack. Open them all up. Yes! All of the coins! I need to get back up there. Oh, hey -o. Exactly what I was looking for. Oh, you're not fun. Nope, stop that. I'll bounce you. I'll bounce you. Bounce with me. Bounce on top of these enemies. It's Mario's thing. Murdering via the soles of his feet. Some would say that Mario's murderous intent is in his soul. Like the soul of his... We get it. We don't need to... I, I don't know how to this fun. We got it. We got it. This is one of my nozzles, is it that? Or is it really your nozzle? Or is it perhaps my nozzle, but I just don't know it yet. Hello, Windy Boy. Nope. Nope. Don't appreciate that very much. When I was a young lad, I did not know that you could do this. Something in me did not click that, oh yes, you can blow on the sails to make them do things that are sail-like. It just never clicked on me. I want to say that I was a nice and bright child, but that was not always the- Aw, man. Not always the case. Hey, Mario, if you could stop falling off that building, I'd really appreciate it. Hey, Cameron, if you could stop being such an asshole in the controls, I'd really appreciate that. Well, I see that we've got problems in both directions there, dear Mario. Dear Mario. I just want to get that through. Oh, there we go. That's all I... No, stop. There we go. I just wanted the coin. I just wanted the coin. That's what I really want. That's all I want. What I really, really want. I need some water. So let's, let's get some water. Mm. And there's also a loop on the other side. Can I go down? Let's go down. Coin! All about the coins around here. I like the coins. Come on, get out of the water. Get out of the- out of the- get out of the- water! There we go. 
What's up with main characters in video games? They're just having problem with problems with like fluids. They got problems with their fluids. There's all those coins I was looking for. That's exactly what we were looking for. Now we can go up here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Another blue coin. Don't mind if I do. Stop. Don't mind if I do all those blue coins. And there's a red coin over here. That's another one. And I gotta go over here. Red coins, red coins, what you gonna do? What you gonna do when I play Super Mario Sunshine and come after you? Oh, this is what a shine sprite's supposed to be. But where are those other red coins at? Hmm. I don't remember. Maybe there's some on the ground. Like I said, I wish I could say that I was just good at this game or remembered anything that was going on, but I don't. Maybe there's a coin inside of one of these enemies. If I continue to take out my murderous intent upon these small little young ones, then perhaps I'll find out. Nope. Open up, you flower things. The enemy, whatever is in. Hey, that's convenient. I'll just get another blue coin then. Sweet! We like that. I like that. Hey, lady! You know what these coins are? Until I've given you a good hurl, I don't feel like my days are started. <laughs> Yuck! Ow. Something about these, uh, piantas and wanting to hurl their fellow citizens, or rather their tourists, around. It just must be the culture. We don't question the culture around here. Now there's one over here. And there's probably, is there one inside of there? There might have been one in there. I do not remember. Oh, there's one right there. Oh, stop, you piece of air, I guess. You're just, you're just air. That's really all you are. Nah, that didn't work. I gotta get up a different way. I must get up a different way for the sun shines. And the coins. Consumption! Ah, tasty. I'll have very little coffee left by the time we're done with this. That's okay. I've been meaning for an excuse to buy more coffee from the store. Recently, I was describing before how my special blend is just a bunch of different coffee grounds that I've gotten from various different occasions, all kind of combined into a single container of bulgurs and mixed up and shaken around a little bit. It's got a nice smell to it. Honestly, it doesn't do well drip-wise, but the French press just tastes pretty good, honestly, in my opinion. It's mostly just a bunch of weird Starbucks blends. I'm not a big fan of Starbucks coffee, but now my actual ground bags of coffee are kind of all out. Honestly, I'd much rather have the, fresh, the freshly ground coffee, but um, you know, sometimes you just don't got the time for that. Depending on how much time I feel that I have in a day, it's either, <laughs> excuse me, just throw those grounds in a K-cup, let the Keurig do all the work, or scoop those grounds into a French press, and then, uh, I don't know, just, you know, put the Keurig hot water in there, let it sit for a little while, and then take it back up again. Um, or it's actually grinding up the coffee first and then doing either one of those steps. The maximum effort that I would put into a cup of coffee, I guess, nowadays would be ground up the beans, put them into the French press, Boil the water, like actually boil it on a stove as opposed to letting it from, from the Keurig, and then doing that thing. I've been wanting to experiment with cold brew, actually, but um, I just haven't gotten around to it. I don't have, like, I don't need coffee grounds that are specifically cold brew, but I just, I feel like I want to start with something that's nice and fresh. Like, I don't want to make cold brew, like, coffee from, like, Starbucks grounds. Like, ugh, this is, I don't like that. That just sounds good. That doesn't sound very nice. If I wanted cold brew coffee I, from Starbucks, I'd just walk down the street within two blocks to go get my Starbucks, but I really don't shop there. It's just not a place that I like to like to go. I can't sit inside anymore. They, they won't let people just hang around on the inside. It's unfortunate. People don't like it. People don't, they don't go into my store. You want to you wanna hang around? You can't do that here. Like, all right, then I'll just hang in my apartment then. I like it here. But I do like me some nice coffee. I like my coffee. I like my tea. I like my liquor. I like my everything. I like it. 
Uh oh! PD Piranha strikes back! What will we do? We'll just vibe for a bit, that's what we'll do. And we'll kill him again! I mean, I suppose... Mario's not really exercising his murderous intent at all. I mean, let's think about it. Let's consider it. Those goo boys? Those goo boys? They're just goo. The, the little fake flower people things? The little flower bulbs? They're just goo. PD Piranha? Just goo. And what draws the line between goo and a living creature? I'm not so sure. Do they even have free will? Or does Bowser Jr. reign ultimate control over all of his creation? Hmm. Or does Bowser have ultimate control because of his uh, parental and patronizing stance for his young son? Or, or perhaps Peach has ultimate control because Peach could be like, yo guys, can you like, hey Bowser, can you do me a hot favor and like, I don't know, try to cause some more mayhem again? And he'd just be like, oh, yeah, Princess, anything for you. And then Mario would be like, you're fucking kidding me. Why? I swear you do this to taunt me. Oh, there's a little blue thing up there. Will you, will you, will you hurl me? If I make you ungoo, will you hurl me up to where I need to be? Woo! Hurl me, baby! Whoo, you saved me, thanks a bundle! Oh, okay. I thought you'd hurl me. I wanted you to hurl me. I thought th surely that you'd throw me up. Oh, another uh, annoying thing. The camera is inverted, and I don't like that. It's very... I'm not used to that. Let's get all this goo out here so I have some time to... So I can get this PD Piranha when he deserves. What she deserves? What they deserve? I don't know. Petey, what's your pronouns? Okay, I'll ask again later when you're awake. For now, we'll just refer to them as Petey, the Petester. I know there's a way to. Ah, oh, there was a way. There is a way to like aim. Oh, there's a way to do that apparently. What's the way to aim? Ah, it's the Y button. There we go. Hey, Petey. Yeah. Aww. Can I have another one? Thanks, boys. Thanks, lads. What'd you job? Wake up, dipshit! Oh, I guess I can't do the thing. It seems to have no effect while it's moving. Oh, no! It has to hit the ground! Or water. Daddy Mario needs more Wawa. Daddy Mario needs to stop referring to himself as Daddy Mario. First and foremost. Get some more Wawa! Get that Wawa! Turn the volume down a little bit for myself. Big follows. Oh, you're asking the right person. Let me tell you how much I actually want big follows, Labingo. I want big follows so much that I'm going to type out a long and arduous message to tell you how much I actually want big follows. Oh, <laughs> whoops. I clicked the ban button by accident. Consume. Consume in respect for all those nasty, nasty bots. Be gone, be gone, be gone. Oh, whoops. Where are you? Where'd you go? Hey, get out from up there! Come on down to the ground, there, asshole! Are you laughing at yourself? Do you think this is funny? Whoops, that's funny. I forgot how to get him down from the ground. I guess I gotta maybe gotta scoot some water up into his mouth. I have to make him heavy enough from the fall. That's what I got. Petey, what's your pronouns, buddy? I'm confused down here. All right, well, until I get corrected, this is how it will be. Yeah! You're having a lot of- you're really having a good time up there, like, what, what are you- what are you doing? Like, just- Where you go? No! Hey! Hey! I want you over here! Go on, look out of here and then, uh, get some distance. Can you- could you perhaps allow yourself to get- I don't know. You want to run away? You want to run away. Honestly, you're just conserving yourself. I get it. 
Life finds a way. Life wants to find a way. Where are you? Are you over there now? There you are. Hey, buddy! Got a, got some present for you. Oh yeah. Oh, I didn't do it fast enough. Uh, I didn't gun do it to fast enough. I'll just knock you back down. Can I knock you back down? Hey, hey, buddy, 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 buddy. Now nah, you're too far. Away. I'll come a little closer then. I'll bring you down from that sky if it's the last thing I'll do. What are you doing? I hear you sending those cannonballs. Hey, get up. Oh, whoa! Okay, okay. Okie dokie, okie dokie. Can you open your mouth? Nope, stop. Don't want, don't like that. Open your mouth. Open your mouth. No, I want you to open your mouth. I said open your mouth. Open your mouth, I said. I said open your mouth. D no! We can get this over with quicker if you, you know, open your mouth. What are you... You want some water? You want water? I, I give you water. Why won't you open your... There you go. Oh, baby boy wants some water. There you go. That's what we like to see around here. Large mouths. Mouths that were meant for consuming. Consuming what, you may ask? I got coffee over here. Coffee and water. Coffee, 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 coffee. Honestly, you know what's on the ground right now? It, it's either feces, chocolate, or coffee pudding. I could be convinced either way. That or it's just goo, but you know. Honestly, I'm I'm open to interpretation. I'm open to uh, other other interpretation. Where are you? Oh, hey there, asshole! No, why are you going back up there? Ah, uh, there you go. That worked. Hey, all right. Now open your mouth. Open your mouth and keep it there. There we go. Thank you. Open up your gullets. Oh, I, I couldn't, I couldn't do yet. There we go. One more time. One more spritz. One more spritz of water. Uh, I'm gonna get up. Uh, I'm gonna get up over here. Cause I'm a Super Mario. Hey, what are you, what are you doing over there? Hey, hey, Val, Val, Ernie. Hey, down from there. Hey, hey, hey. I'm over here. Like that? Like that? Yes. Yes, sir. We got it. We got it. Nope, stop. Oh, you're whipping up a storm. Whipping up them tornadoes again. Water, 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 water. Oh, no. Oh, no, why would you do that? You sent me all the way over there, you asshole. I don't like that. No, not the... No. Open your mouth. Thank you. That was fun. That was fun and entertaining. Someone would say fun entertaining. I don't know. Where's my shine spray? I'm all gooey now. Mario needs to go take a shower. Bling. Me and my shine biddies. My shine sprites. My shine thoughts. Oh, we had six shine sprites. I didn't bring out the Luigi hand puppet for a little bit. Five shine sprites. Luigi, how do you feel about this? Why aren't you talking? All right, because you're a hand puppet. You can't talk. <laughs> Duh. Let's do another one! More Bianco Hills. Honestly, this is what I'd be doing on my Saturday anyway. Just hanging. The secret of the dirty lake. Because clean lakes don't have any secrets. So, if you have secrets, you're dirty. We gotta clean you up. Mario's gotta clean you up. 
Excuse me. Can I have my sunglasses now? I have sunglasses. Sunglasses, sunglasses, sunglasses. No, I don't make them sad. Come back when you're a little more experienced in the Isle of Delfino. Alright, dude. Huggy doggy. Whoop, here we go! You gotta get up on top of these old gay things over here. You're just like the orange ones, except you're blue! And if I come close, you just start clapping. How do you defend yourself? Vigorous and aggressive clapping. That's what I wind up doing. Anytime I see any flies over here, I just kind of start clapping in different directions, thinking that maybe if I clap in the right place, I'll be able to get it. Oh, I need a... I want that down there. But I need the rocket nozzle, which I don't currently have. Oh, actually, no, I see a little trapeze down there. I could probably use that. Let's do this. Bouncy, bouncy. Yep. Give me the coin. Bleep. There we go. I got another blue coin. What can I do with these, you may ask? More shines, Bryce. It's just more shines. More shines, more shines, more shines. Always shines. More shines all the time. Shines for you. Shines for your friends. Shines for your grandkids. Shines for your neighborhood. Watch. Shines for your baristas. Shines for your bartenders. Turbo Nod Module. Come on, Mario. You can make it. Just land on top of that log there. Yes. You got it. Just get that old, uh... Turbo. You got the turbo nozzle. Press and hold R to zoom. Bye bye. So long, big asshole. All right, let's do this shit again. I got my turbo module. Not that it was able to help me in any way, shape, or form, because I don't have my thing here, but it would have been cool. It would have been pretty cool. It would have been pretty cash money, you know what I'm, you know what I'm saying, Mario? You know what I'm saying, Mario? Uh-oh, uh-oh. Okay. I gotta do the bounces. Okay, or I can do that, too. I'll just kill myself. We can do that, too. There's always the possibility of just death by gravity, I guess. Death by gravity. What does that mean? Y you fall. What a nice and elegant way of saying that you just fell. Death by gravity. Yeah. That's nice. You got it, Mario. You you got. Nope. Apparently you don't. Come on. There. Nope. M M Mario. Mario. There we go. Nope. I'm not gonna let that happen. And do a little spinny. And then <gasps> things get a little more complicated. Ooh. Are you kidding me? Oh, that worked. <laughs> hey yo. And then we just walk across, all nice and clear. It's cool, it's cool, and then we go up. Just just don't get caught. Yep, it's just a lot of just a lot of spinning around. I got the light. We just like to spin. You just gotta pick which face to walk onto. That's really it. Just just walking around. Hey, we did it! But it don't end there. Oh no, it does not. There's still more. There's one over there. You're gonna flip. And then I'm gonna jump onto you. And then you're going to flip. And I'm going to jump onto you. And then you are going to flip. And I'm gonna jump onto you over here. You'll flip. I will jump. You flip. I will jump. There's definitely a better way of going about doing this, but I just don't want to do that right now. I'm in this scared. Oh no! I said I was scared! For good reason. That was a long fall there, Mario. Very long fall. That's okay. There's plenty of one-ups here. These were always my favorite levels because they were always the most challenging. That's my reason. That and the whole game is just colorful and I like all the colors. Whoops! Woo! Evasive maneuvers. Alright, Mario, you can do this. You can- you can- you- oh! 
I had faith in Mario. He let me down. I had faith in myself. I let myself down. Sad boy time. Oh, you're flipping. Oh, oh, you're flipping. Oh my god. Accept your failures. Learn from your failures. I've learned from my failures. What have I learned so far? Hmm. Maybe I should stop playing video games on Saturday. That must be the pattern. It has to be the pattern. There can't be any other pattern. Oop. Oh, what the? Okay, that was something that I wasn't expecting to happen. I forgot I could change the camera like that. Alrighty then. Wasn't expecting that one. Alright, Mario, can we just... We can have a very easy time jumping on this platform? Thank you. Bats. Bats. Okay, that, did, that attempt didn't work. It's like so... It's just long enough for you not to be able to jump directly onto it. I think I'm supposed to, like, bounce onto the wall. Yeah, that's probably how I'm supposed to. Yep. Exactly like that. Exactly what I said I should have done. And then just didn't do. There we go. And then just slide, slide on into the spot. You'll go, and then I will go, and then I will jump onto this cube, and we will go upwards, upwards, up cube, go! Thank you, cube. We appreciate the cubes. I appreciate it. Though, to be perfectly honest, I'd be more happy with like a tetrahedron or maybe a trapezoid that's been extended in one dimension to make it three dimensions, like on its uh, face plane. That'd be cool. I think that'd be really cool. But you don't see those every day. Trapezoidal prisms? Really don't see a lot of those. Not since the incident. We don't talk about the incident. I mentioned the incident, but as I had mentioned, we don't talk about it. Flippy! Flippy? Flippy! Flippy? Flippy! And then I should go back this way, because I am not at the right. Yes! Then you go back! There's probably an easier way of going about doing this, but no, not this time. That was close! But not close enough to stop the Super Mario! It's time to fix my posture, as my dearest has stated. And along with that posture, you know what we'll fix too? I'll fix my French press, because it's currently not... I don't know, how do I fix this? Maybe turn that a little bit, then down. I'm gonna put my coffee in the right location. There we go, put Luigi up. I don't know, where should Luigi go? You should go in the background, there we go. I've been adjusted properly. Let's continue. We have been adjusted perfectly. Everything as it should be. Let me just double check. Does it look straight? Yeah, it looks straight. Why am I wearing sunglasses? Cause we're at the beach, baby! Anyway. The light's bright. It's, it's Super Mario Sunshine. I got my- I've got my- my flamingo shirt! I've got my short sleeves! I've got my sunglasses! It's, it's very sad. I'm the one who's sad here. Shadow Mario on the loose. He's on a Lucy. That Lucy Goosey. That Lucy Goosey Shadow Mario. Hey, buddy. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. It's fine, buddy, buddy. Uh, it's fine. Buddy, fine. Buddy, fine. Stay where you stand. Nope, I could have done that a lot better. Where are you going? There we go. Go get him. Yes. Go. Go. Woo. Well, I'm happy to hear that, my dearest. I hope to see you back here again soon. Where, where are you? Are you on the ground? Here you go. Ah, oh, there you are. Hey, go get him. Hey, buddy, 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 Mario. Buddy, come here. Buddy, 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 buddy. Pal. Buddy, old pal. Come here. I just need to make you wet enough, and then you'll bow to me. Bow to me! Bow to me! Yeah, I'll remember this! Will you, though? Come on, give me, give me, give me the, give me the shot. I want to give me, give me the, give me the shot. Give me the shot. What the shot? Give me the shot. I got the shot. That's another one. See, this game's really easy. It's like super, super easy. Like it's so easy to make progress in this game. Obviously, yeah. I'm like so good at this game. I'm like, I'm like so good. Just kidding. I'm just as good as anybody else is. 
I'm just familiar with the GameCube controller. I prefer the GameCube controller. And it's time for celebration time. Let's go back and finish off Bianco Hills. If I if I ever actually learn how to play the guitar, I want to learn the Delfino Plaza theme. Red coins up the link. Red coins of the lake. Bum, ba, bum, 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 bum. Can I have a sunglasses net? You know what? I'm not even gonna bother asking. I already know the answer. It's gonna be a big fat all. You gotta know the island better. Like, fine. Yeah. Fine then, fine. We don't. I don't get it then. Nobody gets it from me. Oh well. I need to go to the lake. I must go to the lake. Hey, what you doing up there? Oh, you look all dirty. Can I help you with that? Can I help you with your dirty? Be undirty. I clean thee. Uh -huh. Oh, you saved me. Thanks a bottle. You're welcome. Thank you. Thank you for your patronage. I appreciate it. Where the coin's at? I don't know where the coin's at. Look, you can see Rico Harbor down there. That's the next stage. There was another- uh, so many things about this game that I absolutely love. Uh, you can see pretty much all parts of the game from different parts. Like, there's uh, the park. There's Rico Harbor from over here. Uh, I can't think of anyone anything else you can see from this particular level, but it's wonderful. I love it. Hey, I'm gonna gain access to the rocket nozzle. Hey, are you crazy too? What if I bounce? Oh, okay. Well, you can't hit me twice. Boom coin! Boom coin. Give me the rocket nozzle! You got the rocket nozzle! Power up with the R button and blast off! Cool. Press and hold the button. Whoa, that was not supposed to happen. But alas, here we are. Can I get on top of that thing? But nope, I'm falling into the water. <laughs> Alrighty then. That could have been like real cool. There we go. It uses a lot of water, but not really a lot of water. It's not like a lot, a lot of water. It's just like water, water, water. There's another red coin over there. Hey there, wind. Woo! I saw that thing. Grab that other red coin. Red coin, red coin. Aw, oh, listen to the song of the blue cactus things. Beautiful. I think. I'm not a connoisseur of things such as that, so I don't know if it's beautiful or if I'm just... If I'm just fooled. I'm not sure if I'm an accurate, like, uh, connoisseur of art. Yes, can I hang up there? Thank you. Okay. There we go! There we go! The sound thing's gonna start getting annoying for me because I know for uh, those little wind things are a lot easier dealt with when you can actually hear the sounds that they make before they come launch at you. Okay, that probably could have been avoided. It probably could have been avoided. It wasn't avoided for me because I'm just stupid, stupid. Stupid, stupid, silly. Oh, I want the coin. But I want the coin. I want the coin. Okay, give me coin. Uh, oh, jeez. Hi there. I don't want the... <laughs> I don't want the pain. I don't want the pain. Oh, stop. No, I don't want... Don't touch! Ah! He touched me. Oh, we're falling. To the ground. No, we're good. We're good. There's a red coin over there, I think, right? Is there a red coin down there? Oh, there's red coins over there. Yeah, I should probably go collect this. Let me out! Oh, there's a coin down there, too? No, it's just, it's hanging on top. Let me out of the water! I want to be out of the water! Thank you for letting me out of the water! Go with the coin! Coin, 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 And there's another one over there. May I have? May I have this dance, dear rocket knife? Dear coin? Oh, come on, don't. Don't. No! Don't touch! I was asking for you not to touch, and I can't believe you didn't respect my wishes. I asked you so nicely. Did I say please? Oh. I don't think I said please. I wasn't as nice as I thought I was. 
I'll be sure to have my, uh, be a little more congenial next time when asking for the lack of touch. Boop, 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 boop. Oh, excuse me. Coffee don't make a me do the burps. I want to be up over here. If I use these coins as a guide, I'll be able to make my way up to the top of the... Yes. Kind of like that. With these coins as my guide, I will fly high. Are there any free coins over here? Well, there's something. Alright, now we're up here. Let's see where the other coins are. Hopefully with enough time to avoid this little thing. That worked. I'm okay with that. Anybody in this little flower? You at- No! That's fine. I can bounce on you like that. Yay! <laughs> I did not mean for that to work, but somehow it did. Where are the other coins at? Did I collect all the coins over here? I think I did. I do not think that I did. Oh, there's a coin. Oh, crabs. That worked. Get that coin. Got another one. But the question now asks... The question now asks... The question to be asked now is, where's the other ones? There's one more coin. Oh, you suck. I don't know where it is. Hmm. I'm on my Wasser nozzle back. I don't believe there's any more up here. If I just jump at the right moment, I can avoid those very easily. Uh, what if I try down here? Maybe it's over in the trees. I probably missed the areas by the trees. Or there may be another one that I've forgotten about. Can't really forget, though, if I never really knew, so... Can't say I've always remembered. Coin. Coin, coin, coin. If, it, if this were in a higher definition, I'd have a better time trying to find where that last coin is. I see electric coming down from the air. I don't see anything spinning over there. I'm looking for spinning red objects. Spinning red objects. Spinning red objects. Perhaps if I go towards the spinning blue objects, I will be able to find a spinning red one. Along the way. I'll go for my hover nozzle and then I'll get that blue coin. And perhaps from that vantage point, I will be able to find the other coin. Maybe there's a coin other in the water. Hmm. Or maybe it's up here. It's coins of the windmill, I think this one was. Was it coins of the windmill? Red coins of the lake. It's the lakey. Das lake. Coins of the lake. Or maybe don't get rid of the big old rocket nozzle yet. There might be a coin in the back. Hey, how you doing over there, pal? It's just hanging. The lake's all nice and clean now, though. That's beautiful. That reminds me of my wonderful current home in Philadelphia. The Schuylkill River is every so often clean, every so often not so clean, ever, you know what? It's only ever one of three colors. It's like questionable, like a question, it's either ever a questionable blue, like a sludgy green, or like a chocolate factory brown. Like it's never anywhere in between. It's only ever one of those three colors. And uh, I remember at some point, they were saying like, oh, we're gonna have like a little bit of a race. We're gonna have, um, we're gonna have people swim in the Schuylkill River. And we're all like, if you swim in the Schuylkill River for a prolonged period of time, you'll probably come out with more appendages than you had when you went into it. I wouldn't trust being in that river. Oh, okay, where's this other red coin? I see a blue coin over there. If I don't get a better vantage point over here. Oh, I see a red coin right there. Nope, uh, is that red coin? Yeah, it's a red coin. Okay, it was just up on top. Alrighty then, well now that I'm up here, that's pretty cool. Uh, I wanna be... Hmm. I wanna get that blue coin first. Hi there! Death, you get a blue coin for me? Blue coin? Of course you do. Thank you! Bing. And let's go over... Somewhere over there... I wanna be up on top of this thing. Oh, Kidoki! Perfect! Ooh. I want to go, but that was not where I wanted to be with that, but I'm happy with it. Get that blue coin! And where was that other one? It was up on top of... There it is. Oh, because I hadn't been up here yet, so of course, how would I have been able to find it? 
Coin, coin, coin. There we go. It's inside with the Goomba. A little graffiti. It's not really graffiti. That's more like a decal, I guess. That's not much graffiti like. Can I make it? Can I make it? Can I make it? I did. Very happy with that. Getting a little cloudy outside. Actual outside. Not like outside, like currently outside in the game. That's not really what I'm going for here. It's not the idea of outside that I got. Yeah, yesterday was a beautiful day outside. Can I? I thought I could spray that for some reason. No. Awesome. Very nice. Another shine sprite. Get. Shine get. Shina has been gotten. We like. We like, we like, we like. And uh, I don't know if there's anything else to do in that area. Aside from more of the blue coins and whatnot. I think there's only eight stages in each level. But let's let's double check. I gotta check myself before I wind up, you know, wrecking myself. Which would be unfortunate. And, although probably entertaining. Nope, nothing else here. Oh, I don't, I don't want, I don't, I don't want. I don't want! Oh. We gotta do it anyway. I gotta click on at least one of them so I can quit my way out stage. Onwards to Rico Harbor. Rico Cho! Rico 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 Harbor! I am Rico! Rico, whatever his face was, from Hannah Montana. Not the first time I've mentioned Disney Channel on the show. Oh, I haven't unlocked the actual. Uh, no, I haven't unlocked the nozzles yet. I haven't unlocked the other special nozzles in Delfino Plaza. Not yet. Let's do it! Let's fight another goop monster! It's all about goop around here. You, want, you don't like the goop? We can't help you. We here love the goop. Which is why we're trying to clean it up. Natural. I was itching. Open your mouth! Thank you for opening your mouth. Can you do it again? We can do it again. We can do that, that thing where you open your mouth. Do that thing that I like. Open your mouth. Do that thing. Thank you for opening your mouth. But it's not over yet. We gotta do it again. You know, it makes it harder because now I have to do it twice. And everybody knows it's harder the second time. Because you don't got that beginner's luck. Gotcha. It's funny though too, because you only need to hit it with just a little bit of water, unlike Pity. Pity boy. Well, you have to fill all the way up. You gotta really fill their gullet with all that water, water, water. Whoa. My controller is vibrating. What do I do? Hey, I got some blue coins for y'all. Y'all, blue coins? Blue coins. Oh yeah! Oh, oh. oh yeah! Yeah, I suppose you're here for that. Mm -hmm. Oh, yes, very good. Well, that means I'll require ten blue coins from you. Hmm, I can exchange those for shot sprites. I'll give you one, okay? Would you like to? Yeah, really? You truly mean it? Well, I love these coins, and I hate these shine sprites. Get them off my property. Hey, we take them. No refunds. We got it. I don't know what else I need these coins for. I wonder what, like... If the people of Isle Delfino, like, will actually go around finding blue coins and they utilize the service over here. Otherwise, like, in canon of this universe, this guy just sits there just like, Do you got that? And everyone's just like, dude, nobody knows what you're talking about. We don't need, where are you even here? You're just paying for real estate over here, you're not making any money. Like, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh, oh, you bring up a really good point, but nope, still looking for that. And if you don't got that, I can't give it to you. And they just kind of sit there. And then finally, Mario comes around and he's just like, That? You mean these blue coins? And he's like, Yes, that's exactly what I've been looking for. I can't believe nobody else has gotten it. Like, you weirdo. Let's, uh, let's jump on in. Jump on inside. Also, something about the animation of Mario becoming, like, paint and then getting sucked inside is... It's, it's great. Very reminiscent of the Mario 64 days, where you, like, jump inside of the painting, except this time it's just paint. There's always been a thing between Mario and his paint. Or maybe not his paint, but the paint of others. I love Rico Harbor. This song has been, this theme has been stuck in my head for the past couple of days. Because ever since we brought back the GameCube, I was like, I really want to play. I want to play, I want to play, I want to play. But uh, I was like, don't play. Don't play until you get things working. And then you can play and record it at the same time for the world to be able to enjoy along with you. And that's what I was going for. 
Hello. Hey, I think you're in need of a pair of my special sunscreens, but you're not. You're not ready. So get the get the hell out of here. I just want these sunglasses. I want to buy it to get these sunglasses. You don't get the sunglasses. Boo hoo. Deal with it. Deal with it. This is Grandpa to flip to the gates. But I don't want to. You see, that's the thing. I don't want to, so I won't. Blue coin in the water. Well, I'm not currently near the water right now. I need to be up here. So, uh, no thank you. Woo! I'm gonna get up here and... Ah, oh, I love that. I always wondered to myself, when I was a young, young lad, very, very small, much smaller than I am now. I'm still a small individual, but not as small as I was back then. Anyway, small lad speak. Um, I always wondered, like, how much strength does Mario need to be able to, like, climb on these grates and stuff like that? And it wasn't only, it wasn't until after I had actually reached that, that beautiful age of Goobertaw, where all of a sudden my muscles gained the ability to support my upper body strength. Probably could have trained it, but, you know, one of the advantages of being a body that produces the hormone of testosterone. My body. No, I didn't want to fall! Oh my god! But then I always suddenly began the game to have the ability of, uh, like, uh, being able to, like, pull myself up on things. I can do a pull-up now. It makes, it makes me happy. I can do, like, five pull-ups now. I can do, like, a ton of pull-ups now. But since then, I've trained. I've trained. Because I was like, wow, now I can do this. I want to keep my muscles all nice and happy. Happy muscle. Happy life. All. You, you know what they say. And they obviously say that. I wanted to go up on this grade. Bring me all the way down and bring me all the way back up. Change my altitude, crane boy. Crane girl. Crane. Crane crane. Crane, crane, crane. Hello, blooper. Look, whoa, I want that blue coin. I want it. I need it. I need it, need it, need it. Yes. Whoa, okay. No, don't touch. Pretend that I'm not here. Pretend that there is not someone for you to touch. No, don't touch. Not until I'm done scooping the goo. Scooby the goo. Thank you for at least waiting for me to swipe the goo, but not collect the coin. It's very much appreciated. A little gooey. See, now this makes sense. Now, this isn't goo. This is ink. Because it comes from squeak. Also, uh, holla if this ever terrified you as you when you were younger, because it always terrified me as well. Now I'm not so scared anymore. I can handle it. <laughs> I can handle this. It's not as scary. Not scary anymore. Didn't scare me. Oh jeez. You got a you got a little something. Yeah, we're not, we're not something. Get that in a that also something about the fact of like being able to just rip this thing's tentacles off, like oh my god. Just just terrifying. Whoops! I want that. Give me. Gimme, 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 gimme. Can I pull your nose? I want to pull your nose. Give me your nose. I want to pull your nose. Smack! Now you're hangry. Maybe you were always hangry, but you couldn't eat before. Oops, I didn't, I didn't bounce on it. I needed to, needed to bounce on those tentacles, and I didn't bounce the tentacles. Bounce on the tentacles, bounce on the tentacles. Pull off your tentacles, pull off the tentacles. Go ahead and then hit me again. I dare you. I'll pull off one more tentacle. Or perhaps a third tentacle. How many tentacles do you want off? You can keep on hitting. If you keep on hitting, you'll lose all your tentacles. That way so I will have a not so hard time just pulling off your mouth again. And thwacking you into the distance. Well now you're sad. Uh-oh! Oh no! You don't like it when I pull in your mouth like that! That makes sense, honestly. Bye-bye. Bye-bye, Goopa Bloopa. We'll see you again in the next couple acts.
Da -da 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 -da. You know what's giving me the chuckles? The fact that I got myself all gussied up for some Super Mario Sunshine. I got my sunglasses, I got my short sleeves, I got my got my shorts on. You can see my leg there for a hot second. Very, very hairy. My apologies. And it's actually cold in my apartment. So I'm a little chilly. I got socks on though. They're my unicorn socks. I have a lot of unicorn stuff. I like my unicorn paraphernalia. Making me happy. Delfino Plaza. Let's go back to Eureka Harbor. The usual pl way that I wind up playing this game is I just go from one area to the next to the next to the next, trying to complete one after the other to try to get as many of them as possible. I just like doing that. Blooper Surfing Safari. Now this one's a tough one. This one I know causes a lot of people problem. I think the last time I had any exposure to Super Mario Sunshine was watching somebody play the, the blooper races, and they were they spent like an hour on it. Yeah. And then I thought to myself, like, I could do that better. I guess we're gonna put that to the test now. And I'm not gonna grab that bloop just yet. I'm gonna go get that blue coin that's currently at the bottom of the water. Because once I get on those bloop 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 bloop, then uh, I'm there. I'm there until I die. Down we go. Save and continue. And then come back up to the surface. I believe there's also a way, I think you can get shine sprites by um, actually uh, collecting 100 coins in each area, but um, no, I'm not gonna do that anymore. maybe later. Only if I confirm my suspicions. I'll have to confirm my suspicions first, because I feel, I feel in my bones, like, yeah, you get 100 coins, you get something for it. You gotta be, I don't exactly remember. I like the green one. Here we go. Oh, you know what? <coughs> Excuse me. Hold <coughs> my own spit for a second. Here. The one that they were having trouble on was the uh, red coins one. That's what they were having most trouble on. Not necessarily the races. I think it was somebody else I was watching that also. You know what? Everybody has trouble with the squids or whatever. It's either with the race part, which is this one, or the red coins. Wahoo! You want to go for a ride, bud? Go ahead and jump on a blooper you like best. Go on. Show me some super blooper surfing and win yourself a prize. Okay. You're very, very forward about that. Let's try the green one. This one's hard to control. I know there's like... I don't remember exactly how fast you need to get through this, but uh, I'm just gonna keep on doing it until I don't have to. Hello. Boxer. It's not incredibly difficult, though it can be frustrating, I admit. For, uh... You know what? I'm just gonna shut my mouth, because I'm gonna wind up jinxing myself. I'll say, like, this really isn't that bad. It's totally fine. It's totally fine. Then I'll be here for, like, an hour and then, yeah. Make me feel unhappy. Oh! Don't do it. I think I, I need to be faster than this. I need to do it in under... I don't remember how fast I need to do it. Did I do it? Oh, okay. I did it. I knew I had it in me. Of course I could do it. Of course I could. Shine, get... I'm not sure what it is about getting that on the first time. It's probably my beginner's luck, but that and I always remember picking the mint colored one. Out of all those colors there, I think mint is probably my favorite. I mean, it's green, but it's like more minty colored mint. Because, you know, you take your mint and you like dye things that are white with it. And that probably worked that way. My mint, my mint ice cream is always that mint colored green. Maybe it's, maybe it's just a mint green because like it's green, but it's more lighter. And so maybe that's associated with like that cold feeling you get when you get something that's real, real minty. The cage shines bright. Oh, I love this one. You just climb all the way up. It's great. See, it's in there. It's the shine sprite that's caged. It's so appropriately named. Like you couldn't come up with a better name than that. It's so appropriately named. I always have problems figuring out what I should name my videos after they're done. So I usually pick something random from it, or bits and pieces of stuff that was uh, from the video, and just be like, you know what? If anybody watches at that point, they'll know what I'm talking about. But if they popped in for like the first like two minutes, they'd be like, what the hell is this guy talking about? But you know what? That's okay. I'm okay with that. I'm totally okay with that. Very, very happy with that. Uh, let's get him up over there. What's up, sailor boys? Sailor boys inside there. 
We're just cleaning up the goo. That's why there's no goo in there, because the sailor boys probably cleaned it up. What nice sailor boys. Sailor lads. Just sailors. I always thought when I was younger that you would, that if I ground pounded hard enough, I'd be able to get through this grate. I don't know why I thought that. Let's be perfectly honest. No, I'm not gonna make it! Did, did I do it? Um, I cannot. I can't. Oh, am I? What am I? Uh, oh, there we are. I can't see. <laughs> there we go. If I just, if I just, little, 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 yeah. There we go. Make my way back on up to the top of the spout. There's a lot of blue coins. In here, so. No, no, no! I want to be on top. No! I wanted to be on top, on tippy tippy top, and I have fallen, and now I cannot get up. I mean, I can get up, but like, would I? My chair is just so damn comfy. Why would I want to get up? Next time I fall to the ground, or fall to the water, and I know I'm going to fall again to the water, I'm just going to refill up my water tank. There's also a surface over here that I can use to get myself some better coverage. Or I go up on top of there. Oh, hello. Okay, can, I, can I come back? Woo! No! Oh! If I go up for this blue coin, then I'll have a better time going for that other blue coin, which is a little bit below me in terms of altitude. Yeah. Got another one! So many coins, so little time. Nope, I didn't want to do that. Oh, I'm falling anyway. Oh, I told you! I told you I'd fall in the water, right? I tend to do that. I tend to do that often. Super Mario Sunshine Town. I apologize for the off sync scene. I have no control. I have no control. It's either it's in sync with my microphone or it's in sync with the video or the actual capture. It's like, is it, I don't know. I don't know. I blame Roxio. When I set up the device, they're like, oh, welcome to the Roxio family. I'm like, dude, no, stop, don't. I'm not your, I'm not your family. I'm not your cousin. No! Oh, that works. No, that didn't work it. I have a problem with uh, getting up like cage surfaces, as you can clearly tell. It's a problem with my, my runs in my um runs in my family. You know, not being able to climb up surfaces. Rather by um by sheer means of a lower upper body strength or the fact that I'm not technologically Enhanced like Mario is right now. You know, with that uh, F L U double D device. Nope, I, I don't want to get good. I, I would take that, but I don't. Maybe yeah, I can get on top of that. There we go, and maybe from here I can. Maybe flip myself upwards? Was that gonna work? Was that gonna work? That was not going to work. It doesn't really matter. Nothing really matters to Mario. Nothing really matters. This Mari bro killed me. He doesn't care about that kind of stuff. Yeah, we're just gonna go this way. Better, better off for me to go this way. Oh. Okay, can I? I want to get up on top of this thing here. Up on top of this little metal thing, then I'm going to jump this. No, not like that. Similar, similar, but not not like that. Can I? Yeah. Then I'm gonna do this. Then do this, and my way over. That worked. Nope. Oh, I see another blue coin over there. But that's easier to get than these ones. So. Oh, you got me, you son of a bitch! Oh well. Gonna have to start over again. Hey, now I can get that other blue coin. I think the sewer grates are probably not uh, blocked anymore. They're blocked during the previous level. The previous act. Where is it? It's over here, isn't it? In it? In it? Where's the. Oh, I don't see the grates. Oh, there it is. Well, that's where I want to be. That's where I want to be. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. 
Now we're underground. Now we're underground. Yes, we're underground. Yes, we're underground. You, you don't believe me? The boxes! Let's break the boxes first. Can't go that way. This is vibe right here. Oh, I feel that vibe. I love that. The Super Mario vibe! Can we get up? Can I get up on this wall? I can probably get up on it. Get up on it. Get up on it. Hello! A little scooch in the wall. Uh, I think I'm thinking here. But I can't tell. Yeah, I gotcha. More blue coins! That's what we like to do around here. So my question is like... If the blue coins are more better than the other one... Like, but why? Because if you think about it... Gold is like a precious metal. And those gold coins, I assume, are made of gold. But these blue ones, these red ones, which seem to be worth a little bit more, what are they made out of? Is it another special precious metal in the Mario, Super Mario Brothers universe? I know not. I would not know. Oh, now I can get that blue coin from over here. That's why I came up here. I forgot. Hello, sailor boy! Hey, it's just like in the movies, you know the scene? It's where something's in the manhole and they can't get it open. Correct. I, I guess. I mean, I, I haven't seen those movies in particular, but I, I wouldn't want to tell you that, you know, you're wrong or anything. But I've never seen those movies before. Yepers. Yepperinos, let's just get this blue coin and then get the hell away from this thing. Woo! You got me. There's something on top of here. But how far up on top? If I had the rocket nozzle, I'd have an easier time. Oh well. Can I make the distance? Can I go the distance? Yes, I can. And then I'll do the same trick I did before. Somewhere over here. I mean, let's try that again. Same trick as before, but this time better. Up here! No! No! Okay, that didn't work again. I usually, like I said before, I usually use the sound to determine where the hell that thing is, and I'm, just, I'm having a really hard time with that, because like, the sound's not in sync for me. Yeah! But that's okay, we'll keep on trying till we get to the top! I'm running out of water again. You know what? Let's let's just try not this way. Let's do this a different way. Let's do this instead. This feels a little more accessible for a Mario such as myself. I must get inside. That looks like the next place to get inside at. Water, water. But that's a little... I can use that. I can totally use that. If I don't fall. Oh, you know what? Uh, source of water. Are you gonna fling me? I don't want... Do not want to be flung right now. This is one of my nozzles, the Gad Science Ink Hover Nozzle. Alright. Weehee! Let's get up on top of there. What? Oh, what the? Oh, okay. Well, that didn't work the way I wanted it to. Yo. Yo, yo, I wanted it to work out, but it did not. Oh. But I can just do it that way, and it was actually a whole hell of a lot easier. All right, now we gotta go up. Any more blue coins around here? Not that I can tell. Yep, that was that was nice and helpful. There is a blue coin over there, but I cannot access that. Yet. Oh, you got me. But at least you hit me in the other direction that wasn't so sad for time. There we go. All right, well that wasn't that bad. Just a little bit of screaming and a whole hell of a lot of perseverance later, we got it. Ain't no problem. Shine! Shiny, 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 shiny. That's fun so far. That's a dozen shines right about there. We're going for that baker's dozen. Or is it. No, we're baker's dozen now. I looked at the wrong number. Yeah, there's still more goo over there. Maybe we should go take care of the goo. Or one of the secret levels. You know what I feel? I feel I should try to get one of these more frustrating levels out now versus waiting till later. 
So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna do that level right over here where the, where the boat gun come up. Uh, there should be a... Are the boats moving right now? Are the boats not moving yet? Oh, because we need more... We need more shiny chain. So I can't actually do that yet. Alright. I mean, can I? If I... If I just go up high enough, can I... Nope, I cannot. Alright. So that one will have to wait. Can we do some boxes? Is the box place open? I can never remember. Box place is open! Hey man, I wanna break your boxes! Break all the crates within 30 seconds to win a prize! You wanna try? Yeah, I do! Oh, that didn't work. Okay, well. This is just the easy one, so it's not that difficult. Okay, you're just, just not gonna let me do that, though, won't you? We'll just do it this way. Then. Fine! You know what? I can do it. I can do it. I can do it! I cannot do it! That's because I messed up the first time. Let's do it again. Let's do it again! You wanna break all my crates? Can I talk to you instead of- <laughs> You wanna break all my crates? I'll let you break all my crates! Yeah, you can break all my crates, little crate breaking piece of- piece of red meat. I wanted to do that a different way, but we're here, so... More crates to be broken! Aw, oh, I got messed up. That's okay. Hey, look, I broke all your crates. That was great. You're the best. I get a tank. Shiny, shiny sprite, sprite. Shining sprite, not shining Pepsi. Nice. Let's just just keep on going. Can I make? Can I break more crates? I break some more crates. Might as well get that out of the way. I gotta come all the way back here. I know there are more crates to break. Here's another thing I really like about this game that I just remembered about. I remember not playing through this game very far um, when I was younger. I didn't really get very far in it, and I'm not sure exactly why that was because my memory escapes me for that amount of time. But I remember while I was still in elementary school, and I know I was still in elementary school because there was a friend that I would talk to on the bus who I only knew in elementary school. And she was like, oh, you play Super Mario Sunshine too? Have you gotten to the Flood yet? And I was like, you mean like the device that I'm using? The Flood? And you're like, no, 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 no. You haven't gotten to the actual Flood when the entire town floods. I was like, what? This town floods? And that was something I didn't know about at the time. And I think that happens at 40 Shine Sprites. I think that's what happens. Yet again, another spoiler alert, I guess. But we've been here. This game has been out for so long, so. But I remember thinking like, oh my god, there's something that I haven't gotten to yet. I have to, I have to continue with this. And so it re-inspired me to go back and play the game once more. At the time, this was at least 10 years ago. Seems to have flown by. That, those memories are still so vivid to me. Like that conversation on the bus about like, you, you know, how we are doing in our video games. Back when I still actually talked about relevant video games with people. I don't really, nowadays I don't really buy like the, um, the really up and popular video games because I just... First of all, I don't have the hardware necessarily to run them. I think the most recent ga like, the game that I bought most recently that was, like, up and coming and everyone was talking about it was Cyberpunk, because I've been reading Cyberpunk series books for about a year now, and I'm really, really into it, and I really wanted to see how the game ad adaptation was. And don't get me wrong, I never got very far in the game. Uh, I barely got past the prologue. Uh, I plan on getting a little bit farther with it. So I never reached that point where, like, everyone's like, Oh my god, the game sucks! There's so many glitches! I'm like, I don't know. I just thought the aesthetic was really cool. Here comes a Shadow Mario taking my devices away from me again, you little snob. I'm gonna get that back from you. Once I get this shine spread, I'm gonna come back out and I got it all. It was all just a dream. It was all just a dream. Wood blocks. These blocks also always reminded me of these toys that I had to play with when I was younger. Uh, mostly the Lincoln Logs, probably. They reminded me of the Lincoln Logs. Although they were really nothing like Lincoln Logs, barely even similar, they reminded me of them because they were also logs. And this seems to be made of some type of wood with rubber coming out of it. And, uh, yeah, that's how it reminded me of that. It takes me back to those days of childhood. I got another thing, blah, blah, blah. I wanna get on that. Then I'm gonna climb up and... Hopefully get on to the next one. Is 
isn't not so bad. Not one of the difficult ones. Then again, it's only, what, this is episode three in this particular level? Or we can do shit like that and almost kill ourselves. <laughs> That's pretty cool, too. Sometimes I like to have the video games to remind me that, yes, your life is not immortal, and despite the fact that you'll come back if you have enough lives in the video game. Oh, did I? Really? I totally misgaged that. <laughs> I was like, yeah, I could jump on that, but it was so massively large, it was actually away, uh, farther away from me. This game does a really, really good job of kind of determining where you are in 3D space, because even if you can't rely on the shadow that's below your character, you can use your nozzle to, like a hover nozzle, to spray water, and it will land on the surface, where which is directly below you. Like, if you've ever played a game that doesn't give you, like in 3D, like a 3D game that doesn't give you shadows, then it's really hard to tell where you are in the air. Because there's no light source to give you a comparison of where the hell you're supposed to be landing, or where your projection upon the surface would be. This game does, does well with that. I mean, it's got shadows, so that's just totally necessary. But uh, it also has flood. It's got the flood. Get the flood of floodability. Because water. You know, flood because water. I think we, we've already gotten that. We've been here long enough that we get the message. Jump on this block. Get over here. Get myself the ones. Get myself the one mans. The one man's, the one, oh please, one man's, one man? One man to rule them all, one up to rule them all. Nope, that almost didn't work for me. Let's go all the way to the end over here first so I can get an accurate representation of where I want to be on this block. There we go. It is so incredibly large, very girthy, that I couldn't tell where I was. And then this next one is actually very small. Which almost threw me off as well. But alas, we've conquered. Yeah, it's almost three. It's only three o'clock, but it looks so dark outside because of how cloudy it is. I wonder if it's gonna rain today. I know not. I know not what the rain would be like. But alas, that's okay. I need some water. I'm starting to get that. I'm starting to get that feeling that the coffee is uh, activating my activating my special bodily ability, reflux. So. Feel the power of my stand, reflux, it just pukes on everything. And it's incredibly acidic. If you touch it, it'll burn your skin. That's my stand. My stand is reflux. And I summon my stand by burping, but a kind of burp that, like, you worry about, where you're like, that comes up and you're just like, oh, there was something else with it. That kind of burp. That's how I summon my stand. Goopa Boopa returns, and now he's at a higher altitude than before. Scary! But no, that's But terrifying. But also never that really that's right. Welcome to the party, sloppy slop Adam. We're happy to have you here. So happy, in fact, that you decided to join the party. Then in addition to these beautiful, beautiful sunglasses that I'm wearing, I'm gonna put on party hat. Because it's party time over here, baby. There we go. That'll go quite nicely. A big wholehearted welcome to you as we continue on with our beautiful Super Mario Sunshine journey. What was I doing again? Ah, yes. Big Squid Monster. That was it. How could I forget? How could I forget about Big Squid Monster? Get in here. Yes. I've always loved the vibe on the ground. I think the last game that I played that had, like, that underground vibe was in A Hat in Time. They kind of had a similar thing in the Yakuza Metro level and the DLC level. I don't know. It really brought me back to this game. It really brought me back to it. I also had a couple of friends that I was hanging out with the other day, and they were looking at my game. That didn't work. What the? Oh, all right. Well, that clearly that didn't work. And they were looking at my GameCube, and then they're like, "Yo, you ever? We should play like, we should play like a game on there or something, or on the Wii. Or like, we should play like Wii Sports or something." But my Wii, don't, I don't have enough controllers for my Wii, and it comes out all grayscale, which is sad boy time. But alas, we can play the GameCube. GameCube is in full color, which is nice. I think it has something to do with. The Wii is either not working because of the cables that I've got attached to it, which might be bad, or perhaps the Wii is actually on its last leg. And funny story about that Wii, it was not my Wii to begin with. Uh, I actually found it uh, previously. Actually, not previously. I'm really into technology. So much that I'm a bit of a scavenger when it comes to technology. 
Um, and so once upon a time, I would collect all the different electronics and whatnot, and when I had too much, I'd sort through them and see which ones I could recycle and whatnot. And we went to a little recycling plant back in my hometown, and we really don't do that anymore. Oh, I didn't want to do that. Okay, a little, a little harsh now. All right, all right, all right. Thank you. Can I have, can I have this? Thank you. Anyway, back in hometown, they don't really do this anymore. Uh, but we would have like these electronics recycling days, and so it was a really, really rainy day. And I went and I found a Nintendo Wii that looked like it was totally waterlogged. But that was okay. Uh, and I, I opened it up. And I was like, can I get this thing working? Because it would be really cool if I had my own Wii that I actually got working myself. And with a little bit of trial and error later, you have to get a very specific type of screwdriver for Nintendo devices. And it's a tri-wing screwdriver. Think of a regular Phillips head screwdriver that has four spokes. This one's got only three. And um, if you don't have one of those, you're going to have a hard time getting that, that thing open. Uh, anyway, got it open, um, cleaned it out, dried it out, got it to work. It was wonderful. It, it actually worked. Um, I don't remember whether at the time it was actually um, black and white or not, but um, when I tried opening up the other day, it was, uh, it was black and white. I need to clean you up. Gotta get you cleaned off. Gotta get you cleaned off, that big old noob dude. Can I, can I have? Can I, can I grab? Can I grab? Thank you. I want to grab. Whip off your tentacles. This will make some really good calamari later. We appreciate that. I appreciate that. I love calamari. Nice fried squid. In case y'all aren't familiar, that is a wonderful, wonderful thing. There's a restaurant that I went to over the weekend for Mother's Day, and they had this buffalo chicken calamari. Oh my goodness. I had no idea it could taste so good. But then again, I suppose anything fried and buffalo is going to taste absolutely wonderful. My turn. <laughs> my turn to hit you in the deep. Like a big old rubber band and just snap. Bye bye. Bye bye, Goopa Bloopa. Bye bye, Goopa Bloopa. Thanks for coming. Thanks for coming along and providing us a little bit of entertainment in the interim. We really appreciate that. That's what I appreciate about you. Oh, is that what you appreciate about me, Mario? Maybe. Yeah, we got another one. Let's party. That's cause for a party. That's cause for a beautiful, beautiful little celebration. Mario. Ah! That's my file. There's also a Mario -ob and a Mario. -k. But I'm on the Mario. Ah. This is the ASA file. I don't remember which memory card I'm on. I have a memory, ca memory card, and my fiance has a memory card, and I don't know exactly which one that I'm currently using. I suppose right now it's irrelevant. It doesn't really matter. It's currently irrelevant. I don't really care now. I can always just look at the thing. Another thing that's a little interesting, too, is every single time, or rather, every day that I start up this GameCube, it keeps yelling at me that the system settings are all off, and I know I've set them once already. I don't know if I just didn't save them or not, but it's possible I might need to open up the GameCube and replace the battery that's in there. Usually there's a little, little uh, tiny coin cell battery that you use to keep some of the memory cells alive. Okay. Memory, at least at this point in time, couldn't really keep their stuff for very long. So you had to put a little coin cell in there to make it work. Collect eight red coins before the timer runs out. Good luck! This is the hard one. Let's do it. We're going with mint. Mint's my, uh, mint's my fave. Mint is my fave. Goes a little slow, but that's okay. I get a little fine control. Let's see. Uh, I don't know where I need to go next. I see coin over here. So let's do coin over here. You got coin over here? Got coins over here. Coins over where? Coins over there. <laughs> Duh. Uh, where is that coin? That coin's over there. I want a little more distance, so I'm not going to follow that path. There we go. Much better control for me. Much better control for Cameron. And I have a minute and a half to do this. That's not too bad. I like to take things nice and slow. Slow your roll there. And I can bounce like this. Yeah, a little finer control there. Put those other coins up. Is there one in here? There's one in here. There's only one more left. Oh, it's right there in, in the middle. So I just need to go around. Let's go this way, this way, this way, this way. And then I need to collect the shine sprite without hitting anything. Don't hide. Oh, that was close. Usually I have... I, I see most people having a lot of trouble with stuff like this. So uh, I guess beginners... Beginners luck. Oh, God. Beginners luck. Oh, please. Oh, okay. Well, now I'm on this one. And this one's the fast one. I don't want to be on the fast one. Ah, I didn't want to be on the fast one. 
beginner's luck to actually get the coins, not beginner's luck to actually grab the shine sprite. But, uh... Oh, it takes me all the way back here? Oh, is that so? That's unfortunate. Maybe they realized that one was frustrating enough to make people be like, Fine! I'm going back to the hub! I'm going back to the hub! And I'm doing something else! But I will not give up. Perseverance is key. Red coins on the water. Red coins on the water. We got red coins on the water. Then we're gonna collect them with squids. Actually, I'm gonna go after that first red coin first. That... That red... That... That last red coin first. That's what I'm going to do. I'm gonna get that one first. Because I feel like that's the one that's gonna trip me up the most. We shall see, though. Slow and steady wins the race. Whoa, okay. That, I don't know what's going on there. That was interesting. I guess we're collecting these in reverse, then. Whoops. Not quite reverse. Can I have that? Thank you. I want it. Wants it and needs it. I don't need to bounce over that. I need to bounce to get this coin. Did I collect it? No, I did Oh, I'll just come back. <laughs> I continue to say things that I love about this game because there are a lot of things that I love about this game. Here's another one. The music. It's a bop. I love the music from this game. Not only is it extremely upbeat, it's got that, you know, that, that kind of tropical, and not necessarily tropical, but that, that beach vibe that I really, really appreciate. Plus, like, the whole the nostalgia, the nostalgia aspect of it certainly helps a bit. Um, there's another one that's right there, so I'm just going to wrap around so I don't whack anything. I must have a big old radius around here to do so. Collect that one, and then there's one more in the air. That should give me plenty of space to go back to the surface surface. Um, what I mean by surface is the actual platform of the Shine Spider Zone. I can wrap my ba way back around. That'll be wonderful. Give myself a big turn. And everything's normal again. Can we get it on try number two? If we can't get it on try number two, certainly we can get it on try number three, because you know what they say, third time is the charm. Here we go. Depending on what number I would have gotten that on, it was either going to be beginner's luck because it was the first time, um, uh, first is the worst, second is the best for the second time, or third time's the charm. And if it's anything after that, then I truly suck. Or maybe I don't. Maybe I'm so... Maybe I'm just, just like everybody else. Probably. Probably just like everybody else. Just a guy who likes playing his video games, and drinking his cocktails, and doing whatever it is that he does. A guy who likes to learn. A guy who likes to learn. I like to learn new things. What did I learn this week? Did I learn anything new this week? Um, I did learn something in my poster review session. Apparently, the kind of application that we're looking to do on the device that we have could probably also be accomplished using a microcontroller instead of what's called an FPGA, which is a programmable microchip that you know, usually works a lot faster than a computer does. A computer has a lot of delay because it has to process things, but if you have something that just does it right then and there, without thinking about it, then you don't have to, it can be a lot faster. That's really good for machine learning applications. And I learned that there are microcontrollers that are well fit for machine learning applications like that. Oh, uh, I have them written around over here. Not that anybody here is interested, but something might pop up eventually. The Max, he said the 78,000. I don't think it has that many zeros. I probably think it's the 7800 and the Xilinx VRSL. But they're controllers, they're computers. Therefore, they have to take all that processing time. They are clocked, meaning they have to wait for uh, a facilitator to say like, hey, it's your turn to do a thing. And then they will do it. They will do it after that. Uh, meanwhile, these other little FPGA things, they don't have to wait for a clock. They're, I mean, there are some clocked elements, but they don't have to be for all of it. Parts of them can be clocked, and some of them don't have to be clocked. Anyway, tech rant over. That's what, that's what I learned. That's what I learned this weekend. There are other microcontrollers out there, like Arduinos and stuff like that. Arduinos and Teensies and this, that, and the other thing. Yoshi's Fruit Adventure! We get to play with Yoshi! I didn't know Yoshi had a level over here. It's fitting, because there's a ton of water everywhere, and if Yoshi goes into the water, he dies! Which is sad for Yoshi, but, you know. Mario's used to the whole sacrificing of Yoshi thing. Just kind of this thing. Where's the Yoshter? Yosh? Yosh? Yoshi? Yoshi! Wait, how many shine sprites do I have? I have 18. Can I get my sunglasses now? Can we do this level in sunglasses? Please, sunglasses, man. Can I have my sunglasses? Sunglasses? Hey, I think you're in need of a pair of sunglasses, but you suck, so you're not gonna get them. Fine. You didn't have to be so rude about it. 
That's fine. Well, we're going, we don't need, oh, is the hyper nozzle down there? Wait a minute. Wait a minute, so the hyper nozzle is open down there, but not over here? All right, then. Not exactly sure why that's the case, but let's go with it. Let's collect that hyper nozzle. About turbo nozzle? Tur turbo. You got that turbo nozzle! Saving file. It's a big old fan. What is this? What does this do for me? What do I obtain with this? I'm not sure what kind of benefit I obtain with this. Does that unlock it over there too? Oh, okay, I just have to get it one place and then I get it anywhere else. Forgot about that. Yeah, I don't see what my benefit is here. Woo! Now I can get I can get some mad distance, I guess. Increase Mario's mad hops to a whole nother level. Where's the Yoshi boy? Where's Yosh? Yoshi! Can I come up here or are those boxes trapping me again? Oh! See Daisy! Would you like to jump, Mario? Jump, man! Jump! Come on! There's no, um... No rocket nozzle. Yosh? Yosh? Oh, I think I have to go up on top of those things. Yeah, yeah I, I recall now. Oh, see Daisy. I wish I had my hub. No, look at that. I was gonna say, I wish I had my hover nozzle. There we go. Da, 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 da. I think if I spray those birds, I get a blue coin. Those bluebirds, I mean. Bluebirds? Bluebirds, I get anything from that? Anything? If I spray those bluebirds? Uh, no, they're, they're not birds. Oh my god, they're butterflies. What is wrong with me? If I disperse the birds, give me your blue! No? Okay. Because they're the, the, the birds have a color scheme. They can be green, they can be yellow, they can be blue as well. And I know if you shoot down a blue bird, you can get a blue coin, naturally. Uh-oh! That didn't work. Upsy daisy Not gonna get it that way. I'm gonna go up on top of here, and I will dispense an egg. Whoopsie. Gotta go here. Banana. We've got banana. As would be said in the Katamari game, which I was playing on Friday. ba -na, na Actually, where is... Do I have to, like, unlock Yoshi first? Because I don't see Yoshi anywhere. I'm gonna gotta talk to you. Hey, buddy! Give me the Yosh! Leisure's a big part of life, my boy, but so is work. It's about time for me to head home in my private helicopter. As for you, you keep up the good work, you're a spunky one. Thanks, pal. Thanks for that, really. Where's the Yoshi? I don't know where Yoshi is. I'm... I don't know where Yoshi is. I forget, do I have to unlock Yoshi first before coming here? I don't remember. Yeah, I'm confused. I don't know where Yoshi is. I thought he was like right up on top of here. I think I have to unlock Yoshi first. Um, you know that's my that's my working hypothesis. So I'm going to exit out of here and continue onwards. I don't. I think I have to unlock Yoshi first in order to do this. And I haven't unlocked him yet in Isle Delfino in the plaza, so I don't think I can use him there. If not, whatever. I'll go back to it eventually. I'll write a note to myself. Write a note to myself. Don't forget Rico Harbor episode eight. Rico! Episode 8. Yosh. There we go. I'll wait on that. I'll wait on that one. I'll be nice. In the meantime, let's go to the beach. Let's go to the beach, beach. Let's go get away. Hey, hey, what you gonna say? That's it. That's all I know. I usually stop my singing abruptly. I wouldn't want to do bad lyrics or anything. Or perhaps I could totally bastardize the song and insert my own lyrics. Hey, buddy! Hey, buddy! You suck. I want my sunglasses. Deal with it. Oh, I forgot. There's a thing over here. I want to go in here. Super secret special. Super secret special. No, we're in the right now. Oh, there's nothing here except for a one-up. Wee! Ha ha! Here we go! I'm up here. Now I'm over here. Oh, you know what there also is? There's a secret level over there. So before I... Oh, let's clean up this mess first. And then, uh, we'll accomplish the secret level type over there. Hey ho, Millie View! How's the stream going? Things are going wonderful over here. Wonderful, wonderful indeed. 
I finally got my GameCube working, and I am very, very happy with it. So happy that I decided to utilize it. Decided to utilize it very, very much so. But now it's time to get rid of the goo. Oh, you hit me. You toads will come out eventually. I was going to play this on a Wii, which probably would have offered a better, like, resolution experience, but the Wii does not output in color right now, so making me sad. Not too sad, though. Just sad enough that I just won't use it. I think it's a problem with the cables. That's my working hypothesis, and I will slowly but surely work to rule that out or uh, confirm it. I have a spare set of cables that I plan on testing some other time this weekend, but I was just so excited to get this GameCube running. I had to. You know what makes me most uncomfortable about these bosses? The way that they throb when you hit them? I don't like that. Get some water? Yeah, let's uh, take care of these little Scooby Boys too. The goo balls! The little goose buds! I don't know what they call it. They look like little, um, little slime. I mean, they're slimes. Obviously, they're slimes, but little goose slimes. I'd rather you not. I'd rather you not explode your goo upon me. I don't like that. Oh, it's time to consume! One moment. Let me, let me take, let me take. There we go. Another nice, well-deserved sip of coffee for you. Ah, I like that. Oh, and now that the blinding challenge that was that little, uh, little goo monster is gone, I can take my sunglasses off. Now time to go to a better, uh, thing. This place is cool, but you know what's cooler? Pipes. Pipes are cool. Pipes are cool. So we're gonna go over to pipes. Can I make my way over there? I don't remember what this level is. As soon as I see it, I'm gonna recognize it. I don't remember what it was. Was there a need for Yoshi over here? No, there's a need for Yoshi over... I think there's another island. Is it... The... That island over there. I think there are two islands that actually have, like, Yoshi block on them. Or it's the... It's the gel. I'm gonna call it a gel. It's like that hurtful gel that only Yoshi can get rid of. This... I'm just gonna take a moment. One of my favorite and most relaxing tracks in this game occurs in these types of challenge levels, the secret levels. They're so, it's so common. Quick vibe check for a moment. That's so lovely. <laughs> I love this theme so much. Anyway, we continue onwards. Here we go, Mario. I think all I have to do is just make my way down, right? Oh, nice. Can I get another bounce out of that? I was not able to get another bounce out of that, but that's fine. I'll just go this way. Boop de doodles. Not too difficult at all. Another shine sprite. All right. Maybe I, maybe I should do that. Should I do that? Maybe I should start putting the sunshades down every single time I get close to the shine sprite. Like, ah, oh, it's blinding. <laughs> the lights. Nah, that's a little extra. We want to be just below extra around here. We don't want to be extra. We want to be like, I mean, we do want to be a little bit extra, but not like surplus extra. Oh, cool. Uh, the carnival is now open. It's time to go to the carnival. Or at least um, say hello to everybody over there. Maybe go talk to Bowser Jr. a little bit. <gasps> Bowser Jr.? I spoil that? No, we already knew. Everybody already knows. I don't remember how many shine sprites I need to unlock Yoshi, but that's uh, one of our goals. Oh, I can do that secret level too. Um, you know what? Before I take care of Bowser Jr., we're gonna do that secret level first. There's a little secret level underneath that little uh, breezeway, and it is also one of the most frustrating things. Um, let's see. On the, it, from what I can recall, the blooper surfing with the races, I think I saw the Game Grumps getting really frustrated with that, or more specifically Aaron of the Game Grumps, the Grump part of things. I think on the Red Coins part, I think I saw a fellow streamer having trouble with that one, and then I think everybody has trouble with this level. Also, the Game Grumps as well. They played this series like a while ago, I think. Not doing it because of them. But I did enjoy that playthrough. I very much did. Very much enjoyed that. And I enjoyed my own playthrough. This is probably the third time I've played through this game. I don't think I've ever actually 100% completed it, though. There we go. We're gonna get up here. This is the Pachinko level. Pachinko? Plinko? Plinko Pachinko? I think it's Plinko is how you pronounce that. Or whatever the game is called. I think it's Plinko. Anyway, incredibly frustrating to get them all. So we'll see how long I spend on this one. Oh, that wasn't right. Hey, oh, that's wonderful. All right, now I'm up here. Uh, which one do I want to be at, though? 
Let's, uh, let's decide this. I have fine control over where I am now. So let's, let's utilize that control. A little bit of control. A little, nope, nope, fine control at all. Oh, that, that was, that's not pleasant. Okay, we're dying. This is the start of a wonderful frustration. I can feel it. I can feel it. Do you ever feel like, when you start to get a little angry, you can feel like that, that, that ball that kind of forms up inside of your gut? I do not feel that yet. But I will eventually, I'm sure. All right, I want to go in there. Dang. Not feeling that quite just yet. But we can get there. It, uh, it may be, inc I may be incredibly lucky. Maybe I'll get it on like my third try. That'd be great. That'd be wonderful. That's the thing. Like it's, it is really hard to control. Uh, can I run out of water? I can't remember. Oh wait, no, no, I don't want to. Okay, well, guess we're going this way. There are ways too where like you can kind of snake your way up from the back and collect a couple of those coins, like those bottom ones. I think you can get by coming up from the back. Other than that, it's just kind of playing around with things as best as you can. Fall in a hole. Fall in the. Oh, look at that. Hey, it's pretty convenient. I'll go in this one. Yay! That's five. There's only three left. I make it sound so easy. There's only three left. It can't be that bad. Oh, you wait. Or maybe not. I'd love to see this go well for me. Come on, can we? Oh, no. Can I get up on top of that nail? I want to get up on the nail! Oh, I want to... Nope. Okay. Sometimes you gotta fall. Sometimes you gotta make a couple of mistakes if you want to succeed in life, you know? Sometimes you just gotta do these things. Don't worry about it. If you're worrying about it, you ain't doing it right. Okay, not sure how I ended up in there, but I'm into it. Why am I still being boosted that way? Did we die again? Yeah, we're dead. Bye, Mario. Bye, Mario. I just figure if I get this stage out of the way now, then I won't have to worry about it later. That'd be wonderful. So let's see. Find control? If I do it lightly. Alright, this is one. This is cool. That's nice. Yeah, that's, that's a good one. Four. We're already halfway there. Wow. We're already halfway there. Let me get this one over here. I think if I go to the surface over here, I should be able to gain access to that if I walk up very slightly. Right? Kind of like a... Nope. Alright. Oh, we fall. That's fine, too. I thought I'd be able to kind of... Like that one, maybe? Nope, that doesn't even let me. The hover doesn't let me do... It don't go let me hover. So we don't get to go hover. That's okay. Alright, you know what I... Mm. Oh! 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 Okay. Alright. Okay. Alright. Okay. Oh. Alright. Alright, then. That's three so far. I'm not even gonna bother keeping track at this point. It just it isn't gonna work for me. It ain't, gonna go, it ain't gonna work for me. No way, pal. Maybe if I, if I do one, like, good good, like that, and then I make my way to the center, and then I get my way back down, and I must have missed one of those coins? I guess. I only had four the last time I did that. Oh, well. Maybe if instead I... Oh, I was meaning to do something different. Oh, there's the other one. I missed one. If I do that, if I instead wall jump, right? Maybe if I, if I wall jump, I thought about wall jumping for a moment. See, I think it's the momentum that gets messed up here. Because, like, you're trying to... You're trying to hover your way backwards. But you can't. Because the game is pushing you in the other direction. Because you still have that momentum. So maybe it was something with the physics engine in this game. Whatever it is, it is wonderfully frustrating. And I remember it being a very crucial part of my childhood. Learning not to throw the controller across the room. In times of frustration. See? You don't have to get angry. We can just be happy. We can smile after this. Positive vibes. Positive vibes are what we're going for. Get lost in the music. How could you get so angry? There's so much happiness in this music. If I can land myself on one of these nails, that would be a way to... Oh, wow! That was lucky. I think the key is to get stuck on those nails. And then with those nails, you can actually provide your own momentum to uh, go to where you need to be. Oh, see, see, that would have been cool. That would have been cool. Oh, 
Oh my god! Oh, wonderful! Now I just have those top two! Oh my goodness, I am not... Because not only you need to have that luck with the red coins, but you also need to get right smack in the center of that shine spray. If I just don't move... Land on top of that nail? Oh, I fell in here. That's cool. Ah! That doesn't really help me. At all. Maybe I can, like, work my way out of it? Can, can I? No, well, that's where the shine spike uh, winds up developing. Um, yeah, that other one's not over here anymore. It's up at the top. I gotta be up at the top. Maybe it depends on where you bounce on the platform. Maybe that determines where you gotta go. Like, if I if I bounce, like, towards the edge over here, will I bounce towards the edge? Maybe. 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 Oh, that... There's only one more left. I'm getting giddy! I don't have any real wood around here. Actually, yes I do. Knock on wood. There we go. It's what my uh, microphone is attached to. Knock on wood. Y'all superstitious? I'm not. Not really. I'm obviously a man of science. But open to interpretation. Okay, this is this is okay for now. I'm okay with this. Oh, I'm not okay with that. Oh, yes I am apparently. That was... That was... In that was in fate's hand there. I couldn't... I didn't even know what was going on. Get on top of the net? Can I get on top of the net? Okay, I fall on there? That's fine. That's okay. I am totally cool with that. I would much rather do that than die where I am right now. I tell myself, like, I have to be careful, but, like, I don't know if there's any way to be careful, so to speak. On top of the net? Nope. Just in the center. That's okay. That's okay. This is okay. This is okay. This is lovely. A lovely little place we got here. I'm almost out of coffee. I might have to, um... It's taking me two hours to drink a cup of coffee. What is wrong with me? Or rather, what is there crazily right about me? I might need some tea soon. I gotta keep that... I gotta keep that flavor going. I can't just consume water. I mean, I should just consume water. Tea soon. That was a self-given consume. Nobody had to ask me about that one. I felt the need. I felt the need, so I did. All right, let's try to control ourselves here. Mario, can we control ourselves? No. I'm also running out of water, which is sad boy time, because I don't want to run out of water. I don't think there's anywhere here to actually fill up your water. No, I don't think so. All right, find control. Find control. Go that way. I want to go this way. Am I right over top? I'm right over top. Yes! Now I just need to collect the shine sprite. That's the difficult part. It's actually collecting that sprite. Well, sort of. I managed to get into that spot twice already. Maybe I can do it again. This would be very satisfying. It would be very, very satisfactory. -o. Okay, that didn't make me go the way I wanted to. That's fine. We're in there. That's fine. It's better than being dead. I always get scared when I'm at this angle because, like, I can't... Am I behind the screen? Am I? Have I fallen off yet? I'm not so sure. Maybe a little one. Little one? Little one. Okay. I fell in here again. That's okay then, I guess. That's fine. Not exactly what we wanted here. I'm running low on water. Indeed, Mario. Indeed, that Mario boy. Oh, this could be nice. This could be very, very nice. Oh, this is very nice, actually. Let's just, um... Let's fall, fall our way into... Yes. No! Oh! Oh, dear. I wanna go this way. Fall inside. Inside! All right! Wonderful! Oh, that's lovely. I'm so glad I don't have to do that again. Honestly, that was incredibly lucky. I'm gonna call that luck at its finest. Not beginner's luck, though. What kind of luck? Hmm. Perhaps favor from Lady Luck herself. Or something else. Maybe I paid off the right demon. I'm not so sure. What I'm going to do in the meantime is I'm going to take a wee brief break. I'm going to get myself some... I'm kind of getting to the bottom of this coffee thing here, so I'm going to clean that out. Grab some more tea and use the banyo. I'll be back in a little bit. Peace.
and welcome back to everybody. Oh, it seems that I forgot to add back the music to my break screen. I've got a new different capture source now because the Roxio comes up as something different than the cameras and whatnot, so I'll have to add back the music. Probably upon my next break. That's what I'll do. Anyways, we're back. I've got new tea. It's not new tea. It's actually very old tea. This tea is the Christmas blend Twinings of London. It's, it's old because Christmas time. But, um... That's not really a problem. It's been sitting in my drawer for a long time, so I might as well drink it. What does it smell like? Mm -hmm. Oh, cinnamon. Yeah, cinnamon. Very, very cinnamony. Oh, how festive. Go take care of y'all over here. Oh, princess! Where are you, princess? I gotta say, um, Shadow Mario? Or Bowser Jr.? Princess? You, uh... Very, very interesting design on that thing there. Very, very cool. Or maybe it's not that he's blue, per se. It's just that everything, all the light that comes to him is blue from the water and from the clouds. That's what makes him appear that blue color. That is Tina Island. The villain's secret hideout must be there. No, well, they must be hidden on... The, the villains must be on Pina Island. Yeah, at the, at the park. Certainly not anything else. <gasps> and then other stages showed up. There's so many new stages that have opened up. Oh my goodness. So many stages, so many time. So little time. Um, the beach came first, so... And I like that area. One of my favorite ones there is the Sandbird. Consumption! Oh, Oreo, you are making me do terrible things here. I just had... I just poured this cup of tea. It's probably too hot, right? Oh, that is way too hot. I am not gonna consume that. I'll take the water instead. Remind me for the hydration. I like that. And a big ol' heart right back at you. Big ol' heart for some big ol' friends. As in the friendship, the, the bond. The bond is big, not necessarily the person itself. I'm not sure. I'm a rather large lad compared to an ant. Not compared to like, I don't know, my desktop perhaps. Honestly, I feel like my desktop is probably like half my size. Let's see. My desktop is about a foot and foot and four inches. Oh, maybe foot and a half. About a foot and a half tall. Uh, I am five foot six. Do the math. That's definitely not anywhere close to half. Oh my gosh. No, I'm very small though, compared to most. Rather small lad. Small on the stature, the height. I'm very happy with that. You could make me work that body, then I'll get big! I'll get beefy! I'll gain these muscles! Well, actually, the work that body stuff really only works my legs. Or you know what? You know what? No matter what comes up, no matter what comes up, if you'll work my body right now, I'll do pull-ups on that bar over there. That's what I'll do. What am I supposed to do here? The secret of the sands? Secret of the sands. I have to go over that. Hey! Enough of that! I don't appreciate you slashing me in the air like that. Hey, stop it. No! Stop! What am I supposed to be doing here? What's the what's the mission again? Then we can wrestle and you'll win. Probably. Uh Dune Bud Sand Castle Secret. Oh, it's over here. Yeah. That's what it is. And then it goes over there, and I gotta run. Another super secret Mario level. Another thing that you've probably got on me that I don't is the probably you have wrestling experience. I don't have wrestling experience. I never wrestled anybody. I've tussled a bit. <laughs> How are you though, bud? Happy Saturday. Oh, it's a lovely, lovely Saturday. I'm very well. I'm so happy I got my GameCube working so I can actually capture games such as this, which I show up or this time. I used to quarrel a bit with my friends. I was a rather... I, I could be a little aggressive in high school sometimes. Except I wouldn't call it wrestling. I would call it a friendly tussle. A friendly wrestle. And I'd be like, Y'all wanna fight? Y'all wanna fight? I wanna fight. Let's fight right now. And I've fought Lycos Lore a couple of times. I've fought Final Rhapsody a couple of times. I've fought Meatball Girl a couple of times. I've fought my fiance a couple of times. We've since begun to be a little less physical in that regard. Because, you know... That's, that's pain. We don't like pain. I mean, there's not- there wasn't a lot of pain. It was a lot of- it was a friendly tussle. It was a friendly tussle and a friendly quarrel. That's what I told myself then. Then again... Oh no! Mario, you dumped in the falls! That's okay. But I used to really enjoy that. I don't have anybody to tussle with. I mean, I, I could tussle with Anna, but she's too busy. And she'd probably kick my ass. 
So, I mean, that would be fun for her, I guess. But I guess it would also be fun for me in the, in the short term. I don't know. It's been a while since I've had a nice tussle. Tussle? Quarrel? Uh, disagreement? Physical disagreement, so to speak? There are many ways to play. There are many ways to fight with your friends. That sounds wonderful. That sounds terrible. Oh, that worked. Thank you, Mario. Thank you, Mario. Let's get up here and then... Okay, I want to take this route. That route for this. And then, uh, I don't know. Let's go this way for that one. Oh, get up. Get up. Get up. No. Get up now. Get up there, Mario. Nope. Okay. Not gonna happen. That's fine. We can we can wait. We can, we can try that again. We can try that again there, Mario, buddy. Oh, no. Stop. No. Stay. Stay. Yeah, climb that sand. I don't know how this works. This is like Minecraft logic. Yeah, you can jump on top of floating sand blocks. Of course you can. Why wouldn't you be able to? That's just physics, bro. Shiny. I almost, I almost, almost sunk into a dab there. Dab on, I feel, I feel the dab coming on. Oh, oh no, oh no, oh no. It's okay. That was a close one. That was a close dab. Work that body, Anna. I don't know if you heard what I said before. Here I go. I'm taking this off. We're doing pull-ups. I'm not doing butt kicks at all. We're doing pull-ups. Here we go. One. And two, and three, and four, and five. Let's switch direction. Six, ow, fuck, seven, eight. Oh my God, I whacked my head on the molding. Nine, ow. Oh, that really hurt. Ow. I can't believe that! <laughs> Anna, this is your fault! It's okay. We're doing fine. We're doing fine. I'm not cheating, this was an agreement! You came in too late, you didn't hear the agreement. The agreement was, if somebody makes me work that body now, I'm gonna wind up doing pull-ups. So kick your butt. Who's gonna kick my butt? You gonna kick my butt? Don't kick my butt. Don't kick my butt! All right, I'll kick my butt at least a couple times. Eh. Eh. The butt has been kicked. Alert, alert! Look at the top of the tower! Hey, look, there's a big old green thing up there. <laughs> so kick your butt. It's butt kicks. I know it's butt kicks. It says butt kicks, but you weren't there for the agreement. Totally worth it. Totally worth it. Thank you, dearest, for always looking out for me. Some weird thing is curled up on the tower to take a nap! This could endanger the legendary Sandberg egg! Sandberg egg? The Sandberg! I love the Sandberg! The Sandbergs. Sandberg? Bird. Bird. Bird? Avian creature. That's what we're going for here. There's a blue coin up here, right now. Yes, there is! <laughs> Burbs. Bird is the. Well, everybody's heard about the burp. The burp is the word. I mean, to my knowledge, I, everyone heard. Heard. I'm, I'm not so sure. Have you heard? Have you heard? Was I? Did I just knock my camera? I'm gonna knock my camera. I, I mean, it was my understanding that everyone had heard. Heard about what? You know the one. You know the one. All right, this was always frustrating. Let's do the hard ones first. Dun, 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 dun. Get out of here. Oh, you weren't close enough to the edge. The edge, the edge, the edge. Hey guys, go that way. Hey guys, go that way. Spray it. Hey, go over there. Oh, I gotta get them really close to the edge. I see. Go, go to the edge. To the edge, I say. Hey, back, back, he fiends. Back. Back, I say! Stay away from me and my friends. You're really going that way. Nope, no, 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 nope, you can stay over there too. Pressure. Pressure building. Come on, go. Go. I said to the edge. Maybe if I, uh... Yeah, there we go. I'll do at least one. No, you hit me, you asshole. Well, I'm gonna kill your friend. 
There we go. Well, I mean, I didn't really kill them. Technically, that's hitting the ground killed them. Get out of here. Go, 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 go to the edge. Go, 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 go to the edge now. Now I can get you too. Yes, double decker punch. When I was younger, I didn't believe that the power of the sun was that great. Like, if you shined a mirror at something like that, you could literally kill something. Nowadays, I've seen screens, not mirrors per se, but screens that will just take the, the sun and you can just melt rocks with it. You know what they say, Sunny D, unleash the power of the sun, dudes. Unleash the power of the sun. The power of the sun can melt you and your entire family, as well as your house and everything you've ever known. So, um, Capri Sun. I think your slogan's actually a threat. I'd be scared. I am scared. I'm terrified now that I think about it. I'm now considering the conceivable power of the sun, and my god, that's terrifying. To the edge. The edge, the edge, the edge. To the edge, please. To the edge. To the edge, the edge, the edge. Go to the edge. I'm gonna add a water. Whoa, pow. Oh, that didn't work? What are you doing? There we go. Now you get out of here. Let me even take this one. Go. Go. Go, you interesting thing. What even are you? I don't know. You're just some classic Nintendo character. Hey, yo. Whoop. See, Daisy. Bye bye. So long, Big Bowser. Oh, tea is still very hot. Tea is still very hot. Mario. Excellent! There's only one area remaining! I think I can do it with that with the amount of water that I have left. I don't think I need a refill. I can survive on this one. Go! To the edge! To the edge, the edge, the edge. Yes! There we go. That was pretty good. Hey! That's pretty good! Nice. La! Unleash the power of- Whoa! See? That's what I was talking about, the power of the sun. It can- It can make you literally come apart at the seams. Like, my hand would fall off and just- my, my limbs would just disconnect from each other if I got hit with that power of the sun. That or, you know, skin cancer. Whichever comes first. Hey, buddy! Oh, wow! You sent me pretty high. I didn't mean for you to do that. But I uh, were here. Hey, don't, don't, don't touch me. Don't, 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 don't touch me. I didn't give you permission for that. Please don't touch me. All right, shines bright. I imagine that being cooler in my head. <laughs> Deal with it. There we go, back to the town again. Hmm. Let's do another one. Let's do another. Gelato Beach. Wiggler, ahoy! Full steam ahead. Choo choo! Choo choo magoo, my friends! Oh, look, there he goes. That's a. <laughs> That's a Wiggler if I've ever seen one. Tea. All right, uh, what are you gonna do about that, Mario? We're gonna make sure that he gets all tripped up, so to speak. Get messed up. What the? Whoa! Okay. That was... Which one do we want? This one, this one, this one. This is the one to pounce. Woo! You know what's interesting about this guy? I think this one was actually alive. Because it doesn't become goo, it becomes sand, I think. Do it again? Did we go? Yeah, we did. Awesome! 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 Now's your chance to attack! Touch me not! Do not! Don't, don't do the touch. Don't do the touch. See, now it will live on in longevity. Unless thou haveth my permission, you are not allowed to touch. Says Mario. Hey, come over here. Come over here, little big guy. You want some? You want something? You're not gonna come over here, are you? Nah, you're not really into that. Hello? Come over here. Oh, man. 
Okay, you're gonna go over there then. So be it then. I don't think I've ever seen something wiggle that much before. Wow. That's one hell of a wiggling going on there. Wiggling, 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 wiggling. Wiggly, wiggly, wiggly. Piggy wiggies, piggly, wiggly, wiggly. Wiggly, wiggly, piggly wiggies. Okay. I guess you're not coming this way. Uh, where's another one? Or maybe. Nah, you're totally skipping that. Uh, oh, maybe it would've worked that time. Ah, that's the one. I'll just wait till you come back over here. I'll just wait till you come back over here, you big old wiggly, 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 we did it. Yep, you just turned to sand. You're not even goo. You're just sand. Scary, scary, scary. La la la. Shine a sprite. We got it. Or I mean, I mean, we'll, I will get it. I'll, I'll get it in a moment. I mean, I see, I see the sprite. The sprite is dead ahead. I don't have it yet. I don't have it grasped in my hands. I can't feel the warmth of the sun holding my hand. As if a nice embrace from the giant plasma ball itself. Yes. I feel the sun. Capri Sun. Roaring waters. Speaking of Capri Sun, it's time to shout out today's sponsor, and that's, you guessed it, Salami. It's always the sponsor. There's never any other sponsor. It's just Salami. I have been working on a partnership deal with Bruschetta, though. It's not gonna work out. Let's do another level while I can forget about Bruschetta. Anyway. The Sandbird cometh! He's coming, alright. And we're gonna hang on top of him. Look! The Sandbird is... What's, what's the term? The sandbird has been incubated inside of a stone egg. Perhaps it's sandstone. Ooh, now that's an idea. That's certainly an idea that we've got going on here. Woo! Let's go up this way. Actually, wait. Sunglasses man. Sunglasses man? Can I have sunglasses yet? Please? Please? Can I have sunglasses? Please? I want Mario to become like me. Hey, I think you're in paradise. You know, paradise special sunshades, but you suck just as much as you did before, if not worse. You need to spend more time here on Al Delfino. Oh, he gets no, gets no, no, no to the Mario brother. So be it then. I'll just make my own sunglasses then. You don't want to give them to me? Fine. I don't need it. I don't need your charity. Your sunglasses charity. My own sunglasses. I didn't want them anyway. Okay, I'm gonna shoot that bird up there. I uh, gotcha. Gotcha, gotcha, birds. Gotcha, gotcha, birds. Gotcha, gotcha, birds. No! Birds, why? Come back here. Okay, well, they drop blue coins if you. Oh! Where'd it go? Where are you? I heard you pop! There you are! I popped the birdie. Which, you know, come to think of it, probably isn't really something you want to do to endangered species such as the blue-footed booby birds of Super Mario Sunshine. Or blue-feathered tittle. I don't know what kind of birds those are. The blue birds, they're probably endangered. You don't see a lot of them. And Mario's just killing them all. He clearly has no respect for uh, Delfino Isle's uh, conservation efforts. Let me get the other one too. Oh, I didn't mean to splash for you. Sorry. Um, hey, Bluebird. You wanna, you wanna come back? Promise I'll be kind. Psych, I wasn't gonna be kind! <laughs> oh. Hey, Luigi, what are your thoughts on that? Still silent, eh? Crazy creature. Oh, there goes my party hats. That's fine. I'll pick them up later. Here we go! Wow! Wow! Into the uh, zoop. Mario. 
If I recall correctly, uh, other players have also had trouble with this particular level. Blue coin! Want that blue coin? Hell yeah, buddy! Can we jump back on the, the bird? Oh, I usually never pull that off. Nice. Oh, I want that coin. Nope. I, I want that coin, and then I want the coin at the edge, too. Because those become incredibly difficult later on when the bird starts turning. Oh, there's a blue coin up there? There's indeed a blue coin up there. I want the coin! Yes! Got that coin. Stay on the bird. Stay on the bird. Stay on the bird. Yes! There's bird. Ha, there's bird. Oh, you're flapping. Oh, you're flapping, my friend. Oh, you're flapping. And I believe there's one. Whoa! Okay! Okay! Oh, okay. whoa. That's, there's my... Oh. Oh. Bye-bye, birdie. Where'd you go, birdie? Can I... This is gonna fall eventually. Hey, you know what? I'll get a life while I'm at it. You got this, Mario. You, you got it. You got it. Perfect. Well, what a majestic sight, which I can't see because the camera won't go up in that direction. Actually, I can do this, right? Uh, how majestic. Anyway, time to die. Not too bad. Let's do it again. Uh, bird? Bird? Birdie! We'll get that one. We'll get the ones on the wings and the one on the tail first. And then the one at the body. Whatever, whatever, whatever. And I won't be distracted by those blue coins anymore. Those illustrious coins that had that, that beautiful, beautiful blue color to them. Blue is my favorite color. If I haven't mentioned it already, I have mentioned it now. Oh, goodness gracious. Oh, goodness gracious. There we go. We'll collect all the coins on here, and now it's just a matter of surviving. We just gotta survive. That's all we gotta do, just survive. The bird will start turning any moment, though. Oh, flippy flappy wings. Flippy flappy wings. Which way are you going? Not birdie? Oh, another blue coin. Hey, I did it! Wow, I was not expecting to actually grab that one successfully. But you know what? We did it. <laughs> bird. Bird. I am on bird. Sad bird. Bird, bird, bird. Bird is the word. I mean, is it really a bird in anything but name? That worked. Hey, hey, oh, that worked. Alright. Well, I shan't speak too soon, because I know if I do, I will very quickly psych myself out. Are we turning again? Shall we turn? Shall we turn, pretty bird? Pretty, pretty bird did turns. I think the final coin is up there. Up up there I think. Yeah, it's definitely up there. Maybe we can just make it over there now. Yeah, let's just do that now. Yes! Alas, I've gotten the coin again. And there we go. Not too bad. Oh, there's another blue coin over there! That's okay. We're not- I'm not doing completion this round. This is not- This is not a full 100 but 100 percent though. This isn't my 100 percent. Not that I would ever do something like that. Not foreseeably. I don't have any urge to 100 percent things. Not like this. But alas. I just want to play through my game. I want to play through my Mario Sunshine. Which I love so much. Hey Toad, how you feeling? Y you feeling good now that you're not good anymore? Horrible, horrible! Princess Peach has been kidnapped! Yeah, you're right. Hey, Val, you're on fire! Allow me to fix that for you. Fire, fire, fire! You're no longer on fire! How you feeling about that? What do you got for me? Wow, oh, you saved me! Thanks, Obama! You're welcome. You're welcome. I think there's something else over here. I don't know where it is in the sand exactly, but I know there's something to find in the sand if I do shit like this. Where are you in the sand? I know there's something in the sand. Oh, there you are. There you are. There's the shine sprite hanging in the sand. I forgot about that for a moment, but now I've remembered. When I started spraying my water all over the beach, I was like, Oh, you know what? I believe there's some secret here that I didn't know about, or have merely forgotten about until now. <laughs> and I get the shine. Another shine in Isle Delfino, aka Delfino Plaza. Alright! 
trying to do? I'm feeling a little peckish. So I, got, I grabbed an orange from the fridge. I'm eating more fruits. Fruits are good for the body and the mind. I'm gonna cut that top off. Cut that bottom part off. And uh, begin the consumption of the citrus fruit. Or at least begin the, the cutting of the citrus fruit. I don't actually have a cutting board over here. My desk is gonna get a little sticky. That's okay. Oh, look at that. Now we've got the nozzles in town. Just one. The one is just enough for now. This is one of my nozzles! The Gad Science Inc. Hover Nozzle! Correct. <laughs> You're correct, Flood. I believe that you of all people would know best about what nozzles that you have access to. I think also as well, um, in some of these windows, you can actually uh, get some stuff out of them. That's a, that's a green window, so I don't think that actually has anything of merit in it. But I'll look around for other open windows. Maybe it's got to do with the colors of the curtains. Probably. That's a red curtain. What's in this? Ah, oh, just a coin. All right, yeah. Well, I had to try it. Damaged exhaust port on the western shore have been completed. Cool. Let's go more sand. Sandy, sandy beaches. <laughs> Yo, what's up, my beaches? A bunch of palm trees start waving in the wind. Yeah. Il Piantissimo Sand Sprint. Let's open up this orange while I'm at it. With this knife, because I don't trust my fingers. Hopefully I don't cut myself. I usually don't, but I'm not cutting towards myself. Oh man, I can see like the uh, the orange oils coming off that orange. Beautiful. Oh, it smells so good! I can't wait to put that in my mouth. The orange, I mean, not the, like the flesh of the orange. Anyway, looking forward to it. I'm very much looking forward to the orange. Orange. I know some people pronounce it orange. I don't. Orange. Ooh. Or orange. Orange, orange, orange. Oh, wait, where, where are you, buddy? Where is Il Piantissimo? Oh, he's down here, isn't he? He's in the little hut? He's down in the little hut? Dude, where are you? Where are you? Oh, there you are. I walked right past you. I'm a little dense sometimes. Hello, buddy. <laughs> I'm Il Piantissimo, and now we shall race to the flag. Alright, acknowledge. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. <laughs> it is a race to the finish flag, and only one can triumph. By the way, the current record is uh, 35 seconds. Uh, are you at the ready? Then it gets it, and the goal! Here we go. Ouch. You whacked me. I didn't want you to whack me, but you did. Oh, that didn't work the way that I wanted it to. Whoops. I probably could have just wall jumped like any normal person would do. Oh well. Yeah, just, just get on my way up here. Oh. Did I do it? Or you probably beat me. Did you beat me? You pokey little flap biscuits! I must laugh at you! <laughs> and next time, show me what you really got, if you please. I know we shall race again! Ciao! I missed him by like a little bit of a second. <laughs> the record is 35 seconds, but I can do it in less than that, so really it's not a record. I'm just lying to you. I'll do it again. I got tripped up on the little uh, bouncy, 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 bouncy ball, wall thing. Bouncy, bouncy wall thing. That's what I got tripped up on. That's okay. Did Mario say open salami? I hear a message from our sponsor coming on! Eat salami. That's the message. Eat salami. Oh yeah, somehow I totally missed him. Water. Water. I shall race you. Yes. I know who you are, and I do not care. You're just a, a man in a suit made to look like a pianta, though I do not believe that you are one. What a guy. I like it, though. What is that? Like, polyethylene? Did you 3D print that helmet of yours? Now, 3D printing wasn't really a thing at this time. Oh, wow. Oh, come on, Mario. Oh, woo! Do the little bouncy bounce, and then... Hey, that thing that, uh... I did that thing. Hey, look at that, we did it. Hey, look at that, we did it. This thing looks like a giant, like, McDonald's straw. 
at one angle. Hey, buddy. Phew! <laughs> You're pretty good. You have some speed. You have grown ever so slightly in my esteem. Slightly. We will meet again, and goodbye! I will not whisk away into the distance. You will never see me again. Just kidding. You will. I'm not going anywhere. Can't spread out. Yahee, Yahoo! I've gotten another Shine Sprite for you. I'm gonna open up this orange now. That is a satisfying sound. Oh, okay. Now there's orange juice everywhere, and partly in my eye. But only partly. Didn't hurt that much. Put that down again, as I must continue. I must continue with the game. Now with slightly stickier fingers than I did before. The orange oils. Actually, I can do a little bit more. Let's peel off that piece. That piece. I love me some oranges. Need some more stream snacks. Red coins in the coral reef. My current trend of stream snacks has been various different types of fruit. Particularly ones that are easy to eat when pre-prepared, such as melons, for instance. I do enjoy me a nice cut melon. Um, there we go, I just wanted to open that up a little bit. Oh, honestly. There we go, ready to go. Ready for the red coins on the beach. Got a little bit of orangeness under my nails. You ever peel an orange with your finger or clementine or lemon? I guess, why are you peeling lemons? Actually, none of my business. Glad to know that you're peeling lemons and or limes. But have you ever done that, right? And you get like the, you get the, the pith in between your fingers and you're like, you smell like orange or lemon or whatever citrus you were peeling. Or I guess anything that you were peeling with your fingers, like all day. I remember when I was younger, I always wondered how to get inside of here to get that, um, to get that uh, shine spray. But you gotta wait till the last one for the melon festival. You gotta wait. You gotta wait. Let's get all these red coins. Oh, there goes that uh, little red coin. That's okay. I'll get it. This one's not particularly hard, unless you can't chase that. Unless you have trouble racing after the fish, which you may have trouble. With. Come on. Come on. Get the, get the coin. Get the coin. Get the coin. Where'd the fish go? Oh, okay. I clearly have uh, chased the fish away. Mario is the reason why the coral reefs are all um, are all dying. He's chasing away all the fish. All the ones that bring it life and luster. Mario, you enemy. <laughs> Mario, you anemone. <laughs> oh my god. Not funny. Oh, and there's a there's fish with the other one. I'll just come down and grab it from above, right? Can I get it from above? I got you. Nice. Is there also a red coin over there? There's something in the distance over there. Is that... Oh, is that a blue coin? Oh, it's just a blue coin in the distance. Oh, let's go. Or is that? Oh, maybe it's just a blue coin uh, set of fish. I'll go get that. I noticed it, so I might as well. Oh, there's also one at the bottom water over there. Oh yeah. I have never noticed this deep little pond up here. Deep part of the pond up here. I don't think I've ever noticed that. Come on, get it. Get it. Mario, you got it. Mario, you got it. You got it, buddy. Go into the coin. Go after the... Oh, you're now beyond the boundary. Maybe if I... If I wait for you to come back. Wait, wait, come back. Come back. Wait. Oh my god, wait. Come on. Oh my goodness. Mario, you got... Oh, now it's under the water. Well, here's another one over here. Oh my god! Fishy! 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 Fishy, no. Fishy, fishy, stop. Fishy, fishy, no. Oh my god! He drowned me! I, I gotta watch my health. Well, now that I know that those co blue coins are over there, I'm gonna go after them first. But first, before even doing that, I'm gonna take a bite of my orange. I'm gonna take a bite of this orange. Here we go. I'm gonna peel out the center. I get to peel out the center of my orange. There we go. Nice and peeled. Take it to the side. Take it to the orange! Mm. I've never really been a fan of, like, orange juice from a container. Like, whatever they do with the orange juice from the store, 
It doesn't really, I, I mean, of course it doesn't taste like a fresh orange, but it really doesn't taste like an orange to me. It's like, it's orange-ish, orange adjacent, if you will. Hey, bud, what's going on? I heard that someone in, someone found red coins in the coral reef, but there are fish out there that'll drag you to the sea floor. I know. I know, I know, I know. You don't have to tell me twice, I heard. Alright, if I go ahead of that and come down, yes! Awesome. That's one of them, but there must be more. There's apparently more blue coins over here. I had no idea that this little area over here had those blue coins. And is that big fish? Is that big fish? That looks like big fish. Are you big fish? Just kind of hanging at the boundary over there. There's also blue coin fish over here. I never knew about any of these, honestly. That's cool. Even in my ripe age of 23, I still can learn new things. Gimme, give gimme, give gimme, gimme. Nope, nope. All right, I'll let it happen. I'll let it happen. Can I? Oh, apparently I can't do that. Got it. Nice. And I think there's one more, at least in this area over here. Yeah, there's one over there. I don't know if I can get that far, though. But maybe there, the fish will come out if I get a little closer. I had no idea there's over here. That is so cool. Authentic reaction. Ha! Huh. My usual authentic reaction to things that I've never seen before are like, Oh! Huh. That's cool. Sometimes it can be a little overdramatic, but those are usually the things I just, I already knew about, but like, I gotta hype myself up for them. Alright. Oh, that's cool. And there's a blue coin over there. I might as well collect it while I'm here. I like the blue coins. I love them. I think I gotta use my water ability to swing that swing. Oh, well, that could have worked really, really well. Hey, all right. Yeah, another blue coin. Save to Mario. Ah, as opposed to Mario Bow. Oh, can I get on top of the tree this way? Sweet. I wonder if there's anything on top of this tree. There must be something on top of this tree. Anything? Anything special? <laughs> Another blue coin! Oh, lovely! I had no idea it was there. No, authentic reaction. Don't get me wrong, but over oh, dramatic size. We talking about this. Yes. And uh, I don't see any more blue coins from here, so time to go after the red ones. Back to continue Mario's uh, extinction spree. First, we'll extinct the bluebirds, and then the coral reefs. Christmas tea ain't so bad. Really not so bad at all. I'm gonna pull my sunglasses forward a little bit. The pressure upon my noggin is making me feel a little headachy. <laughs> got a base coin in here. Uh, you guys got any coin over there? You got coin? I like coin. Give me that coin. Hey guys, you got coin? You got coin? Khajiit want coin? Thank you. Mario also wants coin. But Khajiit, forever and ever, will also want coin. So make sure to consider them the next time you have some spare coin. Give them to Khajiit. Uh, anything else in here? Oh, big fish that wants to drag me to the bottom of the world. Oh, there's a coin in there too. Where's coin number seven? And then consequently afterwards, uh, coin number eight. Are you in here? Hello? Yep, there's a coin in there. And I think, was there a little tunnel coin? There was one like, you can't see it from the surface, but there's a little tunnel you can go through. Maybe. Yeah, well, sort of, kind of, right here. It's, this is kind of what I was thinking of. Not exactly the same, though. Da -da 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 -da. Lovely. That's another science part. Oops. Awesome. Wahaa! We got it! Another giant sprite! I wonder... I just had I just had an idea. I just had an idea for a cocktail mocktail thing. The shine sprite using 
actual Sprite as an ingredient. As opposed to, like, like specific or any other lemon-lime soda, I guess. That's an idea. I, I gotta write that down. I gotta write that down. When you have inspiration, write it down. Shine Sprite Cocktail. Like the soda. We'll workshop it. We'll workshop that idea. Make it into something cool and awesome. Um, there's more to do over here, so... Yeah. We shall continue. Okay. Continue on our journey. Uh, Shadow Mario! After him! Go get him! Shadow Mario is getting away! Alright. I believe you. I got you! I got you. You're running pretty fast over there, pal. Oh, you're running pretty, pretty fast. Woo! Oh, I thought I could jump over that. But alas, it gyrates. And slivers. There we go. Maybe a little something like this. I haven't touched him yet, but we will. Yeah, keep on keep on bouncing you. What did you do? Oh, you're gonna go that way? Okay. Where'd you go? Which direction did you turn to run? Uh, did you go back up again? I bet you went back up again. Where'd you go? Ah! It seems that I have misplaced it. Wait. I'm gonna go over here. I know there's something over here. Is it a blue coin? Oh, it's the rocket nozzle. Well, that doesn't really give me any assistance right now. I don't really want that. Not for this particular level. But now I know it's up there, so I can unlock it elsewhere. Anyway, Shower Ma uh, Shadow Mario is on the loose. Let's go. Let's go. Get the Shadow Mario. Oh, he's way over there. Oh, he's up. He's jumping over there. Can I go this way? Oh, it won't let me jump. It won't let me do the jumpies. I know he's up there somewhere. Oh, there he goes. Hi there, buddy. You're just gonna keep on running, aren't you? Hey, can I... What the... What are you doing? <laughs> I done do the the sprays and you don't get the spray on? That's fine. We got him. We got. Whoops! He's got me too. Where'd you go? Uh, buddy. I seem to have misplaced him once again. The bees. Not the bees. Don't come after me, bees. Where'd you go? I have lost visual. I don't know where he went. Maybe he's up on top somewhere. Hello? You up on top of here, though? You're sleeping in the trees. Where did you... Where did you go? He's bouncing around. And the bees have gotten me. And the bees have this one. Where'd he go? What? Yeah. Uh, buddy. Did he go up there? I'm not so sure. Let's just keep on walking and find out. He's gotta be around here somewhere. I can hear him. Is he out there? Oh, then now I'm down here. That's fine. Fall a little in the sand. Get back up again. Hello. You're bouncing around somewhere. I can hear you. I can feel you in my soul. Not down there. I don't see you walking around nowhere. Oh, shout it, Mario! Wee hee, yeah, yeah. That's taunting at this point. You're basically just taunting me at this point. You know I can't see you. You should make it sounds anyway. Alright, maybe if I look up here? Hello? If I can see anything moving, that would help me. Clearly, whatever part of my brain that helps me detect moving things is not working. I feel like this is like a children's show. Like Dora the Explorer being like, Go! Oh, do you see Shadow Mario? Where's Shadow Mario? He's like bouncing around in the background, like really obvious to everybody else except for me. Alright, um. That didn't work. Are you, are you over here, Mary? Are you on the sand? I will find you. There you are! Look at that! No, don't touch me! Oh, you're bouncing up again, aren't you? Yep, yes you are. I will eventually heal myself. Maybe. Gotcha, 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 gotcha. You gotcha? Gotcha, gotcha, maybe? Gotcha, gotcha, maybe? And you're gonna bounce down there and you're gonna come back up again, right? Because that's what you did before. 
No, I didn't want to be hit. I got you, you little bitch. Dang it, this ain't over. Bye bye. Now that I got that shine spray, and it's just sitting there, I'm going to use this opportunity to unlock the nozzles in this area, as well as get the blue coin that I see that I can get with the rocket nozzle. Got it. Now I can use it in this area. And I believe it was somewhere on top of... Yeah, that thing over there. If I go up over here on top of this little thingamabob, I can go forth and collect blue coin. Specifically that one. There we go. Got another one. And then I see the turbo nozzle over there. Uh, so I'll just unlock that one too. Wee -ha -ha! Here we go, up to the sky. Turbo nozzle. Zoom. That's how I feel every single time I connect to a class or meeting. It's like, <laughs> time to zoom into battle. Because we all use zoom and it's disappointing. For a long while, every single time you join a meeting that's being recorded, this, this, like, like, really loud voice would be like, This meeting is being recorded. And apparently if I would have just updated it, now it says like, uh, something like, Meeting recording in progress. It's much more soothing on my ears. But if I like, if I had my volume up before joining a meeting and it was being recorded, that would greet me oh so aggressively. Like, Hey, by the way, but if like, you care or anything, that this meeting is being recorded, so maybe you want to know right now. Like, dude, shut up. I'm glad they fixed it. I'm sure they got a lot of claims, complaints from their users about that. Like, dude, it's destroying my eardrums. Turn it down. We want a prettier voice. That's what we want. Or maybe I'll eventually they'll add, like, different types of voices that you can add to your Zoom meeting to tell you that things are recording. Like, I want Dwayne The Rock Johnson to let me know, like, hey, buddy. The meeting you're in is being recorded. And I'd be like, thanks, Dwayne. I appreciate that. The Watermelon Festival is now open! Why must I stand here? I'd rather be drinking a smoothie. I don't know. Maybe you should ask Nintendo. For the person who put you in that spot. To dance forever. My poor man. Forever and ever. Forever and ever. Amen. My thoughts and prayers are with you, my friend Pianta. Anyway, so I need the biggest watermelon ever. And I know it's none of those watermelons. I know the real watermelon I'm looking for. Now that one is up at the top. But you gotta be careful with your watermelons. If you're not careful enough with your watermelons, your watermelon will pop, explode, and become all kinds of sad face. I don't want you following me, so. This. The Mongo Melon, as I will now be calling it, is the melon we're looking for. So go! Go forth, melon, and conquer. So uh, let's let's get it over here. A little, uh, little uh, maybe take it along the side a little bit. Okay, maybe, uh, clearly my melon, my melon is so big, it has the ability to warp. That's cool. A little bit of blink ability there. That's nice. I respect that. I respect that, Melon. Melon. Pl melon, please. Melon. Melon. Melon, please. Maybe I'll, uh, get a little... Maybe stand my ground a little bit and just, uh... Melon! Melon, go up the stairs now. If I can slightly tilt the watermelon the direction I want to go. Yes, very slightly. Very slight what? Melon. Melon. Mm, melon. You want to stop doing that thing where you blink around a little bit? All right, otherworldly magical watermelon. We're going to do force. 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 No, not that kind of force. Oh, there was a gold bird up there. That also has a shine sprite in it. Where'd you go, gold birdie? I just saw a gold bird that just flew into view. Huh. I'll be on the lookout for that next time. Gold birds drop shine sprites. Who knew? Hey, go get them, watermelon. Yeah. If I get lucky enough for it to not break as it goes down the hill, then I think I'll be just fine. We go up this way? Wait. I popped it. It'll grow back. Right? Whoa! 
So that's the thing. You'd think melons of this size would cause would fix world hunger, but it won't because as soon as that gets eaten, they're not full anymore. Oh, that almost did something. It's bouncing around. Has my melon broken? My melon has broken. Unfortunate. It appears my melon has been done. Oh well. I'll just have to do it again. Ba, 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 ba. Let's see. Will it survive this one? Go forth! Melon and conquer! That's pretty good. Okay, that's fine. Get stuck in the sand just a little bit. Oh, that doesn't keep them down for very long. Oh, I should kill them. I can't kill them. If I flip them over and then bounce on them... Yeah, that'll do it. Stop! Hey! I don't, appre I don't really appreciate that. Oh, if I do that, it'll knock them out for a little bit. Go! Go! Go, 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 over the... Oh. Well, it appears I can't push my melon into them either. Whoops! Whoopee! That was unfortunate. My melon done dead. My melon done goes away. Actually, they're forever like that? No, like, it came back. They realized that the land of the undead was not enough... Was just not their forte. Go forth, conquer this direction. Fly, watermelon, and try not to bounce too much. All right, slowly but surely. Slowly but surely. There she goes. Bye, bye, melonin. All right, you're nice and happy down there. I like that. And I'll get this guy too. I see another one over there, but I'm not worried about that for now. Oh, I see you. I see you. I see you. I get you too. Melon, melon time. Melon, melon time. Nope, don't. Don't do that the way I think you will. Watermelon. Watermelon. Melon, 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 melon. Don't get hit by the wall. Just go the way that I know you to do. Whoopsie. I see you there. I see you. Oh, that... Well, that was okay. It didn't touch my melon. So long as it don't touch my melon, I'll be all right. Whoa! Okay! Well, I'm up here now, so that's a better vantage point than I was at before. There we go. Alright, that's good. That's good. That's a nice, uh, nice melon situation we got there. A nice old melon situation. I can get you, too. Nope. If I sneakily snake my this melon through here. Oh, there's bees. The bees can probably hurt it, right? Bees probably hurt. The bees probably hurt. I wanna go this way. As close to No, okay, you that's fine. That's alright. That's a that's a favorable melon outcome. Get you. Inch you a little closer this way. Just gotta get it to the melon shop. Melon melon shop. Slowly but surely. Gonna get it to the melon shop. The smoothie shop. This will make the best smoothie ever. I'm gonna take care of you. And then do that. And then take care of you. And then do that. And then, you know. Oh, I'll take care of you too. You're in my way as well. Just a snake through this way. Don't touch those bad boys. Those bad bird things? I don't really know, to be perfectly honest. And then not drop the melon in the water. This, uh, this might be need for some, uh, slow water action. Because uh, if I go a little slow with that, it'll work. Nope, don't fly off the thing. Very careful. Very careful. Melon up to water. There we go. We'll inch it a little bit. Ever so gently. Ever so gently. Ever so gently. We'll go that way a little bit. We can take our time here. It's fine. Why rush perfection? Why rush something this beautiful? This beautiful, beautiful watermelon. Hopefully it doesn't like glitch through the bridge or something. That'd be very disappointing. Dee -dee -dee -dee. Come over this side. And then um yeah. It's all uh it's all cross bridge from here. I'd say downhill, but it's not down any hills. There are no hills. Keep going, Melon! Keep on going! Keep on going! Is what they'd tell me if I was playing DDR Mario Mix. 
always love the director from uh, the, the narrator from that game. Not the director. I don't even know who the director is. Pal, you want it? You want it? It's yours, my friend. As long as you have big enough watermelons. Whoa! Now that's a big old watermelon like I've never seen before. I don't even need to get out the caliper for this one. You win! That's the biggest darn watermelon smoothie I've ever seen. And out comes the shine sprite, because now the machine's broken. Or maybe it's not broken. That'd be pretty cool, though, to be able to have, like, your, uh, your blender installed <laughs> into your ceiling. I love how also Mario grabs the shine sprite and then right after sinks and starts standing, like, very lightly on top of the blades. Like, not the blades themselves, but everything around the blades. Right in the middle. The little, uh, the, the rotor, as opposed to the state, or the, the fan blades. Love it. Love it, love it, love it. I think the car is to settle. No, get off of here. Get out of here, fly. Get out of here, fly. Get away from my clementine. It's not a clementine. It's an orange. I just want another piece of my orange. There we go. Nice. Um. I think that's it over there, right? If I take a look at Gelato Beach, that should be all of them. Oh. All right. Wasn't there a thing of- Oh, the shine souls, that's what I got caught on. Got of each, got them all, except for the coins. But uh, that's good for now. Haven't yet unlocked Yosh. So I will go to which one was next? Was it the park or no, it's um Noki Bay. Which you get if you look up at the sun. Remember, children and those who are not children, uh, if you look directly into the sun, you'll unlock a new area. So don't forget. Or do. You'll probably be better off if you do forget. To the sun. To the sky! Noki Bay! Uncork the waterfall! This was always one of my favorite levels. I love the music here, and I just love the aesthetic. And then, in this level as well, is also one of my least favorite missions. The one where you have to go down and clean the eel's teeth, because that one was terrifying to me as a child. Oh, welcome back to my happy zone. We heard much about you, yes, and all of it good. As for me, I'm just an old man who loves nothing but fishing. But, lately, I've had a terrible problem. Please, look up there. You see that asshole that looks like a mole? Well, he's a mole, and he's blocked my waterfall, and he's gooed all over the mountainside. He's gooed so much that we can actually see it with our visible eyes. I don't want to know about the physiology that leads to a goo of that color, but even still, whatever. I don't know who did it. Someone corked our waterfall. Oh, you know that thing I said about the mole up there? Yeah. I can't see him, because I'm old. So forget that. I don't know who did it. This is no doubt why our lovely bay has become polluted. Because there's not enough water flowing to wash away all the pollutants to some other ocean? Yes. That makes sense. That makes total sense. <laughs> And I can't even fish, and so I ask for your help. Yank that cork! Today's episode on Yank That Cork, we've got our special contestant, that Clover Boy. How's it going, Clover Boy? Today on Uncork That Cork, we have to ask one question. Can we uncork that cork? I say yes. Please fulfill this old man's wish. Ah! That was him coughing. What's that? You'll do it? <laughs> Thank you so much. Thank you so much. You're not very good today. Oh, would you would you feel like sharing? You're more than welcome to share if you'd like to. No pressure, though. If at the very least, we hope that we can make you better over here. Here on Uncork That Waterfall! The only game show where you can uncork a waterfall or else all of your friends and family will perish in the polluted waters and you'll never be able to fish again. The stakes are high. The stakes are very high here on Uncork That Waterfall. Uncork that water. There we go. Oh my gosh, your service got nuked. And DDoS, that's terrible. What do you get to do to fix that? Yeah, I wonder if you had any... Uh, I don't know too much about like being able to prevent DDoSs and whatnot. But I can imagine the cleanup work is going to have to be a little... Uh, pretty extensive. On the bright side, I gotta rebrand too. Or else I guess it'll get redosed again. Yeah, that's terrible, it sucks. I mean, I suppose if you're a believer in faith, then that might mean that the Sherex was never meant to 
Never meant to succeed to begin with. And this is merely paving the way for something even better. Eh, I'm sure it'll take a lot of work and whatnot. And, but that's just the, I guess, bright side of everything. Type thing. That's the way I'd like to see it. But then again, I'm sure I haven't gone through something like that. So I can't say I understand. Or be able to vibe with you, but... 500 active users? Well, you know what? Maybe with the rebrand, you'll have over a thousand. Things can only get... I mean, su supposedly, right? The way I see it is if you're at rock bottom, if you would consider this rock bottom, then you can only go up from here. But it does take a lot of effort and whatnot. Which, I mean, if you're a... If you're the best kind of owner, the best kind of developer, the best kind of person who has that like that, you'll be able to bring it back up again. I, for one, am not a web developer myself. Uh, I don't really know too much about web dev stuff, to be honest. And that's just because I don't have the exposure for it. We never covered that stuff in uh, online classes and whatnot. I've tried to make a website before, and uh, it's still up there. I just, uh, it, it never looked the way that I wanted it to be. Uh, but I've done some back-end stuff and some front-end stuff as well, but that's it. It's only ever been some. But I'm always willing to learn if I can help somebody else out this. If there is help needed, of course. I do like to see what I can... Besides, if I never give it a shot myself, I'll never know if I'm good at it. Let's see what's over here. Ooh, springboard. Oh, that wasn't that wasn't good. That wasn't good. I don't, won't make it. Ah! Can I see that site? I don't think it's willing to share right now. It's nothing that I was able to... It's literally just bare HTML that says, Hi there, my name's Cameron. And that, that's about it. I've had, I had a, a, a book that I was looking through to try to learn how to see it or try to learn how to get things running But um, I really didn't get that far with it. It was like a couple week venture And then I had to focus on class stuff. So I really haven't gotten back to that But recently I've actually had the urge to go back and try it out a little bit again. Oh, I've run out of water Oh, That sucks Oh, wow, well, I gotta go back down here. I think is there Is there water down here? Is there anything, like, water-related? No. Okay, well, let's see how far I can get without water, and if I need to go back down, I will. Oh, dear. No, I need water. Actually, I think if I destroy one of these little guys, some of them drop water bottles. No. Oh, okay. Dokie dokie. Oh, there's the water bottle I was thinking of. There we go. That'll be enough water for now. Wow, you are just gooing up the place. Incredible. I mean, so, as I think about it, if you'd like to see the side... I can definitely show it to you, but it's not much. It's definitely not much. Oh, can I not use this anymore? Oh, oh, has it been, can I only use it once? Do I have to, why are you tiny? Oh, oh, I can't do it. Maybe I can get up a different way. Yeah, like that, no, I don't think that's gonna work. Okay, I'm just gonna go the normal way then. The way that I'm supposed to be going on uncork that waterfall. Oh dear. Oh wow 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 oh. There we go. Let's go up. Oh dear. That's a lot of. That's a lot of goo balls. That is a lot of goo balls. Hello. Go Whoa. Hi there, goo balls. Okay. Hey, they got water inside of them. That would have been helpful. No goo water. Yes. That was a big water bottle. He likes that. I likes that a lot. Oh, look, there's another stream thing up there. Oh, and something to fill up my water. Lovely. Let's go. Oh, not like that. Not like that. Not like this. Okay. No, can I do that thing called wall jumping? I like that. There we go. And I come up here. And these special tablets over here hold a special secret. What do you got? A coin. Oh, wow. And a... I must have forgotten about those things. The little bird things. Bounce. Bounce. Oh, sweet. There's a one up up here. And, uh, and a little flower. Oh, that's cute. Can I water the flower? What if I water the flower? Water the flowers. Yeah. Oh, lovely. Oh, that's cute. Um. Yeah, this is the guy. I can take this. Oh, dear. Whoa, hello, hello! Did I do it? Oh, that hit him once. Let's do it again! Whoa, okay, you're gonna explode? I don't like- No! Oh, don't let me fall! Don't let me fall! Today on Uncorked That Waterfall, we have another special guest star, Monty Mole, who's a bit of an asshole today. Doesn't really want to play the game the way we intended it to, but you know what? That's why he must perish. Can we uncork that waterfall? 
The answer may shock you. Yes, yes we can. <laughs> yes we can! Mario the plumber uncorking waterfalls. Wahoo indeed! I'm gonna continue. <laughs> We're continuing this wonderful, wonderful journey. Wonderful, wonderful journey of uh, Super Mario, Supers, Marios, and Sunshines. It's a beautiful journey. And now we know that Mario has the power to uncork waterfalls. I knew it. The worst part about the DDoS attack is that someone hacked the uh, the OP account. Oh, jeez. And ordered a bunch of dollars of dedicated servers. Oh, jeez. Well, I mean, is that on, like, a credit card or something? Like, maybe you can get those taken back or refunded. Just be like, that was a boo-boo. I mean, technically, at that point, it's considered fraud, so... I feel like there must be a way, at least. Yeah, I'm a master. Well, that's good, at least. <laughs> I, would, I would think, like, that is a tricky situation to lose that much money. And without recourse, that's makes no sense. There must be something to that. Oh, the bank is an ass. Well, you know what? If your bank's being an ass, you gotta be assful back. Or else they're not gonna... They'll, be able, they'll probably just like, no, 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 we're not gonna do it. We're not gonna do it. But I bet if you fight hard enough, you'll be able to get that out of there. I know a lesson that I learned from my dear, dear mother is that if you keep asking for the manager enough, you will encounter the manager. What am I doing? The boss of Tricky Ruins. That's what I'm doing. If you, <laughs> if you scream hard enough, somebody is bound to listen at some point. And uh, she always, she always gets away. I call it the mommy magic because she does it very well, but I've uh, gained the ability to myself to be a bit of a pain in the ass to get what I want and whatnot. But you kind of got to be that in this cutthroat world. You kind of got to be an ass sometimes because the systems weren't made to be favorable to you. So uh, why do you have to be favorable to them? I mean, of course, attempt to be courteous in all that you do. But if you're not getting, if you're not getting what you need and you're being duped, then there is no need for you to be nice about it. That's how pirates got their way back in the days of... I don't know what I'm talking about. At least now you've got the five years of dual epic CPUs with 256 gigabytes of RAM. You're right. There is always a bright side. This is indeed a bright size. And you got it for five years too. Nice. I guess at that point, this is a bit of an opportunity, right? Now you've got them and you just got to figure out what to do with them. In a way, that is pretty, that is pretty good. I don't know, maybe more servers, or I, I don't know what you could do with those. Bitcoin mining, nah, I don't think there's any profit in that. I don't think the CPUs themselves would be very good for Bitcoin mining. You'd need <laughs> harder hardware. More paralyzable hardware. Are there any blue coins over here? Blue coins, blue coins, blue coins. No blue coins, but that's fine. 4x4 terabyte HDDs, too. Nice. Or even storage space. You gotta rent out the storage space, too, perhaps. Oh, does that not work anymore? Oh, I already did it. Oh, it's slowly going back to... Uh, <laughs> um, now can I... Now can I have it back? Oh, I gotta get in there for the timing. I mean, XM rigs, Moneros, that's... That's what's running on it right now. Nice. I don't know what that does. Enlighten me, if you will. I don't exactly know what that does. There we go. Can I get up? Ooh, there we go. Yes. Any blue coins? I see a blue one. There we go. That's a book. That's a coin. Make like ten dollars a day. It's not too bad. Not too bad at all. That's more than I make on most of the things that I do. So it winds up working out, I guess. Always a bright side, at least. I mean, it may not be as big as a bright side as you were incurring before, but oh, what's up, Goop boy? You're bla You're back. Go Gooper. Gooper. You're back again. So way back in the goop. You do not like. Give me, give me, give me. Okay, you're gonna hit me with the front ones. Whoops! Haha! <laughs> Why not try doing the thing with the. I don't know. I'm not even paying attention. You float. Let's take. Take this. Take it, take it, take it. You just keep on wanting to come back and goo up the world, don't you? Have you been polluting the beautiful waterfall? This man can't fish. He cannot live without his fishing. And you are here, messing up everybody's day. And for that, we do not appreciate. Goop up, Loopa. Outta here. Back on out of here. Smack. How does it feel to be uncorked there, Gooper Blooper? Huh? That's how the waterfall felt. Pretty nasty. Do, 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 do. Lesson learned. Always use PayPal and avoid linking credit cards anywhere. I would understand that. 
I mean, I think the only place that I have linked directly to, like, credit cards and whatnot is probably the Amazon account. And probably just... I've got it on my phone as well for ease of access and whatnot. But... Super Mario Poo Poo Factory! Well, I mean, this is a little inky. The, the, the poopy type stuff was definitely in the beginning where everything was, like, brown and stuff. But I opt more for the Chocolate Factory. The Chocolate Factory interpretation. But then again, all interpretations are correct and all interpretations will be audited by the end of the session. For if we don't audit things and double check our numbers, what kind of a business are we? A sad one. A sad one that lets, like, big old squiddy boys like this run rampant. Bye bye. Bye bye. Big old factory doing its thing. And now I can go inside the secret land. Oh, there we go. But it's secret because... Secret, secret, secret. It's secret because it wants to be. We don't need any more reason for it to be more secret. Are anything in here? Super special vases? What you got in those vases there? Anything of interest? Anything? Anything, 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 anything? There was a blue coin in that one. I don't know why. I don't remember there being... I don't remember there being blue coins in those things, but I just felt, I felt that urge to water the vases. And it worked out in my favor. But there was coin that was blue inside. Wonderful. Woo! We got another one. We're at 31 already. Is this an emulator? No. It is actually on the GameCube. I was planning on running it on my Wii, but the Wii does not want to output color, so... We're running it on an actual GameCube. This is the first time I'm streaming anything console related, which is cool. And it's working out pretty well. It was an absolute annoyance to get things set up. It was an absolute annoyance to get things set up, but... It's working now, and I'm happy with it. And it hasn't broken yet. If there's one thing that I'll give to the Roxio, which is the game capture device I'm using, it's very old. But if there's one thing that I'll give to it, it's an absolute bitch to set up. But once you do set things up, it seems to work really well. And uh, that's all I could really ask for. I find that there's, I have a lot more importance assigned to keeping things running if they've already started versus having things be easy to set up. Like, I'll, I'll take the annoyance of setting things up. Maybe I'll take an hour on it. But so long as I can go on to an interrupted, I'm happy with that. And I'll, I'll knock on that wood again. Because now saying that, it'll probably mess things up. Anyway... I've got it! Yes, I surely do have it! What have I got? A jar! By the answer to our polluted ocean problem, of course. And the answer is you. You must go to the ocean floor. <laughs> of course, of course. That's impossible for you at the moment, but therefore I've made an area for you to hone your skills. Now you got space suit on. Wear this and you can stay underwater for much, much longer use that flood to move around and get red coins it's cool like that i'm also a fancy scientist if you didn't already know but don't overdo it if you run low on air here's what you do just grab some regular coins to refill your meter okay there buddy now shall we get started how can you keep my guy check my output caps on the wii my friend we put the color in it fixed it yeah no i have a different cable i'm gonna try over the wii um uh, probably the next day or two that and also, uh, the Roxio was being really weird too. It was outload- it was outputting, um, black and whites, which, um, usually, I didn't know that you- if you would connect- I've got my words wrong. Okay, so I have the component cables, you know, the three different colors. And with the Roxio, you can't actually use component with it unless you have, like, an HDMI converter. So, uh, I had to get a converter, which took a couple of days, but no problem. And, uh, I got that working. Come on, come on, come on! Yeah, you got that thing. But so now it outputs in color, at least. I know for a fact that it's not just the Roxia that was causing me problems with the Wii, because not only was it capturing in black and white, but it was also outputting in black and white as well. So, oop, I gotta turn around. Turn around, get that, get that coin, get that coin, get that, get that, get that coin. Nope, please, this other way. The, con the controls. There we go. And I'll get that coin down there. Nope, don't do it. Whoa, why, why, why? No, thank you. I didn't mean to be vaulted up like that. I'm just gonna go down like this. I'm gonna get that little red coin and... Yes! There we go! Do I have the red, yellow, white combination or the red, green, blue cable combination? The red, uh, red, yellow, white 
is what comes out of the Wii. I could convert it to the um, the split component ones, the AV ones, but I had the I bought the converter and it works just fine. So uh, I'm I'm down with it. The only thing that I think is annoying about it is the fact that I have to have another little USB cable over there powering things up. But I got I got plenty of I got plenty of cables. Ain't no problem there. Oh, can I go in there? Is there something inside? Can Mario go inside? Mario can go inside. Oh, but he can also get, oh, get my stuff. Uh, can I come out? There we go. We have Skart. Right? What's a Skart? Is that a particular type of capture thing? Or a type of cable combination? I'm unfamiliar. You use a lot of cool acronyms, by the way. You got that industry knowledge that I seem not to have because I don't recognize a lot of the acronyms. I'm assuming it's an acronym for something. Or, or just short for something else. All right, there's one more coin in here. Where is it? If I go up here, perhaps I'll find, find, find my way. Where are you? Where are you? It's like VGA output for the TVs popular in Europe. Oh, okay. What color cables does that have? I suppose it's prop popular in Europe, I guess. That makes sense. VGA output for TVs. Okay. I got my VGAs, I got my DVIs, I got my HDMIs, I got my mini HDMIs, I've got my uh, display ports, I've got my components, I've got my AVs. I got a lot of cables. And it's a good thing I have a lot of cables because I always seem to find use for my cables. I also also, I also have a couple of um, uh, European power cables too. Don't ask me why. I, actually, this is why. Uh, I was picking up power cables from my school. They were like, I found a box of power cables on the outside of the lab, and I was like, are you guys throwing these out? And I was like, yeah, 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 yeah. And I was like, can I have some of them? And they said, uh, you don't want to take those. They're all broken, but I'll give you some new ones. Which ones do you need? And I got a bunch of power cables, the, the, the US ones, and then in that box were a bunch of European ones. I can't test if they work or not because I don't have any plugs for that, but I'm sure I could buy a tester online if I wanted to. Excuse me. The tea and the, uh, the, the tea and the oranges. They're making me get that. Let me get that gas in my tummy. This was one of the most terrifying things that I did as a child. Cleaning the eel's teeth. I was terrifying when I was younger. Does not have color cables, just like a thick cable with a huge plug on the end. Oh, nice, nice. I had to look into that. I need context, so I'm gonna I'm gonna write that down. Skirt cable. Soon I will know. Grandpa's waiting for you up top. Oh, don't forget to wear this. You might need it. You can use this river as a shortcut to get, ready, get to Grandpa. All right. Shortcut. Shortcut. And then there's something up there. There's a big blue coin up there, and I want to access that. So I'm going to try that first, because it seems that I can only do that little uh, bouncy thing once a level. Yeah, we're going to go way up like this. Da -da 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 -da. Oh, you sent me a message of it on Discord. Thank you for the reference. I'll take a check on that later. I usually don't check my Discord when I'm streaming. Too distracting to me. But I do look up. I look over everything later. I always do. Everything that I've been told to. Everything that gets mentioned, I wind up researching for myself too. Because then the next time it comes up, I'll be at least vaguely aware of what somebody's talking about. All right. So I want to get all the way up to the top. I want to get all the way up to the top. How can I do that? There we go. Climb like that. And... Oh, it seems like I can get up this way. There we go. I hope that doesn't come all the way. What is this? Ooh. I guess it's probably a way for me to... Nope, that... I don't know what this is here for. Okay. Where do I go from here? Oh, there's a blue coin! Oh, lovely! Oh, and if I had the rocket nozzle, it would make things easier. I see now. And it also has audio support, too. Oh, okay. So it's kind of like, it, I think it's more equivalent to, like, I guess, an HDMI or a display port, because that also has the audio in it as well. Or some H... I, I think... Oh, you send me down. You bastard. Alrighty, then. That's cool. That's cool, I guess. I mean, I guess it's equivalent, right? I know some... Not all HDMI cables, I think, can do audio. But it's VGA. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. I don't believe VGA has sound. I don't think it does. Otherwise, what does VGA stand for? Video graphics mm. apparatus? I'm unsure. As I look up to the sky, let's ask the Google. What does VGA stand for? Come on, Google. Video graphics array. Oh, video graphics away array. That's it. That's the one. 
Nice. Nice, nice, nice. I knew I was close for a little bit. At least I got that, uh, that blue coin. Oh, oh Mario, you're finally setting out of the up. Blah, 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 blah. We got it, we got it. Yeah, we understand. Oh, those little Noki people are just so cute. iPhone or Android? I run Android. I like my Android stuff. I like the uh, customizability and control I have over an Android phone versus an iPhone. Too many things that iPhones tell me not to do that I'm like, but, but, but I want to. And that's why I go Android. <laughs> Android best. At least from that frame of thought. My fiance uses uh, iPhone though, because, and, and the Apple OS because she's prone to breaking technology. And I, I agree. Like, if you are prone to breaking technology and you don't want that much control over things or might get yourself tripped up, then you might, might want something that does it all for you, like, a, like an iPhone would. So that's why she opts for stuff like that. It's just not my style. But I've seen a use for both. I used to be the kind of person who's just like, Bleh, Apple sucks in every way, shape, and form. I'm enlightened now. I think there's a there's a time and place for everything. I'm an Android kind of guy. She is an iPhone kind of, an Apple kind of girl. And that's just a beautiful, beautiful thing. Somehow you do nothing but break them. Yeah, yeah you do. Somehow you do. Whether you be stepping on them or just existing around them. It's, it's okay, because sometimes I can fix it. You like Redmi and Miwi. Is that a type of Android builds? You don't look like you're ready. The gunk in the ocean is caused by... You guessed it, a giant eel at the bottom of the ocean. <laughs> a giant eel! It's moved into our ancestral home. At the seafloor, and it's nursing some nasty, nasty cavities down there. So you know what you're gonna do? You're gonna be its dentist. It's a UI thing made by Xiaomi. Okay. Nice. There's some cavities. Let's take a look-see. Yeah, let's take a look-see. Oh, there's a blue coin down there. I read that down, too. Red me. Red me and... Xiaomi. You are. All that stuff. Looks really cool and responsive. I like that. I'll admit, usually I don't wind up changing things unless I have a reason to. Like, if I get fed up with something, I'll wind up making a change. And I've been very, very, pleas very pleasant with the... Um, the Android UIs that I've got and interfaces. Uh, I got a Google phone right now. It's the Pixel 2 or uh, Pixel 4a. I like it. It's nice. They tried to change things on me, and I was like, no, 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 no. We're putting those gestures back. Here we go. Time to go make some, or rather, not make those cavities. Isn't it beautiful down here? A little. It's the ancestral home down here, and there's a giant freaking eel down there. Look, there's its eyes. This one always terrified me as a kid. Anyway, I'm not so terrified anymore. It's not that scary now. Yes, it seems that I'm losing air. My sensors show highly toxic bubbles. Capture study in a little bit. Oh no! I hope not. Hopefully that'll fix itself in a little bit. Thank you for letting me know though. It looks pretty good from my end. It might be on a year end thing, but I'm not so sure. Oh, if I pop these bubbles. I've also got it monitoring over here as well, and it looks pretty good for me, but. Let me know if it continues occurring. I might see it pop up on my side. Let's clean your cavities. Let's clean your cavities. Ooh, we'll get that gold tooth. It seems we're being attacked by the plague. There's another one. No, more cavity. Oops, got the goo. Okay, nope, don't suck me in. Please, please do not capture me. Please don't get me in. I don't like that. Oh, I need help. I don't have help. Okay, let's, let's go down. Can I go down faster? Faster, faster, please. Do not die! I don't want to die! There we go, I'll take this. There we go. Get some of those coins. Get some coins, get some coins, get some, get some, get some coins. There we go, let's go back up. Hey, pal. Hey there, buddy. Hey, you going up again? Open your mouth! Everything seems to be solved by opening of the... Everything to accomplish in this game all seems to be accomplished by opening of the creature's mouth. I guess... Did I get that one too? Okay, got another one. Uh, there's a tooth there. Ah, uh, come on, come on, come on. Come on, come on, come on. There we go! Get that, get that, get that! Yes! Do we do it? Oh, it's nice and sparkly now. And then I'll go over here and collect some more coins. Think it's okay, though you're not watching consistently. Well, thank you for your input nonetheless. I appreciate everybody's input who is giving me input. And I appreciate everybody who is not giving input either. I know you're there, and it's okay, and I appreciate you nonetheless. Come on there, eel boy. Girl? Eel thing! 
eel. You got the lady side and the boy side, it seems. I like you. Represent. I like that. Come on up there. Eely, 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 eely. Oh, well, don't like... Don't like... Don't be too bad. That's... Got a teeth mission over here. I know one of these teeth wind up being, um... They kind of get launched out. Oh, actually, it might have been one of the ones I already cleaned up. They're cavity-inducing. Okay, um... I don't want that. Come on. Cavities. Cavities, cavities, cavities. I like those cavities. They're taking me a little bit. There we go. There's another one. And hopefully another one. Hopefully another one. Oh, okay. Maybe not. Are you heading back down? Oh, you're gonna swirl again. Oh, it seems that I need some more help. Alrighty then. Uh, let's go over here. Plenty of coins over here. Plenty of coins on this side of the stage. Yeah! Is there anything special over here? Like, are there blue coins? I, I wouldn't even know. I don't think I've ever looked for blue coins in this location. But I'm sure there are some. There must be. I just don't know where. Vortex! Oh, okay. The spinning vortex of dentistry. Oh, do we do it? Oh, do we? Oh, there's one more. I saw one more. Hey, what are you doing? Hey, uh, hey, what are you doing? Hey, what, what you what you doing down there? You don't like that, do you? You don't like it when your teeth come out. I can imagine so. I'd be pretty annoyed, too. Oh, there's one more. One more right over here. You gotta clean it up. Oh, almost cleaned it up. Oh, I'm getting a little... Getting a little suffocating. A little asphyxiable. A little drowny. Drowny? A little drowny. Spin, spin, spin. I can probably... I can hopefully do this before... Uh, there's a lot of bubbles there. I don't like that. Oh, uh, there's some points. Yeah. Didn't think I had enough health for that one. But maybe for this next one. Are you still here? Are you still here? You're still here. And you're turning, too. Perfect. You will eventually turn to over here. I hope. I hope. Oh, you got over there. This little one. This little toothy tooth over here. A little difficult. Yeah, a little bit. A little... Yeah! Remember to take proper care of your teeth! Says the robot that is on my back. Oh, so your tooth is gold because you've got, I bet, a shine sprite in it, don't you? Little drum roll. Yeah, not too bad. Not too bad at all. The most terrifying parts of this game, I believe, are behind me. Oh, actually, you know what? Mecha Bowser was pretty terrifying, too. Oh, it's got a little heart on the bottom. Because they appreciates it. Thank you so much for cleaning my teeth. You're welcome, eel monster. We support good dental hygiene around here. I, for one, had braces when I was a young lad. My mother would always tell me we spent a lot of money on those teeth, so you might as well smile. Well, I'm smiling all right, because I got plenty of reasons to smile. Plenty of reasons to frown, too. But I think the reasons to smile are ones that I can readily create to outweigh the reasons to frown. Let's do another one! Honestly, I wonder how far I'll get in this today. I don't really have an intended time that I plan to stop. I just really, really wanted to play Super Mario Sunshine. Il Piantissimo Surf Swim. That was a thing that I did, like, before I before I streamed. One of the reasons I really wanted to stream was there were times when, like, I'd be hanging around on the weekend and I'd just do nothing but, like, just play some games. And I'm like, you know what? I could really... Like, I have a lot of fun with these games, and maybe somebody else will have some fun too, to be honest. And I figured if I did this and put this live on the, you know, for people to join along with, maybe I won't be the only person to enjoy just, like, my days of playing games on the weekend. I haven't done one of these in a while. Like, I, like, I start and do it in the morning, and then just go till whenever I want to. Oh, well, now something I missed the first one. And now I challenge you to a race to the flag! Go! The flag is over there! Seems pretty easy. Seems I'm not so to me. It is a race to the finish. The best time is 40 seconds. Are you at the ready? And then get the set. Go. All right. I meant to do that. I, I didn't mean to do it like that, though. There we go. Your swim. You're a pretty fast swimmer there. Aren't you, Piazzissimo? 
That'll work for me. There we go. I think that was easy enough. Unless he gets there within like the next few seconds. Nope, he did not. Come over here, LP Adizimo. Come hither. Hello. How you doing? Oh, <laughs> you're quite the speedy. You like a fish? You may not be the slow clam chopper I took you for. <laughs> Gotta head on out of here? No problem, Clover boy. I'm happy that you could pop around for a little bit while you did. I hope everything goes out well for you. Well, I mean, it's currently not going well right now, but I'm sure it'll be a bright side on the end of it. And I'll, I'll hope for it. I'll cross my fingers for it. Best of luck, my friend. Shine Sprite. Gotta, gotta, gotta. Gonna try to do a GTA mission again? Oh, go for it. I haven't done a lot of GTA. I don't think I've ever actually... I, I have played GTA at least once, but I was over at a friend's house, and actually, they really weren't much of a friend's house. It was more of an acquaintance at the time. And they were like, come on, we gotta play GTA. And I was like, okay, we can play GTA if you want to. And he was like, <laughs> my favorite part is when you kill everybody with the guns. And I was like, you are really freaking me out, pal. And uh, I haven't played GTA since then. There was also another person, a, a different person, who I think we played... Zombie Island or something? What is, I don't know. You were on this island where there were a bunch of zombies all over the place. And this was one of the weirdest ways to make contact with another person's family for the first time. Um, he's like, you want to come over to my house? I'm like, yeah, sure, I'll come over to your house. I mean, I don't really want to, but I'll give this kid a chance. And as soon as we walked over to his house, his older brother and everybody else in the house basically were all watching the Human Centipede 2. And I was like, oh, I'm a young boy, and I don't really like movies like that, and I'm feeling very uncomfortable right now. I was like, okay, uh, can we can we hang outside? He's like, yeah, we can hang outside. Hung out there for a little while, just kind of chatted over an orange juice or whatever it was, and I really wasn't very into that. The shell secret, I have to get that top of the shell. That's what I'm doing. I wasn't really into that either, to be perfectly honest. And then he's like, you want to play video games? I'm like, yeah, I love video games. Let's play video games. And we played the zombie island thing, and don't get me wrong, like, I I'm not, like, totally averse to games with guns and whatnot. Like, I've, I've uh, let's see. Soul Worker and stuff like that. I love me Halo. A classic example. I love playing Halo, so I'm not totally averse to stuff like that. But, like, this one just seemed a little more gory for my particular tastes. And so we played that for a, and he, we played that for a little bit, and then he's like, oh, but you know what? This isn't fun. I've beaten this game so many times. This is the way I love to play it. And he entered in some cheat codes, and we were just playing in God mode. Which, to me, I don't know. There isn't enough challenge there for me to be entertained. There's like, there's there's too much power that you have. Peace out, Clover Boy. No, no, no. I don't, I don't like, get, like, if you earned God Mode, like, if I worked my way up to being able to, like, destroy everything with the power to, you know, combine suns together and explode planets, like, if I worked for that, that'd be really cool. And I think I might enjoy that. But, like, just putting in the cheat codes to be able to have access to everything, I mean, I guess you're probably, you're probably not doing that unless you've played through the game already and you're trying to get more out of it. And I understand that. But, like, this was my first thing to the game. I was like, this is... I mean, I'll admit, buddy, I'm not really... This is not really my kind of game. And, uh... Also, too, we also went to the carnival one time, and he got really, really close to me in a, one of the carts. And at the time, I was like, I am very uncomfortable right now. I don't really want to hang out with you again. This is, this is not fun for me. I was very uncomfortable at the time. Uh, I haven't talked to him since then. And then, actually, no, a little bit after... I, I, I hadn't talked to him since then, right? And then I, I see him afterwards, uh, during my senior year of high school. He was a grade above me. And he's like, hey, by the way, guess what? I actually got held back a year, so we get to graduate together. And I was like, oh, that's, that's, that's cool. Awesome. We get to graduate together. Well, if you have any help with anything, like, you know, obviously, let me know. And, uh, yeah, I never heard from him after that either. Just, just kind of disappeared. Oh, come on, these silly, bouncy things. Where's the top of that shell? Where is the top of that shell? I know the shell secret is over here. Oh well. Oh, it's over there. <sighs> silly me. Silly, silly me. It'll be a super, super shot of Mario level. Here we go. Take my flood from me, I dare you. Bye bye. <sighs> oh, I don't remember this one very well. Oh, yes I do. I actually did, there was a Hat in Time workshop level. That was very similar to this. And I always got stuck on this part, but you have to wall jump. I never forgot that. I never forgot that you have to wall jump there, or else you wouldn't, you know, you wouldn't be able to do what you need to do. And one of these, I think, has a 1-up, too, and I want one of those. Because I think I only have one life. I really haven't been gaining lives. I think I only have two lives? 
I haven't really been proactive with keeping myself alive over here. So let's continue onwards. There's definitely I gotta get that. Gotta get that. Gotta get that light thing. Can it jump up the There is always a problem jumping on top of these nails. Because they're so tiny. They're so very tiny. So very tiny indeed. So very tiny indeed. Is there one in this one? Nope, it's just coins. They're just coins. Only coins. Maybe it's this one. It's probably over here. They usually don't give you the one-up like at the very beginning. You have to do something treacherous. Therefore, there's at least a small percent chance that you will die in between yourself and the mushroom. No matter how small it is. Is it this one? It's this nail! Awesome. I got one of those. There we go. Whoops. There we go. Not too bad. I honestly thought that one was not going to work out for me, but it did. Yeah. All right. How's it going? That's oh, going lovely over here, uh, dearest Disney queen. I'm having a good time. It's great. I, I, I've been eating. I've been eating stuff. I had a nice egg sandwich this morning. Nice bit of coffee. Nice bit of tea. I've got some oranges over here. I'm staying healthy. Don't you worry. Don't worry about me. Can't be healthy. Oh, I can climb up this. Micro bakes. I've had one break so far. But I will take another one soon. I feel I feel a break coming on. Soon. Soon. I do feel that. Don't worry. I feel that. You need to at least stand up and make- Whoa! What the hell was that? Whoa! Okay. Wasn't expecting that one. Wow! Alrighty then. Get up and stand and move. Here, here's my get up and stand for a little bit. I'm gonna stand and move around. There we go. This is my stand and move thing for now. Thank you for reminding me to get up and move. Get up and move that body. We're walking a little bit around here. Work those legs. Work those arms. Yes. There we go. Is that micro break enough for you? Feels pretty micro break. Honestly, it feels so micro that I feel like that break could have been longer. <laughs> Thank you. You're so welcome. Anything for you, dearest. Oh, let's get on the green. Get on the green. Yeah. How's your work going so far? I'm sure you've made a plenty of progress. As much progress as you can. And even if it's not a lot of progress, that's okay. You've made some progress, and some progress is infinitely better than no progress. And that's good. Alright, let's see about... There we go. And then I can do this. And then I can do that. Um, we come back in, and I can do this, and then that, and woo! Alright! Like 40-ish percent through the info you're missing from Neuro. Alright! You got this! You got this! I believe in you! I believe in you! And then the reward will be hanging out and playing some, uh, what was it, board games? I think board games this next weekend. That's what it is. There we go, if I keep moving up there, it's not a problem. That's probably how that is. Just finding it, then applying it. That's the toughest part. I think that my, in my opinion, the toughest part of any sort of learning quest of sorts is the part of the application. That's what I think, at least. And I'm sure for some it's a lot easier. But not for me. Oop, you gotta... Oop, there we go. Perfect. And I think there's a... There's something at the end over there. It might just be a life, and I don't need it. Fire! Fire, fire, burn! For the Mario! And then just more wood blocks. These ain't too bad. I hope I don't fall off. Because they get increasingly faster, too, so you have to switch faster. You gotta get a little bit of a diagonal in here when you move. Or else you die. We don't want to die around here. I Actually, I can't speak on behalf of the Mario crew, but I don't think Mario wants to die. I think it just kind of happens. <laughs> Alrighty, then. Not too, too bad. Maybe we just gotta spin up here. Just gotta jump at the right. There we go. Where's my shine of I don't have to my shine of spritte. There we go. Shine of spritte. Awesome. That's another one. I can't remember how many shine sprites there are in this game. Let me, let me at least get that. Let me at least figure out. How many shine sprites are in Super Mario Sunshine? 120, shine 120, the classic number. 
The goal is all of Neuro today, then Ortho, and then reviewing Neuro. You got this. I believe in you. I believe in you. Come back anytime, dearest. I love you. Oh, there's a fly around here. Bye bye, fly. Hold it, Shadow Mario. I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get you real good. I'm gonna get you real good. If I just hit you from over here. Can I get you from over here? Oh, you start moving. Unfortunate. Oh, you're swimming. You're doing the swimmy swims. This one's always annoying, because, like, he's doing his thing, right? There we go, there we go, there we go, there we go. Where you got? Where you at? No, I can't believe I did that. Yes! I mean, he went over that way. It's not like it's very, um... It's not like it's very difficult to go after. Because there's kind of a clear path of where he's going. Come on, come on, come on. Ooh, you, 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 you. There we go. Slowly but surely. We'll win that race. Oh, come on now. What are we doing shit up there? Oh. Oh, darn it. Shadow Mario's gotten away from me again. But not for long. Oh, I can't see you. I cannot see you. But that doesn't mean I can't feel you. Okie dokie, and you're heading up there? I'll follow! I'll follow back the other way, if I, if I can. Can I? Thank you. Thank you, Mario! Where are you going? Not where are you going, pal? There we go! You can run, but you can't hide. Curses! I won't forget this! You won't? Yeah, clearly you won't. You didn't forget it any of the other times. Or maybe you did forget any of the other times because you keep saying that you won't forget this. Therefore, I have reason to doubt that you actually remember the last time you told me that you were not going to forget this. Alas. I'll try not to look too far into it. I'm sure Shadow Mario's got, got his thing to do. Bowser Jr. Got his thing to do. I think I'll complete Noki Bay because there's one more left. And then afterwards, I'll take a little break again. Um... I'm like halfway through my tea. So maybe I should drink more of it. I'll probably grab another little snack too. I've got my orange over here that I've yet to complete. Um, this tastes great. I love this orange. Nothing like orange to bring your body up. The red coin fish! We've been waiting for you, Mario! Grab us at the top as usual. Please wear this again, okay? You can use this rope as a shortcut to the top. Sure! Sure there, pal. I can do that for you, little youngster. Little young shell boy. Go up here, and Perfect. That worked out perfectly. The inverted camera still gets me sometimes. Where is he at again? He's probably at the top of the waterfall, right? We're so top of the waterfall. He loves hanging up there. He loves to do his hanging at the top of the waterfall. Right? Are you over here, buddy? Grandpappy! Pappy Shell! Are you over here? Oh, that didn't work. That kind of worked. Yeah, there we go. Pappy Shell. Pappy Shell, you up here? Oh, there you are, Pappy Shell. We're going back in the water again. Mario, our people have all come back at least, at last, to show our thanks. We've prepared a fine treasure for you. It lies on the ocean's floor, so please go down there and claim it. I'm not going to get it for you. This fishing rod doesn't go far enough. Just remember to watch your life meter. Go righty then. Here we go. Into the depths of the abyss again. Oh, it's just, it's a fish. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yep, it's all the fish. I remember this one very much. Aw, oh, what a lovely, what a lovely sound. Oh, I do remember this one. I remember specifically that the fish can, like, break apart and then come back together. Oh, you're over there. I see. Oh, I got some coins. Okay. I need to go the other direction. Fishy, fishy, fishy! Fishy made of goodness and grace. That worked. Oh, you didn't like that. <laughs> I wouldn't either. 
I wouldn't like the idea of somebody ripping my body apart piece by piece. Something about that just feels morbid. Where'd you go, Fishy? I know you're up here. Where are you? Oh, there you are! Hello, Fishy. Can I get that one, please? I got another one. I got another one. Maybe if I... If I just let the fish pass through me. I am become one fish. One with fish. Nope, okay. So I guess... If I just continue along the path that it was giving for me, maybe I'll, uh... Maybe I'll be able to catch up with it. I don't know. I hope it's coming back together. But where is it coming back together? Right there. Ah, so I was kind of correct. Oh, there's another one. There's another one. Oh, there's one. And another one. Ah, la 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 la. Oh, it's close. Oh, it's close. Oh, it is so close. Oh, well. There's one more left. Easy mode. That's not difficult at all. Oh, hello, fish. Fish, what are you... No, stop, stop. No, no, no. Fishy, no. No, go back the other way. If I wait here, as it plops around... Ooh. Fishy, 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 fishy. Fishy tail. Fishy tail. Come here, fishy tail. I almost got you. Nope, almost. Nope. Okay, there you go. Bye. All right. This will be the hardest one, I'm sure. That last one is always the hardest. Um, we're coming back together somewhere over here. There we go. Which way are you swimming? Are you swimming the other way? Oh, no, you are swimming that way. I just wasn't looking the right place. There we go. Not bad there, Cameron. Pat on the back. Oh, my life total is purple now. I guess that means I'm okay. I will not lose my life, maybe? I don't know. Oh, no, okay, I had like a little thing, I guess. Maybe it was in a, I don't know. Anyway, down to the bottom of the ocean floor. Down to the bottom of the ocean floor. There's something shiny down there. And therefore I must touch. Touch. Gotcha. That was something that was touch-worthy. We'll save and continue back to Delfino Plaza. And with that, I will take a little bit of a break. I'll get up, stretch my legs a little bit. Um, probably get myself another snack so I have more things over here. I've only got the orange and the tea. I need more. And also, I've noticed that there's no music on the break screen, so I'll fix that before, before I head off and do my things. Be back in a little bit.
Welcome back, everyone. I hope the music was at least soothing while I was gone. I managed to fix that. I've got some new snacks for myself. It's kiwis! Got more kiwis. I tend to be very happy with the amount of fruit that I get. Hey, speaking of fruit, hey, what do you want? Hello! Oh, uh, you want to work for me for a little bit? I'd love for you to bring me some fruit. I'm craving some. But then, bring me three, would you? Just bring the fruit here and put it in this basket, okay? Sure, I'll do that for you. Anything to help out a pretty lady such as yourself. <laughs> oh. Mario walks away and is like, no. Too much, too much banana. Oh, there needs to be three. And there's four over here. I thought, for a moment, I thought there were only two bunches of banana. In which case, I may have some trouble bringing her the bananas that she requires. But, if there's four and I only need three, then that's not difficult at all. Get it up. Hey, let me get me. There we go. Ba -dum -ba -dum. I don't remember that sound effect. That seems new to me. There's always new things to discover in the games that you thought you were used to. Unless you've played it, like, to the 100% mark, and you have absolutely godlike memory. In which case, I, I guess there's nothing new for you here. Get a different game. Oh, come on, drop, drop, the, drop the banana. Drop the banana. Mario, the banana. Drop it. Drop. Not like that, silly plumber. Drop the banana. Stop right there! Banana thief! You didn't pay for those! <laughs> I didn't do it! It's not my fault! The bananas regenerate. How did I not notice that? Oh, because they keep disappearing, so they keep respawning. That makes sense. That's three bananas, but by the way, you should have been more specific. You said three bananas. Every single bushel I give you is three bananas. But you see, what you actually wanted was three bushels of bananas, or three bunches of bananas, if you will. Next time, be a little more specific. Thanks, sweetums. You're welcome. Not coin. And Noki Bay has been completed. So, Peanut Park seems to be the one that's next. But alas, you know what I'll try to do? Break some more boxes. And I know I can break more boxes. I can break more boxes. The ultimate box breaker. Hi there. Break all the crates in 30 seconds. You got it. I'm gonna break some boxes. Box breaker. Box break. Gotcha. How do you like those broken boxes? Broken bo boxes that are broke. <laughs> I like them very much, actually. Thanks so much for cleaning up my place. Here's this shine thing that I found. I'm not actually gonna give you any money or so. You find these things important? Oh, okay. You can take it, I guess. It's like paying somebody in, like, spoons. Like, hey, I I'm the spoon man. I learned I work for spoons. Like, you'll work for spoons? Okie dokie. I've got some spoons. Want to clean my house? Like, yes, I will do it for spoons. And you're like, okay. Spoon man doing spoony things. Are there any... I'm gonna look for at least one blue bird around here to collect another blue coin. And I think there's at least one on top of these buildings over here. I don't know where they are. I see green ones. I see green little tweety tweets. Yeah, green little tweety tweets. That's, that's that. Oh, there's a blue one right there. I'm blind. I'm coming after- No, where are you going? How dare you fly away before I have a chance to squirt you? Oh well, you'll be back. You'll be back. They always come back to their perching place. Those birds. Oh, did I not get- Oh, I wasn't close enough to the bird. I have to be very quiet. I have to be very careful so the birds land. As soon as you try to perch back over here, I'll get you. Oh, I'll get you. I'll get you. There you go. I got your bird. 
Mario yet again takes out another member of the ex almost extinct and endangered blue bird population in Isle Delfino, making himself worth more in a bounty than he was by graffitiing up the entirety of the town. But that one wasn't me. I actually killed the birds. He was framed for graffitiing, but he fully takes responsibility for the extinction of our endangered blue bird species, the national bird of Delfino Isle. What say you, Luigi? Okay. Luigi's learning to talk again. He was mute to begin with, and now he's at least making sounds. Like, we all started at sounds. And I'm cool with that. Hey, buddy, how you doing? <laughs> Just kidding. I don't care. Ah, oh, Mario, deal with it. <sighs> hey, Toad's worth. <laughs> yeah, funny name. Nice. Oh, you're really getting a little squishy. Mecha Bowser appears in the park. This one also terrified me as a child. Many of these things terrified me as a child. The mole that hangs over there also kind of terrified me as a child. I was very, I must have been a very tired, very scared boy. And I was. I'm a very scared boy when I was younger. Very timid. But now I use my words to defend myself against scary things. Which, don't get me wrong, if I was up against a giant mecha turtle a dinosaur thing monster and all I had were my words, I don't think I'd survive, to be honest. I'd be like, hey, you thing, don't hurt me and my family or I'll, I'll insult you. And then they'd stare back at me kind of like, what's going on right now? And he'd be like, Words don't work, John. And then this shit will happen. You know. Imagine I was in Mario's place and I just said, I'm gonna insult you. And Shadow Mario is just like, Give me the best you got. And then Bowser comes up and he's just like, yeah, I'll show you to talk back to my son. I know Bowser's got a little hole on the bottom. Maintenance port, I'm sure. Also, the sound effects that they have here with, like, the, um, I don't know what the instrument is, but the one that's going, like, almost sounds like rattlesnakey. That really sold the fact that this thing is a terrifying monster that I need to be afraid of. And I was afraid. Alrighty, then. Oh, you guys are great! Whoever hired you needs a raise! I love how you play the Pharaoh's hero, and he's like, oh my, he's like a bad version of you, but you both look like the same and stuff. Well, I mean, as director of the park, I want to show your success, so I'm gonna help you defeat the guy who looks like you, and you're probably just playing a game. My god, this is just so entertaining. So, how about I provide you with a hero's vehicle, huh? Like, a, like, a, uh, it's a, it's a, it's a roller coaster, you see? You get inside the vehicle, and you can shoot rockets from it. It's not safe, but uh, it was for debugging purposes, and we just kept with it. This song is also an absolute bop, but also made the whole experience here a little more terrifying. Also, if you notice, I mean, in my opinion, Bowser's chest kind of looks like the GameCube controllers. That, that might hit. I cannot remember. Let's try that one, too. I can, yeah, I can explode that with water, right? Gotcha, baby! Don't hurt me! Oh, I'm trying to, I was trying to, oh, forgot, camera's reversed. Oh, that didn't work. Can I have another one? I want another one. That might work. Oh yeah! Try to douse the flames! Trying to douse the flames! I douse the flames! Yes! I've doused the flames! And I'm gonna blow those up ahead. Hello! I could probably get a shot from over here. Maybe. Ah, uh, maybe. Nah, that was a little tight. Whoa, hi there. Hello there. <laughs> Hello there. Hello, bullet bills. Bills of the bullets. A bullet bill approaches. What shall I do? 
probably shoot at Bowser or something. Oh dear. I'd like to use this as a proper opportunity, but I can't really see right now. It's a little, uh, little woozy doozy. Ah, that didn't really work in the way that I wanted it to, but... Down the flame! Oh, there's more! Oh, there's more! Hello there! Big bullet bills, there's more! Oh, there's more in front of me. Of course. Get him. Oh, I totally missed it. Two of them? Are there more? Could there possibly be more bullet bills to use? <laughs> down the flames! Down the flames! Down in the... Oh, I missed it. I apparently missed the head. I had to go for the head. Aim for the head, Mario! Aim for the head! If you're not aiming for the head, you're aiming for something else, and that's wrong! Um, aim for the head. Do that? Ah, that was a little off. So, uh, all the way down the next time. A bullet bill approaches from behind. Oh, that worked. Oh, there's more. Ha, but look, there's more. <laughs> but wait, there's more! More deathly bullet bills with every single purchase! You have been defending yourself for months! Okay, let's take care of these guys. Did that work? A direct hit! Oh, okay, I guess I'm not necessarily supposed to aim for the head. Is there more ahead of me? I get it, the head. Boop! Oh, that missed again. No, I can't aim from there. I should have waited. I should have waited. Yeah! Yeah, that'll work. Maybe? A direct hit! Yet again! And... Are you dead now? Oh, you did it. We did it! Alright, we did it. I think the thing that I mo I always forgot about the most when I was younger was I didn't know that the water could kill the bullet pills. I thought you had to use your missiles on the bullet pills. Hello, buddy. I had no idea it was Bowser Jr. This caused me a bit of a conniption when I was a child, right? Mama. He refers to Peach as Mama, and I was like... Bowser and Peach had a kid? Don't get me wrong, the first time I questioned this reality, I didn't know where babies come from. So I was like, I guess this is okay. They just brought in the... They, they were like, oh, the stork's just like, yeah, this is your baby. It's got Bowser's and Peach's name on it. But um, as I grew up and got older, I was like... Um, Koopa King and small little mushroom princess girl and... I'm sure that there are many in this world who did not react the way that I did. I'd say I reacted quite negatively. I've seen proof of the internet that some people reacted very positively. But that's none of my business. Yeah, that's that's kind of what happened. You You're right. Bye-bye. I'm gonna follow you. I know you said not to, but you kind of got- You kind of got to my girl. So... I'm gonna follow you. Also, that balloon was just like... What? Balloon very, very, very spooky, very no, scary to me. It doesn't make much sense. Bye-bye. I'll see y'all at the Corona Mountain. It appears to be heading toward Corona Mountain. Mountain. Correct. Thank you for that astute observation, Flood. We very much appreciate your input here. Mecha Bowser's dead! And if you notice, you can see across the ocean, that's the hotel, uh, that's the... That's the beach we're at. You can see the big giant thing that kind of looks like a sun over there. And over there, you can see the hotel. And over there, you can see Rico Harbor. And up those, those trees in the mountain, that's Bianco Hills. And anyway... I just like the fact that you can see the other stages, like, from the, um, from the horizon. That was so cool to me. That was something that, when it, when it clicked to me, when I was younger, I was like, Oh! That's awesome! I'm gonna take the stickers off of my keys. I mentioned the other day that, uh, according to some, you can eat kiwis with the skin on. I found that out, and did it, and you know what? They're totally right. You can totally eat the kiwi with the skin on. Honestly, it adds another layer of flavor to it. A little, a little savory flavor. And I like that. Can I? I forget. Can I? Crap. Is there a way for me to crouch in I can't. Okay, never mind. Let's go inside. Let's go inside. Yeah, let's do the game.
Anybody here ever listen to that one mix of the Delfino Plaza theme where it's just the it just keeps going and it never stops. I don't know where I was going with that, but if you've ever heard of it, it's annoying. Or at least it can be. Hello, you. Follow me. Follow me. Are you following me? You should be following. You should be following me. Yeah, blue coin. All right. Those ones follow you. It's spooky, spooky, scary. And you get up closer, you can throw things at it. There we go. You can also jump on me too. Throw your time bombs at me. There we go. That's how we do it. Keep doing shit like this and I'll, um... Uh, one day I might just... Oh dear. You're gonna explode! Wait a minute! That's a bomb! Bombs explode! There we go, take that one. Yeah, woo! We did this. And amidst this terrible, terrible Monty Mole dying yet again, we at least have time to listen to some beautiful, beautiful music. Uh oh. Bye bye, Mario. Bye bye, Mario, other Mario. Mario, Mario, not so Mario. That wasn't what I had in mind. We all fall down sometimes. And that's okay. Da -da 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 -da. I had something in my head for that. I don't know what it was. We'll just go after the ones that go away. Whoa, okay. And then we just, whoop, they're not too bad. I always thought there was something you could do over here. I think there is a, is there a blue coin or something. I, I don't really know. Whatever. Crate. 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 Ooh. Lifeu. One man. Okay. Mario. You want to bounce correctly? The bouncing things in this are just ooh, so crazy. The Plinko level really convinced me that those things are actually trash. But that's okay. That's just some difficulty built into the game's mechanics so that it's not too easy for you to do anything. Because why would we want this game to be easy? Oh yeah, there's this thing. I gotta, I gotta start running when I can. You just do it a little bit like that and then you can get to the other side. No problem. Uh, when does this start regenerating? Okay, I started regenerating a little too later than I thought it would be. I thought if I jumped then I'd be okay, but nope. <laughs> Jumps into block as it comes back. No, 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 Mario. No, no, no. It's all about blocks disappearing and reappearing and reminding us about the, uh, the certainties of our world, like the fact that nothing is ever forever. Yeah, that's what this game teaches us. It teaches us about the lack of object or material uh, permanence in this world. I mean, I didn't discover that when I was a young boy. I just discovered it now. But now I know. You know what? My life will be changed forever. Did I do it? Did I do it? I did it. I did it. I don't have to dress as much on this one. I don't think I do. I don't actually think I have to rush. So let's not jump into the abyss until we know that the abyss is ready to catch us. Just do a little... There we go. Not too bad at all. And we got another shiny. Shiny? Shiny. Shiny. Yeah! Waha! That's 40 shine sprites. We're averaging about... Like, nine, eight shine sprites an hour? Like that. I guess. I guess I like that. It certainly ain't no snail's pace, but I'm enjoying it nonetheless. Oh, I should go back inside. Right, there's still more to do over there. Why would I leave? Why would I leave? Oh, that was pretty cool. Kind of jumped in and 
right into the hole. Right into the hole of the cannon. Liking that. Red coins out of the pirate ship. I believe this one usually also bothered me, at least. Shouldn't be that bad. Cause like, but I love the fact that you get to climb all over everything. That's I, I like platformers. I really, really enjoy platformers. Oh, everything seems so wonderful. What was in this barrel over here? This little bin over here. Ah, oh, there's a blue coin in there. I can always go back to the cannon level to do that. Oh boy! Red coins! We know. We're aware. Oh, I see bleep. Bluebird. 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 There you are, flying around. I'm gonna extinct you. Oh, don't you do it. Oh, you're trying. I can see you over there, electro turtle thick. Stop. Oh, there we go. You just gotta get him where it hurts. The face. Oh, it's making me bouncy. I think one of these clams over here also opens up. Nah, it's not that one. It's not that one. No. 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 Oh, I see. Oh, did I do it right? Nope. I do that. There's a certain order. There's one. Okay, so it's apparently not that one. Is it this one? And then this one? Nope. Red! And then, and then, not orange? Oh. I don't even know, dude. Is that it? Alright. Oh, I understand. Okay. Clearly not. Open eyes! I don't know why I'm doing this. There aren't no red coins in there. Why bother? Oh, but there's a blue coin over there. My bad. I like anything that promises blue coins. What a beautiful color. I'm proud of myself on that one. I like that one. That's a good one. I like that one. Oh yes. Oh yes indeed. Must find those red little things. The pirate ships are really annoying, I must admit. Because you gotta hang on top of them when they got their things and... No, I, I can't really articulate why they're annoying, but they are. Oh, hi there. Oh, can I can I have a piece? I'd like a piece. I wanted a piece. I wanted a piece of the red coin. Unfortunately, there's a blue coin in there. I'll go after that one. Oh, I almost got that. Yes. I kind of no stop. Can I come out of it? No, I cannot. Bye bye. Whatever. Whatever then. I'll just take a different way to get up. There's more than one way to party when it comes to Peanut Park. Peanut, like pineapple, I think? That's probably where they got it. Is there a boy cone up there? Blue cone. Oh, bluebird. Beautiful bluebirds in the sky. Like Super Mario Sunshine. If I just go up here, there's no way I can lose, right? I'll just go on top of those little rails over there. There we go. I see a red coin over there. On top of the pirate thing. Well, not really on top of it, but it's this one. Got it! Is there a blue coin up on the top over there? It looked like there was. Hey, look at that blue coin! Now that I'm down here, let me grab that blue coin over here. Yay! I just, I just, uh, be real careful, be real careful inside here, jump, and then, ee! yeah, just out of reach, but if I do it again, right here, okay, there we go, that was, took a little more effort than I thought it would, that's unfortunate, effort, why would I want to exert effort when playing a game, this is supposed to be effortless, no, then there's no fun in it. It's my, my opinion. Now, I know there's a bird up there. Are you still there? Nope, you flew away. You'll be back. 
30. Here we go. Try it. 30. There's a big old blue coin up there. We're coming back. There, I see you, Bluebird. Come on back. Meet your maker. No! Drop it. Yes! Where'd it, where'd it go? There you are. Mario kills another one! And then there's you. I think you also dropped. Did you I don't know what you did. But I know you were fun to destroy anyway. And squish like that. And you get the new coin. Yeah! There's so many blue coins to find! Maybe I can spend them at the Peanut Park Arcade. Oh, no arcade. Oh, there's a blue thing over here. I don't think I ever knew about this one. Or at least I didn't remember it. Then again, I don't remember a lot of this stuff. Hmm. Let's go back over here and see what the world has in store for Mario! Mario, Mario, Mario. Mario. Mario is a cold-blooded bird killer. And he takes... Oh, man. He does not take mercy. Mario does not take mercy on extinct or potentially endangered species. He just helps. Because technically, if there are a lot of bird blue birds in on Isle Delfino, they all drop blue coins. And if you want to get all those shines bright, you have to kill them all. So, um, yeah. Mario is a total... He is going against the conservation effort. Okay. So let's not get hit by the pirate ship. I see blue coin over there, so I will, I will attempt to. There we go. Let's do it again. Yeah, carefully, carefully, carefully. All right. Oh, okay. Just come to the end and grab this blue coin. I'll take that. Yoink! Let's see if I can get over there to those greets. Actually, I think I'd be better off over here. Oh, that was close. There we go. That was not that difficult. I'll just get my way over here. There's a blue coin in there. <gasps> no, I did not mean to do that. Okay. That was cool. I didn't mean to do that at all. No, I was in the wrong place. I had to be facing the other direction. Oh, and I also ran out of water. That's probably what did that. That's more than likely what caused it. Can I bounce? I can bounce! I can bounce from up here! I can also bounce over here. Oh, and there's a little thing, uh... Yeah, red coin, red coin, red coin! Red coin? Oh, okay. Red coin? Red coin. Red coin. Oh, and I can go up from down here, too. Awesome. I'll take that blue coin and I'll get back to you later about whether I want you to take it back from me or not. I'll just keep it for now. There's a man on the dock who likes these things. Or a squirrel thing. There's a creature. There's a creature that enjoys these things. Bye bye. Bye bye. I don't want that. I want to go this way. And then in through here and then... Then I gotta jump down and then I gotta do this and then there's a... Is that a blue coin or a red coin over here? It's a red one! That's indeed the color that I identify it as. Oh, I could have just done it over here. Yeah. That was more fun. That was much more fun. That's what we're in. That's what we're in for. We're all about the fun. Uh, you got nasty boys up there. So uh, let's go this way so we can get you. Bye bye. Bye bye. Hi. <laughs> oh, I got you. Oh, I got another one as well. Though. Why am I so happy about this? Probably endangered as well. Very endangered. Let's go back down here. <laughs> Mario's climbing sound effect. Can't get enough of it. Can't get enough of that Mario. And then there's a shine sprite right there, but there's also a blue coin, and I can get back up here rather easily, so I'm gonna go after the blue coin! Where are you? You're right there. Yeah, alright, blue coin, and I'll come back up here again. Alright, bye-bye to the water! Now let's go back up again. Bro. I'm gonna go grab that sheen that's beeping. I can use that palm tree over there to get where I need to go. 
and correspondingly, these little things are above. Yes. And then we bounce. Oh, okay. That works. Uh, yeah, I can flip this way. Go over here and then climb my way back up again. Go over here. That's not exactly how I wanted it to be. That works. Gonna climb up this grape now. It is green. Shine spray. Da -da 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 -da. Yippee, yippee, yippee. The yippee, yippee, yipster. Yipster crowd. Let's do another one. I'm loving my Super Mario Sunshine. What, was that? what episode was that? Was that number four? It was number three. It might have been number three. I don't remember. We continue on more. Which was this one? Oh, the sunflowers. This one always confused me. I always thought you had to find a... I, when I was younger, I was like, I have to water these flowers. Clearly, I have to water these flowers. And if I water them enough, they will eventually stop wilting because that's my young child logic. You see flower wilting, you have to unwilt them. Um, no, it's just those egg things over there. They're kind of, kind of causing a ruckus. Kind of taking away all the nutrients from the ground. And uh, Mama Sunflower and her babies. She's not into it. Get it up there. And then that thing happens. Hello. I don't know what I'm supposed to do about you. Oh, you come over here and... Oh, okay. You popped into the tree. Yes, go ahead. Do it again. We can kill you that way. Lovely. Sunflower, sunflower, sun, sunflower. Awaken! Thank you. Yo, what's up with it? That's what I always thought they were saying. Yo, what's up with it, dude? Because they're like, they're like, surfer sunflowers. These sunflowers surf the seas. More sunflowers? Yo, what's up with it? Right, right. Is that what you're going to say? I mean, it sounds like you're saying, yo, what's up with it? Like, yo, what's up with this Mario dude going around and freeing me and my mother? That's great. I love this Mario dude. Another one. More sunflowers. This guy's a baddie. Oh, he's gonna whack me. He's gonna whack me in the head as soon as he comes back down. Oh, okay. Well, that won't happen. And I get the coin. Beautiful coinage, coinage, coinage. Anybody over here? Yeah, touch it. Touch it. Yes. Would you like to touch as well? Touch. Touch my Mario body. Touch my sweet plumber body. There we go. Thank you. And now I'll go after your comrades too. Yes. What is up with that? I may ask you big ol' thing. What do you- oh. Usually you stop moving by the time you get to me. Oh, that didn't work apparently? Oh, I guess you gotta be in the sand. Alright, come over here. Oh. Yeah, you gotta be in the sand. How about right here? That seems a lot better. Don't know how sunflowers are growing in the sand, but honestly, this is not my place to question the reality of this world. This reality. Though I could very well reject this reality and substitute my own, but I don't know. I like this suspension of disbelief. Is a, It's doing it for me. Oh, that worked-ish. Come on, get out of the ground. Here, you can hit me right over here. Come, come closer. Come closer. Nope. Not that close. Not that close. Exactly that close, and then exactly that far deep into the sand. Everybody's alive again! Yo! Like, all the kids are just like, what's up with that? And the mother's just like, yeah, accept this. Thank you. Like, you're welcome. Mother Sunflower. <laughs> Save and continue. We're, ki we're continuing this. Gotta continue. Gotta continue. I don't see a reason to stop. Hey, Yoster. I guess that was the uh, award for... How many shine sparks do I have? 42! Meaning life. 
or maybe until I don't exactly know what the trigger is. It's either the number of shine sprites that you have, or a certain amount of progress that you make in a particular level. I don't know. Uh, not anything. Oh, Shadow Mario, you got that egg over there. You certainly can't eat it all yourself, can you? Oh, I started, I started spraying in the wrong direction. Buddy, 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 buddy. Just drop the egg, all right? Drop the egg, buddy. You don't gain anything from that egg. And clearly I don't gain anything from harassing the local citizens because they already think that I'm under reason for arrest. Where'd you go? Uh-oh. Uh-oh! I don't know where you went. Uh, I don't know where you went. Whoa, GameCube, you're having a hard time there. Spray. Spray. Oh my god, you know what I can do? I can spray that bell over there. Yeah, I'm gonna spray this bell. I know there's a crisis going on currently, but you know what? We're all about making things clean around here. Oh, can we, can we? Make it clean, make it clean, make it, make it, make it clean, make it clean, make it clean, yeah. More water. More water! Make it shine, baby, shine! Beautiful golden bell. I mean, it's, it could be golder, but this is fine. Oh, it's gonna hang up on top of... The... Oh, okay. I need the rocket nozzle, which I currently don't have, so... Oh, well. I can't get up there. I require the rocket nozzle. And to find the location of Shadow Mario and Egu. Where'd you go? Where'd you go? Where'd you go there, Shadow? Shadow, Shadow. You're probably on top of a building, right? Oh, and somehow I hurt myself by falling onto a tree of all things. Trees are supposed to break my falls, not make them painful. Uh, where'd you go? Did I go the wrong way? I might have gone the wrong way. Is it over here? Oh, okay. Oh, you're over there! Well, actually, I can get a good... I can get the drop on you like that. Oh, yeah, buddy! Oh, well, stop doing that. Oh, I gotta get the drop on him. Give me all your water. Give me all your water. Okay, well, I know you're going that way, and I need to refill up on water, so... I know where you are. At least, I like to think I know where you are, and honestly, I probably don't, but I I'll convince myself, until I can prove myself- Oh yeah, you are right here. I knew it. I knew it. Why are you going that way? Am I gonna get it? Am I gonna get it? Where'd you go? Where'd you go? Where'd you go? I see you over there. I see you, Sorry, Mario. Come on back here. Come back here, Mario. Mar- Mario thingin'. Give me the Yoshi! Darn, I was just about to ride that Yoshi too! If you could figure out how to open it up, clearly you don't know what a banana is. You died right next to it. Just about to ride that Yoshi. <laughs> Doubt. You befriended Yoshi! Make him eat with the B button! Alright! Yoshi. Bouncy, bouncy, bounce. And you know what Yoshi can do? Yoshi can eat that big giant pineapple. Yes. Meow. <laughs> Love the tongue. Slurp. And, um, I guess I'll go inside at least for once, because that way it'll be unlocked to the future. Here we go! Up to... There's a Pianta Village, I think. S oh, Serena Beach. Oh, this is the hotel. Oh, the other one is up at the top of the Shine Tower thing. I remember now. I remember now. Ah. Uh, the Manta Storm! This is one of my favorite color combinations of goo in this game. The paint... I don't know, it just... It speaks to me. It feels electrifying, and it looks like it would taste great. I'm not sure why I feel that way. To the beach! The manta cometh. Also, this boss also terrified me. Oh wait, I have to talk to the guy at the front. And then there's also, the other one is cleaning up the beach, I think, and that's a, that's a pretty tough one. Hey there, buddy! How's it going? Oh, please tell me my nightmare is over. You can save me. I don't know why, but you just look very capable to me. Listen, it all started around noon. This giant manta shaped thing showed up, and it was the, this paper thin floating silhouette. Ah, 
It came and covered the hotel grounds in this electrical goop. And then, well, oh, the horror. My beautiful hotel, my poor building, just whoosh, sank in the middle of that awful ooze. Why me? Why? Why me? Oh, well, now I've got the staff cleaning up, but where's my hotel? What am I supposed to do? I just got to sit back and... Gah! Oh, it's back, that gossip. I'll cool. I'll do something, please. Here he comes. That thing is terrifying. Something about the idea of this silhouette moving across the land is just like, whoa, spooky bookie. Spooky bookie kabooky. And the only way to stop it is with more water. Oh, and to hopefully not get shot by the goo. Spring, it made it divide. And it also lags up a GameCube considerably. Oh, goodness. And of course, the little ones get more and more annoying and stuff like that, you know. That's how we go around here. And Mario get hit a couple times. That's fine. We don't mind. We don't mind. Uh, also, the small ones hit just as hard as the bigger ones. And of course, if you don't get... If you, you're not careful, you'll get gooed up. It's just like the proportions of which they split. It's like, it's like a Manta Ray Hydra. If I just do my spinny, maybe that'll work. I think it only takes one bit of water. Oh, I need coins. Need some coins, need some coins. And plus, being that this thing is like shadow silhouette it can't hit what's underneath. Ma'am, can I ask how you're doing this fine, wonderful day? I don't know why, but this was a safe place when the goop fell. Yeah, because it's a shadow. That makes sense to me. Uh, da -da -da. I'll get him from above and split him into more tiny pieces. Oh, goodness. It can be rather bothersome, especially when there's only, like, tiny ones left. And you're like, I cannot find you. I do not know where you are. I need more water before this thing comes and gets me. Oh, you were close. You were Whoa, hello. Look at all these silhouettes everywhere. Oh, goodness. What a tiring situation. Oh, I didn't hit the goop for long enough. A big one? It's tiny one? Tiny ones? Tiny ones? Tiny, tiny ones everywhere. Larger one? Split up into other ones? And tiny and... Oh, whatever. There's so many manta rays. Rays of the manta. Oh, here's one. If I can get all of them, I can do it. Actually, I wonder how many times this thing splits. It'd be cool to calculate how many it actually went. Now they're all after you. Beware. Oh, that makes it easier, right? That's fine. They're all very angry. Here they come. Hello. They're all after me. They'll all come towards me, and they will all be drowned in the waters of justice. Oh, or be killed. No, Mario, don't. No, you don't. Mario, no. The flood did say be careful, and uh, I did not listen. Sure, clearly, I should have been more careful about the fact that they are indeed coming after me. There's so many! And they're also cute and purple! Which uh, I, I honestly say, it's a, it's a little tough on the eyes. I mean, perfectly honest, a little tough on the eyes with the blue and the yellow and the bright purple and, you know, the fact that the sounds are still going. But uh, the more I kill, the less they have to talk. And that, I think, is a positive, positive thing. The less noise, put noise pollution. These things are just too loud. They're just too damn loud. But if they're all coming to me, then I will allow them to have that swift release from the world of mortality. I believe this thing's called the Phantom Mantha, too, so, like, it's pretty much a phantom anyway. Phantoms are kind of dead. Or they're famously fleeting. If they go away... I don't know. Would it be better to use my, uh... I don't know, my sprayer? Nope. Uh, clearly that's got put me in a pretty odd situation. This is the slower way to go about doing it. It's slower, but in my opinion, more effectual. Oh, goodness. Nope, don't, don't kill me. I need more coins. And there's more under here. There we go. If I spray this way, will I be protected? Spray like that? I just, I just spray. Spray in that direction. Oh, I'm out of water. Nice. 
needs more water. Yes, they do. Doodles. It's funny, they said they're all coming after me. They're really not all coming after me. They're kind of just kind of swimming around. They're schooling around me. Like, we surround this man, and he'll be terrified of our phantom, like, fishy, evil aura. There is more. There is definitely more. Maybe it's just they don't they like the areas that are not so grouped up, because they want to they view the world. Almost there. Almost there, probably. Maybe. Hey, we did it. Nice. The goo is gone. And the hotel shall rise again. Or rise from the ashes. I put on my sunglasses for a little bit, actually. My eyes are getting a little, uh, a little tired, honestly. Oh, these are, these are so foggy. Let's collect this shine spray and uh, clean up my sunglasses. I didn't realize how non-utilitous this thing was because it's so foggy. But my eyes are getting tired. So, the right thing to obviously do is put on sunglasses at 6.30. Yeah, I'll save and continue. That's fine. All right, we're gonna go cool for a little bit to rest my eyes. I could use my gaming glasses, but alas. Oh, the turbo nozzle. I think we're at 45 shine sprites right now. 45 or 44? No, we're only at 43, aren't we? Because I just got Yosh. Or maybe... I don't know how many shines do I got. I got 43. Okay, that's not a bad question. Oh, goodness. Piece of hair under my little thing. There's a tiny piece of hair that is just going all up against my eye. Not pleasant. Come back here, you! Damn. Come hither, you evil Mario person impersonator, and you took my nozzle, and where is he, Dad, when you need him? There you go. Oh, there you are. Over there. That kind of worked. This method doesn't work wonders, but it works normalcy. Hit, hit it, pal, pal. You like moving, don't you? Oh, we did it. Right? Hey, where are you? Hey, where, where are you going? Where are you? You most definitely fell to the- oh, there you are. Oh, I thought you fell down. It sounded like you fell to the ground. Oh, almost. Oh, no! Oh, I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get that, Mario. I'm gonna get that, phony, phony Mario, if it's the last thing I do in my turbo nozzle. Even if I have to race you to the ends of the earth, Bowser Jr., I'll get you, and I'll obtain my princess back. Yeah. Rats! You got me. Oh, well. Now I got that turbo nozzle. Zoom! You're so cool now. Watch out, Shadow Mario's gonna get you. Shadow Cameron's coming after you, so watch out. Let's go in here and collect the guy's spray. Yeah, boy! <laughs> We got another one! We got another one! I think there's at least one more area in this town that could benefit from a little turboing. That being near the fruit cell. Oh, we got the rocket nozzle too! Let's get them! We're unlocking a whole new slew of abilities! Lovely! Deb's alert! The mysterious mustachioed man has been seen running. And he's running. He's running for his life around town holding some kind of device. Machinery. Machine. The mustache man is also the prime suspect and the one who defeated and gooed up the entirety of our land. Gotta get you? Gotta get you? Oh goodness, you dropped me, you son of a gun! I'll get you. I'll get you. If you just hang over there, just, just stay right there. Stay right there and I'll, I'll get you from a distance. There we go. Yeah, yeah. Perfect. <laughs> I got you, you little bastard. You think you can take my nozzles from me? Shoot! And I was just about to rocket jump too! Bye bye. Now I got the rocket up here. What does that gain for me? Oh, you know what I can do now? 
I can go clean that bell. I can clean all the bells. With this power in my hand. The power to shoot up multiple stories high. What will I, the prime mustachioed uh, subject, suspect, do now? Mario. Anyway, there's a little coin in there. I want to go in there too. But I want to clean this first. Big power, power jump thing. Power jump thing. Yes, just like that. Let's get you. Let's clean off this bell. I want to clean the bell off. Water, the universal solvent. Great for absorbing and soluting any type of substance, especially those that are gooey. You know, water itself is a polar molecule. That means because likes dissolve likes, that it can also dissolve other polar molecules, such as salts. Salts are bonded ionically, so when you put them into water, they dissolve because that's science, baby! Now, if you wanted to dissolve oil, you wouldn't be able to do so with water because, aha, remember the likes dissolve likes thing? Well, oils are non-polar molecules. They have a really hard time being absorbed by molecules that are polar, such as water. Did I get it? Did I get it? Did I get it? Yeah, baby! Yo, what's going on, Harry? Welcome to the party. Oh, yes. Oh, yes, indeed. It gets awesome. You have adverts. Oh, ignore them. Ignore those adverts. You don't need them. You don't need them. You don't need them. You don't need them. Technically, if I wanted to turn them off, I'd have to run ads during my screen stream, and that's not cool, baby. That ain't cool at all. Well, now I've got all these nozzles, what do I do with them? Why, hello there, once again. I was greeting you as you came in the first time, but, you know, ads are ads. Adsy, 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 ads. Let's get a blue coin. Oh dear, I'm in prison. But that's okay. Looks like I left something behind for myself. Me, the mustachioed killer. Well, I mean, it's not my fault that the time is all good up, but it absolutely is my fault that these blue birds are now going extinct. That's Mario's problem now. <laughs> evil, evil boy. That Mario, Mario. Uh, let's see. Oh, turbo nozzle. No nodule? Nodule? Nodule. I can use this turbo nodule to... Don't be surprised if one day I just... Oh, whoops. Well, if I go this way and hit that wall over there, this door... Hello, police station! I hate you. Alright, nobody saw that. Nobody saw that. If you guys can just space a little bit farther apart, yeah, I'm gonna do this. Oh, no, okay, okay. What if I, what if I, just right, right on, like, right on, like, just like that. There we go. Now I can break into your police station. I'm gonna find all the confidential files on Super Mario inside of the, what, this is quite a police station. Y'all saw cases in here? Incredible. Zoom! And I can jump? And we can jump. We can jump if you wanna. We can leave your friends behind because we're going so damn fast. Because your friends don't jump, and if they don't jump, well, they probably don't have turbo nozzles and help from technology. Oh, I wasn't supposed to jump. Yes, I was. Actually, I was totally supposed to jump. Oh my god. Alrighty then. I'll take that one. That is usually a lot harder for me. I'll save and continue. I'll take that. Well, that's another shine sprite down. 45 shine sprites down, and uh, there was 120? Oh, I'm already almost halfway there. No, I don't really care. I know there's another bell that I can clean. And honestly, I'm sick and tired of seeing that giant shine sprite looking all shine not so bright. More like a, a shine, let's see, shine sprite? More like a dull. Yeah, I'm not very good at this right now. Anyway, it's it's dirty, dirty, yucky out there. It's ucky, wucky, disgusting. So I'm gonna fix that. Because we're all about making things not so ucky, wucky, disgusting here at Camera with the Next Enterprises. We don't like ucky, wucky, disgusting. We like, we like slippy, wibby, beautiful. Yes, we do. Yes, we do. We like slippy, wibby, beautiful. That's what we're searching for. And I see Corona Mountain over here. This is technically where the final area is, but I, I can't access that yet. Nor do I really want to. There's still so much more to do. It's been closed off. We don't need that. And let's go from over here now. I'm gonna get up to that sprite. 
Do I get up to the sprite? Yeah, I do. Yes, I do. I want to make it all pretty looking. Not quite like that, but a little bit like if we, if we drop down here, a little bit like, yeah, kind of, nope. I'm going to jump like that, and then not catch on that ledge, but catch on this ledge. And then, we're going to make it beautiful. Spin, I say. Shine bright, shine sprite, and make your face and beautiful visage known to the world. Shine. Beautiful. Now would you look at that? That shine sprite is shining bright now. Beautiful. Honestly, I don't think there's anything more beautiful in this world than a nice shiny piece of metal. Right? I don't think there could be anything more beautiful than that. Not even a newborn baby child could be anything close to this level of beautiful. There you are. I'll dance like the Piantas for the sweet victory. There we go. I don't know. That was a little... That was very... That was my attempt at being a kawaii des. And, uh, well, I kind of did a thing there. Now it's shiny. Cause I'm shiny. That's really all the words in the song. That's what Tamatoa sings in uh, Disney's Moana. In case y'all are curious. Oh, not curious? Now you know anyway. And I think there's one more bell that I can... Ri oh, I have to get in here. Um, is it up that way? There's a shine sprite up there. Inside. And actually, that's where the bell is, so I gotta go up there. Zoom! That almost worked. And up here. Let's make you beautiful again. We're making this whole town beautiful. Keep Delfino Plaza beautiful. That's our conservation efforts here. And to start with, we're gonna try to conserve the now almost critically endangered species, the blue bird, which this mustachioed man with a red hat has been going around trying to extinguish from our beautiful, beautiful island. The same man is also held to be responsible for, for graffitiing up the town. Mara's just like, I didn't, I didn't do the graffiti, but I am killing the birds. Yep, you want to get a little, a little, you want to get a little more, yeah, get, get beautiful, get beautiful. We don't stand for things that are not beautiful in this town. Yes. And it's going to go in there, and I just need to use the sewer systems to find my way out that way. Oh, sweet, I landed on a little trapeze. I'm guessing those are supposed to be power lines, but honestly, it's anybody's guess at this point. I'd say we're all correct. Into the depths of the turquoise! There's so much to find underneath the ground. But once you know how to traverse these sewers, you'll never not want to be in the sewers. I'm in the wrong place. But there's stuff over here. There's definitely blue coins under here that I don't currently have. I can go this way and... Well... Oh, that's an idea. I can go this way, and... I'm kind of lost now. I just need to go to the... No, I didn't want to be over here. Okay, uh... Let's go the other way. And see if that gets us any closer to, uh, where I need to be. It's like a little bit of a maze down here. A little bit of a maze. This is a maze down here. It is, it is. I can go this way. And that... Nope. Uh... Didn't want to go that. Nope. Alright, this is clearly the wrong tunnel system. But I want to be up here. Oh, I want to be in that tunnel system. This one right here. In we- Nope. In we go. This way. Come. This way is the way you want to go. I will show you. We got it. We're almost at 50! Maybe it's 60 shine sprites when everything goes all flood. All flooded and stuff. And now we hear the bells ringing too because they're clean. <laughs> Excuse me. What a beautiful attention to detail. And now that I've unlocked Yoshi, I think I'm able to complete the other episode of Rico Harbor. So let's give that a try and see if I can. A Yoshi egg has been spotted. Or maybe, you know what? What if I take Yoshi with me? I don't remember whether you have to take Yoshi in with you or not. I don't know, but being that I've thought of it, I'm going to test that hypothesis now. Woo! I can make it go faster if I make the water in front of me. 
Mario can slide upon pavement. Even better so, now that he's wet the ground a little bit. He needs a little bit of that, uh... That encouragement to be able to slide so far. I gotta get my... Me, myself, and Banana up there. I could probably do this. Hey, yes. Hey, yes. Oh, no. Kind of like that, except you go in the direction that I want you to, Mar Nope. Oh, no! Oh, no! Oh, yes. That's fine. Take this banana! Let's fly, Yoshi! And by fly, I mean let's get ripped apart atom by atom and then go here. Oh, bye, Yoshi. Well, that answers one question. Yoshi's Fruit Adventure. Now, hopefully, there's actually a Yoshi. Now, let me see where the actual egg is. Where is the egg? I see the shrine spread up there, but where's the Yoshi? Where's my Yoshi? Where's my Yoshi? Yoshi, 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 Yoshi. Hey, can I have sunglasses now, by the way? Pal? Buddy? I love the sunshine! Ooh, is it ever bright! Hey, little man, try a pair of my special sunshades. They're cool. You're styling now. Oh, yeah. Come back and talk to me when you don't need them anymore. <laughs> All right. Now the screen's even harder to see. And I still don't know where the hell Yoshi is. It says Yoshi's Fruit Adventure, but I, I don't I don't see the Yoshi anywhere. You know, I'll do a little bit of searching. I'll do a little bit of soul searching before I call it quits this time around. Like inside of this hole. Hole? Oh, ooh, close. Hole? Oh, can I go this way too? What's in this direction? I wonder. What's in this direction of the underground caverns? Anything of consequence? Just coins. Coins and more and more coins and... Oh, I could have done this to begin with. Oh, well, that's not necessary anymore. Walking along inside the sewers. It's a good thing Mario's so experienced with water now. He can just clean himself up when he feels like he's getting all ooky gooky from the sewers. Can we go up? I'd like to go up. We're going up, baby! Yeah! Alright, so where's the Yoshi? Where be my Yoshi? Hey, y'all seen an egg? Y'all seen an egg around here? I've been looking for an egg. If you, you know where an egg is, kind of look for an egg. Kind of, kind of white, kind of green. Green and spotted. Some would say white with green spots. I don't really know. Maybe I just needed to, um... I don't know, did I just need to push these buttons enough for me to get the ish? I don't remember, actually. You know what, let's try that hypothesis. Try number one! Banana! Try number two! Ah! A durian! Let's do it again. Try number three. A melon. But no eggers. Another one? Papaya or squash? Maybe a squash. I'm not exactly sure. Let's do another one. Pineapple. All right. We like pineapple. I like pineapple. We like a pineapple. And another one? Oh, there's no more fruit. All righty then. But where's my Yoshi? I don't know where my Yoshi is. I really don't know where this Yoshi egg is. Huh. The rocket nozzle is yet to be unlocked over here. I know there's a blue coin around here that I can grab. I thought it'd surely be under here somewhere. Well, it's pointing me in this direction. But I know I need Yoshi. Maybe I have to discover it for myself. <laughs> it says proceed this way. What the heck am I going to do with that? Oh, no, I know Yoshi actually has the ability to hit those fishies. He can spit at those fishies, and then they have... They can turn into platforms, I think. Oh, what's over here? Nothing. Cool. Awesome. I don't know where my Yoshi is. I'm going to cry. I thought it was up there. Where the hell is Yoshi? Like, I know I needs the Yoshi. I know I needs the Yosh. But I see no Yosh. There is no Yosh to be found. Oh, this wasn't going to work out in any way if I wanted. Oh! Oh! Yes, it did! All right! Please don't touch me. That worked. 
Uh, and then I need to go that way. I don't see it. Uh, again, I don't see a Yoshi egg anywhere. Ooh. That ain't gonna work. Oh no! I wonder. I I'm actually gonna take a check on that. Where is the Yoshi egg in Rico Harbor, episode 8? I don't know where it is. The fish market. Oh. I don't see a Yoshi egg over there. I didn't see a Yoshi egg. Am I missing it? It's up near the fish market. It says fish market, but I see no Yoshi at the fish market. Oh my god, it's literally sitting right there. I'm blind, and it wants a durian. Oh, I need to get that durian again. Look at that! It was harder to see because I was wearing sunglasses! Clearly I've put myself at a disadvantage. But at least it's easier on the eyes now. Durian! I've never had a durian, but I've always wanted to try it. I've heard they smell terrible. Kick. 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 Kick, little durian. Kick durian. Yoshi! Alrighty, I've got some juice! Got some juice? Oh, I gotta, I gotta spray. I gotta take y Yoshi's little stomach acid and use it to... Yeah! How do you like me now? Oh no, I want that. Oh, we're floating. Floating along the air. I know my audio is out of sync. Don't hurt me. Please don't hurt me. Oh, come on, come on. Fishy, 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 fishy. Yeah. Oh, I, I wanted to. There we go. Ah, oh, that's a little too high for me. Yeah, Yoshi can't reach that. All right, bye-bye. Float along, little platform. Goodbye. We'll be back eventually, I'm sure. Maybe I gotta... I'll, I'll aim my blast, like, right about there. I'll wait for fishies to come back. Oh, I got some over there, too. Bye-bye, platform. I guess I'll be waiting for you, too. Anyway. How y'all doing? Y'all got our party sunshades on? No? That's fine. I got mine on. It's because my eyes are getting a little hurty. Okay. That's good. And there's another one. I need another platform. Uh, if you'll come back in a moment, I'm sure. What am I gonna do for dinner tonight? Oh, I saw a fishy right there. Fishy, 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 fishy. Yes. Oh no, I didn't do that right. Bye, Yoshi. Bye, Yoshi. Yoshi dissolves in water because Yoshi is uh, a polar molecule. Science. I'm gonna get up here and uh, attempt to console myself with a thought. That Yoshi's dead! It's okay! I'll be okay! I promise to be okay! Okay, I can get up here. I'll be fine. I'll be fine. I'll be just fine. I'm not heartbroken or anything. I didn't mean to kill Yoshi. I'm certainly not. I, I, I might be a little heartbroken. Mario certainly isn't. Mario doesn't even care what happens to the animals in this kingdom. He doesn't even care. He's killing birds. Killing Yoshis. Or maybe this is what Yoshis always wanted. To be able to sacrifice himself for the good of the Mushroom Kingdom. You want another durian? He wants another durian. Oh, I'll give you a durian. I'll give you a fistful of durian. You need exactly what you need. That's not a durian. How about this one? You want this fruit? That's a durian. All right. We like durians around here. You know what I have had? I think I've had a uh, durian shake before over in uh, Philadelphia's Chinatown. I think I had one of those one time. It's different. It's a very, very different flavor than what I'm used to. Oh, come on. I want the fish. Give me the fish. And now let's fly.
just vibing along as the platform moves. And we're gonna break for a little bit so uh, I can actually get on this platform. Oh no! Ah, I gotta do it very carefully. There we go. There we go. Maybe I can do this a little quick, quicker than I did before. Nope. Okay. Be careful, Yosh. Be careful, Yosh! You got it! Yes! That was cool. I know I can get over there. That's easy. What is that? Oh, there's a little mark in the ground. Oh, that didn't work. Over here? I know I can jump off of you. I can jump off of the ocean. But how? I can do it very carefully. Because I don't want Yoshi to die. Do it very carefully. Don't die, Yoshi. Don't die, Yoshi. There we go. There we go. No worries. No worries, Yoshi. We got you. We got you. Now jump back on. Okay, that was scary. Nope, that was certainly not the right location. Oh, I don't think I can reach that, honestly. Could I? Not confidently. I gotta wait for the platform to come back. So it's gotta be at just the right location. Actually, I can probably use all these fishies as a way to get up. Let's experiment. Nope, that didn't work. Ah, that's really not helping me. That platform went away, so we'll wait. At the top of your trajectory. Where is the top of your trajectory? Fishy? Big fishy? Where are you, fishy? I know you're here. There is the top of your project trajectory. If I aim for over there. Oh, that kind of work? Oh, yes. Besides, Yoshi's tummy is getting a little... Not so no! Okay. Yoshi in the water. All right, instead what I think I'll do is I don't know if I can get Yoshi up there. I think I can get myself up there. And Yoshi spit. His gastrointestinal acids can be shot up to a point where I can use it properly. I like that idea. I like that idea a lot. Yeah. Shall we rise, my greats? Thank you, my liege. For raising me up so I can conquer mountains. Because clearly what Mario's conquering here is mountains. Oh dear. Can't fall from there. Does he want that Anna? Nope. Wants Darian. Always wants the Darian. He's in the mood for something a little astringent. Actually, I don't even know if it's astringent. I just know it tastes weird and smells weird, too. I've heard Darian's described as smelling like everything bad in the world. I have nothing to compare it against, except for that one shake that may or may not have contained Darian. I will try it eventually. Other fruits that I've been dying to try, jackfruit. They sell that at my local Whole Foods. And I hope to be able to uh, try it someday. I don't exactly know what's, uh, what's in it, though. Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. There we go. Give me that surface. Off we go. Uh, again. Because I think Yoshi's acids, if I'm on that other platform over there, can probably shoot all the way up high enough to be able to destroy that little barrier up there. Which is, which is kind of the way you want to... I think is the way you want to do it. Okay. Didn't make that work. There we go. There we go. And do it again. Shall we do it again? Thank you, Yoshi. That went a lot faster than it did before. Okay. Missed that one. Vigi, vigi. 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 Vigi, yeah. Now, can I get it from up here? If I aim my Yosh way up high... If I aim my Yosh way up high... Yep, that'll do it. Yeah, alright. Now I just need my Yosh to get that one. Oh, okay. And then I can just use my hover nozzle to make up the rest of the distance. Oh. I don't need you anymore, Yoshi. Or I probably do. I don't think this was very high. Nope, definitely not high enough. Uh, Yoshi, I'm coming back. 
I'm coming back for you. I, as it turns out, I still need your assistance. There we go. And I won't water you, because if I watered you, you'd be dead. All right, we'll wait for the platform again. Aim for the top of its trajectory. Probably somewhere right about here. All right, Stish. I'm waiting for you. There you are. Nope. Over there. Fishy? Fishy. Fishy. Yes. I just gotta bounce high enough. Yeah, that's good. Perfect. Now I just gotta get that sprite without falling to my doom. Kind of like that. Yep. Awesome. Yes. Very much yes. Very much okay. I'll save that. I'll save and continue that. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Very, very wonderful. Worked out for me. All right, I'll admit, the tea's getting to me. I, uh, I need another break. So I'm gonna do that. I completed another area, aside from the coins. I think I, I, think I deserve that. So, uh, break time! Yeah, yeah, yeah. And we're back once again. I have been emptied, much as Flood sometimes is. And I've disposed of the rest of my tea. And by disposed of, I mean I drank the rest of it. I think it's now time to switch gears for drinkies this evening. So I'm gonna drink something a little, a little different. I have a beer that a buddy gave me. It's a River Horse Raspberry Trapel. Trapels are a little darker. A little dark, darker, sometimes almost chocolatey or mocha-y, but this one's got raspberry with it, so it kind of reminds me of that chocolate raspberry. And, uh, I like that. 
I'm gonna, I'm gonna have some of that actually. Get a little pour action going on there. Oh, that is a terrible pour. Terrible pour. Oh, we try over there. Yeah. I could have been a little less aggressive on that. Cheers! It's mostly foam, but it's pretty good. Synergy, how are you, my friend? Popped in at the right time, and by the right time, I mean there's never a bad time. So hello. Hello and good evening. Or afternoon. I don't really know, honestly. Okay, so where have I not gone to? Let me check. Let me take a check on my shine totals. Uh, Peanut Park. I haven't done all of Peanut Park, so I'm going to go back there and do some more. Because, uh, trying to get as far as I possibly can. Because I am just loving it. This is my... I'm dedicating my entire day to playing a video game Saturday. I mean, it wasn't my entire day. I started a bit late. I was doing some work stuff this morning because I have responsibilities. We all have responsibilities. And sometimes, sometimes I feel that I'm behind on them and so I have to catch up. The Runaway Ferris Wheel. Let's conquer it. Conquer the Ferris Wheel. This little pint glass of mine can actually hold an entire little, uh, little bottle of beer. Or a bottle of anything that's canned, really. Coca-Cola, Sprite. I've seen Pepsi in a bottle. Runaway windmill. It's going crazy. Take a look at that windmill. That's not very crazy at all, actually. Not a very crazy windmill, if you ask me. Not very crazy at all. It's gonna get crazy when I go in here, right? Oh, man. Oh, my God. Everybody, Mario's here. Mario's here. Make the windmill go faster. Oh, no. The windmill's going crazy, everybody. Somebody watch out. Did you flick the switch yet? He's almost here. Like... <laughs> I can clearly see that it was not going crazy before. Now it's going pretty crazy. Now it's a little crazy crazy. I understand that. Don't touch me, Electro Boys. Oh, goodness, goodness. You missed a lot of streams since you don't have the Twitch app. Oh, don't worry about it. The stuff is always... Even if you've missed anything, if you wanted to watch them, I'm not saying that you have to. You can go and uh, do some, watch them on the YouTube. I put all my backups up there. <gasps> We're working that body. We're doing some squats. Squats. Yeah, I put everything up on YouTube and whatnot, and sometimes it comes up a little bit cleaner. I can't guarantee cleaner broadcasts because I do not have something on my computer called a GPU, and the GPU would help me be able to make those video videos and put them up faster because uh, it takes a really long time for them to encode. Uh, I had a video yesterday that was like six hours long, and it took over 24 hours to re-code, or to re-encode. I was like, this is, this is terrible. So I don't usually put in that much effort um, for the video uploads, but mostly because, like, it's more or less infeasible at that point. I mean, it's feasible, but it would take a lot of time. And I'd be, uh, I'd be better using that time on and streaming what I've already got. And uh, potentially raising money for that GPU. It, it's not about even raising money at this point. It's the fact that there are none available. I have the money for a GPU, but I can't seem to get one. There we go. And then we'll just whop like that. See? I can go up the, I can go up the pinwheel tower like that. You got some notifications on, but it never gives me a notification. That's really weird. I think, um... Uh, Anna, I, I know you popped in for a moment. I know my fiancé actually gets those, um... Gets those notifications via email. You get those emails, but they only... Let me just have the emails up. I don't have a Twitch app. Yeah, I'm not sure how that is, actually. I could try to look into that at some point and maybe give, like, a... Oh, not getting my notifications? Let me teach you how to do it. Let, I don't really know. I think, um... I know that on the About page, you can actually see there's a Follow button and then there's a Notifications button. It's possible that they're turned off, so you might want to double-check that, I guess. It's a little bell. I think it's a bell. It's probably a bell down there. If you need to, that is. Obviously, there is no pressure on my end. You can do whatever you want to. Oh, there's a little... Oh, you know what? I can... Ooh, get any emails. I, I don't really know. I honestly didn't realize you can get notifications via email anyway. I was like, really? Do that one, and I can get the other one. I can do this, and then I can go over there, over there. No, I missed it! Oh my god, I fell! Oh! Where's that shine sprite anyway? Where did I... I was not paying attention to where that shine sprite went. Well, I guess I'll make my way back up again. Oh, please. Oh, please. Oh, thank you. Oh, thank you, dear Mario Overlords. I appreciate. Oh, come on, go this way. This way, this way. Oh, I can't, I can't see you. Oh, well, now I can do this. 
Did the Twitch in like 2018, maybe that's why. I don't really know. I'm totally, I'm totally lost on that one. I wish I could be more assistance than I am now. But, um, I'm not so sure. I know, like, at least on the Twitch app, because I use the Twitch app for my notifications and whatnot, sometimes, like, actually most of the time, when a streamer actually goes live, you don't actually get the notification when they go live. It comes about a couple of minutes later. I don't know, I feel like, you know, Twitch being a live broadcasting thing, that maybe their whole people going live notification thing could probably be better. The, actually, after discovering that, because I didn't realize that was the case, I put in the just starting, or the, the starting soon screen. Because I was like, I was like, I have no idea. If, if the people who want to be here for the very beginning have no idea that I'm live yet, then there's no sense in me starting things until like maybe a couple minutes later. Or at least that's why I, why I imagine people would use the um, uh, starting soon screen. That's why I use it. Uh, help article. Oh, thank you so much for linking that. Uh, by the way, it looks like there's an extra comma in there. Um, maybe you remove that if the link isn't working. It looks like that. I don't know. I don't know. What I'll do is, at the very least, I can absolutely take a look into that and see. Because if it's an actual problem, then I'd like to fix it if I could. Oh, did I get the... Yes! Oh, maybe it's for the app. Come to think of it, if you don't have the app, how would you normally get the notifications? Aside aside from emails, I mean. Oh, I'm gonna fall. I'm gonna fall. Am I gonna fall? I fell. Ah, I fell again. I got a better. I got better ways of doing this. I got better ways to do it. Also, I still don't know where the shine sprite is. I wasn't paying attention to it when it happened. <laughs> Whoops! Oh, I just spit all over my screen. Ew! 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 Disgusting! Anyway, I'll get back up again. Oh, jeez. Because I'm thinking, the only ways that I can possibly conceive of getting notifications is either a push notification, which means you've got the app, or an email, which means, I mean, you've got an email. I guess that's what that means. I don't know. I don't know how else to debug that. I guess my only recommendation would be try clicking that bell and making sure it says notifications on. I think. Or, I don't really know. I, don't know. I think I'm, I haven't talked on long enough about this. I really don't know. I really don't know. Now, I know my shine spread is somewhere up there, but I want this blue coin. I want the blue coin. I must have some. I must use them. But, but I will. But I, I, I will do you a favor. I'll put that on my list of things to check out in case anybody else has that issue in the future. Check notifications for non app users for all we know it might actually be a glitch in twitch's system and they don't know about it so we might do some good might do some good uh, reporting that to the devs all right all right all right all right all right yes we'll go that that should get your notifications oh look at that okay so i'm gonna go way over there i want to i got it yes more blue coins for my collection of blue coins which I will soon turn into a collection of Shine Sprites. Okay, I remember how to do this. I need to go on top of this thing here, and the Shine Sprite is up on top, I believe. No! No, please come back! Please! Please come back! Oh, please! No! Oh! I've fallen to the ground again. Gah. 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 <laughs> I like this little shortcut I got in the back, though. Turn them all on. Very weird. That's no problem at all. No worries if you miss a couple of things here and there. I mean, I'd, I'd feel bad, like, if you... I, mean, I do feel bad, actually. Well, maybe we'll try it again next time. The best thing we can do at this point is hope that it works next time. All those notifications are on now, so maybe they'll work next time. I'm hoping so. But you know what I'm happy about? That you managed to catch on here for, for now. So... I'm happy that you're here, Synergy. Happy that you managed, that you were able to grace my presence today. Whoop de doodles. And try to make my way up this crazy, like, pinwheel tower thing. I need to go that way. I need to go that way. Thank you. Up to the top of the pinwheel. No. Oh, jeez. I'm also running low on water. I need more water. 
Mario needs more agua. Oh, I did it! I had it! I had it, and then I... Yes. Where's that shine spray? Oh, it's up on top of there. Yes! Oh, thank goodness. Thank goodness. My goodness. The River Horse Raspberry Tripel, everybody. Raspberry Triple Horse. It's it's nice and raspberry -y, but like a deep raspberry, not like a tart raspberry, but like essence of raspberry. I like it. It was a friend from my buddy, Dalukare. Ooh, excuse me. And of course, you know that that's beer in the cup, because I am burping like crazy. I love how, I love how my dearest is the one in chat, given tech IT advice. I love it. Things have come full circle. Usually I'm the one giving tech advice and whatnot. It's okay. Hopefully it works for next time. That's all we can, all we can do right now is have the hope in our hearts for next time that Twitch gets its act together. What am I doing in this stage? I wasn't paying attention again. The Yoshi go round! Oh, we're doing more Yoshis! More Yoshis! Oh, hello, Mario. Hi, Mario. Boop, de boop, de boop, de Where's my Yosh? Oh, I have to get in there with my Yoshi. Right, right, where's my Yosh? Show me the Yosh. Show me the Yosh! Oh, there's no Yosh. I just gotta get inside there. Do I just, do I just walk inside? Do I just, do I just walk inside? I'm pretty sure I need a Yoshi. No, yeah, you do need the Yoshi, and you need to put the Yoshi right here. But where's the Yoshi, you may ask? Uh, I believe he's over there. That's my favorite one. The classic answer to any tech question. Did you try turning it off and on again? It's the most annoying thing to hear, but honestly, it sometimes works. I was actually having... This was the funniest thing. When I was trying to get my game capture set up this morning, my computer literally would not work. I could not type on my keyboard. The only keys that worked were the I button, the tab button, and the minus button, and the escape button. The only things that were working. After messing around with my computer for quite a bit of time now, uh, it, it took me about 20 minutes, I realized I still had another keyboard plugged into my computer, and it fell. So the place where it fell, it, had, it was lodged in between like two different dressers, and the, the control key was pressed did a little bit of sleuthing. I knew it was the control key because when you click on an icon on your desktop, if you clicked more icons, it would select them all at the same time. And the only way that happens is if you click and hold the control key. So, I was like, oh my god. There must be something else plugged into this computer. Also, I had something plugged into USB and every time I unplugged it, it probably wouldn't persist anymore. It's a little bit of tech sleuthing. Sometimes you gotta use your noggin. Not saying that people don't usually use their noggin, but sometimes I don't use my noggin. And that time... I exercise my noggin good. Also, I have no idea where this bananas are. Where be bananas? Bananas where you be. Oh, bananas. Hey, look, bananas. I like it, bananas. Uh, how do I get those bananas though? Let's go back this way. Let's take the long way around. Just a pleasant walk through the park. Pleasant little walk through the park over there. You got those bananas in my hand, and uh, my name is Mario, and I'm used to bouncing things on their head. How about we do that? Yep, bounce on the head. You're dead now. Mario Mario, Mass Murder Mario, coming along, extincting the local creatures of Isle Delfino. Specifically bluebirds and goldbirds. They are arguably the most pretty, but Mario does not care. Mario wants to kill them all. That and these Koopa things that, you know, it's, it's complicated, but they took his princess. Hi, Yoshi. All right. Let's go this way. Hi there, electric thing. Don't touch. Don't touch. Nope. And we can go this way. I okay. Didn't wanna... Yoshi, why are you being difficult? Why must you be so difficult, Yoshi? I raised you. I helped birth you from that eggshell. And this is the way you treat me? By not flying high enough? Oh, wait. I need to be the color orange. Meaning? What color is orange? How about a squash? I must find the squash! Come, yep. Yum, 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 yum. Give it, give it, give it. Am I orange now? I'm orange now. Oh, the reason you didn't see they there in the promotions tab. Weird. Well, that's pretty odd. Hey, Twitch overlords. Yeah, overlords, Twitch. You, you're listening. 
Twitch overlords. If you're listening to me right now, get your shit together. Signed, Cameron. And the X is in red marker. Maybe that'll fix it, though. If we pray. If we pray to the Twitch overlords. I want to be a Twitch overlord. I'll get them all. I'll fix the problem if it were my design. Or I probably wouldn't because I have no idea what I'm talking about, so. Sometimes I'll talk. Sometimes I'm not just talk, I guess. I'm, I'm just human. I'm human like everybody else is, except for those who are non human. Like lizard people. I don't know if they exist or not. But for all I know, they may. Uh, I want this one. Oh, I see a little thing in there. There we go. If I just hang around here, I can get that one man, right? This ain't so bad. I love the colors. I love the patterns around here. I mean, to some it may look like, like, cow pattern. But I think it's Yoshi pattern, because they're like actual circles. Like, cows don't really have actual circles on them, at least not from what I've seen. That's a little confusing. Here's the hard part. Oh dear. And then I gotta get that red one. Red one? Red one! The red one! I actually kind of, honestly, it's kind of maroon, but, you know, <laughs> nobody cares except for me. I like colors. Let's go this way. Are we moving? We're moving right along. And I see a big old watermelon. Big old watermelon. So where, what could I do? Oh, I need Yoshi. Because Yoshi can eat the watermelon. Oh, I could have caught that. I guess we'll wait till the lot comes over. Yes. Yes! I'll be jumping like that. Perfect. And then we can do like the little flippy. Little flippy. 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 A little bounce. A little, do a bit, little bouncing. A little bit of bouncing. Oh, actually, I I guess I can't do anything with that. Oh, you know what? I, mm, I should go over here instead. I think that'll probably be a smarter move for me. Because then I can get up there and then I can, you know, fun stuff. And then I can do over here. <gasps> yes. Perfect, to get to the top of the thing. Top of the block I found! Top of the block! Top of the block to ya! Shine Sprite! He had another one. We're at uh, 51 right now. That's great. We were at zero this morning, this afternoon. It was 1.30. It's now... Excuse me, 7.12. And I am very much enjoying myself. You know what I'll do? I'm in the mood for a little snack, so I'm gonna eat a kiwi. Gotta cut off both ends. Cut off both ends of the kiwi, and then you're good to just eat that whole thing. Um, at least that's what I was told, so. Nice kiwi. Nice kiwi. Juicy kiwi. There's more to do in Peanut Park, so we're going back. I can't leave these kiwis open for very long or else the flies start getting to them, so. I sincerely apologize about the slurping sound effects. But for those who are enjoying it, you're welcome. You know I don't have? I don't have a napkin over there. Excuse me one moment. I'll go grab a napkin. I don't have a napkin for my keys. I'm making a mess of my face and my nose and the oranges and the kiwis and stuff. I'm going to get myself a napkin. Now I'm going to grab myself a towel, a little paper towel too, in case I need either of them. If I spill things on my desk, then it's better if I have a regular towel than a paper towel. Paper, paper towel. Words. I was never known for my words. I was always known for everything else. There we go. I get all clean now. Cameron's the clean boy. Well, not the clean, clean boy. But I mean, I'm cleaner than some. Like, I showered this morning. That's pretty clean. Oh, uh, what was I doing here? Shadow Mario in the park. This is not park. Park is that way, so we shall go this way to find a shadow Mario. Back in the park we go. Hello, Shadow Mario. Want to get wet? I know you don't want to. No, I thought you were going to throw your shell. My predictive measures were incorrect. No, please come back. Please, please just take the water. Take the water and run. Where you going? Where you go? Sorry, shell boy. I didn't mean to hurt you. 
But alas, it happens sometimes. I'm not perfect. I'm only human, you know? I'm only human, and we make mistakes. And my name is Mario, and Mario probably makes a ton of mistakes. That's why he has to have lives. For so many, for so many lives, Mario has failed. And for that, he has to do... Ooh, a little bit of lag going on there. By the way, any lag that you wind up seeing in the video capture is actually from the GameCube itself. <laughs> That's not anything I could do about it. It's not like running on a computer or anything. This is the native hardware having problems. Crazy. It just goes to show you how crazy this game actually is. I mean, that or... I don't know. I love the GameCube. And I'm so glad that I'm actually able to use it again. This is actually my fiance's GameCube. Thank you, dearest. Because the Wii won't work. The Wii doesn't like to do color. Darn it all! I remember this! I will remember this! Sure. Can I have a sprite now? We can just get past this whole, like, rigmarole. You can make it easier on yourself if you just give me the shine sprite now. Thank you. Here's you. I would agree that it's incredibly sweet. But the way that she took it was uh, she just kind of stole it from her parents' house. My future in-law's house. So uh, she says it was hers to begin with, so now it's ours. No, just kidding. It's just hers. Because as we all know, what's hers is hers, and what's mine is also hers. I don't care that. I'm very happy to share my belongings. If she wants a piece of this now half-eaten kiwi, she can have it. But she's not here right now. She's at home. She's doing work stuff. Roller coaster balloons. I should probably cut up this kiwi instead of biting into it. That way it'd make less slurping sounds. Yeah, I'm gonna cut it kind of fun. I don't know. I'm not exactly comfortable. Like, for example, I wouldn't imagine hearing, like, a radio host crunching on a taco, like, over the radio. Or I wouldn't imagine somebody taking, like, like in an actual video, like, taking a... I, I don't really know. Unless that was the actual video or the actual radio show. So, my idea of, like... I'm not sure if chewing stuff on camera is cool or just weird. I opt for the more to the weird side. I'm sure it doesn't matter. It's like anybody, like if I were a professor in a class, I'm like, don't eat in my class. I wouldn't actually say that. I'd be like, you can eat in my class. Just, you know, try to be quiet about it. I mean, if some kid in the back of the class is going like, on their soup or something like that, I'd be like, okay, you can leave now. You are disrupting from the lecture. But to what degree can I launch into a kiwi that it becomes disruptive to the show? I, I don't really know. I'll have to listen to the playback and find out. Also, I just noticed my light is incredibly bright for the amount of sun that's outside, so let me lower that down a bit. It's at 72? It does not need to be that high. Goodness gracious. I'm still working on my light setup. Oh, can I get... Nope. That's the next thing that I want to upgrade of my setup. It's my lights. I have one light source over there, and I should have one over here and a reflector over here, or vice versa. Mm -hmm. I know how I need to do it, but I haven't done it yet. Welcome to the grand reopening of the roller coaster. We've got a balloon popping water rocket game going on. Wanna try? Yes. Yes, I do. There'd be nothing more entertaining for me than that. Well, if you can hit all the balloons with the water rockets, <laughs> you know, before the roller coaster makes three loops, you'll win. And then we will give you a prize. Well, good luck. Cool. Used to be in the back of the class. The classmates used to have a feast in the back. Like, it was insane. I understand that. I mean, when you gotta eat, you gotta eat, right? That's that's my thought. Can I shoot balloon? Oh, okay. I want to use that. What I can. Ah, uh, shoot both of them. I got both of them. Sweet. Oh, you know I can shoot back. Um. Oh, I missed those. Oh goodness. Oh wait. Well, I should have been shooting those. I don't know. Shoot some rockets. And <laughs> they got caught like twice. I can imagine. You'd probably be making a lot of noise if you're scarfing all the food over there. Did I get two? I got two. Let's get another one. Uh... Oh, I want to get those. I want to get those to the side. That seems like an okay angle. That seems okay. I got one of them. That's fine. Oh, I totally could have gotten these ones. That's only one. Well, I have three loops to do it, so. Oh, that didn't work. Did it work? I totally missed that. Oh, well. Was I able to get it? I was able to get the other one. 
Only two more laps. Watch out, Mario. Okay. Did I hit one? Nope, totally missed it. Oh, well. How it has to be. Maybe from this advantage point. Oh, my God! Ah! Can I get one? Can I get one? No! Oh, there's some back there, too. Oh, God, I suck at this. Practice makes perfect, right? Practice makes perfect! I shoot the things through there. Oh, that doesn't work for me. And you were just there, like, staring at them, like, what the heck, are you guys hungry? How are you guys this hungry at 9 a.m.? I mean, what if they didn't have breakfast? I mean, I suppose that would be the only conceivable way to be that hungry at 9 a.m. I don't, so I, sometimes I don't eat breakfast, but I try to. But, don't get me wrong, if I didn't eat breakfast, you know I'd be scarfing in the back of the class. Oh, come on, yes! I don't know if I'm gonna be able to do this. Oh, another one. Is it yes, that one? Yes! And there's a, there was another one over there, I got one more left. I definitely can't do this. I'm trying my hardest. There we go, maybe a couple of them? Maybe a little lower. That's one of them, for sure. And maybe one more? One more, one more, one more! Oh, I was too far downward. Oh, I could have gotten all of them. <laughs> My goodness. Well, I certainly am not going to get all of them, but I'm sure as I'll try for most of them. I'd say I've succeeded at that goal. If I have that, I should be able to, when I get over here, to shoot all of them at once. I don't know. I tried. I got one! I got two! Oh, all right. Definitely not, a, not enough for all of them, but I'm coming close. That was good. Maybe another one. Did I get one? No, I didn't. That's okay. I'll try it again. How about this one? How about them apples, huh? Well, I can't do it this round. There's definitely no way that I can do it this round. But perhaps the next one. Failure! And then here comes the game over screen, right? Yeah, yeah. Ah! Uh, no! I fell to the ground! He fell to the ground. The horror. What'd you say, Mario? Okay, hold on. We'll just try it again. I ain't stopping there. I, one little fail ain't gonna dissuade me from popping balloons. You know what? Do I have them? Those are pink balloons, right? Let's see. Do I have any pink balloons in here? I think the closest I have is purple. Purple and red. I have a balloon set up for this. If I can pop all those balloons, I'll pop this balloon. Roller coaster balloons. This one's for you, Bowser Jr. This balloon's for you. I have all these balloons. I gotta use them for something. There we go. We'll place that back here. So that when I pop all the balloons, I can also pop all the balloons, per se. You know? That's what I think of it. It'll be, it'll be as much metaphorical as it is physical. When those balloons don't get their pops, so will that one. But how shall I pop the balloon? Should I use a toothpick? Should I use a knife? Should I use a bottle opener? I got a corkscrew right here. I'm gonna do it with a corkscrew. Can it pop? That's today's game show. Or that's this hour's game show. We had a game show before that you probably missed. It's called, Can You Uncork the Waterfall? And the answer was yes. You can uncork the waterfall. For those who missed out, you can indeed uncork the waterfall. In case you were curious. If you weren't curious, that's fine, but you know. Consider yourself enlightened. Enlightened to the possibilities. Hey, can I have a can I have another ride on your roller coaster? Can I can I have a ride on your roller coaster? Oh, well, Grammy, have another roller coaster. You have another roller coaster. Yes. Please, I want to ride on your roller coaster. How many loops can you make before you win? Hopefully, not many. All right. I think I can get both of them he Nope, just kidding. Got a total waste of a rocket. Maybe at this At this height, I can get one of them. At least one. Oh my god! Mm. Oh, what about this one? Get him! I don't know, did I pop one? I didn't even know if I popped one. I can't even tell. Da -da 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 -da. Uh, where's the next balloons to pop? You guys, that's one. Boop, that's... I totally missed that one. Incredible. Uh, I need to be facing... That direction. Both or just one? Just one. 
This is the one where I should be able to fight. Get both of them. Oh, or none. Sir Oh, that would have been perfect. There is definitely a method which which to do this. I just don't know that method. It's all authentic. How about this one? Nope. Definitely not good enough. You always get scared when somebody pops a balloon since I'm not always prepared. I will make sure to have a very obvious warning look before that balloon is popped. Oh my god, I'm not down far enough. I don't know how to get these balloons here. Like, maybe there's a certain angle I can aim at? Mm, kinda. I'm totally missing all my chances here. Yeah, there's one balloon. Alright, cool. And there's there's a can I get another balloon? I might as well. I'm about to get another rocket. That's yes, I got that one at least. And this one I think I can shoot at these ones. Oh, I shot too soon. That's yeah, one's better than none. Can I get all of them? Ooh, I got all those balloonies! Nice. Another rocket? Can I get those ones? I can get at least one. This is our last time. Yeah. Yeah. Don't you think I know that? How about right there? Hey, it's not too bad. That wasn't too bad. I think I'm getting better at this. Slowly but surely every single time. Alright, got those ones. Oh, I somehow released a coin as well. I heard that. I heard that coin. Eddie? Okay. Uh, now I have all these ones. Uh, did I get it? I got it. I think I got it. That was cool. There's five more balloons left. Ah, uh, where's the other one? Oh, there's a, there's one. And there's one down there, too. That's one. What about... I wasn't able to get that one. But I need to get these ones. That didn't work at all. Nope! Close! Closer! Closer than before. I don't know, shoot one over there. One more for good luck? Nope, or just totally miss it. Oh well. Let's try it again. That's okay. We'll just do it again. Ain't no big thing. We've got that swing. I got that swing. You got that swing? I got that swing. I don't think it ain't no big thing. Very close indeed. Very close indeed. I think it's possible. I think it's very possible. Your days are numbered. Anyway, let's continue. I'm watching you. Maybe the balloon's watching us too. Evil balloon. There we go. Evil balloon. Evil balloon doesn't want us to succeed. We'll succeed. If it's the last thing I do, it will not be the last thing I do. It's it's only it's only 7:30. If that's the last thing I did, this wouldn't be very much of a not one of those parties that continue all night type of things. It's not a party that continues all night. But we've been going pretty far so far. We're at the six-hour mark. I love this game so much. It does not feel like it's been six hours. That's what it feels like we're just kind of on a game day. There's always opportunities on a game day. I like having a game day. I feel like it's no different than, like, working on a project that you're really passionate about all day long. Making progress nonetheless. That's, that's how I feel about it. It feels like a hobby. It feels like a project that I'm working on. I like it. So why not play some more games? Why not play some more times? I've got my other priorities all stashed away. Okay, let's try, I don't know, these ones? That was totally not... That was totally off the mark. Oh, that was so low. Can I get them all? Can I get them all? Yes! Oh my gosh, all three of them. That was wonderful. That's good. That's good. It's very good. I don't even know how I'm supposed to do balloons in this one. Oh, I managed to get two of them. All right. Um... Shoot a balloon over there. Nope. How about shoot a balloon over here? At an angle. Alright, only one. That's okay. Uh, there. One. Just one. But one's enough. Oh, dear. 
One? It's okay, it's fine. It's fine. Can I get both? Yes! Did I get to play the win uh, get to play win trace yet in the hide and seek event? I have not yet to play uh wind uh, win trace. I haven't played that one yet. I kinda got through all the uh, stones and whatnot the other day. I think. Was it the stones? Yeah, the fruit shards. That was cool. It was good. It was very good. Uh down we go. Oh, that's another one. That's it was good. It was very good. Very good. Nice. But I managed to get all the fruit shards, and I have not been able to play the wind trace event yet. I was a little low on time yesterday, so I had to had to get off early. It'd be cool if I got the second one too, but I didn't. But that's okay. Can I shoot that one? That's another balloon. And how about this one? Oh my god, there's two more! Oh, can I get it? Yes, there's one more! Oh my goodness! That's quite a distance, but can he do it? Can he do it? He's got two shots. Two shots from here. Okay, no, but that's okay. There's plenty of other... There's another rocket. Oh, the distance? A little too high. Last time I ran, I have one more try to get that one. I don't know if it's doable. Of course it's doable. It has to be doable. How can it not be doable? That was it. That was it. Yes, that was it. We popped up the balloons! Warning. Incoming popping sound. I beat you! Oh, come on! Pop. I dare you. There we go. Balloon has been popped. You just wanted to get Diona during the event, so I joined co-op and some players helped me get the points to get Diona. Dude, I... Same. Same. I really wanted it. You did it! I did it. I really wanted Diona. I had no idea. Like, I was like, eh, I'm not gonna really play this event. I'll probably, uh, skip on this one. But then I noticed that Diona's like, she's a little bartender girl. I'm like, oh my god, bartending. I, I like the bartend stuff with the mixology and the shaker and stuff. I was like, I had to have her. I had to have Diona. And so now I have Diona. And she's got that little shaker thing that she does. I've got my little shaker thing that I do. And it was just, it was awesome. I was like, I love that. She's also a cat girl, which for some would be more of a reason to have her. I'm just like, that's just, just it adds to that kawaii-ness, I guess. Adds to that kawaii-ness. Oh, we need the rest of the kiwi. Oh, was that there? there? That was the last one, right? All right. Time to go to Serena, Be uh, Ser uh, Serena Beach. More shine sprites. And she's a Capricorn like you. Oh, nice! Do you know if any of the characters are Scorpios? I'm a Scorpio. I didn't realize you could even check what their star sign was. But I suppose they all have birth dates, so... I guess that makes sense. In we go, to the beach! Let's go to the other beach, other beach? I was gonna say we could go to the beach, but there is already one beach, but... The Hotel Lobby Secret. This is a spooky one. Spooky wookie dookie. Yeah, if you have a chance to check and get back to me. I mean, aside from that, if you don't wind up checking, that's okay. I'm gonna wind up checking at this point. I'll write that down for myself. I have all these different colored markers. Scorpio characters, Genshin? I gotta know. I gotta know. I gotta know who I vibe with. Do 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 <laughs> the the music here is just so oh, it's got that vibe it's got that like luau vibe like hot evening smooth love that um hey um it's mario right yeah mario um listen i um i have a feeling you can help me out again see uh, the hotel it's uh well it's full of uh, the ghosts so, well, maybe... Look, just come inside. Somebody's got to help me with this. I I can tell you're a miracle worker, so please don't be modest. You even have the look of somebody who may be related to somebody else who also fights ghosts for a living. Anyway, please, I'll take you inside. Like Luigi. Hey, look, ghosts. Awesome. Well, if I'm about to convene with the paranormal and supernatural, better get myself mentally ready for this. Mentally prepared. <laughs> I 
I can't exactly remember what the secret is, but I know you have to try doors and eventually you find it. It's like in the attic or something. Oh, door's locked. Let's try the next one. How about this one? This one? Bad door. Good door? Bad door. Nasty door. Can I get some can I get some platforms up in here? Platforms up in here? Can I get some platforms up in here? Get some platforms up in here. Oh, did that work? Can I please get the ledge? Thank you. Can I go inside? Ooh, secret. This must be the secret. It must be the secret! There's something spooky going on the totem. Thanks for taking my flood from me. Anyway, look at all these bricks. Oh, they remind me of bricks. Oh, hey, Spuddy. Hey, Spuddy. These things remind me of tiny little, like, not, not actually potatoes, but they remind me of the word spud. Like, I feel like they'd be called spudlings. I'd call them spudlings. They just feel so spuddy to me. No! Oh, shit. We all fail sometimes. We all fail sometimes. Let's do it one more time! Or as many times as it takes. Hello, spudlings! Hello, spudlings. Little spuddy things. Spud spawn. Spud spawn! I don't call them spud. Oh, that one just fell off the ledge. Alrighty then. I don't question this reality. I, I contain it. Alright. Hello, sp flying spud spuddler? Spuddler. I'm gonna use you. Thank you. I required that. Thank you. No! Why? Why would you do that? I will cut off a piece of my kiwi and console myself with kiwi piece. Kiwi piece. Also, I should have my towel over here. I'm making a bit of a kiwi e mess. Yes, oh, that worked. Well, I didn't know I could do it that way. There are many ways to play. The Super Mario Brothers. Thank you. I'll take it. I'll take it. Oh, let's get over. Let's get spudly. Thank you. Let's get spudly. Let's get spudly. Let's get spudly. You make this joke with my sister's girlfriend about how Toad's scream when he falls out of the void is so brutal that Princess Peach is just there with graceful like, ah, Toad's is like, ah, and then Mario's just like, oh, whoa, 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 and then Luigi's just like, kind of the same, and I imagine Waluigi's is something like, ow, 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 ow. actually, that's kind of Yoshi. -y. I don't know. I scream sometimes. Sometimes I scream on camera. Just, just a bit. Let's get to it. Let's get to it. Let's get Sandy Blast. Uh, I want to be over there. I'm going to be down there. There's like, whoa, please stay on top of the sand. Thank you for staying on top of the sand. Mario, please. We have guests here. Be on your best behavior. All right, we got it. Um, can I break these blocks? No. All right. So, I need to get over there. Can I break these watermelons? I can break the watermelons! I didn't know I could break the watermelons. I forgot. I'll be honest, I forgot. I forgot how to break the watermelons. Alright, down we, down we go. There's probably something over- Oh, look at that, there's a little rolly block. No! I cannot believe you- Ooh. Oh, I like game over! That's the first time I've game over in six hours. Let's do it again. I just gotta climb my way back up to the tower of the Goosty Goosts. <laughs> I cannot believe that. That's what I get. That's what you get when you don't watch your lives. Remember, gents, ladies, and those in between, if you're not watching your life total, you'll die. You only have one life, so. You know? Let's do it again. I forgot I unlocked this. That'll help me get up very easily. Thank you for helping me get up there, Flood. I think one of my favorite parts about this particular level is one of the one of the uh, missions that you do is you go down to a little casino area of the hotel. I love that. 
Also, there were probably one-ups in that area that I just wasn't looking for. So... That's my beef. I, I partially blame myself. Actually, I fully blame myself. I'm the one who's got their hands on the controller. Oh, Mario, Mario, Mario. Dude, Mario, what are you doing? Eh, something about ghosts and whatnot. Can I have you inside? Please, just come inside. I know it's cold outside, baby, but please come inside for the night. It's a Christmas miracle. You're a Christmas miracle worker, Mario. Am I really? Am I really this magical, magical force that you think I would be? Mario is Santa Claus. Confirmed. Oh, can I? I thought I was able to turn you into a platform by using my water ability. But apparently, you just have to go and be all weird like that. That's fine, I guess. Can I climb upon your... Can I climb upon your well-placed platform? Okie dokie, then. We can also do it that way if you'd like to. There are many ways to play. All right. Let's do it. I love that little statue there. Like, its face is just like... Something about everything having their mouths open in this game. The eel thing. Mouths open. The goo piranha plant things. Mouths open. Petey piranha. Mouths open. That boo statue thing. Mouths open. Something about it. I think it's a metaphor, you know? It's probably a metaphor for uh, coming to terms with the fact that you have to not only keep, you have to keep your mind open. So the metaphor in this game is to keep your mouth open. Maybe, I, I, I don't you know. What I, I'm happy. I, I'm happy. I'm cool with this. Let's do it again. Let's do it again. Let's go this way. And this way. And let's go this way. And, whoa! And get on top of there. And then, ooh, ooh, ooh. Let's see what these pineapples have in store for us. Any lives? Well, no lives, per se. It reminds you of a pit bull named Pumpkin, since when she yawns, her mouth is really wide open. Like, dude, some of those cute little doggies just always kind of walk around with their mouths open. It's cute. It's cute little puppies. Ah, uh, just a coin! I didn't want a coin, I wanted a life. Are there any lives around here? Any lives around here somewhere? Ah, uh, yeah, don't think so. Why would I go this way? Why would I go down that way when I can go up here? There's literally no benefit except for coins. Like, duh, Mario. No, I can't believe you do this to me, Mario! Where are the one-ups in this stage? I thought there'd be one-ups in this stage. There are no one-ups in this stage. Actually, you know, maybe it's... Perhaps it's down here. No, I got hit! Oh. Oh, 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 oh. There we go. Well, I haven't found any one man so far, so it's unfortunate that I haven't got bother. That was a close one. Didn't think I was gonna make that one, to be perfectly honest. Wee! Oh, you're jumping around like a, like a plumber, I guess. Plumbers jump around a lot? Yeah, probably. In well, this universe, they certainly do. Ah, come on, get up on the blocks. Yes, yes. All right, Mario, don't, like, die or do that thing that you do when you don't succeed. Don't fail. Yeah, don't, don't fail. That's, fail's the right word to use. Do not fail. Don't fail me now, Mario. Okay, okay, sand block, and then sand block, and then dangerous sand block, and then more sand block, more, more sand block. All right, let's go down here and not, like, fail to walk into a single platform. I, like, fell between that tiny little crack. What? Why would you do that? No! What, <laughs> what is going on? <laughs> All right, I just have to jump a little less cool then. You know what? I need to be less cool for that. So I'm going to put my sunglasses on. Which makes me infinitely many times less cool than I already am. Mario jump and be a laugh. Yahoo! Yahee! Wee! Oh, yeah! And then he falls to his doom and he's like, Oh, no! What a way, what a world. Actually, how many lives do I have left? Two! Well, I mean, I have two tries left. I have one life left, as in extra lives. That was always a concept that got me. I was like, why does the life counter say one, when clearly I'll have two more tries? Like, computers start counting from zero. I'm, that's, what I'm, that's what I'm going with. 
Or at least that's how, that's how I start counting. I count from zero. On the computer, at least. Unless you're using MATLAB. MATLAB starts counting from one. I was like, wow. Why count from one? What's the point of that? Everybody else counts from zero. Not humans, of course. But in the computer world, all these languages are counting from zero. I cannot believe it. That's the thing. Every single time I die, I know for a fact if I just moved a little bit slower or thought about what I was doing, I wouldn't have the same problems that I currently have. I think it- stop. No, no, please. Oh, god. No, no. Okay, I did that on myself. Alright, let's do it again. Let's go! Let's do another one! With the power of Kiwi- Oh, I dropped my post in this. And another Kiwi. More Kiwi, more Kiwi. On the bright side, I only gotta do it once. Somehow, I'm having a harder time on the stages that never gave me problems in the past than I am on the stages that gave me, like, infinite amounts of trouble in the past. Actually, I'll admit, I think this one did give me trouble in the past. It should be so simple. Mario removes his feet from the ground to go up, and then uses those feet again to fall upon another platform as he returns back to the Earth, or to wherever gravity is pulling him. It should be so simple. It should be so simple, but yes, yeah, Mario's not into it. Ma'am, please calm down. Thank you for calming down. Listen, I've got this hotel that you could probably stay in. I'll give you a night for free if you want to stay in the master suite with me. I'm sorry, sir. I have ghosts to attend to. Okay, no problem. Maybe, maybe next time. I had this really nice place uh, on the other beach that uh, makes really awesome smoothies. I like to think that the hotel manager is actually just like, he's like, Mario, I just, I just want to know you, Mario. I didn't even know there were ghosts in there to begin with. I just wanted you to come to my hotel. Oh, please. There we go. Oh, no, 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 no. That worked. Can we go inside? I want to go inside. Inside mouth. Inside mouth. Ah! All right, you know what they say. Third time's the charm. I like charms. Charmy, charmy bee. Charmy, charmy bee. Charmy bee. From the Sonic the Hedgehog series. Now that I've got a GameCube to work, there are some other like GameCube games that I absolutely loved. That I should totally play again. I was gonna think, the Sonic games are all, like, on PC, so I don't really have to use the GameCube for that, but it would feel so much more authentic if I had a GameCube file. But, like, things like, uh, like Sonic Meg Mega Collection, I loved that game. I could play, like, Sonic R, or, uh, Sonic, if I could, I could play Sonic Heroes. That could be fun. The world seems to be really enjoying Sonic Heroes right now. Oh. You're imagining seeing pink ghosts in real life and how freaky they would be compared to just stare at the ghost and then look right back to it. Then their mouths are open, they got their tongue flopping out, and you'd just be like, dude, can you put that away? You can put that away. It would make all of us very comfortable if you would put that thing away. Put that thing back where it came from. Or so, help me. No! No! Okay. The wow, that was almost very scary. Oh! Okay, okay. Cameron? You got this. Here, you know what? Look for one-ups. Are there one-ups over here? There's gotta be one-ups over here. One-up, one-up, one-up. Is there a one-up on this pineapple? Is there a one-up on this pineapple? Nope. How about this watermelon? Uh, how about how about this watermelon? How about this watermelon? Could there possibly be one on this watermelon? Or maybe this watermelon. How many watermelons have to die before I'm satisfied? Hey, a coin. Uh, life? That's how many- That's how many have to die. Now I'm satisfied. I'll never game over again. 
All right, That's, this is all we have to do. We have just have to walk. That's all Mario needs to do. He just needs to walk. It's not difficult. No, oh my God! At least we got another life. We're good. We've got another life. It's okay. It's okay. So, you know, that's that's a thing. You know what? I'm about to reflect on life for a moment, right? Right. Vibe with me for a moment. There are some things in life that just come so easy to some people that to even people who are absolute masters in their field can sometimes get so utterly frustrated and stuck over, like, two plus two, two times two, two different answers, I assure you, obviously. But, like, I like to, I like to relate that to times like now, where I'm like, jump, Mario, jump. And Mario's like, wahoo, yeah, wahoo! And you're like, I get that, yep. That's exactly what we expected. Now, can you yee-hee, wahoo, yee-hoo, where I tell you to? And Mario just like, here we go! And then he flies off the edge. Or he slips and he falls, but everybody slips and falls sometimes. It's okay. Even Mario, the great jump man, star man, star man Mario, Nintendo, flagship character, has trouble sometimes. And therefore, so can someone like myself. So I think we should just take it slow in life. Take it, take it a little, take life a little slower. Like this, slow. Slow roll. Oh! It's okay. It's okay. That's all right. We'll just try it again. What was it that Bob Ross once said? Happy little accidents? Well, that wasn't an accident. That was totally on purpose. <laughs> I did that on purpose. I just wanted to feel the feeling of death again. I was so comfortable with living. So comfortable with this living world that I thought, you know, it'd be cool. If I tried the death for once, you know, I might go up the right side. Go up the right side. I can do it again. I can do it. Of course we can do it. You don't do it. <laughs> I've done it before. How can I not do it now? Right, Mario? R Mario, you agree with me, right? Mario? Mario? Please respond, Mario. What's your comment? <laughs> Oh, yeah, okay, gotcha, gotcha, yeah. That's what you always say. And the mare, and then run. It's okay. On the bright side, I've solved the game over problem. I just gotta bite. As long as I can get over here, I get these watermelons. These watermelons. All right, all right, Mario. Let's do this nice and cool, right? Nice and cool. And then when that looks flat, you walk on over. And then when this looks flat, you can walk on over. And then when that looks flat, you can walk on over. Oh, I a little bit of a little bit of a slide there. That's okay. Oh my goodness gracious! Well, that was something that I was woefully unprepared for. Oh my god! Oh, hello, Sand. No. Oh my goodness! We can do it just fine. We're fine. We're good. We're good. <laughs> We're good. We're chill. Slow, slow and steady wins the race. We got this. Like what baffles me the most is that I'm like there are so there are things that are based on luck that I've done better than. This. There are things based on luck that I've done better than this. Maybe it's because I have my shades on. Maybe I should take my shades off. Yeah, shades off. Don't bite kiwi. Sniff kiwi. It's the kiwi of luck. The kiwi of power. With the kiwi of luck and power, Mario and I will succeed. Okay, that's not exactly what I had in mind, but all right. Okay. Yep, we can. Yep, 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 yep. We can just. Yep, all right. Watermelon, hello. Okay, now we get a different view. I love the flapping sounds that these things make because they, you know, they're flapping their little wings. It's very fun. Like, like, click, 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 click. I feel that. I feel that on my bones. It's resonating with me. It's resonating with me on the deepest levels. That's the thing about platformers. I think it's the fact that the smallest of things can frustrate me so that actually gives me a nice release for my innermost anger qualities. Oh, that almost was terrible. That was almost bad. Yes, there we go. Now for watermelon time. When you did your ascension quest in Genshin, it was like really struggling during it. Kept dying, so it was like the lower level, and every single boss was like 59 and 60. 
See you waiting today. Can't, yeah, I get you. I get you. If I ever got like, if I ever got so frustrated with a game or whatever level, I'd definitely just move on to the next level. I'm not at that point yet. I'm, I'm pretty good at realizing that. Like, I have this stubbornness in me that, like, kind of is a source of motivation that kind of keeps me going. And it usually works out all right. Okay. A little fast. A little fast there. On the bright side, no game over yet. Because I've been collecting those one-mans. And like I said before, on the bright side, I only have to do this once. Successfully once. Nope, not falling off the edge. That'd be cool if you didn't do that in the Thank you. Plus, I always catch myself addressing Mario as if he's something that- He's somebody who could stop whatever's going on on the screen. It's just a way for me to trick myself that I'm not completely in control. Because if I'm partly in control, then it's obviously my fault that I've died. And it usually is. It's totally my fault that I've died. Obviously. Obviously. Change that camera angle. Go around a little bit over here. Oh, good. Whoop. Okay. Um, inverted camera. The inverted camera gets me. That'll get me. How many lives do I have left? How many times have I done this so far? Maybe a dozen times? Maybe a dozen times. You know what? This time I'm going real slow. This time I'm going real slow. Real, real careful. Oh, see? That was too fast. We must go slower. Oh, one. Okay, wait. Wait, wait for a moment. There we go. And then we run. And then we jump. Jumpy. And then that's perfect timing, so we're gonna do that. Yeah, it's okay. What am I, like, 60 sprites in? I'm almost 50, uh, 53 sprites in. This can't be the one. This won't be the one that defeats me! I will continue! With the might of a thousand Kiwis of might, that is. Not all Kiwis are Kiwis of might. So, uh, we, uh, we will prepare for the Kiwis that are so mightful. There we go. See? Nice and slow. Slow and steady. Slow and steady. There we go. On these, on these sand blocks? Sand blocks? Sand blocks. Sand block. See? That was, that was a nice little flippy. Nice little flippy. Come on over here. Hello there. Watermelons. I've only made it to those sand blocks once. I feel it. This time I feel it. I feel a kinship with Mario. I feel that we can do this if we do this together. Nope. Oh, oh, oh. That was close. That was close. There we go. Very, very slow. Don't slip. Don't slip. You may fall. There we go. Gonna go up there. Gonna go to this block. And then I'm gonna change my camera angle to this block, which will hopefully help me in this. There we go! Oh, yes! Hi there, Spudly! Thank you for supporting me in this journey there, Spudly. Oh, you're gone. Okay, well, you clearly haven't supported me at all, I guess. Bye-bye. Yes. That was good. That was lovely. That was well-deserved, I think. I think that was a well-deserved win. I think we've been, we've been waiting on a win for a while. Yes! That's cause for it. You know what? That was so difficult. I'm gonna celebrate. Oh, this one doesn't make sound. Oh, it does make sound! Oh, there we go. Nice. That's celebratory. There we go. Back inside. <laughs> We're doing it again! Not the same thing. We're just proceeding on with the level. There we go. Da, 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 da. The mysterious Hotel Delfino. Everything's either dolphin, like the word is either dolphin based or pineapple based. Peanut Park, Pianta, or I guess that's kind of similar to like, like, uh, uh, Pinata, I guess. Which I mean, pin, you dig. Hi there, sir. How are you in staying? Are you enjoying your stay? Are you enjoying your stay? A day of relaxing by the sea just washes away your troubles. Thank you for those wise words of wisdom. You're right. A day by the sea just washes away all your troubles. Hello, sir. How can I help you again? Oh, dear Mario, please come right in. Do I sense some reluctance? Come now. Don't doddle, don't doddle. Come inside, come inside. There's nothing waiting for you to kill you. 
Nothing will kill you here. Something will kill me here. <gasps> Yoshi needs a pineapple. But where's the pineapples? Do you know where the pineapples are? If you see the pineapples, point with your finger. Are any of these pineapples? No, no, no. Those aren't pineapples at all. Where would we find the pineapples? Certainly not in the women's bathroom. Hello, ma'am. Will we find pineapples in the men's room, perhaps? No, we cannot. Though, perhaps we'll get find it up this way. Oh yes, you can go up through the levels over here. While trying to pull for a Yanfei, you got Mona and C3 Noel. Nice! I don't remember what I've pulled for recently. Let's see, I got the Yona. What did I get last? Um, I don't really remember, honestly. Oh, there's a boo. And if I if I bring the boo out. <laughs> Spooky. That was cool. Scary, scary, scary. Now I'm in somebody else's room. I think the pineapple's actually up in the attic. Hey, kids! How you doing? You scared of those little ghosts over here? It'll get you. It'll get you. Oh, you're scared, aren't you? It's okay. I'll make you not so scared by killing these ghosts. Okie dokie. Woo! Go on through. Can I pass on through? Oh, they have to all be boofied. Boof. 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 No, not that one. Boof. There we go. On uh, this one. Boof. Nope. Not, not boof enough. Boop, 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 boop. Nope. A little bit more. A little more. A little more. Yeah. Oh! Yes! Thank you. Now I'm over here. Hello, ghosties! Hello, ghosty ghosts! You want to help me with the with the mission I have? Oh, okay. I'll just jump up on here and then I'll go up into the air ducts. Oh, these are not the air ducts. These are just merely the master bedroom. Hi, pal. How do you feel about the fact that I just infiltrated your room? This is trespass. <gasps> Wait a minute! Where did you come from? I'm calling for help! You're damn right you're calling for help. But remember, no help will come. This is a Mario game. The only help there is is Mario. And when Mario's the enemy... What do you do? Do I hear a shine sprite? Really? Why do I don't hear a shine sprite? That's weird. I thought this was all about... I, I don't really know. Maybe this... Yeah. I don't know. Well, I'm up here now, so that's pretty cool. Door? Oh, I can just go right in here. Hello, pal. I'm gonna go into the air ducts, so don't mind me. Oh, alright. I don't like you! Big ghost- Ow! We'll go this way. Nope, 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 nope. It's a little bit- <coughs> Excuse me, a little bit of a maze up here. Oh, look at that. I made it to the center. There's a star in the center. Maybe if I hit the star just right. Pow! Oh, that wasn't what I wanted at all. I want to go in there. But I can't go in there. Oh, yes, I can. I can. No, you're not going to let me. <laughs> hey, you! No one in the pool without proper swimwear! Shh! You! You little... Oh, my God. I'll recover from this. I've been rejected. I don't deal well with rejection. I've been rejected by the swim pool. I, I can't swim. It won't let me swim. What will I do? I'll have to find another way in. That's what we'll have to do. We'll find more. More ways to get into the thing. Oh, there's a blue coin right there. That's cool. I like blue coins. Blue coin's good. Oh, I have to come up from the, a different angle. But I got a blue coin. So not that way. Hello. Yeah, I, I see you there. I see you there. And I won't let it happen. There's another area down that way. That might actually be... Is that the one? I'm gonna go over that way. But I don't have access in that direction. But how do I get past the booze? I don't exactly know how to do that. I need to come up from a different angle. Clearly I need to look at this problem from a different angle. I've already found that that's not the way. What other ways are there to get inside, though? I can't just... Can I Can I get these loops? Nah. I can't just do that. But I see an area over there that I can go to, so maybe if I head up in this direction... Nope. 
Do you want to open? Hmm. What about this one? No. Hmm. No, no, no. Not that one either. This one was the one I was in before. Oh, just kidding. So I want to get over here. And there's a way to get in from above. I know there was a way. What was it? Is there a way to get into the other room next door? I don't think there was. Up here. Okay, so what I want to do is I want to go that way. I want to be above right over here. So I want to get into there. That little area where the coins are. That's where I want to get. And in order to do that, I have to wrap all the way around the back. I see an opening over there. I see an opening way over that way. If I can get into there, I can get into where I need to be. So that way. That's where I'll search for. Unless. Oh, did I? No, I did not. Go this way. I guess I have to go back to down through the uh, things again. Oh, that's the thing. Oh, I need Yoshi, because Yoshi can get rid of those ghosts. That's what it was. How could I forget? But I need that pineapple! Is there a pineapple in there? Are you telling- is- do I- did I just see a pineapple in there? I think I just saw a pineapple in there. Pineapple? Oh, I thought I saw a pineapple. There's no pineapple in there, so we're good. Well, where could the pineapple be? Was there a pineapple in the hot tub? Pineapple in the hot tub! No, just, just you. Just you, old lady. I wish I remember where the pineapple was. That'd probably make this a little easier for me. I know all these rooms are blocked off, so you have to get into the bathroom. I know you want a pineapple there. Poor Yosh. Poor Yosh just wants a pineapple. I'm gonna be on a special lookout for pineapple. Pineapple? You're not a pineapple. What about over here? Do y'all have pineapples in this room? You kids are all running around like crazy. But I don't see no pineapples. Maybe one of these boos are holding the pineapple. Yeah, maybe. Nope, that kind of works. Hey, died too. Nope. Pineapple in this room? Anybody? Anybody? Any takers? Pineapple? Pineapple? No. I cannot remember. On this surface, and I go up. Up through here. I think there was something about this, right? Oh, yep. I can go to the room next door. And what do I find? I see a boo on the wall. What do I find? I got a boo on the wall. I can go down through here, or I bet I can do this. Yep, break that open. That's what it was. Hey, blue coin. We love to see it happen. I love to see it happen. Oh, hi there. Yeah, you, you got me. Pineapple? Anybody got a pineapple in here? Any pineapple? Pineapple? Oh, I see is there a way to get up from your room? Oh, I see. Right there, there's a glass table. I bet if I go up... Is there a little area here? Nope. But what if I go down through here and I can come up through the bottom? Let's try it. Oh, now I'm down here. Oh, hi, box. Another pineapple! Yeah! That's exactly what we were... Oh, you took my pineapple from me. Where the pineapple go? Oh, it's in the it's in the corner. How dare you? Oh, there's just, there's a lot of pineapples here. An infinite number of pineapples. Oh, I'm gonna take this and can I not come out of the room with it? Wait, uh, what? Maybe there's a. I need to remove pineapple from room. There's so many pineapples, but what can I do about it? No! I thought I found what I needed. Can I can I come through? Oh yes, I can. I can actually walk through with the pineapple. Got scared for a moment there. Yush! Take this! Let's fly! Now we can go wherever we want to! Me, Yoshi, it's a lovely time. A match made in pure heaven. Go over here and we can get these ghosts out of the way. Go over here, I can... Uh, I need you to... Uh, yeah. Can I like... That's that's a way to do it. Okay, then you turn into a platform. Thank you. Oh, come on. You, why won't you get on top of the platform? Why won't you platform? I want you to platform for me. Yoshi, come on, dude. There we go. 
Oh, come on! Yoshi got the... Come on, Yoshi. There we go. That worked. That scared me for a moment. I thought it would... I thought it couldn't be done. Can I come through this door? I can't. Oh, but you know what I can do? Uh, then I can go this way. Yeah? I can go up? No. Oh, I see the thing up there. Hey, pal. Can I bother you? No, I fell through! I don't want to do... Oh, you know what? But I can do this now. I, I thought... Can I not kill you with the power of the goo? I thought... Oh, I can eat you. Okay. I need to consume. We must consume for the benefit of the hotel managers! Everybody else. Okay, so now I'm over here. Can I... Now what? Got all these coins. Got all these coins. I unlocked it. So now what? Can I go through this door with Yoshi? I can't seem to go through the door with Yoshi. Well, now I need to get up to... the ventilation area. I wish I remembered. Honestly. How to do this. Yoshi. Yoshi, can you... Can you, can you, can you go through the... Nope, we can't go through the... No, we can't go through the door. Oh, this is a predicament, ain't it, Yoshi? Well, where do we go now from here? I can't. I can't. Can I bounce on this couch? Can't bounce on the couch. Can I go through the doors with Yoshi? I mean... I don't know if I can actually go through the doors with Yoshi. I've always been fuzzy on this level, specifically. Maybe there's something in the wall. Wall, 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 wall. Nope. Just consuming by Yoshi. Spit his goobal over the wall. Thank you, Yoshi, for being such a pal. Okay, well, I can't. I can't just go through the doors. So that wasn't the way to go about doing. It. But I need Yoshi up there. Oh, puzzle games doing their puzzly things. All right. Well, I don't know if I can do anything about Yoshi. Can I get him through the door if I open it? If I open it with Mario, can I get Yoshi through the door? Come on. No, I can't actually move to the... No. 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 Get through the door. Yoshi. Yoshi, please come in. No. I lost you. Oh, but I can't get rid of them now either because... Oh. Sigh. On the bright side, the ominous feel of this hotel is absolutely doing things for my mojo. Do that. Go through there. We'll go back over this way. I'm gonna find the Yoaster again. Perhaps in a better way than I did before. Nope! Oh, you can just die like that. Platform. Now I'm up here. There we go up here. And now we got Yoshi over here. Oh, there is no Yoshi over here. But I can use the Yoshi over here. But he goes this way. And then, what do I do? What do I do, Yoshi? Oh, I needed to go down through here. There we go. Now I can kill Yoshi. With the power of water. Water. Wa water? Water. No, I want to... If I just use all my goo... Does he, does he run dry? I forget how to kill Yoshi. I need to kill Yoshi. I need to reset. Yoshi, I gotta reset. I have to kill you, my friend. I'm sorry. So in order to do that, I'm just gonna ask you to vomit everywhere. Use the power of the juice. Oh, did I get something? I just heard a coin. Hmm. My god, Yoshi, you have a... You got a lot in you. Maybe if I... Can I... Can I do it like this, maybe? Do I get coins the same way? If I do that, nope. I don't know, dog! Because I can't go back up there, can I? I definitely cannot. No, I have to kill Yoshi. I have to get him out of here. I have to get him out of here and give him more pineapple. Bring him back from the dead. I must bring Yoshi back from beyond the grave. Clearly, this entire level is giving me some issues. Alright. Bum, 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 bum. Why does it take this long for me to empty Yoshi's stomach? I, I think it kills him when you empty your stomach, right? 
it does it? I am unsure. You have nothing left, Yoshi. Oh, bye bye. Bye bye, Yoshi. Oh goodness, you turned back into paint. Well, now I can now I can grab this pineapple and bring you back to this earth anew. Reborn, some would say, is who you need to be, Yoshi. You were born to be a ghost hunter. You know what? Let's change your color. We got plenty of fruit over here. Gimme, 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 I want you to be pink, because pink is a beautiful color. Alright, let's try to do this the normal way. We've got to get you up to the upper levels. How are we going to do it? We're going to eat all those ghosts. Ghosty, ghosty, ghost? Nope, no ghost. Any ghosts over here? Nope. No ghosty ghost. Ghost! Oh, okay. That just sends me flying, apparently. But do I... Oh. Do I have to kill him first? There we go. Then I can hit you with my tongue. And Yoshi can't use doors. So instead, I'll go up this way. Because there's one door that Yoshi doesn't have to open. And that's this door over here. I should have known from the beginning. Come on, Yoshi. Let's bounce on the bed together. <laughs> We're bouncing on the bed together, me and Yoshi. <laughs> We're having so much fun. Anyway. No, please, Yoshi. I, it was only supposed to be for fun and games. Yum. Now I'll make a new path for myself. What is that over here? A oh, dead blue coin. That's a, that's a trick. That's a trick. It's a trick blue coin. You tried to get me, but you couldn't. I won't let you. Progress is being made. Yes. Now, it's not this area. I don't think it's this one. Let's just see what there is to find up here. There we go. There's more big boos. And technically, I only need Yoshi to be able to unlock those areas. I don't need Yoshi for anything else. Just the... Just like this. Another one. Yum. Oh, now I can go that way. That's the room that I need to be in. But I'm gonna go this way and unlock those ones, because there might be more blue coins for me to find. Oh, yes. Blue coins indeed. Some yellow coins over there. Is there something in this direction? Oh, there's a little thing. Nope. Oh! Gotcha. Nice job, Yosh. Very nice job. Is this the way I must go? This is one way I must go. And another one. Are there any blue coins in this direction? Any secrets that I won't know about till later? Well, it's, it's kind of a way. It's kind of a way to do things. A whole section. Yeah, and this is all pointless. Let's just go to where I need to be. Like, right in there. Yes. Uh, can I go this way? I'll go this way. And I'll wrap my way around this direction. This is where we must be. Come, Yoshi. Down we go. Oh, I'm leaving you. What? Oh, no! Oh, this was the wrong room! Oh, you're kidding me. That's funny. Oh, well, now I can unlock this. Shine spray. Oh, it's got a... It's got a blue coin in it. Well, I got a blue coin out of it. That's good. I just need to find my way back up to Yoshi and um, take, take it back. Okay, so that's the one I want to go to. The other one. Not the one I'm currently at. If I predict how things are going, I'm going to wind up trying every single possibility before I get to the one that is correct. Because that just feels like a me way to do things. Very indirectly. Is it that one? Might be that one. But I need my Yosh. <gasps> Where's my Yosh? Actually, I don't need my Yosh. What am I talking about? I need Yoshi. I've already used Yoshi for everything he's good for. Friendship. Companionship. Is it this one? Nope, it's not that one. But I know I can do that one. I'm gonna go over here and... Hi, everybody. I don't want to be over here. I don't want that one. Let's get my bearings straight. This is Hot Tub Area. I need to get to the Hot Tub Area. So in order to get to Hot Tub Area, I have to be... Where? Over here. In there, where all the coins are. Yep, that's the one. That's where I gotta go. 
Got to wrap myself all the way around over here, then back this way, and then continuing along this little pathway over here. And then we're going to make a sharp left over here. I found more coins. And let's go. Shout, shout spray. How to get into the pool area without swim trunks on. Truly, it is a mystery that we've all been wondering. That took much more time than it needed to be. Oh my god. Wowza. But we did it. Success was just around the corner. Except there wasn't a door for that corner, so to speak, in this metaphor. It can't stop there. Ba -da 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 -da. Ooh, here we go. Inside, 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 inside. The power that's inside. The casino. I love the casino. Excuse me. It's a little luck based, but also kind of not. You fight a monster here. And I like that monster. It's a nice little monster named King Boo. Well, now, Mario, you really should drop by the casino. I'll let my boys know you're coming. Come on, go on now. Okay, sure. Sure, pal. Yeah, yeah, we can do that. Yeah, yeah we can totally do that. So I need the casino. How do I get the casino again? Oh, it's gotta be over here. Back to go. Check back in the stream later. No problem, Synergy. Happy to have you around for all you are still here. I hope whatever it is that you are doing, you have fun with it, you have luck with it, and then it doesn't permanently damage you. Because that would be sad. Anyway, it's time to do some casinoing. We like the casino. We want the jackpot. There's one. Oh, sweet. Ah, oh, three coins. Nice. I like that. Let's do it again. A little bit. I want all the sevens. That's unfortunate. Gotcha. Let's do it again. More coins. I like coins. Coins are good. Let's do it again. Another boo. -hoo. Oh, we got the sevens. Yeah. Boy, we got the jackpot. Very happy. And what do we get for that? Nothing. Cool. I'm going to extinguish this fire over here because I can. And I'm Mario. Oh, look at that. Good one. I like that. Happy to know that extinguishing your fires is something good for all of us. I gotta get jackpot again. That gentleman over there seems very angry with his slot machines. Oh, this one's a... Okay, I want the seven. Seven? That's a seven. Seven? And a little, little flick of the, flick of the water droplet, so to speak. There we go. Look at that, the final puzzle! I didn't try these slot machines over here. I also didn't try this piece of fire over here. You got a blue coin for me? Got a blue coin for Mario? No, you're just sad and disappointed. What about these, the slot machines? Surely if I... If I play around with these slot machines, I'll get something, right? Can I win? Do I get the jackpot? I gotta get the jackpot. Jackpot, jackpot, jackpot. Hey, pal, why are you, um... Why are you so angry? The game's are rigged! Where's the manager? I want my coins back! No. All I can do is throw water at these things, so clearly I'm not helping anybody. Let's play another game! It's called... Mystery Square! What's behind the Mystery Square? It's a shine sprite, obviously. Over there. Right there. Little little flick of the flick of the water droplet, so to speak. Yep. Oh, oh okay. Nope. You got it. You got it. 
You got it. No. Nope. Okay. Gotta be very careful with. Oh. Oh no. A little bit to the right. Oh, wow, I'm just making a mess. Yeah, we got that one. That's cool. All right. Not exactly what we had in mind, but that's fine. A little bit like that. Okay. No, that's good. That's good. Now I can flip both of these. Hopefully, both of them. At least one of them. Nope. Oh, very close. There we go. That's nice looking. Oh, you're, that's nope. No, I flipped the top one. I didn't mean to do that. Casinos. The house always wins. Oh, I didn't want to do that. Nope. Didn't want to do that either. Why do you flip so much? Why must you flip me so much? Why must you flip? You know, this allows me to reflect upon my times when I went to the casino one time. We were in Atlantic City for an anime convention. And we were like, what, probably 16 at the time? And I was the under the impression, I mean, I knew that the gambling age in New Jersey was 16. I knew that, I looked it up. And then we got there and uh, my buddy and I started playing um, some of the games. And then an associate came by and was like, yo, you, can I see your kids' IDs? And I was like, don't worry, we're 16. Here's my driver's license. And they were like, yeah, but we serve alcoholic beverages here. Therefore, you actually can't be here because it's the equivalent of a bar. Oh, nice. Awesome. We did it. We did it, we did it, we did it. I'm going to increase my light a little bit. My light's getting a little weird over here. So I'm going to change that up a bit. There we go. That's, that's better than it could have been. You know what? That's fine. I'm not too worried about the light. I'll fix that eventually. White light. Cool. Brighten. Wow, I look so blue. My current obsession has been dealing with the light. So I'm going to figure it out while I can. Maybe a little brighter? A little brighter? Hey, it looks a little better. Face is a little red. How about that one? Eh, hey, whatever. I'm cool with it. I don't want to stress too much about it. I'm not going to stress too much about the light. Besides, the video game is the main show. And it looked beautiful, I think. Oh, this isn't the one where you fight King Boo. Oh, all right. I could have sworn it was. Jumpy. Woo! Bounce on over. I'll go this way. And where are you going? Oh, that's cool. Oh, you got something going on there. And I'm cool with it, I guess. Oh, look at that. I want that. Yes! I got that one man. Oh, I gotta hang over here for a little bit. Until this comes and hopefully doesn't kill me. Slowly but surely. Slowly but surely. Okie dokie. That's not too bad. Whoops! That worked out perfectly. Wow, I did not think that was going to work out that way. That's okay. I'm not actually worried about the one man's for now. Big block. Let's do it. Big old block is going to do what? One turn or maybe two? Oh, that was fine. All right. Well, we only got the next one, so... Ain't no problem. Woohoo! We did it! We did it! We did it! We did it! We got another shine sprite. We're at like 56 now. Things are moving well. Things are moving right along. In the world of Isle del Pino. Let's do a couple more of these before I take yet another break. My body just seems to need some breaks. Just needs to need some breaks. King Boo down below. What's up with you, Astro Rock 21? I hope your evening's going lovely so far. My evening is going just fine. The GameCube works. That's all I'm happy about. Really, it's the simple things in life. It works and it captures. That's all I can possibly ask for. That I could also ask for. You know, nice comfortable chair, which I have. I could also ask for um, quality lighting. I got that. I could also ask for. What else can I ask for? I don't know. 
That's kind of awesome. I could ask for a nicely, beautifully white wall, which I have. So, nice. Uh, Mario, Mario, the casino is this way. Well, actually, I must admit that unfortunately the casino's closed today. You see, there are creepy sounds coming from the basement. Therefore, we can't have it open, because that'd be weird. Could we trick you? Oh, <laughs> I mean, ask you for your help. Oh, you will? Thank you so much. Perfect. Not a bad night for you either. That's wonderful. Getting to sit down for dinner. I've been eating, I've just been kind of eating fruits all day, and I am very satisfied. I might probably take a little break to get something more substantial a bit. You play on Dolphin, and it can be buggy at times. Is Dolphin the emulator for GameCube, or is that a certain type of capture? I can't say that I'm super familiar. If you wouldn't mind enlightening me for a moment. Because I got, I got the GameCube, I, I guess, I'm guessing it's probably an emulator. Which is sweet. I was actually considering, if I couldn't get the GameCube to work, I was absolutely going to emulate, because I really had this urge to play Super Mario Sunshine. On the downside, the downside of that is, I wouldn't be able to, like, you know, wouldn't be able to use with the, uh, with the controller. Emulator. Thank you for confirming that for me. But I get to use the actual GameCube controller, and I don't know, that just, that does it for me. Purple! Here we go, down below. Wow, look, look at that, a big old, uh, big old circly circly roulette wheel. <laughs> this boss also freaked me out as a child, as did all the other ones. Naturally. Because I was also used to seeing the way King Boo looked in Luigi's Mansion, and this is not similar at all. Hello, pal. Oh, that worked. That wasn't what I was expecting to do, but look at that. Okay, or we can just hurt myself, like, a bunch. Oh, bounce. You got any coins for me, King Boo? Any any coins? I'd, I'd appreciate some coins. No, no, coin, no coins from you, Boo? No coins from you, Boo. Oh, I forgot. I have to I have to spin the wheel. I don't have to spin the wheel. I have to spin the wheel. Spin the wheel. Spin the wheel. Oh, there we go. Gotta spin the wheel. What do we got? Fruit. I love fruits. Give me that chili. Give me that chili pepper. That's what we're all about. We're all about that chili pepper. Chili pepper. Yes. There we go. Now's your chance. I just... Yes. What did we get? The boss just... <laughs> This boss just pissed me off because it took forever to figure out that you need the chili to kill him. Oh my god, yeah. That'll do it. Where am I get that? Oh no, I missed the chili pepper! I threw it! No, okay, there we go. Here, take this. Take this, pal. Eat that. No, what the Okay, fine, you can take a... Here, take a mango. I don't know. Ineffective, it's just laughing at you. Where'd that chili dog go? Chili dog, chili pepper? Whoops, I made that boo-boo. You need to throw the chili pepper at it, and then you need to throw other fruits at it. Then he gets all knocked in the head. Spin the wheel. I don't need to think- it's okay if things turn. Oh, that's not lucky. I mean, is any of this really luck? Hey, everybody. Hey, you got coins for me? If I defeat you, do I get co- Wow, okay, you were just being aggressive. Alrighty then. Yep, not fun. Well, at least we got some coins. Why am I bouncing? I do not want the- Give me the coin! Thank you. Oh, nice. We got this thing, too. You want some of that, boo? Take it. H how about another one? How about- How about another? Oh, you went down. Oh, please don't do that. Boo. 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 A boo! Oh, that hurt me. That's unfortunate. I might die on this one the first time. I was, uh, it took me a little- I was a little late to the, pa the party of understanding, so to speak. Oh, that's good, actually. Coins are good. I want coins. Yes. Give me those coins. Give me those coins. Da -da 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 -da. All right, what else you got for me, Boo Boy? Boo King? Boo King? King, as opposed to Queen, so I can call you Boo Boy. Boo Wow. Boo 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 boo. Is that fruit? Nope, that's not fruit at all. I honestly wasn't looking at the spinning wheel. Another one. And, whoa, okay. Well, I missed my fruit chance. So this may take a little bit. I forgot. I thought you needed to chili pepper and then, you know, wet his gullet. But, eh. I pray to the RNG gods. With those coins. I know, right? Finally, it's fruit time. 
Fruit time is here again. Give me it. Give me, give me, give me. Here, take, take pepper. Take pepper, and then literally take anything else. Whack! Please stop laughing at me. You taunted me, scares me. You're a scary, Mr. Boo. You're a spooky one, Mr. Boo. You really are a who? We try to rhyme around here. We try. Whoa! What's going on over here, everybody? Wow! Look at that! Look at wow! Look at everything! Oh my God! Whoa! I forgot this was a thing. Maybe you could like do me a favor and kill your partners over there. No, please. No, please, please. I had so much to live for. Yes, please. Wait, 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 wait. No! Why must you do this to me? All right, I'm gonna come over here where I feel like I have more control over my situation. Oh, he's gone. Alrighty then. Well, it's a good thing I only had to survive. More fruits. I want more peppers. You like dead peppers? You probably don't. But here, take this instead. It's purple on the inside. I don't know why, but it is. Can I have that? No! I was gonna grab the other one. I don't know if that would have worked, but... Eh. Spin that wheel! Ding! Oh boy. Here we go again. Oh, hi everybody. I can just... You're fish on land. You don't hurt me at all. For the spudsy boys. Oh, and then another fish. Another fish? Another fish? Another fish? Oh, okay. Missed it. But I got some coins. Unfortunate. Shucks that I can't use two chili peppers at the same time during the same interval. Oh well. I only got one more. I think I just need to hit him one more time. Easy. It's fruit palooza time again. Gimme, give gimme, give gimme. Give oh, 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 where'd, you, where'd my chili pepper go? Chili. Some would say it's chili. Down here in Del El Delfino, and they'd be right. Snaps for the now also dead again ghost. We'll probably just return back to being. Just doing back to a little, uh. Ah, uh, what is it? You're just back to the goo from which you came from, the paint. You're just paint. You're all just paint. Nintendo does love to use the number three. What was I watching the other day? I was watching actually something the other day where there was a boss fight where it wasn't, I mean, it wasn't the number three. It was many more than the number three. And honestly, it's like, it's really. I don't know. I have mixed feelings about the whole number three thing. I don't know. Do, 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 do. Uh, so how many more do I have there? What do we got? What do we got? What do we got? That was number f five. Okay, we should do it again. Gotta keep going. Gotta keep going. I still can't stop. Can't stop, won't stop. I'm gonna cut off another piece of this kiwi because I'd like another piece of it. Actually, no, that's kind of the end of the kiwi. <laughs> Crab in the Serena Beach. Oh, we're not doing the same thing again. We're not doing King Boo again. We're doing the other ones. Gotta get all those shine sprites. Oh, I gotta clean up the... Oh, I hate this. I hate this one. Mario, we've got trouble. That electric goo was back. Where? Oh. Uh, look around, dumbass. It's everywhere. Anyway. Oh, time to clean it up. This is annoying. I never liked this one. I never, never liked this one. But in order to proceed, we must continue. In order to proceed to the next one, we must continue. I never know if there was, like, a trick to this one. I really never knew. I guess these, these barrels, right? Would splash some water everywhere? Oh, for sure. Oh, it's time to do hopscotch. Oh my goodness, dear. You popped into like the wrong time. But I guess we're doing hopscotch now, so I'm hopscotching back and forth to, uh... Actually, I have socks on. This might not be very well for me. And I don't want to hit my chair. Oh, goodness, I've been run. Make sure I stand up. I gotta stand up. I gotta stand up. I gotta stand up and do some exercises. Now you'll get a wonderful view of my t-shirt. That's not a t-shirt. What am I talking about? Actually, I'm doing line jumps. Oh, this is not... You know, I'm gonna do line jumps for now because I'm having a dumb moment where I can't remember 
how to do the hopscotch exercise. And so that I don't, like, hurt myself while I jump around and line jump over my chairs. Not chairs, I mean just chairs. What am I talking about? There we go. I think that was enough. Acerduck, thank you for co-hosting. You're so kind. Kind as I bounce around like an absolute moron. Anyway, that's definitely enough jumps. I know it said hopscotch. I will make it up to you another time. But I needed to, I need some time to move my chair out of the way. I've been cheating a little bit today, to be honest. I've been doing a lot of cheating on my exercises. But I'm still exercising. I'm still doing the thing. I'm still doing the things. And that's a good thing to do. Exercising is good. All right, let's let's try to clean up all this goo. Oh, there was a tiny piece of goo there. That probably would have messed me up. I feel like the the uh, the trick to this is to be able to do like the this thing, but that only kind of works. It only kind of works to clean up all the goo. There is a method to do this right, and I just don't know. What it is. I'm trying. Gotta get all that goo. Gotta clean up all that goo. Clean up all the goo. That's what we gotta do. Gotta clean up the goo. We're almost there, aren't we? We're definitely almost there, right? Oh, certainly not. Alright. What am I talking about? Wowza. Nope. We're definitely not even close to there. Oh, I got a... Oh, blue coin. Well, that was worth the time it took. Oh, I did... Well, okay. Find them. We don't get that, then. It's like that one off. Alrighty then. Well, that ain't happening this time. I gotta take advantage of those bottles a little bit. You gotta do the explosion technique, yeah, right? When you press the right trigger to jump at the same time. Oh, yeah, yeah, I know. Or whatever it was. To be able to scatter everything around. Yeah. Oh, well. My head wasn't totally in the game for a moment. My head was also on my requested exercise. But that's all right. I played this game many times in the past, and this one always gave me trouble. But that's only natural. I think I wound up lucking it, like, most of the time. Scrubbing, scrubbing, scrubbing the beach. We've got trouble! There's electric goo! Oh, is there goo? Oh, goodness. Come on, give me the thing. Oh, goodness gracious. Get out of the goo. Wow. Three times in a row there, Mario. Do the thing. Then, like, it kind of works. It kind of works to get, like, a real spread out area, but not always. I think it just depends on where you use it, I guess. Sort of, kind of, sort of, kind of. Yeah, because there's, there's some tiny spots left over, too. Sometimes that happens. It's the tiny ones that get me. Yeah, it's a little, a little scatter shot, a little scatter shotty. All right, that seems to be at least everything on the beach. Well, there's Sina over there too. It's, this certainly helps. Ooh, there we go. Why can I clean up you folks too? Why don't I have to clean y'all up? Oh, got me. So, oh, good. Let's do this one. Wow, all right. Give me all hurt now, don't you? Oh, wow, I am very hurt. Well, I'm very hurt by this. Clearly. Clearly, I am very hurt by this particular accusation of thinking I have to clean up all the beach. Well, you know, we're trying. We're certainly trying. There's still more. Is that halfway there? Yeah, that feels about halfway there. First shot. Wow, actually, that really works over here. Wow, look at that. Wow, would you look at that? Actually, that's working really well. And then you just gotta go up to the tiny spots. It's kind of working. Can I do the rest of the minute? Let's see. Let's see about that. How about I don't have to clean you guys off? Da -da 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 -da. 
If I ever actually completed this in a, another playthrough, which I probably have, I definitely did it by luck and luck alone. Just so happening to actually complete it. A little bit more goo over there, there's more goo over here. Wow, look at that. That worked. For a little bit. A little bit over here. I think I missed the entire upper area. Whoops, okay. Well, we can do that too. Alright, now I have to find the rest of it. Oh, it's... I see right there. Trying to get it. It's very close. It's very close. Oh, okay. The timer stopped. Alrighty then. So we just have to clean up most of the goop. I'm happy with that. I'd say that, like, my heart was racing because I was beating the clock. I was trying to go against the clock. But honestly, I don't think I was paying enough attention to notice that the clock was running so low. <laughs> wow, that was great. I never expected you to do it so easily. Oh, fantastic, Mario. Take the shine spray. Why, thank you. Da -da 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 -da. Thank you, Rastro Rock, for reminding me about the spinny whirlpool thing ability. I probably would have just forgotten about it. As I tend to do, I'm a little dense sometimes. A little bit dense. But I'm the most dense when it counts. Or when it would have the most effect on the gameplay. Funny how things work like that. You, you indeed. Thank you. Thank you, Mario. Mario. I don't know what I was thanking you for. <laughs> Let's do another. Number seven. Just Shadow Mario. You're not difficult. You're not difficult, Shadow Mario. You want to be difficult, but you aren't. But where are you? This is just how it be sometimes. Sometimes you want to be Shadow. Sometimes you don't. How you doing there, hotel manager? What do you got? What do you got? Yeah, Mario, there's a troublemaker inside who looks like you. Hurry, go, go, get, go get him. Go get him there. Yeah, do that for me. Because you've been doing all these other favors for me, so why shouldn't I ask you for more? You know? I like to think Mario comes up to him after the fact. is just like, but seriously, though, like, where's my payment? Oh, hello. I didn't realize you could use co leave uh, copies of yourself here. I didn't know you could do that. Oh, it's the booze. Oh, you asshole. That's fine. That's fine. I poof you. Oh, you went to the door? Are you gonna come out? Where'd you go? Oh, man. It doesn't compensate me enough. I've been doing all of this dirty work for him. And just like, can you do some more for me, please? Like, no, not unless you give me my money. Give me the money! Or you know what? Not a money. Give me a shine spray. We need more. Oh, hello down there. Hello down there! You are resilient! Look at you go. Look at you go! Running up the stairs in your body form suit. And I know you're a Koopa, but like, my god, my friend. That suit works well. Maybe it's just because you look like me, Mario, but... Nice. Can we get... Oh, you look like you... It appeared. I had the impression that you were about to, like, you know, keel over. You come by this way, and then you're gonna go somewhere, and you're gonna show up on the bottom again. Yeah, you're down there. It's fine. Got you, got you, got you, got you, got you, got you, got you. Yes, please. What are you... You can run, but you can't hide, bitch! Come here, dude. No, I know you're gonna... Oh, there you go. What are you, what are you gonna do about it? What are you gonna do about it, pal? Huh? What are you gonna do about it? Run away? You can run, but you can't hide! Yeah, you're so annoying! Yes, I am. Oh, don't hurt. Yo, hey, Boo, haven't I been through enough shit? Yeah. Die twice. Lord knows I'm coming back to that Pianta hotel manager to come and collect. We'll save and continue. As we shall continue to do. 
one more shine sprite in that area in Sierra, Sierra, Sierra Beach? What's it called again? Serena, Serena Beach? I don't know, let's check. My memory escapes me. What do we call that place again? Serena Beach! Red coins in the hotel. After this, it'll probably take me another break. That seems to be the thing here. Complete an area, take a break. Because my bladder just keeps filling up. Who knows? I don't know why. Perhaps it's because I've been drinking all day. Tea. Well, it, was it was coffee first. Then it was tea. Then it was tea again. A nice pint of ear. Oh, can I... Sir. Sir, can we have a nice chat? I'd like to talk about my compensation. Um, I believe you know the currency that I take. Shine sprites. Mario, please do come in. Um, excuse me, sir. I think I asked you first about compensation. Oh, there's there's no time. Just please come inside. I'll be asking about it again when I come back. Do I have to do this in a time limit? Probably. Oh, can I? There's probably a time limit. I just need to know where they are. The timer runs out. There's one. Now we just gotta go in again. Am I going to drink any spicy water? Probably. After the beer's done. Spicy water, so to speak. You know, like cayenne pepper and water. Like, oh yeah, that's for sure. Oh yeah, we like spicy water around here. There's a, there's a red coin. Probably. I'll probably mix myself up a cocktail on this next drink. That'd be fun. Oh, that door's not open. Hmm. Where are the red coins? There's a bunch of marks all over the walls. I just gotta remember where all these coins are. And once I know where the coins are, I can map out a course for all of them. There's a thing in there. Can I enter? May I enter? May I enter the pool? Thank you. I like that. How are we doing so far? There's like four minutes left, and I got four. I'm halfway there. So nice. What kind of beer am I drinking? I am drinking one by a comp- Um, uh, excuse me. A distiller called River Horse, and it's their Raspberry Triple Horse. It's like a, it's a tripel beer, so it's kind of like a, kind of stouty almost. A little bit of like a, like a, um, like a deep, almost mocha note to it. I really like that. Plus, it's it's made with a bunch of raspberries, so it's kind of got that. It doesn't have the tartness of a raspberry. It's got everything else about the raspberry without the tartness. It's very pleasant. Uh, my uh, my buddy Dalukare uh, brought some over the last time they were up, and they were just kind of sitting in my fridge. And I'm like, you know what? Today feels like today. To crack open another one. Not really a big beer drinker, but when I have them in my fridge, like, yeah, I gotta use them. Or else they'll go bad eventually. Are were there any coins up here? Oh, I don't, doesn't seem like there's any coins up here. And I will look around and map out what I'm looking for. Any, 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 any? No, I don't see any red coins. Maybe this is just a method for me to get to other rooms that do have the coins. But first, blue coin! Thank you. When I'm done with the time limit thing, I'll be happy to throw up the, um... What is it? The River Horse. The, the actual bottle to showcase those who are interested. Hard Cider? Yeah, I like Hard Cider. It seems that Hard Ciders, from what I've found, are actually, like, very, very, uh... They all kind of taste the same, for the most part. Like, everyone seems to be trying to do, like, a version of, like, a, like, a, um, what is it, Mark, Mark's Harb, I think they do? Or Angry Orchard. Everyone's trying to do their own Angry Orchard, I think. At least in my area. It's, um, it's alright. I found that going between different types of beer, there seem to be a lot more different flavors. And, of course, there's even more possibilities in the cocktail world, which is where I like to go. I love to do some cocktails. What am I doing? I thought I had... Oh, that was a blue coin that I grabbed. Yeah, I don't think there are any other, um, red coins up here. Oh, another blue coin. Alright, cool. Nice, nice. I'm a big cocktail guy. In case y'all didn't know that already. Love to make, mix me some cocktails. Every once in a while I do streams on cocktails too. Which is nice. What's my area? The great city of Philadelphia! And the United States. Um, but most of the ciders I've actually- they're like- I don't know. I haven't tried a lot of ciders in this area. I tried, like, a pineapple cider one time. That was just weird. It wasn't really my style. Okay, I don't find any red coins up here, so I'm gonna try to get into the other rooms. I'm gonna get into the other rooms. I know I can go in here and go from room to room. Uh, oh no, I actually can't, so just kidding. I need to go up from the bathroom. Oh, I forgot to go up from the bathroom! There we go, I gotta go back down and come up from the bathroom area. There's probably a red coin in the bathroom, too. 
Oh yeah, look at that. <laughs> There's one in here. Who knew? You're over in Texas. Oh nice, what area of Texas? I've got some friends. I got one friend from, I think, Austin. Uh, she's from Austin. And then I got another friend uh, in Sugarland. I've never been there before. I was planning a trip one time, but uh, it had to it kind of fell for me because things got a little crazy. But I've been hoping to visit at some point. I want to try what they've got down there. Oh, look at that. Another coin. All right. And then I have to do this thing. Whoopsie. So I can pass through. Yep, turn slowly, but surely. Turn, turn. Thank you. San Antonio, nice. I'd like to say I know where that is geographically, but I'm terrible with geography. Oh, there's nothing in here. Oh, that's great. Now, how did I get over? Oh, I came in with the Yoster. Can I actually get up there from here? Oh, no, I don't know if I can. I do the flippy ability, perhaps, perhaps maybe. No, that's gonna make that difficult. Oh well. You were in Austin for a couple months for work. Hey, pretty cool. Pretty cool, pretty cool. Again, can't say I'm too, too familiar, but I've always wanted to visit. I think we we're gonna try, when we went down there, we were gonna go to um, Richardson. That's where we were gonna stay for a little while, but eh, it kind of felt good. Again, I have a friend whose family lives down there, and she goes there every once in a while, so, like, I need to go visit her at some point. So, about an hour, hour south of Austin. I've always been amazed by the sheer size of Texas. Like, for real, though, you can take, like, it's like three hours to get from, like, one city to another down there. Just, you know, it's, it's really, really big. It's a really big place. Understandably so. Pennsylvania's kind of big-ish, but my home state's over in New Jersey, and that place is small when you can think about things. Yeah, sure, it'll take you two and a half hours to go visit your friends who are going to college down south, but, like, compared to literally any other state for the most part, except, like, Rhode Island, Vermont, Connecticut, all those ones, like, yeah, yeah. Really not that long of a drive. Just try this again. Sometimes, yeah. It's just, there seems to be so many big cities in Texas and whatnot. Like, like, I thought, like, by knowing Austin and Dallas, like, I knew them all. Like, nope. Many, 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 many more that are really, really large. Not that I know of. So I accounted for, I think, what, five of the, five of the red coins? Let's keep on searching. There's one of them. There's some up in the regular areas. What about these ones? Your home place is actually in Wisconsin. Oh my gosh. I mean, you did a, did a bit of traveling now, didn't you? Wowza. I'll admit, my homelands haven't very strayed very, uh, strayed very far. But, um, I've visited, like, places overseas and whatnot, but I've really never lived anywhere that was far away from the home, the home state. No jarizy. I had six before? Thank you. That was six accounted for. I know there's two in the main areas. Um, there's three over here. I thought I'd be able to... Actually, I don't think there's a point to going in this room. Because I can't get up to the where I need to be. There we go. Flip those over. Peel on backwards. I can't seem to get up here, so I don't think there's actually a point to be in here. Oh, is there something going on over here? I don't remember. No. If I go up to the next level, I should be able to get somewhere else. I don't know. I'm going to try this one again. See if I like, go from over here. Nope, that didn't work. A little higher up, a little higher up, a little higher Nope. Thank you, Mario, for... Oh, maybe. I'm gonna try it a little bit. I'm gonna try it. Oh, no. Okay, no, I'm not gonna try that some more. Have you traveled around, like, mostly for work and whatnot? Because I know I've only been local because, like, let's see, I grew up in the New Jersey area. I'm going to school in Philadelphia. So that's really the only reason I needed to be around. I haven't had the need to go anywhere else, so to speak, except for, for, like, travel and stuff. I go down to South Carolina every once in a while. Love that state. Love that state. Or rather, I like the islands that surround the state. Love Hilton Head Island. That's where my family does their family vacation. That's where my, my family does their family vacation. I am part of that family. Duh. But that's always a good time. Just for new experiences. Dude, that's awesome. I wish I... I mean, I, I'd say that I wish I had the ability to do that, but I'm actually very happy, like kind of my situation right now. I'm living with my fiance up in Philadelphia. I'm finishing off my five years of college over here, um, which should be ending in a couple of weeks, actually. And then she's got two-ish more years, I think, left until she finishes up 
her um, PT, physical therapy degree. So um, after that, we're probably going to move somewhere down south, I think. But, uh, I love to travel around. I got a friend of mine who lives in uh, South Carolina right now, and I go visit him every once in a while. That's always a good time. He's stationed there for uh, uh, government work type thing. That's always a fun time. Okay, so I need to get up over here. I want to go this way over there so I can get to that other location. You live in Chicago, Utah, Arizona, Texas, and Wisconsin, all for those new experiences. That is awesome. I gotta say, I've probably got way too much stuff to want to lug around with me to warrant going to all those different locations and bringing all my stuff with me. I mean, I think I'll probably stay local for the... Oh, excuse me. Philadelphia for quite a while and kind of see what there is to find while being based out of here. That'd be cool. Oh, there's number seven. Where's the last one? But where is it? Where is that last one? Is it in there? No, I don't think so. Let's see. I haven't gone down this way yet into the into the box room. Maybe there's a more pineapples. Oh, do I see? It's right there. Awesome. What was that? Only the second try? Not too bad at all. Not too bad at all. And after that, I'll take a quick uh, break. I'll take a quick old break, and I think I'll mix myself up a cocktail, too, because this beer's running a little low. Yahoo! Spirit of choice, anyone? Anybody got a spirit of choice? I've got everything, really. I mean, everything that would be normal for at least the United States. There's so many other different types of liqueurs and stuff that exist all around the world that I really want to get a piece of, but, like, shipping. That's the worst part, I think. The worst part about it is trying to get that stuff shipped over here. They just don't want to. He traveled super light for a while, and most of the belonging would be in, like, two suitcases in a backpack. That's usually how I do a lot of my traveling and whatnot, to be perfectly honest. We go down to Florida every once in a while, too, for, like, a little vac a little vacay, small little weekend vacays, if we can. And that's always fun, and I literally just take a backpack with me. But, like, all of my worldly belongings will forever, will probably just stay in this apartment for a while, despite the traveling that I want to do. And I do want to do a lot of traveling. Most of the work I wind up doing is remote anyway, so I just need to pick up my computer and go, and it's all nice there. Okay, okay. Um, so I'm going to take a quick break, and I want to mix up a cocktail on the way, too, so while I'm gone, if anybody has any spirit ideas, uh, if not, I'm going to grab one of my books and find something random in there, so, uh, see y'all back in a little bit. And we're back. Bathroom couldn't keep me away for very long. I grabbed all my cocktail books too. What do we got going on over here? 
don't really know too much about those kinds of drinks, so ain't no problem at all. I got a ton of books here and a ton of things that I could possibly make. And Meatball Girl's arrived too. Meatball Girl, you got a got a suggestion for a base spirit that I mix into mix into a drink? My beer's running a little low. Oh, you know what? I forgot. You know what? Let me do this. Let me do this, and let me show you. Um, to those who are interested, this was the beer that I was drinking. It's a oh, that's very very light. So if I pull it back here a little bit, and maybe trying to not get that into the light a little bit. This is what I got. River Horse Triple Horse. Not too bad, not too bad. It's a really nice, very really nice beer. Very nice beer, I very much like it. Very much like the beer. Um, yeah, looks cute, very cute. All right, what I'm gonna do is I wanna make a cocktail next because it's gotten late enough and I don't feel bad drinking liquor after 9 p.m. So that's what we're gonna go with. I'm gonna open up to a completely random page in my book. Got a tiny little black book here and see what I'm gonna mix. That's what I'll do. That's what I'll do. Well, I've got the beautiful Isle Delfino in the in the background. Why the heart party hat? Well, I'm glad you asked, Rastro, because there is always a reason to celebrate, always a reason to party. This party hat's for our most recent follow, and that's what I usually do around here. It like, kind of livens things up a bit. I kind of like that. Plus, it kind of makes me look like a moron, which I tend to laugh at, and if I'm laughing at it, surely at least somebody else is. Ooh, this looks interesting. I've got a drink here called the Prado. And he uses tequila, maraschino, lime juice, and egg white, and grenadine. So I'm going to go with that. So I'm going to switch myself over to the bigger screen. Uh, I don't have my bar set up, so I'm just going to make a cocktail at my desk. So I'm going to go grab those ingredients, and I will be right back. Please enjoy the music while I go find my ingredients. <laughs> Shake it. Shake? It doesn't say strain. I'm going to strain that. I definitely strain that. Oh, hell yeah. Hell yeah, I'm going to make sure I strain that one. For sure. It also says garnish with a cherry. Sweet. Sweet, 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 sweet. I love mixing cocktails. I love mixing cocktails. What I like to do. Egg white? Yeah, egg whites kind of give like a... Uh, they kind of give a little bit of a frothiness to your drink. They add like a bit of a, it's a very interesting texture to be perfectly honest, but it's all right. I kind of like it. I need my maraschino liqueur, I need my tequila, I know I need an egg, and goodness, I need to get a little bowl for that egg, because I don't want to keep that anywhere. I got my egg from the fridge, only the egg whites. You can put, you can actually put egg yolk in a cocktail, and it just makes things so weird. Oh, my desk is full of stuff. Oh my goodness. I'm gonna put things over here as best as I can. My desk is really not set up for this type of stuff, so it's a bit of a mess. So it might be a little bit for me to kind of put things down. Please excuse the mess. Not that you can really see the mess, so it doesn't really matter, but you know, you know. Is that a good chair you sit in? I need to invest in my own chair and just haven't found one I like. I like this chair. I like this chair very much. Um, I can find the link for it if you'd like me to. I can probably pop it on somewhere. But I know that I needed an actual chair, and so I asked my parents to buy me one for my birthday, and they're like, absolutely, Cam, we can do that for you. I was like, I love you, Mom and Dad. And they got me a nice chair. I love this chair. I love that chair. It's, a, it's not one of those gaming chairs. It's one of those ergonomic chairs, because in my opinion, gaming chairs are a waste of money, and they just make your back feel worse. Not that I would know. I've never really sat in a quote-unquote gaming chair before, but I, did, I don't know. Something skews me about the idea of you advertising yourself as a chair for gamers. Like, me as a gamer who doesn't know anything about ergonomics, probably wouldn't be able to say, oh yes, this is absolutely a great chair for my back. I mean, I wouldn't know unless I sat in it and my back didn't feel bad or didn't feel good afterwards. What am I missing there? Where's my other cocktails? My a recipe says, um, tequila, maraschino, lime juice, and the grenadine. I need, I need the grenadine. Put that on top of there. Yeah, there's a little lime. Oh, and I need my cutting board. I need my cutting board and my grenadine, which I have freshly made. Oh, it's not freshly made, but it's made in the fridge. It probably goes in. I have to make some more of that, honestly. And make some more grenadine. And my cutting board. Cutting board, cutting board. Cutting, cutting, cutting board. I'll admit, I was not actually prepared to be making cocktails tonight, so I usually have a little bar set up that I do, but I'll just kind of tilt my camera down a little bit to make things a little more visible and clean things up just a little bit. This is how I used to do it. Office chairs are where it's at. Dude, office chairs are exactly where it's at. Because you got to think about it this way. I mean, to a gamer, 
who's never really, who's probably never really considered, excuse me, we'll like change this camera around so I get a view of, uh, you get to see my shorts and my streaming computer and everything else on my microphone. A little makeshift cocktail setup, that's what we're gonna go with. But to like, um, oh, you thought the yellow thing was a rubber chicken? Oh, you mean this thing? Oh my God, I love this thing. It's my, it's my little noodle. It's my stress noodle. It's great, it makes funny sounds. Listen to this, this is, this is hilarious. Oh my God, I just whipped off my party hat. I uh, didn't plan that one. That's fine. Anyway, danger noodle. There we go. Danger noodle. All right. Oh, the, no, no. Oh, something else. Something else. We'll look at that later. Oh, was it the... Oh, I bet this thing. Lime juicer. Oh, my God. I forgot. I forgot my measuring thing. My jigger. It's actually called that. Don't see me. It's actually called it. It's a little measuring thing. Yeah. All right. It's time. This just in, CJ whips out his eye with a danger noodle. I whipped out my party head, actually. All right, whip. I, I, you know what? You know what? You do you. I'll let you have it. Okay, okay, okay. Um, this one says shake. But I'm gonna do this a little differently, because you're supposed to do... So with an egg, there's two things you can do when you have an egg in a shaker. You can dry shake it, and then wet shake it, or you can just wet shake the damn thing. And I'm gonna try to do a dry shake, because that's a little different. Okay. Uh, fill a glass with ice. I'll go grab the glass later. Instead, I'm gonna go with my cocktail take shaker. Cocktail shaker. Gonna put an ounce and a half of tequila. I've got Casadores because it's the only one I have. I don't do a lot of... Honestly, my collection is made with way, way too much rum and a lot of whiskey. I don't have enough gin. I don't have enough tequila. And I wish I did. And there. That's an ounce and a half of... Whoops! Ounce and a half of my tequila. Love that. I love the Delfino music in the background, too. This is so fitting. Sort of. Half an ounce of the Maraschino liqueur. I'm gonna put these bottles on the floor so they're not taking up my time on my desk. Maraschino, specifically Luxardo. I'm gonna do a half an ounce of that. Pour that in there. Trying to get as good a shot as possible. Again, unplanned. Usually I have a bar soda on the other side of my desk. That's what I usually do for cocktails like this when I do my cocktail streams or when I'm actually planning on making cocktails. This was unplanned. I just wanted to. I wanted to, so I did. Speaking of which, I need a glass to put that in. So I should probably finish out that one. Um, three quarters of an ounce of lime juice. I already have a little knife over here because I was cutting up my kiwis from before. Oh, you were a, you were a tough lime. Goodness, you were tough. Tough little lime there. Let's do that. Being raised Mormon, my drinking experience is very super, is super low. So you've been trying to expand my knowledge with alcohol. Oh, absolutely. Absolutely. I honestly, I was never, I was never that kid who like drank a lot in high school or college and whatnot. I mean, I'm still in college now and now I drink as much as I want to because I like to think mixologies is a bit of a hobby of mine. Um, but like I joined a fraternity when I first entered college and I was like, you know what? This is, this is cool. But they're, the only drinks that they wound up really, really buying a lot were all, like, beer and stuff like that. They're really cheap stuff. And I was like, there must be something better to the world of alcohol. And uh, lo and behold, cocktails. My saving grace. My saving grace was the world of cocktails. And I love mixing things up. It's funny, though, too. Um, I guess it's not really funny. It's just kind of cool, I guess. My mother also worked a bit as a bar uh, bartender as well uh, in her younger years before having children and whatnot. So she kind of gave me these books. Actually, the book that I used over here is actually from my mother. Uh, it's got both of our names in it, and, um, yeah. And that kind of inspired a love of cocktails for me. That and the fact that, you know, there's a whole world of flavors and stuff out there, and so not knowing... Like, for example, if you've been to a cheeseburger and you didn't know what beef tastes like, you'd be like, wow, this, ta this cheeseburger tastes great. It tastes like a cheeseburger. But if you've had beef before, you'd be like, ah, I can taste the beef in there. Maybe it's like a like an Angus or something like that. And I wanted to be able to, like, expand my flavor, flavor palette. It's kind of like, I guess, what you've been doing, like, expanding your knowledge of alcohol and whatnot. To be able to pick out those different flavors and whatnot, different spices, different notes of the wherever the spirit was from or what was in the ground at the time that they picked up the grapes from the vine for wine and stuff like that that whole that whole world of alcohol just it's it's so cool and i love it and now i'm gonna try to shake i want half an egg white in here oh god here we go i'm gonna try this i don't know how to accomplish half of an egg white so i'm just going to attempt to uh for those are squeamish and don't like the inside of egg watch out this is inside of egg I'm just gonna crack this that way. I'm planning on making a mess. Okay, so that's 
That's the yolk. Uh, let's get half of that egg white down there. The yolk over here, and try the other half of the egg white in my shape. That seems about half of an egg white. Yeah. Uh, that's a shell. I don't like that. All right, I'd say that's half of an egg white. Oh, why am I tasting that? Oh my god. I thought I'd clean my fingers by just kind of licking my fingers like you do with like when you mess it with sugar and stuff, but it's an egg. Ew. Why did I do that? Jeez. Take that out of here. That's a very interesting concoction over there. And then I need about a teaspoon of my grenadine, and I'm gonna call that a. I'm just gonna call that a dash, because I don't really feel like getting my teaspoon. Um, is that really it? Um, yeah, that's it. All right. A little dash of my grenadine. Homemade. Not my recipe. Somebody else's recipe, but still, ha uh, that was a little much. Your parents don't con just don't condone out drinking at all. So it's just whenever you were hanging out with friends and experimenting and seeing what it was like and how it affected me. Oh, absolutely. My biggest part of when, uh, you know, after I turned, I mean, even before I turned 21, our little secret, I was um, trying to determine like what it is that where my limits were because I wanted to know about my limits before I wound up just going out to bars and stuff and potentially getting myself all messed up. Um, so I'm gonna dry shake this first, by the way, all my ingredients in here. You can kind of do that with an egg white to kind of emulsify it a little bit. Gotta be careful when you're dry shaking. There is no pressure built up, so it doesn't stay that way. It's a little dry, a little dry, a little dry. Give that a shake, that a shake. It actually kind of builds a different type of pressure. Oh, and my thing is shaking again. My, um, my, my shaker over here is kind of broken. I need to go get some ice. I need ice in a glass and ice in my shaker. And I knocked over one of my bottles. No problem. I'm gonna go get some ice. Couple of ice cubes in my shaker. I'm gonna say about three of them. Got three ice cubes in my shaker. I'm gonna get myself a glass. Let's have a nice one. Nice glass. Tiny glass. Small glass. Put some ice in there too. Do that. Yeah, my parents were always pretty cool with the idea of, like, don't, don't drink excessively, but if you want to explore, you can do so in our house. And when I went off to college, I explored a lot, and I loved that world of cocktails and whatnot. It was just cool. It was really, really cool to me. So now I've got ice in my shaker. I uh, dry shook first. There goes the other half of my shaker. It's kind of broken. I'm sorry. I need to get a new one. But I wet shook it, or uh, I dry shook it, and now I'm going to wet shake it with ice on the inside. Awesome. <sighs> Love the sound of that shake. I'm gonna strain this in my glass. I have no idea what that's gonna taste like. That's got an interesting red color to it. It's kind of pinkish. And it fills up the glass quite nicely. And it's got a little bit of a, you can't really notice from that angle with the color and whatnot, but it's got like a bit of a foamy head on it. That's because of the egg. And because I don't want any of this stuff just sitting around while I'm streaming, I'm gonna go do a quick cleanup, just throw this stuff in the sink, and I will take care of it another day. Probably tomorrow, more than likely. Why wouldn't I? Clean up my desk area a little bit, and then I'll readjust my camera, and we'll get back to the game. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. And I'll put my grenadine back in the fridge because that needs to be... Oh, you know what? I forgot. Got to garnish that with a cherry. Don't forget the cherry. Can't forget the cherry. I got these little, uh, Fabri, Fabri? Fabri cherries here. And a spike. So I'm going to go fishing for, uh, for the cherry. There's a cherry. Nope. Can I please have a cherry? If I go fishing, if I spike enough, I'll find cherry, right? Yep, there's the cherry. Perfect. I'm just lay that on top. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. I'll just take a couple more things away and then we'll be back into it. Open up my fridge. Throw my grenadine in there. Turn this all over here and stuff. Perfect. Let's get back to it. Uh, for those who are interested in a close up, I'm always interested in a close up. That's our, that's our drink. It's a little, it's a little pinkish. Kind of like it. Kind of like it indeed. Let's, uh, let's switch on back to the live screen. I'll put my headphones back on and readjust myself over here. There we go. That, uh, that light is a little... Yeah, let's put... I like that. Put my Isle Delfino back on. There we go. That's beautiful. I like that. Oh, what am I stuck in? Oh. Piece of my hair. Piece of my hair being a little wonky. Perfect. Now we've got cocktail to keep our engines going. How does it taste, though? 
the Prada. Tequila, Maraschino, Grenadine, Lime Juice, Egg White. Oh, wow. <clears throat> That's very... It's very tequila-y. And it's actually very tart, too. It's very, very tart. I guess that lime juice really does a lot more than you think it does. I'm gonna drop my cherry in there, too. I like the way the cherry tastes inside. Or cherry juice. And I'll set that aside. For now. Let me get going back to the game. Back to a little bit of Del Vino. Um, what was I doing next? Let's see, let's see. What was I doing next? I've collected all the stars there. Shine sprites. There's another place up on top of everything. So I gotta go up on top of where the shine, the big old shine thing is. And I need the rocket for that. I need the, the rocket nozzle. Cool, cool, cool. Make our way to the other side of town. And blast our ways upward. Ba -da. Lovely, lovely. Making our way up shrine. Looking at the shine sprite. Having a good time or something like that. La 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 la. La 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 la. La 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 la. I gotta stop doing that. I never I don't even really like that song, I'll be honest. I don't even really like it. I gotta stop using it. Alright, let's go in this pipe. Pianza Village, I think is what this place is called. Pianta Village, that's the one. That's the one. The one we know and love. Chain Chomplets Unchained. Chain Chomplets Unchained. As opposed to still being chained. Alrighty then, let's go for it. It's the fiery goop of doom! So, uh, let's get the not so fiery, right? Oh, look at that. Over there. Another blue coin opportunity. I love it. What kind of music do I listen to? I listen to a lot of different types of music, to be perfectly honest. I've been on a bit of a pop kick right now, but um, I really enjoy lo-fi, like the lo-fi beats and whatnot. I enjoy like hard rock and metal, heavy metal, man after my own heart. Uh, my father actually did a lot of like um, heavy metal music and whatnot. He does uh, still a bit of music like that. And um, yeah, I kind of got that from him. Let's push you in this direction. Into the water. Into the water. Into the water. There we go. Into the water. Have a good time, little one. Oh, you're cute. But let's see. I also enjoy Electro Swing. I have playlists for regular, like, classic rock. Oh, goodness. What else? I love to listen to games, uh, video game music, to be honest. And that's very interesting things. I guess off of video game music, I love to listen to, like, electronic and whatnot. It really depends on what kind of mood I'm in what kind of music that I wind up listening to. Like I said, I'm in a bit of a pop mood right now. I've been really, really liking, uh, what is it, Dua Lipa's album, uh, Future Nostalgia. Really love the song, Hallucinate. I like that, That's, that gets stuck in my head very often. But um, what are some heavy metal bands that I really, really like? I mean, it's necessarily heavy metal, but like, some like, I guess, dark metal? I, I got some recommendations to that. If I listen to Bury the Light, no, is that a band? From the, DMC5 game. Devil May Cry. Devil May Cry. That's what DMC stands for. I haven't, but I'm gonna write that on my list of things to listen to. I still have that in the Desert Song from, I think it was Persona 5 or whatever. DMC5. What is that called? Bury the Light. I'm gonna wind up listening to that later. I take these recommendations and I look at my lists. I always do. Oh, this random book over here. I don't need that. But I haven't listened to that one in particular, probably because I haven't played the game. Though then again, that's not necessarily, that's more the rule than the exception. A lot of the times, I'll wind up buying a game because I love the music from it. And there's been a couple of games that I've done that for. I love the music from uh, Celeste, the platformer. I love that. And so I got the game and I've played that a bit on stream a bit. I, I love it. I like Lena Rain. She's got... I think she's got a really nice beat to her music. It's kind of my thing. Uh, in terms of the lo-fi interests of mine. Uh, let's see, what else? Um, oh goodness, what was the other one? I really want to play, what is it, Hollow Knight, I think? Because of the music that is done by... I don't remember the artist's name. I really don't remember. I wish I remembered. Change my camera a little bit. There we go. But, uh, yeah, it really, it really depends. It really, really depends. It's like a mixed song, the Bury the Light. 
That's amazing with the Virgil theme from that game. I have to make sure I give that a listen to it. There's a, like, th another thing is, like, there are a ton of pieces of game music that I probably have never had the chance to appreciate because, like, I I've never, never played the game. I think Devil May Cry, I don't know if that's very PC friendly, or it might be PC friendly, but certainly not low budget PC friendly. I only managed to build myself a PC r capable of running with these, you know, A, AAA games or whatever, it only was in the past year, so I've never really been able to play those types of games, at least not in the, the modern era. Um, I don't exactly know how recent Devil May Cry 5 is. I don't usually keep up on those types of things, just because, like, you know, I haven't haven't played it before, so why would I keep it on my Twitter feed, so to speak, you know? If they came out with, like, what, a, a Slime Rancher 2 game, I'd be all on that, because, like, I've played that game before. Or, uh, you know, any Mario game, really. Um, but yeah, I appreciate the recommendation, by the way, because for all I know, that game's music is going to be so awesome that it's like, yep, I'm playing this. I'm going to buy it and I'm going to play it. I know the Devil May Cry series is incredibly popular. I just, I just never tried it. Never, never played it. Never played it. Don't know why. I don't have a particular reason, aside from the fact that I really haven't been playing video games a lot in recent years. Bing. Oh, hello, you're on fire again. Oh, don't worry about it. Get this way. But I really only started playing video games aside from Minecraft again in like the past year. Oh, wow, that didn't work out for me. Basically, since I started streaming about a couple of months ago, I started playing video games again. Like, all different types of video games. Because I was like, there are so many games that I have. My Steam library is extensive. Like, and I probably haven't even played more than half of those games. And really, the reason is that I couldn't convince myself that I had time for it. With the college work and whatnot, but I've kind of taken up streaming as a bit of a hobby, so it's been encouraging me to play the games that have just been sitting in my library. I have a link of that in my about profile, by the way, a link to that in case anybody ever had any recommendations for things. There's a couple of things that are on my list now. If I have an NVIDIA Force GTX AMD Radeon R7 260X with 2 gigabytes of RAM or better, you can play DMC5. I didn't have a GPU. I don't. That's unfortunate. I've been waiting because there's a big shortage on GPUs right now. I've been entering shuffles every single week. I've been trying to really try to get my hands on a GPU. But it's been incredibly tough to kind of get my hands on one of those. I could probably just go with something that's pre-owned, but like, I'm a little skeeved out by the idea of buying a pre-owned GPU. Because like, I don't know, once you get a GPU and you use it for like a year, I don't know. I, I, I'm not exactly sure whether it like kind of decreases in quality or, or not. I'm not so sure. But um, my current setup is um, 16 gigabytes of RAM and a Ryzen uh, 3 with integrated graphics. And it can run Cyberpunk, which is pretty cool. It doesn't run it well, but it runs it. So I think it can handle most things that I'd be able to throw at it. Just, of course, not with the streaming and everything at the same time. I mean, yes, I can. The streaming computer's right there. The actual gaming computer is over there. This is the one that runs the game. Actually, technically, that's the one running the game, because we're on a GameCube right now. So, uh, there's not a lot of stress going on on any of my PCs right now. PCs, laptops, yeah, But, uh, as things become more serious over here in terms of streaming and video gaming and whatnot, I make subtle upgrades every once in a while. I'm a bit of a computer guy, by the way. So, I got parts all around here. Um, I tried to actually attach a couple of the GPUs that I had laying around, but they just would not work with my particular processor. And I was like, that's eh, no problem. They're like 13 years old, old anyway. PC parts like that don't really go down in quality. All right, all right. I mean, I could certainly go around eBay and whatnot. What I'm currently waiting for is my, my tax return to come in. And once I know exactly what, once I have a chance to take a look at the bank account, get a chance to do all the finances and whatnot, I will actually be able to see like, oh, this is what I can afford as of right now, but it hasn't come in yet, so I don't exactly know what's coming. I know I can check that somewhere, I'm just too lazy to. It's not something I need to worry about right now, so I kind of pushed it off into the boundary. I'm perfectly happy with what I've got right now. I'm looking to upgrade if necessary. But there hasn't really been anything to convince me that it's necessary, so... What we're trying to do? I'm trying to go that way. This shouldn't be difficult. We go the other way. I need to go up the tree, I think. I think that's the point. Yep, go up the tree. Yeah, run, Mario, run! Oh, goodness, please actually hit the... There we go. <laughs> nice. 
and I'll get this blue coin up here while I'm at it. Yeah, but actually, I'm super happy with the fact that everything actually runs right now. I, I couldn't say the same about myself previously, with my previous setup. Which was basically just a laptop. I was like, at the beginning of the year, I was like, you know what, it's time to actually build myself a gaming PC, because I have the, I have friends who can teach me, can, can fill in the gaps, and I already have the PC experience myself, like, I should really do that, because I want to play some more games. Oh, by the way, uh, Il Piantissimo says, Grr! Yes, Grr! That was not so bad. You're a quick yes. I suppose. And maybe I underestimated you a little bit. Perhaps. You try again after you have practiced more. Until then, here's your shine sprite. Thanks, Il Piantissimo. Thank you. A lot of people have just been buying pre builds and taking them apart and just selling the parts again. I mean, I'd rather just, there's, there's so much fun in being able to build your computer yourself. I feel like that's all a part of the experience. But uh, I guess that makes sense, because the pre-builds probably come with some of the nicer ones. I know um, my future younger brother-in-law just bought himself a pre-built computer. I don't know what's in it. I gotta ask him about that. I'm curious. But, um, yeah, the GPU is... So the next, the next upgrade that I'm going for is lighting. I don't have very good lighting in here. I want to upgrade my lighting. And then probably after that will be the GPU and whatnot. The Goopy Inferno is the next part of this journey here. Without my flood. Beer's completed. Trying to go to the cocktail. And also, obviously, to anybody not already averse to alcohol or if you're too young, whatever you do, drink your water. I got water around here. I'm going to drink this entire bottle probably in the next few minutes. Water and food are the best things when drinking alcohol. Doesn't matter if you're a lightweight or a heavyweight, keep yourself hydrated. You don't want to be, you don't want to have a hangover. And if you do want to have a hangover, I guess don't drink water. Because that's, that's the best hangover cure. But it's like a, it's like a retroactive, it's like a, you have to be preemptive about it. You got to drink a lot of water if you expect to get the hangover, then you can avoid the hangover. Anyway, that's my, that's my, uh, that's my 9.30 lesson on alcohol. Oh, they buy the pre-build, they take the parts out and then sell them for market. But no, yeah, yeah, I, I got that, I got that. They'll probably sell them on eBay and stuff like that. I get that. I mean, people gotta make their living, I guess. You know, the secondhand market for a lot of different products is incredibly strong, I guess. I wouldn't do the same thing myself. Oh, that's not working for Mario. Nope. That ain't working. I understand it. I wouldn't do it myself, but hey. What am I supposed to be doing here again? Oh, I need to get on top of there. I need to get on top of that one over there. That's what I'm doing over here. Yeah, I wouldn't do it myself. But I, I just don't feel the need to. But I mean, I suppose it's a really good way for people to get at least access to all the parts that they need, despite the fact that they've all been marked up and whatnot. Uh, I want to get to there. I want to get over there. No, don't send me back the other way. You're going to kill me. Oh, well. We'll try that again. But I'm meaning to get my hands on something, and honestly, I am happy to spend anywhere from like... Oh, it's time to consume! My first excuse to take a sip of my cocktail! Wow, you know what? That's had a chance to mellow out a little bit. So, there's a dryness on your tongue. Probably... Probably from the lime juice. After that, you get the taste of that maraschino liqueur, which is kind of... It's kind of like a... An airy... An airy cherry kind of taste. Airy cherry. I like the way that rhymes. An airy cherry kind of taste. And then tequila punches you right in the face. Right in the face. It's just like, you forgot tequila was here? Bitch, now you're gonna know tequila is here. And honestly, the grenadine kind of gets lost in there. I'll admit that. I think the grenadine was more so for the... Pink-ish color... I don't know. Let me take a let me take a picture of this actually, because um, I have a recipe book that I keep. I got a recipe book that I keep, and I'll probably take notes on this later. I'll go back. I'll watch it. I'll add it to my collection, collection notes and whatnot. Oh, excuse me. Oh, lost my train of thought. What was I talking about? Oh yeah, we were talking about PCs. That's what we were talking about. PC parts and whatnot. Um, I need to get to the middle over there. I don't remember what the best way of doing that is. Maybe I should come up from below. There's probably an area down below that I can go to. 
That's what I'll do. Oh, pfft. well that didn't help me at all. Can I fall down to a mushroom? Fall down to a mushroom? Yes, I can fall down to a mushroom. That worked. All right, just kidding. I don't think I'm gonna go that route. <laughs> Whoops. Too bad, game over, whatever. We'll just start it, start it over again. Ain't no problem. My budget, I am trying not to spend more than $1,000 on a GPU and power supply to compensate for the GPU combined. That's what I'm attempting to keep it to. I will go a little higher. I think my maximum would be 1400. That is my absolute maximum for what I'm planning on, what I anticipate to pay for that. So uh, that's, that's, what I, that's, that's my current stance on that. I've been, what I've been doing, because I'm not really in, I'm not really in a rush, is been entering the, Newegg is the site for PC parts around here, at least one of the sites, and I've been entering their shuffle every couple of days to see if I get picked for the opportunity to buy. Easy way to beat this level. There probably is an easy way and I've forgotten about it. Not really. Oh, I'm in the wrong place. Oh, what am I doing? Wow. I totally absent-minded that. I don't need to be here. I was wondering about it, why that blue shine sprite looks so yellow. That was weird. Let's give me at least one or two more tries. And, uh, and then we'll go for the <laughs> let's just give it to you approach. I like to give things a little bit of a try every once in a while. I need that. I do have that rocket nozzle. For a second, I thought I forgot my rocket nozzle. That'd be unfortunate. I love this game. It's giving me that, give me that nostalgia feeling. And now that I got the GameCube working, this was like the proof of concept. Today was to determine, hey, if I wanted to play a game on the GameCube, can I play a game on the GameCube? The answer is yes, because the stream's been going for about eight hours now, and nothing has broken. I'll knock on the wood again, because I can. We all <laughs> we all make mistakes in the heat of passion. You know, heat, because goopy inferno. Haha, <laughs> the passion of playing a video game. Yes, we do. We do, we do. Where's I going with that? But this was the proof of concept that actually works. And now what I want to do is, I play video games with my fiance every once in a while on stream. And so she's like, we have to play all the Mario Party games. I'm like, yes, we absolutely have to play all the Mario Party games. And I would love to do that. Oh, stupid wind peoples. Stupid wind peoples. But yeah, like now, the opportunity to be able to actually play those games with her is, is totally within reason. Totally within reach. Mario, can you? Can you skeet by this? Skeet on, skeet on by? Skeet on by? No, no, skeet, skeet, skeet on by. There we go. That's nice. That's very nice. Come over here, and I can probably just fly my way over there. Oh, come on. Oh, not the way I wanted to go. That works, sort of. There we go. Hey, look at that. You've been doing that with your cousin? Dude, awesome. I, I can't wait to do that. I'm like, I'm really looking forward to that. Oh, you hit me. I didn't mean for you to do that. Nope, that didn't work. Oh, well, I have to give it a shot. But like what she wants to do, her her idea is like, we're going to play through every single Mario Party game. And I'm like, I like that. We should do that. Remember, though, that means we have to have access to a lot of Nintendo systems. Because they were on various different systems and whatnot. I think it was, what is it? Is it 4, 5, 6, and 7 are all for the GameCube, or is it just 5, 6, and 7? I know we have all those somewhere between our combined collections. Number 5 is a bitch. Is that... Is number 5 the one with all the different stars? And they're all trying to tell you, like, you're, it's in the dream world, I think. I get them mixed up sometimes. I think... What is it? Number 5 is all the stars in the dream world. Number 6 is... Um, the sun and the moon fighting each other, and then number seven is the cruise. I think. Number seven is the cruise, number six is sun and the moon fighting each other, and number five is the stars in the dream world with the cool little, like, uh, uh, RC car mode thing. Which was, I thought was incredibly awesome. I think that's one that was. I think that was my favorite, probably, because I really like the, uh, one of the levels on that. The, um, is it the Pirate Co. level? I think so. Yeah, I think that checks out. I think that checks out. I remember I always played number six 
at my orthodontist office because when I would go and get my braces, they had a little GameCube set up and whatnot, and we would always, my brother and I would always play um, number six. They, and we'd, we'd get all the coins and stuff to be able to unlock all the different unlockables and whatnot. And for a while, we were the ones who, uh, we were the ones who really carried through on those. But then, like, they'd re they removed it after a while. You've only played five and seven. Yeah. Uh, GameCube ones. I like those GameCube ones. I really like the ones for the GameCube. I've played, I think, I've played some of the more recent ones. I think I've played nine and ten. Um, whichever one had Ballyhoo and Big Top, I played that one. I think that was number nine. Ten is the one, I think, where you get to, like, go into one device. You, you're all in one car or something. And, um, I think that's that one, if I'm correct in saying. But I played that one, too. Oh, wow, that gives me a bit of a boost. Uh, la 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 la. What am I doing? What am I doing here? I know there's a way to do this very, very easily. I wish I could remember what it was. Oh. Let's see what's going on below. Isn't there an area to get, like, right over there, I think, that I can access from below? I do not remember. Let's check and find out. Hey yo, Mario down below. I want to make my way over there. You never touch the Switch, so you wouldn't know. I don't remember which one was on the Switch. Is that 11? I don't know. Honestly, there were so many power, uh, Mario Parties. I also played Mario Party DS. I played that one to completion. I liked that one a lot. And I lost the copy. I lost that. And then eventually, I found it again. Uh, actually, what had happened was, I found another copy of it, and it was actually the, my buddy Christina's. And I was like, hey, I'll give you like 10 bucks if I can keep this. And she was like, so go ahead, you can take it. I was like, thank you! I got a nice little boost from here. Alright, that didn't work. Come on back, Mario. That didn't work the way I wanted it to. Oh, you got it, Mario. Yeah, give me the easy way. I like that. I can't remember. It's on the tip of my tongue of how you're supposed to do it, and I thought it had to do with going underneath. But I just can't remember what it is right now. I'm not sure. I can't imagine why I can't remember why it would be. I have no idea. There's something in my system that's making me forget. That's what happened to it? You forgot what happened to your Mario Party DS? Yeah, I bought it from you. I was like, hey, I found it on my thing. It's got your data on it. It said Chris on it. So I was like, is it yours? And I, was, I gave you money for it. Yeah, you let me keep it. I think. Probably. That's my story. And I'm sticking to it. That's what I'm going to go with. That's what I'm going to go with. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to say it's mine now. And nobody worries about it. Go right at a square and follow the river. Follow the river! Oh my god, that was it! That was it, you follow the river. I was I was going the opposite direction. I was like, it had to be something so simple. Oh my goodness. It's okay, that's what I get. So so some of the things that happen to me during stream is if you have if you couldn't tell already, I talk. And I talk. And I talk and I talk and I talk and I talk and I talk. And after a while. Um, you know, the mind just starts going, and it gets caught in its own tangents and whatnot, and I completely lose focus of what it is, and oftentimes, the coin. That loss of focus makes me forget, and so I appreciate your assistance in this, and yeah, I like that. Yeah, I was gonna make, yep, there we go. Yep, that's the one. That's the one. That'll do it. You come along the side, and you can, okay, not like that, Mario, seriously. Mama! Reason you was reason I was snap about it because that was a steal compared to selling at GameStop, which I was thinking about doing. Yeah, exactly. Ten bucks. I love that game so much. I need to get on top of that mushroom. Uh, mushroom? Mushroom. Whoa! Okay. Hey, that works. A little bit of that. Not the way you're supposed to beat it, but it's the way everybody else does. I'm sure the speedrunners probably got that down pat. Uh, hmm. Where's my mushroom? It's behind this tree. Honestly, the fact that I can just take the water and make everything fun for me is wonderful. I can just clear a path for myself. Like, there's that- Whoa! Okay, Mario, don't do the, don't do shit like that. Make a little bit of water? A little water way? Whoa, okay, it's coming from the- It's coming from the ground. That's fun. No, stop! Mario, no! You were doing so well, Mario! Goodness gracious, Flood is the other way? Wait, where's Flood again? Oh, wait. Flood is here? Oh my goodness, what? I can get Flood back? Oh my god, wait a minute. <laughs> I thought the goal was to get to that mushroom. Flood's the other way. Well then. That's okay. 
I honestly forgot you could get flood back. I'll be perfectly honest on that. Completely forgot. Another friendly reminder from the community to make up for the lapses in my understanding. It happens. Yes, yes, we know, we know. I bet it, I bet it shows you where Flood is in this level, right? It says go up to the top. Flood is where you were going, but you died! Hilarious! Oh, there's Flood. Yeah, right there. Exactly. Yeah, that's where I was headed. I was trying to use my flippy abilities to give myself enough space to be able to go through the goo, but then the goo started dripping from above, and I was it was very unpleasant. I don't like it when the goo starts dripping. And the goo start dripping, and they don't stop dripping, and they don't stop dripping, and they don't stop dripping. The goo just don't stop dripping. My goodness. The goo. The goo. The goo, the goo, the goo, the goo, the goo. I love this little area over here. It's wonderful. This little this little area thing we got. It's great. Love that. Love that. Fill that with water and then do the same thing. Maybe just fill some more with water. Clear the way! Clear the way with the water! That almost worked. Yeah, actually that's gonna work. That's totally gonna work. No! Why are you going that way? You needed to go the other way, Mario! Silly you. Silly little wudgemajigger. Nope, please don't. Nope, I didn't want you to do that. There we go. I need a little bit of wet to send it flying. A little bit of wet to send it flying. And of course it's dripping down from before. I just gotta use that water to my advantage. A little bit of water. No, I didn't mean to do- Well, okay. La, la. I think I need a little more distance on that. I'm trying to flop my way over and use the water to my advantage. I'm sure there's another trick. And I don't know it. That's my- uh, that's what I'm gonna go with. I'm gonna go with that one, and uh, that's- I believe I can do that. Given enough attempts, I think I'll be able to do that successfully. I was just thinking about this before. There was another level that just seemed like it was so simple, right? But every once in a while, you get tripped up on the simplest of things. See, my luck has been the exact opposite than what I would think it would be. I'm having the easiest time on the hardest levels, like the ones that rely on RNG or the Plinko level. And that I've been having a hard time with the simple stuff. Follow the river. Follow the river back. You can find boxes which have a couple of coins in it. Oh, nice. Actually, that's convenient. To heal myself up after I've been hurt so many times. I've been hurt so many times before. Oh, come on. <laughs> Falls off because he's not paying attention. Oh, come on. Go. Go. Go to the direction you need to go, Mario. Dude. Mario. Mario, please. Well, clearly I'm, I've been drinking too much water. That's that's why I'm so crazy right now. I've been drinking too much water, obviously. I think it needs more water to balance out my judgment. There we go. La 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 la. Do it again. Do it over again. How long have I spent on this one? It doesn't matter. All I know is we started and it was dark and it was light, and then uh, and then we uh, were here and now it's dark. So uh, Mario doesn't listen. That's what I've been saying this whole time. I keep telling myself that it's my fault. It's not my fault. It's Mario's fault. It's Mario's fault. That's what I keep telling myself. Like stuff. And you know what? I blame Mario. Also, you know what's incredibly disorienting? The capture that card that I have delays things considerably, so there are some things- I rely on sound sometimes to be able to determine, like, where I'm headed, what enemies are coming towards me, and I can't do that because the sound is incredibly delayed. What I'm seeing actually over here is about four seconds off from what you guys are seeing, which is because of the Roxio capture card. That's another upgrade I plan on getting every once in a while. There are so many better other- there are so many other solutions out there that are- Cheaper, but I stole this one from home and it was free, so that's what I have to work with. That's what we're going with. Oh dear. No, I wouldn't. I wouldn't if I were you. Make some more water. Make way, make way! From Water Mario. Nope. Okay. Cool, cool. More water. More water. I mean, I was th hoping. 
I was hoping so. A little more of a water solution. This feels almost enough. Almost enough. Whoa, okay. Water, water. Okay, that was that was fun. There we go. Finally got my way over. Jeez. Gee whiz. Gee whiz, my friends. If you're watching, you can feel the frustration. Hi, Flood. Hi, Flood. I want to break this crate. What's in the crate? What's in the crate? Nothing. Nothing's in the crate. Thank you, Flood. See, this is one of those things where I have to question myself. Why the hell did that take so long? Am I really that bad at this game? No, I don't think so. <laughs> there was just something, something was glitching. Not with the game, with my brain. Something glitching with my brain. Oh, come on. There we go. Back on up. How are you not on fire? You're covered in the fiery goop. How are you not on fire? <laughs> oh, yeah, we're really happy now because I'm clean. We should take a shower. Wow, you saved me. Thanks a bundle. Here's a shine spray. Take it. To everybody who assisted me in getting to this point, I thank thee. <laughs> Mario's a bit of a dumbass. You know who's not a dumbass? You know who's a psychopath? Sociopath? Lugi. Lugi's a bit of a sociopath. Yeah, this is my Luigi hand puppet. I bought it at Toys R Us before they went out of, at least when they went out of business in my area. Isn't that right, Lugi? Can you speak now? Yes. And Mario's a dipshit. Yep, that's, yep, yep, that's, yep, we all agree. I think we're all on the same page. Let's go back inside. Legit ask that question every time, every time you see the big nosed idiot. Oh yes, this is the question that's raging. It's the question everybody wants to know. Everybody wants to know the answer. And the answer is... Probably. I've, been, I've learned from my fiance. In the PT field, in the field of physical therapy, excuse me, it depends, is a totally viable answer. So you know what? To answer that question that we've all been asking, it depends. For what reason? I guess I can't tell you, because, you know... Something about a big fiery chain chomp. The beast owner is always Brent Hand. It's terrible. It's terrible. So, okay. Well, thanks for chatting me about that, Mr. Sir. Uh, yeah. Oh, wow. I need my camera to be in the right location. Well, they don't seem to like bathing. Certainly not. Come on. Get a little... Get a little cooled off there, my friend. Whoa, okay. I forget what the point of this was. I forget what the point of this was. Come on there. Oh, look at that. Nope, that's actually not what I'm going for. I'm gonna go up here. I wanna be at a higher location so I can better facilitate that big old monster. Oh well, I guess I'll come down a little bit. I'll come down from that. Come on back here. Dude look like an absolute Mexican drug lord. Oh, right? It's these mustaches. It's the facial hair that they give these piantas. They really make them look like they're like, I'm gonna go. I tell you something about the business. You don't want nothing about the business. Oh yeah, go that way. And then yeah, keep on going. A little bit of a little bit of water. A little bit of water will do you good. Will do you good. Pal, it'll do you good. Come back. Come back. Okay. I gotta go to the other direction and push him in the other way. They seem to be avoiding you, Mario. That they do. So let's go in front of them. Okay, that wasn't gonna work. We'll just go this way. Yeah, that's right. Avoid me. If I get far enough ahead of you, you'll go back the other direction. Go! Go, I say- Okay, fine. Not gonna avoid me? That's fine. Get you a little cooled off. I can pull you back the other way. Come back, I say. Come back this way before you get all nice and hot again. Please, 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 I say. Come this way. Come this way. Follow me. I'll set you free. I will set you free, dear Chain Shop. I will. I promise. I will set you free. Nope. Okay, that got me hot again. 
Oh my goodness. No, you're deleting all of our progress. Well, sort of, kind of. A little bit more, a little bit more. There's a better way to do this. There is a better way. Yeah, let's um, let's take the direct path. Let's go back this way. I'm gonna try to do that. I'm gonna try to do that. A little bit over here. Yep, come on, come on, little buddy. Yep, yep, come on. Yep, I'll pull you along. I love how the fact that this particular chain has got like a big old streak through the top of his head, like a uh, obviously looks like a member of the Yakuza. Please calm down. 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 Lost all of our progress. You know what? I'm gonna do this strategically. I'm gonna let you get to the location where I want you to be at, and then I'm gonna make you go all nice and cool. I'll just wait for you up here. I'll just wait for you. I'll wait till you get over here. You'll come up eventually. Come up eventually. Right? There he comes. Here he come now, say Cheney Chain Cha. Oh, you're going that way. Oh, you bitch. Bitch, I thought. Mario, have you tried using a water filled barrel? Oh, well, would you look at that? That's an idea. Well, Flood, I gotta say, it was a pretty good idea. Honestly, didn't know I could carry that. I was gonna say, I couldn't remember if I could carry those things or not. Mm. It's okay. He'll come down over here, and then we'll just pull him back. Right? Where are you going? You're going that way. Sir, what's your say on this? Sunglasses? I love the sunshine! Oh, it's ever so bright. Here, let him try a pair of my special sunglasses. Alrighty then. Let's do it again. Alright, where'd you go there, pal? Now that I've got my shades on, I'll get you real good. Because obviously, the shades make you better at playing video games. Yes, keep going that way. Keep going that way. Yes, now calm down and let's take you this way. This way, I say. Yep, this is the way to go. Yep, this, this is the way. This is the way. The Mandalore, the people of Mandalore have been saying this for a while now. This is the way. Thank you. The shades make things easier. Uh, you look very happy. And you know what? That makes it all worthwhile. Nice. Every so often I put the sunglasses on, one, because we're playing Super Mario Sunshine, and two, because, eh, the light kind of burns my eyes every once in a while. You've been staring at a computer free screen for a while. I could put on my gaming glasses, but that's not cool. What's cool are sunglasses. Or rather, not so cool. Rather, the lack thereof. Zoo! Get back, get back inside, Mario. We're not done here yet. We must continue. Secret of the village underside. <laughs> I'll admit, I was moving at a much faster pace earlier, but things are slowing down a little bit. Probably because, you know, the, light, the night's kind of dialing down a little bit. Got a nice cocktail to smooth ourselves out. You know. You know. It's time to just enjoy ourselves playing Super Mario Sunshine. Just to chill and relax. Take a load off. Have fun with a couple of these gigantic mushrooms. I know you can't eat them, but I'm sure they're hallucinogenic if you tried. Probably. Oh, I wanted that. Okay. Well, I wanted this. Can I have you? Yeah! All right! One up, man! One man! One man! One man! One man! One man to rule them all. I said that a couple of times. And there's another one man over there. I'm gonna take that. I'm gonna take that. Because I don't have enough lives. Oh, I need Yoshi. I forgot. <laughs> Lest I forget, we need Yoshi to get inside. Here's Yoshi. Oh, that's it. Where I live. That's it. Hey, oh. I gotta get back up. I gotta find the Yoshi. Gotta find me the Yoshi. Yo, Yoshi. You're probably somewhere up top. Uh, can I walk in this brand though? Nope, I cannot draw. I cannot do that. I cannot climb on that bamboo in particular. 
But I can go this way and find my Yoster! Yoshi! Yoshi, Yoshi, Yoshi! Yoshi, Yoshi, where are thee? I've gotta give you fruit now. Oh, that, hey, that worked pretty well. Let's go up this way. Oh, okay. Or we can go this way. Yes. I forgot that I need the Yoshi for that, so, uh... Alright. There we go. Alright, Yoshi. First, let's find the Yoshi. Figure out what fruit he wants. Where'd you go? Uh, Yoshi. Had to dip for a bit. What'd you miss? Oh, you know, some, uh, sunglasses action. But, uh, yeah, that's yeah, fine. We, uh, we took a big old chain chomp, right? A little feisty chain chomp. Fiery chain chomp, some would say. And, uh, give him a nice little hot bath. And I think it enjoyed that. Now we're trying to find the Yoshi. I always tend to forget where the hell Yoshi is. Like, Yoshi, what do you do? Are you up on top? Are you up on top of one of these mushrooms? I feel like if Yoshi were gonna be anywhere, be on top of a mushroom. Okay, hello. Especially with these later levels, like, I'm really used to the, um, like, some of the earlier levels, but with these later ones, I'm just a little more fuzzy on them, just because it's been... I don't even know how long it's been since I've played Super Mario Sunshine. Are you up on top there? You might be on top there. Yoshi the bridge! The, I can't believe I missed the Yoshi. Of course I missed the Yoshi at the bridge. Oh, yep, there. There he is. So, so... This is not the first I've done this. This is not the first that I've missed Yoshi who's in plain sight. The last time I did it was in Rico Harbor. I was like... I was like... How? I was like, where the hell is Yoshi? He's by the fish stand. He's not by the fish stand. He's by the fish stand. He's by the fish stand. I just had to use my eye to open my eyes. Have I stood up recently? Yes. I've stood up recently. And now I've stood up. What? No. What's the next step, dearest? That's my fiance in chat, by the way. Checking on me for standing up. Oh, I lost my fruit. Here, I'll even do a little bit of... Yeah, you can't make me exercise, because you've made me do it three times so far. That's beyond the limits. So I'll just hang here for a little bit on my legs. Tears. Tears and deeds. Cry me a river. Somebody else is going to have to make me exercise. Where'd my fruit go? Where did my fruit go? That was actually very nice. That was very, very pleasant. Oh, baby! We're doing some side leg lifts! Um, how do I do that? Um, yes, I do that. There we go. I just kind of put my leg up to a side as I try to find where'd the squash go? Where's my squash? Where the hell is the squash? I, it disappeared. Anyway, I'm doing the legs lifts to the side. I'm not doing this right. Honestly, the fact that I don't have I, this is I gotta be honest with you guys. I don't have a proper camera angle for when I'm actually up standing and doing exercises. I just locked over my liquor bottle. Excuse me. Pick that up. I don't have a proper camera angle for when I'm standing up, so y'all get a big old piece of um, the bottom of my shirt. Now it's time to do the other side. I don't know where my squash went. My squash is around here somewhere. You need to move more. Eight hours is too long to be seated. I have been seated. I went up and made myself a cocktail, so it's good in one way. Maybe not good in the other way. I have no idea where the hell the squash went. Where did the squash go? You know what? I'm killing myself. The best way to go about dealing with these problems is to die. We're starting over again. Starting over again. All right, I think I've done, honestly, I don't count how many leg lifts I do. I need like a little counter. I need a thing that I can press and it'll count for me. You know, what I get? you know what I'll do in the future when I need to move more? You just finished family movie night. Oh, yo, did you guys watch, um... Um, oh, let's see. Let's see. What did you guys watch? Did you watch that, um, Mitchell versus the robots? You said you guys were gonna watch that. So how was it? That's awesome. That's awesome. How was that, by the way? I wanted to watch- I figured I should watch it on my own, but I've been too busy playing games. Actually, actually, actually. Yo, where's my glasses? Actually, I didn't do hopscotch. I did, actually, line jumps, because- <laughs> The hopscotch that I was doing was not... I, I kind of forgot for a moment. 
how to do hopscotch. So I went with, um, oh, you need a melon. So I went with the um, line jumps instead. So um, like the next time hopscotch comes up, I remember how to do it now. It's just like, it's like a, it's like a, it's like a dance. The hopscotch is like a dance. It's complicated. Cameron, Anna, Disney Queen. So this is the thing. So if this were a stream where my fiance Disney Queen was around, she'd be here. She would storm in from the other room and be like, this is how you're supposed to do the hopscotch. You gotta do it like this. And I'd be like, yes, I'm sorry. I have to do it like this. I'm so sorry. But she's not here right now. So, um, anyway. Oh, what's that? We were playing a video game? Oh, yes, yes, we were playing a video game. Yes, indeed, we were. <laughs> I want this. Can I, can I have? Can I have? Yes. My poor viewers. Have y'all suffered enough? Have y'all suffered enough? We can make you suffer more. We have methods of making you suffer. I can scream. I can scream. Oh, I have to fix my posture. Oh, my God. I actually wasn't in a correct posture position that time. Holy cow. I really wasn't. Ooh. Actually, that was a good... That was... That was a well-placed fixture posture there, dearest. Damn. That was good. I was sitting like a really weird crisp. You know what? I'm gonna get, I'm not even gonna bother explaining what the hell that was. It was bad. That was a bad, bad posture. Come on, Yosh. You got this, Yosh. Yosh! I believe in you. I believe in you. The song I Believe in You which I believe debuted in How to Succeed in Business Without Really Trying, starring Daniel Radcliffe. You know, Harry Potter was one of the first songs that I performed in a... One of the bigger songs that I performed in my high school career during my freshman year. I actually had a number where I was the lead singer. It was so cool! It was awesome! I was so proud of myself. And uh, I got to sing that song, I Believe in You, from uh, How to Succeed in Business Without Really Trying. Oh, wow. All right, then. That was a really, really good time. I remember those days fond those those days fondly. Actually, I used to love doing theater and stuff in high school, and I kind of fell out of it in college. The the theater crowd over here was not really my cup of tea, so to speak. They were wonderful people, just not like just not people that I necessarily vibed with uh, in the thing of it. Plus, I really wanted to focus on my academics and whatnot. But uh, I'd like to think that streaming has kind of filled the majority of the space in my heart that the lack of theater has left behind. Hey there, buddy! You gonna chuck me? Chuck me! I'm a chuckster! Wow! There he goes. And we need another chuckster. Chuck me! Chuck me! Chuck me! Chuck me! Don't hold back! Oh, I'm going. I'm going. Whoop! Wow. Never able to do uh, theater in high school because the people in the high school didn't get along. Understandable. I'll admit, I had like my own little, I had my own little group in high school and I actually convinced one of the people in those groups to uh, do theater. And uh, you know, I joined mostly well with the theater folk and whatnot. Um, they were kind of, uh, I was always intimidated. I'll be honest, I get intimidated by the idea of like an upperclassman. And so when the upper level theater folks were like, yo, you, you know, you're one of us? I was like, I mean, I, I don't know about that. I feel a little uncomfortable over here, but like, I eventually found my own, you know? Uh, not everybody has that. I completely understand that. Uh, it actually kind of feels nice to kind of like, this is sort of like the, um, it's almost like center stage and it feels really cool. And when I got other people online too, it's like, it's, it's awesome. It's really fun. I, I sometimes play with a, some other friends of mine and whatnot. My fiance uh, and my buddy Christina, who's in a chat right now. Uh, my future uh, younger brother-in-law I also play games with. Uh, Thank, I guess, is his channel. Or my buddy... I got a lot of people that I want to play in games with. It's a really, really fun time. But this almost feels like a performance aspect. And by the way, thank you, dear, for giving me your permission to return to regular gaming. Uh, I needed that. I definitely needed that. Guys, can we stop? Can we stop? Spudlings? Can we stop doing that thing when you hurt me? All right, gotta get myself right on. Right on. I'm a chuckster. <laughs> Toss me. Toss me, Pianta man. All right, so which way do I have to go? I gotta go that way? Or I gotta go that way? Well, I'd rather go to the Shine Sprite. So let's... What is over there? Maybe if I... Uh, okay, I guess you're going over here. So I'm gonna wait till you come over here. You're welcome, she says. 
Thank you, dear Disney Queen. I curtsy to thee. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. All right, I'm gonna wait for this uh, Chuckster to come on over here. Uh, Chuck, 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 Chuck me! I said Chuck me! Chuck me! Chuck me! No, you're gonna chuck me in the wrong direction. There I go. Ah! Astro was a bit of an emo altkin. Just had a hard time with other theater kids because they were the exact opposite of me in every way. I completely understand that. Theater kids, from what I understand, or from my particular experience, are a little, uh, a little extra. They're a little dramatic. They're a little vocal. They're a little hua. If I had to use an onomatopoeia, I love theater kids and whatnot. But then again, like I would consider myself to be a bit of a theater kid. But I've seen the vibe with various different types of people. I've had, dude, I had emo moments. I still have emo moments. There are times when I'm just like, I don't want anybody to bother me. I just want to listen to my hard rock music blasting through my headphones and draw a picture or wallow in my depravity, so to speak. Honestly, I like to think of it this way. Sometimes I want to feel angry. And some of the music that I listen to will allow me to feel angry. And I kind of like the feeling of being angry sometimes because the fact that I can even feel all these emotions to begin with makes me feel more human. And if there's anything I want in life, it's to feel human and holy shit, there we go. Woo! I want to feel human in life. I used to be the kind of guy who would kind of attempt to conform to those rules of society. Like, the man is stoic. He gives no emotions. He doesn't care about anything. And therefore is relatively unemotional. I never really liked that. I never really liked that. Eventually, when college hit, I kind of had the idea, I kind of had the ability to kind of come into my own, express my emotions in ways that were not completely held back. My fiance was crucial in convincing me that you don't need to internalize everything, you can externalize things, but how you wind up externalizing things is incredibly important. Um, I had ways to be able to externalize, uh, not necessarily in a healthy manner, but I'd chop wood in my parents' yard, or I'd chop wood in my now uh, fiance in law uh's yard. And that was a way to get rid of that, but that wasn't really consistent. I couldn't consistently have wood to chop. I needed something else. I used drawing and painting and whatnot as a way to kind of uh, vent my frustrations sometimes. And I listened to the music to kind of use it to channel. Oh, that's not gonna work. Oh, will it work? Will it work? Oh dear, oh it worked. Hell yeah. Um, but I kind of used, I kind of used the music to gear my brain into the direction of the way that I want to feel. Like, you know, if you feel a little tense, I just want to let it out. So I listen to a little bit of a horror music to kind of let those emotions out and feel that frustration in a way that's constructive. And then when I'm feeling all, I don't like anybody. I don't want to be touched. I don't want to be near anybody. I kind of grab my sketchbook and I try to draw something. And I've got a couple of pictures that absolutely, absolutely, <coughs> um, I've drawn things that absolutely look like a man was going through a rough time. The last time you were cutting wood, you got stung by a scorpion. Well, that's because you live in Texas. I don't have any scorpions up here. I think the worst thing that could possibly happen to me while cutting wood would be either getting bit by a snake or or making contact with a bear. And uh, I've been contact with bears before. Not direct contact. I've never touched a bear. I have never gone close enough to a bear to make actual physical contact. But what I have done is I've gone out into the woods to kind of brood with myself for a little bit. I had myself a little cup of water or whatever, and I was sitting there on a tire in a little fort that we made in the woods, and I just kind of was sitting there, and all of a sudden, this bear, I saw a bear over near one of the bushes, and I was like, remember what I learned in elementary school? Don't move. And I sat there for about 20 minutes waiting for this bear to walk away, and I made, I made contact. I was like, I feel you, bear, on a telepathic level. But uh, that was my experience of, my mother called it having tea with a bear, which I've never done, actually, but whatever. Anyway, this, this gentleman over here, this mafioso man is speaking. Oh no, I just went away for a bit and now look, I can't believe it. I'm a fine mess. There's a dozy. Some of the villagers, uh, trapped in that burning ooze. And they just finished evacuating everyone a little while back in the, hey, shoo. What in the world's happening? I think I may just start crying. I'm a, such an emotional pianta. I must cry. Oh, my dear Mario. I'm so sorry to trouble you at the time. But please, please. Did you find the Italian to help us again? Ten villagers are trapped in the slime. 
The slime. Is it the goo? <sighs> Maybe it's the slime. Perhaps it's the goo. You must hurry. Save my piantas before they drown. Save my villagers! Okay, okay, okay. You don't have to scream. It's okay. I got you. Save the family. The family? Don't worry about it. You'll get your compensation later. I've saved you. I wash you off the goo. Washing off the goo. There's two of them washing off the goo. It opened up my goo. How do you feel, nice being all clean and stuff? Are you clean yet? There's one. There's two. There's three. Yippee. Get you up like this, and then I'm gonna. I'll save you with the power of water. The universal solvent. Uh, where are the other ones? Find the goo. If I, I have to find the goo. If I go to the goo, they will be there. Are you in here? Anybody in there? Yes, there is. There's one little tiny one in there. And now you are clean. Now you are nice and clean. We like to see clean things around here. Like the, we like to shower around here. Uh, but I guess it must be hard to shower when you can't move your arms because they feel like they're on fire. Because of the goo. Because of the goo. Um, it's all because of the goo. This all happens because of the goo. Uh, was there two over here, or was there... Oh, I wouldn't like y'all making a mess like that. Please no. Please no. Oh, uh, there's more goo over here. There's another goo over here. Another puddle of goo. Gotta clean off the puddles of goo. Where are the other goos at? Well, they called it slime, but honestly, it seems rather goo-like to me. That's a little space over there. That's a little space over there. Where are the other ones? Where are the other goo balls? Oh, here's a goo ball! Goo ball! I'm gonna wipe the goo off you! Wiping off the goo, wiping off the goo, wiping off the goo, wiping off the goo. Consider yourself gooless. Is there more over here, perhaps? Is there a goo man over here? What about a goo man over... Oh, I think I see one over there. Right in the middle. There we go. I think I can... Yep, you're the one. You're the one that's covered in goo. You are the one now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You are covered in goo. You're covered in goo now. Now you're not. Yes, indeed. Now you are clean. Where do I go now? Can I talk to the... Where'd you go? Are you over there? Should I talk back to you now? Hey, I cleaned off your pals. Oh, look, there's a little thing over here. Liking that. Give me the coin. I haven't traded my coins at all. Wow, I should probably do that. I should really probably do that. Hey, oh, hey, I, I fixed your... Can, can I talk? Help, hello, uh, pal, pal, pal. Hey, bat, buddy. Um, hey, um... Can I, can I talk? No? Okay, fine. Forget about you, then. So be it, then. We gotta talk to somebody else. Who do I talk to about this? How do I, who do I talk to about the goo? Hey, by the way, everybody, you're all gooless. Maybe there's somebody over by the pond. We back over here? Hey, everybody. hey oh, hey oh. Everybody happy now? Can I talk to you? Let's go! The mayor awaits! Where's the mayor? What, where's, where's the mayor? Who do I talk to about the goo? I tried to go back and talk to the mayor at the beginning, but he didn't want me to talk to him. Uh, where, is he up here, maybe? Mayor, are you hiding the tree again? Are you hiding your shame again? You don't need to do that, Mr. Mayor, man. You don't gotta do that. Okay, uh, please don't fall, actually. It'd be really, really uncool if you fell. Where's the mayor at? Bro! Where's my mayor? Where's the mayor of the town's folk? Where you going, man, friend? Uh, I guess I'll try again. Can I talk to you? How you doing? You okay? Let's go and see the mayor! Okay, the mayor is where, I guess? Was he back over there? I just tried to talk to the mayor again. Are you mayor? Oh, you know what? Maybe the mayor is the other guy with the mustache. Lord knows, the man who's in charge is usually one, the one with the stash. 
Except in this case, it's certainly not Mario. He's not the one in charge right now. No, he is not. Hey, you have a mustache. Are you in charge? Thanks, a bundle. You're totally welcome. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, oh, wait a minute. Oh, you gave me a coin. Hell yeah. You're damn right I saved you. You're welcome. Maybe the mayor's the other dude with the mustache. You don't have a mustache. You've got a mustache. Are you the mayor? Thanks a bundle. You're welcome. Oh, another blue coin. Oh, well, I didn't know that I could do this. Oh, that's pretty cool. Uh, how about you? You mayor-like? Let's go! The mayor awaits! The mayor doesn't want to talk to me! Neither of you are the mayor! I'll go back to the other side of the bridge then. Alright, I'll try to talk to the mayor again. That's what I'll do. I'll try to talk to the people on the bridge. He didn't want to talk to me before. He's just like, oh my god, everyone's on fire! And no one's on fire anymore, dear mayor. It's okay. It's okay. Can I talk to you now? Can I, like, spray you with water to make you stop? I'm out of water. Wait, 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 wait. I see the B button. I see the B button. B button. Can I please B button you? B button, please. B button. B button. B button. I know I can B button you. Bro. Bro, calm the hell down. I need to go grab water. We need to splash some water on this guy's face. Somehow, well, let me talk to him. I see the B button, but I can't seem to hit it fast enough. So let's go get some water. Let's go get ourselves some water. We can splash some water on the mayor's face to be like, dude, your people are safe at. There's no water. Oh, but there's water at the hot spring. Oh, and there's also water over here. But I go to the water at the hot spring. There's also a little sprinkler over here. I thought I saw a sprinkler. Get some water so I can go knock some sense into the mayor. Because the mayor doesn't seem to want to respond to any sort of communication right now. Unfortunate. Or some would say fun fortunate. Haha, <laughs> because it's fun and unfortunate. No, that's no. No, no. No, no, no. Okay, let's splash some water in this guy's face. Hey, pal. Pal, buddy. Buddy, your people are safe. Yes, your people are safe. You're the, you're the savior of the village. We're in your debt. Now, as a reward, please take this. Oh my god, dude. I had to splash some water in your face to make you stop running around. Oh my god. Another shine get. And I think there is, what, one more level here, I think? Maybe two more. Perhaps two more. La 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 la. Back into the tube. Into the tube. We're going down into the tube. Uh, this is number seven. Shadow Mario runs wild. Before I continue with this, I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to take a little quick break again because. Because biology, I don't know, what do, you, what do you want me to tell you? The body sometimes wants to take a break. And I need to get up and walk around, my fiancé would be proud. Anyway, y'all get to hear this awesome Shadow Mario music. Awesome Shadow Mario music while I go take my break. Peace, be back in a hot sec!
And we're back in action. Time to go chase after Shadow Mario. AKA Bowser Jr. Spoiler alert, we've been over this. Let's go get him. Let's jump back into the action. Hey, pal. You think you can run from me? Oh, you're leaving your goo behind you. Disgusting. Disgusting. Am I actually hitting you? I haven't been hitting you. Oh, that was incredibly easy. Yeah, I gotta remember this! I doubt that. The shine sprites look so cool in this area. Something about the lighting of, like, the darkness of the night and the shine sprite. It's, I don't know, that's so cool looking. It's really cool looking. I like that. We shall save and continue. Yes, we shall. We shall continue. Shave and continue. Shave and continue. That's what we'll do. Whoops. Oh, now would you look at that. Shadow Mario is here again, and he's going to Corona Mountain. Obviously. Where else would he go? Where else could he possibly go? That's where the final boss is, baby. Oh, and the flood is happening, so... Well, I'm not particularly interested in the flood right now. But I guess I should go and find Shadow Mario. I need the correct nozzles for this. I need the rocket nozzle. I need that nozzle. I need that nozzle good. Everything's flooded! How could you? How could you, Shadow Mario? I was talking about this. I actually had no idea. When I was younger, on the, um... I'd be talking to my, uh, my friend on the bus about this. I had no idea that there was a flood because I never got this many shine sprites when I was younger. Oh, I gotta get up to the place where I need to go. So let's jump around the things and whoop de doodles Golly golly gee indeed. I remember chatting with my friend in the elementary school bus about this and they're like, did you ever get to the flood? I was like, the flood? I had no idea there was a flood over here. But I never got that many. But alas, after playing the game a bit more and coming into my own and playing my things properly, I managed to get to the flood. Thank you for the coin! We appreciate that. We appreciate that. I gotta, do, I gotta turn this light down a bit. I'm really gonna fix this lighting in this room. It just seems too bright. It hurts my eyes. Sometimes the lighting hurts my eyes a bit. Uh, things are going crazy. <laughs> There's people with a big old rubber ducky. Love that. I don't think I ever fully appreciated the flood of Delfino Plaza. Never fully appreciated. Never give it the appreciation that you really deserve. Hello, Shadow Mario! Yeah, make it happen. You can glitch in this area too so you can run under the water. Really? That's incredible. Didn't know that. Into Corona Mountain! Let's get her done. It's Corona Mountain time. Guess we're fighting the Bows Boy to release the flood. This area always haunted me. Always haunted me. Because, you know, like, fire and volcano and stuff like that. Like, pretty spooky. Plus, the boat at the very end. I could, at least at the time, I was like, I have no idea how to use this boat. Uh, I eventually figured it out. You just, you just have to. You just gotta use your water sparingly. Oh, that wasn't about to work the way that I wanted it to. Ouch. All right. Didn't time that correctly. Plenty of uh, one man's around here in Corona Mountain. Can I have? Thank you. Ooh, I see the local motorcycle gang is zooming outside again. They tend to do that. Yeah, the boat is incredibly. I, I don't know what it was about the boat when I was younger. I couldn't figure it out. I mean, even still, it's still kind of annoying. But um, you know what? We're gonna make it work. We're gonna make it work. Oh, that would. That was close. Blue coin, keep me coin. Kajit, give you coin. Thank you for coin. Thank you for blue coin. I'll wait for that spiky. Yeah, that's probably good timing. Yep, that's fine. Man. Let's go over here and uh, extinguish this fire. I wonder if there's any blue coins in these fires. I wouldn't really know. I don't think I've ever actually explored Corona Mountain a bunch. I wouldn't be surprised. Let's just extinguish all the fires. I'll have more surfaces to pop onto. That's a, that's a very good advantage to have. Oh, it comes back alive. It comes back alive. I didn't realize the fire continued after a while. That's news to me. Didn't realize it could reignite itself. Huh. I've discovered something else, though. Okie dokie, then. 
Virus, come back. I'm inclined to agree. I'm very much inclined to agree. I wouldn't have believed it unless I saw it with my own eyes. But alas, my eyes have seen. And now that these eyes have seen, they know. That spike's gonna come back. But I'm gonna go over here. The fire's gonna come back, so I'm going to run. Spikies? Spikies. Here we go. Yee! Don't fall into the lava. The lava kills. The lava will kill you! Coin? One man. Nice, nice, nice. Okay. Alright. Let's let's do this vote the way God intended. No, stop, stop, stop. Nope, not the right. Stop. Whatever, dude. I gotta be a little less aggressive with the boat, clearly. Or the boat needs to be a little less aggressive with me. I don't need that spike. I don't need it. I don't need it. I don't need the weight. I don't need it. Oh, goodness gracious! That's not how God intended the boats to work, my friend! They don't! Honestly, after levels like these... Is there really a God? A man has to wonder. A man has to wonder if there even is a God up there. With gods, with, a, with levels like these... Who needs enemies? Who needs... With, en with levels like these, who needs deities? Ha 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 ha! I was actually... I'm very proud that I got that the rhyme there. Ah. Pretty good. Oh, that was close. Let's go over here and then to the fire! The fire and the brimstone. Go over here to the spikes. More fire and brimstone. La, la, la. I always love this theme. It always had that feeling of evilness to it. Evil. Yeah. Every once in a while, you fall and want to feel a little evil. You know? I want to feel a little evil. Some of my songs that I listen to make me feel a little evil on the inside. Alright, let's do this very carefully. Very carefully. So, um... A little bit of the... Look, a little bit of the... Yep, kind of like that, except not so much. Nope, that doesn't turn out right. Let's go over here and slowly turn our... Okay, dude. Little bit. Little bit! Little bit! Little bit! Little bit, little bit in the other direction? A little bit in the other direction. No, 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 not, not that way. Okay, we can go that way, that's fine. Being Mormon, you'd say so, but like the idea that God made some things mega difficult, like, I can't believe, stop, stop, no, 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 you're gonna turn, you're gonna t turn, turn, I say, keep turning, that's right, keep on turning. Yeah, that's right, turn the way I want you to turn. Nope, stop, stop, not like that, not like this. Please, if anything, not like this. Nope, stop. Nope. Okay, fine. We can slow down. We can slow down. We'll change direction. Change course a little bit. Nope, stop. Not that way. You know, on the bright side, it's a good thing that if there are deities out there that they made things difficult. Otherwise, I don't think we'd have any challenges in life. And honestly, life needs a good challenge every once in a while. Turn the boat. Turn the boat. And then forward. But not too forward. Yeah, actually, this will work. Nope, not like that. Oh! Oh! Nope! 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 Turn a little bit. Turn a little bit. Little. Nope, stop. No, not that direction. Not that direction. Nope, I... Uh, nope, not into the rock. Not into the rock. My friend. Boats, I want to call you my friend, but I'm not sure if I can at this point. A little bit. Nope, a little bit. I don't understand. What? What is going on here? What? What in the... Okay, fine. Turn that way. Don't hit the rock, though. I want to say that this is incredibly intuitive and that Nintendo makes really awesome controls that are really easy to understand, but I'd be lying to everybody. I, I feel that I owe you the truth. Okay, now we're going that way. Okay, now we're going that way. That turned us. That turned us a little bit. Yeah, let's go that way. I like that. No, not that direction. No. Yes, continue. Don't hit that little block. If you hit that little block, 
Mario and Cameron would be very sad. Okay, okay. Hey, that's that's fine. You want to turn that way? We can turn that way. We can turn that way a little. Not like that, though. No, 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 no. no. Okay, thank you. No, no, no. There goes the rock. There's a rock. We're going to hit the rock. We're going to hit the rock. Scoot on by the rock. I like that. A little bit of space. A little bit of space where we can think about our life choices so far. Wonder how we got here. Wonder where we're going next. Slowly but surely. Don't hit that wall. Don't hit that wall. Don't hit that wall. Um, yeah, I don't I don't like this position that we're in. I don't like this position. I don't like this position at all. Let's get a little more space from the wall. Uh, not close to rock. Nope, not close to rock. Turn, 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 move. Fly. Fly forward. But not too far forward. We don't want to do that. We'll turn in the direction. And now it's straight on. Straight on. I see that blue coin. I feel that. I feel it good. I'm going to change direction a little bit. That's not the direction I wanted to turn. Nope. I, I want that direction. No, 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 no. That's not the direction. Turn the other way. Yes. I want to be directly on that. Directly on. Bearing straight. No! Move! Oh, away from the thing! Control's easy. Mechanics, genius level inte intellect to understand and explain. Uh, yeah. Actually, I just noticed there's a ton of blue coins in this area. There's one. I'll save that. You know what? I'll take a little time to get those coins. How many are there? Oh, they're literally everywhere. There's blue coins everywhere. Let's, um... Uh... Get some blue coins. We got some time. Got some time to spare. Gonna get some blue coins, you know? Lots of blue coins around here. Yeah, let's go. Let's fly, Mario. Let's fly. fly. That, that's literally not the direction I'm telling you to go. Dude. No, 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 no. Fuck this. Nope. Not doing it. Nope. Not doing it. It's not worth it. Not worth my time. Not gonna do it. Rocket nozzle! Power up by blasting off! Thanks, I really need to hear that right now. Here we go! Woo! Let's do it again! Cameron needs another drink of his cocktail. Jeez. What in the world? Gotta get those clouds! Those clouds make me go up! Ooh. Oh, come on! Oh, I see a little one man. I don't need it. I don't need it. I don't need it. I didn't need it. Clearly, I did. I needed it. Holy quo! That would have been really sad if I fell. That would have been really sad. Oh, back on the cloud, please. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. It's not going well at all. This is. This is sad. This is sad and disappointing. It's a disappointing. Oh, come on. Yes, on one of those clouds. Are you kidding me? That's fine. We can fall a bit. We can fall if you wanna. We can leave gravity and every other cloud you've ever known behind. Oh, oh, okay. I'm out of water. Oh my god. Well, might as well get that one man, right? One man? One man? I missed it. Give me water, please. Can I have water? Thank you. Thank you for refilling me. Clearly I needed a refill. I'll try it again. We can do it again. Up through the clouds! Lovely how you can actually walk on clouds in this level. Not saying that that's physically impossible or anything, but just saying it's... It's beautiful. It's it's clearly possible in the Mario where... Can I get that one man? Oh shit, dude. Got that one man. Nice. No! Back to the ground. On the bright side, I don't think you ever take more than one ounce of damage when you hit the ground. Hey, that worked. Oh, the crates open my tank, uh, film up my tank too. That's good to know. You got it. You got it. You got this, Mario. And there's the dark cloud, which obviously means <gasps> Bowser. What a great Hey, Junior. Come on, Peach, go into the water. It looks like it'll kill you, but surely if these Koopas can handle it, so can you. Mario! You again? Don't you ever give up? 
No, are why you? would I give up? How dare you disturb my family vacation? Family vacation? You've been literally destroying everybody else's. Time to be Bowser! Oh, okay. Well, I walked straight into the fire. That's really good. Here we go! And then... Oh, pow! Oh, don't get hit. Don't get hit by the goo. That seems to be effective. Do it again. Can do. Oh, I'll wait. I'll wait. I'll wait. And now we never see blue bandana again. He just didn't need it. Oh, that didn't work, but it kind of did. Here, just keep running. Keep, yeah, just keep walking, Mario. You got this. There we go. What? What, what happened? I'll admit, I have no idea what just happened there. I, I literally don't... I, I have no way of conceding what the hell just happened. And now we're back here again. And now we're on the... Okay. That's fine. No! Mario, please! Mario, please! That one I can understand. I just didn't get back up on the ledge. I get that. I get that. But that first one... What? Lol, what? Yeah, like, R and Jesus... Not, not making these things work for me. Yes, please. There we go. Down. Okay, so I should just try not to move. Okay, 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 okay. No, oh, all right. Oh, oh wait, I have this thing. I mean, nobody said it was easy. Even, nobody ever said this life was easy. I managed to get to number two the first time, so that was my beginner's luck running out. I'll just use that to get myself back up again. Yeah, I should probably do that. And I can jump over it like that. Just use a bunch of water. Use a bunch of water, Mario. I mean, that's the whole point of this. It's literally water in Mario. There you go. I can use that to get over top and... Oh, hopefully not be killed like that. That's fine. Just hop on over. Oh, and I apparently didn't bounce in the right direction. All right. That's that's appropriate. I'm sure that's fine. I'm okay with that. I'm cool with that. It's fine. Some would say we're in this life to succeed at the things that we want to accomplish. Others maybe not. Bounce myself up like that and uh, pop myself there. All I need to do is do this five times. Whoa, hi there, fuck. Yep, all right. I didn't really appreciate that, but... I suppose it's okay. So long as you're having a good time. That was, that was buddy. That was buddy, you're having a good time? And I got hit by the dude. Whoa, I've been fired! Time to consume. Ah, uh, quick little sip. Quick little sip in this match of mine. Can I hit that bullet bill? I was not able to. Hey, that worked. Oh no, don't hit me! Oh goodness gracious! See, this could be difficult if we wanted it to be. Oh, that wasn't high enough. That clearly wasn't high enough. No, why? Why? Why would you do that? You've sent me through the rocks! I don't understand. I don't understand. Whatever. Okay, fine. I, I, I guess we're just gonna move on with our existences then. I, I can't do anything about it now. Oh, I just saw one man get released from that uh, blue bullet bill. Uh, I guess I should look for that next time. I'm powerful. I'm Mario. I, I'm dying. Go that way. Don't get hit. Okay, uh, that's gonna hurt. That's twice that have to happen, right? Oh my god, please. Uh, that hurt me. That's fine. Uh, I can take a little bit of damage. 
That's fine. That's okay. I'm too. I'm totally cool with that. I'm, a, I'm running a little bit out of water, but that's fine. I can survive with that. Bring me back up upon the thing. Also, good for you, Bowser, that you can, like, bathe in hot green goo. Is that just the paint? Is that the paint from which all other paints flow? I don't know what was going on there for a hot second. Hey, you missed me. I'm gonna run out of water real quick. Oh, we did it? That was it? Wait, I actually did all five? There was, there was another one, though. There was another fourth one. All right, whatever. I am not questioning that. Why question the things that work out in my favor, right? Why, why bother? I, I wouldn't. I wouldn't do that if I were me. So I won't. Hey, Pete, you're safe now, right? You're, uh, you're all nice and hunky-dory. Yeah? Nice and hunky-dory. Hey, I did it. I beat Bowser. All right. I like that. Oh no, is Flood dead? No, he's a machine. Huh. But you need to do all four of them. I guess not. Game over for Flood. Mario, was I, um, of um... Yes, Flood, you were definitely of assistance to me, Mario. All of Mario? us here at Camera with an X Enterprises. Mario, look, the Shine Sprite is coming back to Isle Delfino. Isn't that beautiful? Isn't that beautiful? The whole world will shine once again. Everybody gets to celebrate, too. It's always time for a party. See, that's, that's celebration. That's a need for celebration if I ever saw it. What about you two? How you feeling? Junior, I've got something difficult to tell you about Princess Peach. I know, she's not really my mama. I mean, I beat the boss. That's I did end the game in that regard. Oh, we've also found out, for those who didn't know, Princess Peach is not actually the mother of Bowser Jr. I wanna fight that Mario again. That's my boy. Well put, son. The Royal Cooper Line is as strong as ever. But for now, let's just rest a while. I guess now what I plan on doing is I'm just going to keep on playing until I feel like stopping. There are more Shine Sprites to do. More things to accomplish. Let's see. And I managed to fight Bowser in nine and a half hours. I'd say that's a personal the best. Vacation starts now. The vacation starts now. We did it, everybody! We beat Super Mario Sunshine! <laughs> Raise a toast! Grab a party horn! <laughs> we did it, everybody! Maybe you grab two party horns. <laughs> ah, that's terrifying sounding. I'm done with that. You thought I was going to play more weekly based? Honestly, I was just planning on getting through as much of this as I possibly could in a single day. This was my Super Mario Sunshine stream. I liked it. I had a wonderful time. I'm not done with it. I'm still going. There's still more Shine Sprite. I still haven't accomplished my own personal goal. I have to continue. I had a little cherry on the end of that stick. Think about it this way, Disney Queen. I've got the GameCube working. Now, I can play any GameCube I want to. <laughs> any GameCube. Any GameCube game that I want to. It actually works. And I'm glad that the stream didn't break. I'm really happy about that. Da, 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 da. Love that. What's the goal? I don't really know at this point. Um, what I at least want to do is get all of the main shine sprites in all the levels. That's what I'm planning to do. As well as anything else I remember. My idea is just to get all the sprites that I remember exist. That's my goal for now. That, or I just go until I stop. 
Uh, Il Piantissimo is confused about that paintbrush. The end. Nice. What a lovely journey. What a lovely journey. But there is more to accomplish. Have I ever played Metroid Prime? I've never actually played the Metroid Prime series. I've always wanted to, but I never did. Awesome. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Yeah, I've never actually played Metroid Prime. There were a couple of friends of mine. Christina, if you're still around, I think you played Metroid Prime, right? Those were, those were fun. 68. Oh, we're so close, baby. Anyway. Fun, fun, fun. That could be something. Is that for the GameCube? Hmm. Delfino Plaza is now beautiful and no longer flooded. We appreciate that. There was at least one more shine sprite to achieve in Pianta Village. <laughs> so let's go get that. All three, you can borrow the trilogy collection if you like. Yes! I think that'd be another wonderful GameCube game to play alongside the Mario Party series, which I'm sure my dearest will happily join me on. I think that'd be cool. I think it'd be very cool. It's the Wii release. Uh, well, I gotta get the Wii working then. I gotta check those cables. The Wii is currently in black and white, so if I can get my hands on a copy and, like, FPS with tons of exploration, I will love it. I'd love to. Oh, come on! This is the second I do that. You're doing what? We're gonna play Mario Party together, I thought. I believe that was the plan. We, we've discussed this. I believe we have discussed this before. The current trilogy collection is the Wii, but if I can get my hands on all three of them... I got another pal of mine who also streams and makes videos on YouTube that's got um, plenty of GameCube games. I know he's a GameCube fanatic too, so I know he's got a he's got a store near him. I can ask him to look out for those Metroid games, and then I'll just pay him back. Lycos Muro is my man. Oh, like, uh, number three was on the Wii. There, might as well fix it. I just dropped my thing, bub bub Oh, I gotta go reach that fluff festival coin hunt. Sweet. I will finish my cocktail. My cocktail's over. Wow. Might as well fix it. I hope so. I mean, I don't think Wii's are too, too expensive. I mean, hopefully I can fix it. If I can't fix it, then eh, well, whatever. But I can try. Um, Trilogy was also a remaster in the light types of ways. Very wonderful. I'll continue with this. I'm actually very proud to say that this has been my longest stream yet. I'm very happy about that. I'm out of a wonderful time. I don't even feel tired. Or do I? Uh, who do I gotta talk to for these? Uh, do, should I have talked to somebody about the red coins? Uh, red coins. Coins of red. Hi, everybody. It's a wonderful, wonderful celebration. Hi, guys. Should I talk to you, Mr. Mr. Mayor? You can't snag a piece of love without climbing way up high. Oh, is that how that works? Okay. Guess I'm gonna go snag that fluff. So to, so to speak. I'm gonna go snag that fluff. That's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna snag that fluff. That's what I'll do. I'll snag that fluff, and I'll snag it good. Not exactly that I know what that means in context, but I'm gonna snag fluff. To, to the tree, to the tree, to the tree, to the tree, tree to the tree, to the tree, to the tree. We we'll go up the tree. Hey, pal, how you doing? You having a good time? Wonderful. I'm glad you're having a good time. I'm having a good time. Well, I'm having a good time over here. Oh, I see. You have to snag the fluff. I understand. I, did, I must snag the fluff from the tree. Oh, look at that. Oh, I just saw a blue bird fly by. Mario has to extinct that. There's a copy on Amazon for 22 bucks. Oh, hell yeah, I'm clicking on that tab. Oh, yeah, I gotta switch tabs. Metroid Prime. Nice, that sounds lovely. I'm always looking for more games to play. Now that I got the, so usually I have all these PC games that I can play, which is mostly all of them, but like now I have opportunities for others. This is great. Can I go up? Oh, I see, I see. It says red coins, but like, I guess I need to get to the top of the tree. I gotta snag that fluff, so to speak. What is at the top of this tree, anyway? Oh, I see. Come on, get up there. No, we were so close, Mario! Alright, then. 
There's probably something at the top of that tree. I know this mission said red coins, but I haven't seen any coins that are red. Uh, I'm just going to try to get to the top of the tree. I want it. I need to get to the top of the tree. First and oh, the first and second Metroid Prime games on the GameCube, and the third one is on the Wii. I believe that was mentioned. Yeah, that makes sense. That could be fun. Well, at the very least, I can play through the first, and then I play through the second, and then if I haven't gotten the Wii fixed by then, then well, I mean, I guess I'm sorted out of luck there. Wow, my wow, buddy, you just don't want to climb up that tree, do you? I'm gonna snag a fluff. I'm gonna snag that fluff. That's the goal, I guess, to snag that fluff, so to speak. Mario's just having fun with his rocket thing. Hello, bird. Goodbye, bird. I don't know. I kind of want to get to the top of the tree. I don't know if that's possible. I see coins up there. There must be a way to get to the top of the tree. Okay. Yeah, I tried that at least three times now. I'm going to try to snag a fluff. I'm gonna go snag that fluff, so to speak. I'm not sure what snagging a fluff means to these piantas, but... Seems a little suggestive to me. Like, uh, hey Mario, you're gonna go snag some fluff tonight? Like, yeah, dude. Weird. Can I turn my camera, please? No? Alright. Oh, I see a cloud over there. I almost got that. I guess I'll fall down to the surface for a little while. I've got that rocket thing. I've got that rocket nozzle. This is probably the most frustrating, relaxed red coin level you've ever played. I haven't even found a red coin. I'm just like, where the hell are the red coins? I don't even know where they are. I haven't found a single one yet. I'm up here now. Uh, that's cool. But where be? Oh, I was so close to the top up there. Nope, I guess not. I fall into the ground. <laughs> I love how I have yet to find a single coin. Can I grab this fluff? Can I grab this fluff? I want to grab that fluff. Can I have... Yes, I grab the fluff. Okay, fluff has disappeared. I need water. The water's all been dried up, huh? Has the water all been dried up? Where's the rest of... Oh, I gotta go to the hot tub for more water. I'm guessing all the red coins are way up high. Way up, way up, way up to the... Just kidding, I found a red coin. That's one. Cool. Maybe there's another one up here. If I snag some fluffs, will I find more coins? If I snag a couple of those fluffs, so to speak. I do see a way to get up there to that, uh... A thing, and it may or may not involve snagging a fluff. That'll work. That's one way to get up on top of the tree. Coin, 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 coin. Will I make it? Will I make it? Will I make it? Yes, I will. All right, I'm just gonna—I guess I'm just gonna find the other ones. Hey yo, welcome to the party, there, Astro Rock. Welcome to the party. Welcome to the party. That means I'm gonna put out a party hat. I don't have a lot of real estate in my head, so I'm gonna put a tiny party hat on. I hope you don't mind. Do -do 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 -do. And a little party hat. Not a lot of real estate in my head right now. I get a tiny party hat. Make me look a little silly, but a little fun. A little silly, a little fun. I would love to, uh, to play some more of that. I, I just thought, I just thought of that again. Like I'd love to play some of that Metroid Prime. So, uh, Christina, you wanna hook me up with some Metroid Prime? Do you got any GameCube versions? You know, maybe my buddy Lycos Lore has some GameCube versions of it. He might. He's played he played a lot of GameCube, so he might have access to those. I just gotta try. If I promise right now that I'm playing Metroid Prime, I'm sticking to it. I'm gonna stick to it. Oh, I see a little fluff up here. Get that fluff. Get that fluff. Get that. Okay. Oh! I just hang on the fluff, right? Oh, that's so cute. Oh, Aww, that's pleasant. And I can just kind of... Okay, or I can fall and die.
Well, you did mention frustrating and relaxed. I feel at least both of those right about now. I feel that. Alrighty then. Let's drink some water. Let's see. That's the thing. There are a lot of shine sprites in this game. And it doesn't seem like the levels kind of... Um, they don't seem very comprehensive in them all. Because there are, what, about eight levels? And they've all got eight each. That's like 64. There are a ton of secrets. Each one of them has like nine, I guess, if you count the 100 coins. I'm not planning on doing 100 coins or anything like that. A little, a little too much. A little too much. But, um... I think the goal is to at least, the ver at very least, to be able to get all of the main shine sprites in the main levels. So, um, I can get achievements for all the games in the trilogy that stack across all the games. Ooh. So if I wind up getting that Wii working, I'll borrow the trilogy version from ya. And we'll go with that. I just need to get that thing working. I haven't yet. I haven't yet. I still haven't. I told myself I was going to figure out the, um, what is it? I need to replace the cable and see if the cable's the problem. I had, if I had to guess, it's probably not the cable, because I don't understand, I don't see why the cable would be wrong with it. I think there were new cables anyway, but, uh, we gotta tr try to be exhaustive on all the possibilities, so we can get that thing to work, and we'll get it to work. I promise it will get it to work. Something. That I'll just buy myself a new week at this point. Might as well. I've got the rocket nozzle. I can go down here, go up on top of the tree, and go up from the other side. Oh, wait a minute. I forgot about the red coin down here. Don't forget. Don't forget red coin. Red coin in the hot tub. You know, there's probably also red coins below as well on the mushrooms. I didn't even think about that. Come on top of this leaf over here top of that leaf over there. I don't see anything of interest over there on those leaves. Unless... Eh, I'll check it later. I don't see any coins on those leaves. There's at least a second red coin over here on top of the tree. Let's see if I can get to that okay. Oh, okay. Falling down. And then I'll grab into a fluff and go to that little, uh, uh, little cloud area. That's the next one. <laughs> grab a fluff, so to speak. There we go. I've grabbed onto the fluff. Off we go to the fluff. There we go. I jump off in that direction so I can actually land properly. Now I'm on a cloud. Some would say this is also a form of fluff. It feels pretty form of fluff to me. Now I got the hover nozzle. Now I'm up on this level. Finer control over my movements. Okay, up on the next level. Wow, that is incredibly disorienting up here. It's just a big white fluff. What do I do with that though? I must find another. Whoa, am I moving? Whoa, wait a minute. Why did you move me? Oh my goodness. The clouds move. Let it be known. The clouds move, and they don't move with you. They want to go away from you. That was interesting. Huh. I wonder if I've ever actually successfully completed that level before. Because I have a strange suspicion that I never did. Hmm. But I want to, and I need to, and I will. I will do it. It's 11 o'clock at night. I feel that. Clouds expand with water. Oh, yeah, that's pretty dumb. I don't really like that. Are there any red coins down there? Let me check to make sure that there are or are not any red coins down here. In the mushroom area. What is it? It's this fluff festival coin hunt. So I don't assume that there's any down here. But there well, very well could be. Just to double check. That is really stupid. The clouds expand. I mean, I guess, I guess it makes sense because like 
clouds being water and all, but like, hey, I don't, I don't know if I really like it. I don't know if I really vibe with that. Oh, there's a red coin over there. So there are some red coins down here. There's one, I see. That doesn't look like there's one in there. Probably some more over there. If I can just get in my brain where those red coins are, I'm gonna have a very easy time with it. But these silly little fluffs. Silly fluffs doing silly fluffo things. This is a pretty extensive level, and if they got if they got red coins scattered everywhere, there are a lot of chances to absolutely mess yourself up, because I'll just fall and die. And I don't want Mario to die today. Not today. Usually I'd be totally down with putting Mario in his place. But no, not when I am Mario. If I am the Mario, I do not want to <laughs> I'm going to die. Okay, cool. Uh, is there anything of consequence over here? Interesting how this entire level is like I can't even find where the where the things are. Oh that Wow That's not pleasant. That's not very good. The light oh can I make it up? Can I make it up? Okay, I saved myself. I wasn't expecting that to happen. I'm running out of water too. Checking for more red coins. I feel almost like I'm completely new to this. I mean, I am essentially completely new to this particular level. Like, I don't remember at all in my brain whether or not I've ever gotten these particular shine spray. Because I don't recognize these coins at all. I don't even know where to find them. But I guess if I look around enough, I eventually will. Okay, uh, I think it looks like there's only one down here. Yo, what's going on, dead girl? How's it going down in Alabama down there? Hey, look at that! You've done a little subscription! You did that thing where you did the subscribe thing! Therefore, we put on a special metallic party hat. They all seem to be gone over, but, uh, wow, my chocolate has fallen. Blue one. hey -o! Wow, now my head looks... Well, oh, that's unfortunate. I gotta try to put a party head on for that. Let's, um... Uh, let's try to go from the back. Try to go from the back. Wrap it around this other party head over here. We're gonna try to make that work. There we go. Around my ear. We've got it on the back! Yeah, baby! And I'm able to put my headphones on still. Sweet! Yeah. Sweet! Now I gotta, um, get myself out of here. I gotta get myself the hell out of here. There was only one coin down here. I have searched extensively. I have searched far and wide. And I believe that there is only one. So, uh, I'm trying to get back up. I'm gonna try my hardest. Try my hardest to get back up. You ever had a party hat rip on stream? Not yet. Not yet. Nothing has ever... Honestly, nothing has ever ripped. Um, I do have one party hat. Uh, I'll, I'll go grab it, actually. It's actually in pieces. No, it's actually not over here. Where'd that party hat go? Blow my pants? I have pants on my printer. Oh well. Well, I do have one party hat that's in pieces. Uh, it's not really in pieces, but I tried to put a little... My, uh, my gin, the gin bottle that I had, came with a little top hat, and I was like, oh my god, that is so freaking cute! Um, and I tried to put it on one of my party hats, and it just won't stick no matter what I do. So in that regard, I have only ever... I've never had a party hat rip. Uh, rip. But I have had party- I have modified party hats for other purposes. Though it's never worked out. Oh, you're kidding me, right, Mario? I'm out of water. I'm almost out of water. That's not fun. All I need to do is get up to that green one. Please! You got it! I had like 20 party hats on when you first watched. No, it wasn't 20. I actually, I believe it was 12. It might have been 12. I think there was 12 party hats on that time. And yes! Synergy, we're still here. I, uh... No, I ran out of water! You're kidding me, Mario, please! Oh, my God! I'm gonna... Oh, jeez. Yeah, we're still here. Yeah, we're still here. I managed to beat Bowser at Corona Mountain. He's gone. Corona Mountain has been completed. Now it's just a matter of attempting to get... I, I don't know. So... 
There are more shine sprites. I'm just gonna go until I'm done. Until I feel like I need to stop. I really, I really love this game. This is something that, like, was incredibly important to, like, me growing up as a child. And the fact that I'm able to actually play it now is, like, super, super cool. I'm 23 years old now, and I'm still getting the same amount of enjoyment out of this game that I did when I was, like, 8 years old. 8 to 12 years old. When did this game come out? I'm probably getting my math wrong there. But, I, I wow, I, I, I love this game so much. So, uh, I'm going with it. And I'm still finding out more things. There are still so many things that you can find out about those games that you played when you were a young lad and that you didn't really know about before. And I'm finding out new things all the time. Hell, I've mentioned that I write down everything that I don't recognize when people mention it on stream. And I have at least three or four post notes just filled, filled with terms that I plan on educating myself on later. Whether it be, uh, let's see, what do I have so far? What are my other post notes? I, I actually have a thing of, I don't know where it is. Uh, anyway, there's stuff on there, I assure you. Shine Sprite cocktail idea, um, we got Xiaomi UIs for Android device, we've got Berg the Light, Berg the Light, oh, Bury the Light, that's the song that I need to listen to from uh, Devil May Cry 5, I have that written down as well. It's 11.09 over here, it is also 11.09 over here, actually it's 11.10 right now, and maybe by the time you hear me saying that, it'll be 11.11. .11. So, um, knock on wood if you're into that. I need to get up on top of this little thing over here. Yeah, we must be in the same time zone then. Ho ho, it's 10-10 over there. Nice, we all, we're all we all in different time zones, it seems. Well, slightly. Some of us in the same time zone. There's one red coin over there. One red coin over there, and I want it. I want it, I need it, the precious. Oh, dear, that's, is that enough momentum to get over there? Yes! Now I need to get back up. Because I don't think there's any other red coins down here. So, uh, yeah. I'll admit those too. This is, uh, this is, this is unusual. I don't usually spend this much time playing a single game. Uh, I think the longest stream I ever had before was almost eight hours. And we're borderlining ten right now. I've seen people do like 24 hour streams for like charity or new games that come out and whatnot. I've never really had, I've never had the motivation to continue playing a game for so long, but I guess nostalgia just does it for me. Red coin in there? Nope. There must be a red coin in one of these little crevices over here. Some of us in that central something time. I'm guessing CDT, CDT is central something time. It's the Texas time. The Texas time, I'm sure. CDT Central... Central something time? I don't know. When I think of Central and then a D afterwards, I think of Central Dogma. Which is... That's that's in an anime I've watched. Central Dogma is like, in the show Evangelion, that's where they all did their stuff. That's where they all did their stuff. There's probably another red coin over... Oh, look at that! There's a red coin in the grass. Is there a red coin down here? Hello? Nope. Central Daylight Time. Ah. Nice. I'm over here, Eastern Standard Time. Over here on the beautiful East Coast. It's time to consume, baby! Water! Sorry, that was a little loud, I'll admit. I gotta, yeah. I'm gonna go to bed as soon. Catch, catch you later. Yeah, catch you later, Synergy. Happy to see that you popped on. Always good to see our old friends. Old friends once again, coming back for a little bit more. But yeah, it's pretty late. I'm not even tired. I'm sleeping in tomorrow. That's what I'm going to wind up doing. Tomorrow's going to be a work day. So long, farewell, and have a wonderful night yourself there too, Synergy. It's definitely going to be a bit of a work day tomorrow. I'll probably get up late. Uh, I believe my fiance, Disney Queen, said she's probably getting back around noonish, so maybe she'll wake me up depending on how late I sleep. We'll see. So there's one on the grass. There's one red coin in the grass. There's one below on the mushrooms. Uh, I see leaves over here. I don't see any red coins on these leaves, but I see a blue coin. That's pretty cool. I'm down with that. Blue coins? Blue coins are good. Save and continue. Ba -da -da. There's probably more. There's probably more. Maybe there's one more red coin up on top of this? 
I'm guessing the most difficult part of this is going to be just finding all the red coins and then figuring out a path to grab them all at once. Or uh, maybe it's about grabbing that fluff, so to speak. Can I grab that fluff? Grab that fluff? I want to grab a fluff. Yeah, I've grabbed that fluff, so to speak. Are you down with that sickness? Hell yeah, we're down with that sickness. But this sickness only has one cure. And that is more cowbell. Oh, it seems that I've run out of agua. More agua. Let's go grab more agua. I mean, I'd like to say that I'm down with that sickness. I did have the sickness. I did. I did have the sickness. That sickness that everybody's talking about? Remember where those clouds took me? I mean, did the clouds really take me anywhere, so to speak? I gotta step safe so that- Can I get out of here, please? Mario, please? That's where the star spawns. Okay. But I still need to grab all those coins. You got it, Mario. Yeah, you got it, buddy. I just gotta find all those coins first. Just need some more water. I mean, lo and behold, if I collect all those red coins, the star will spawn somewhere. Where, though? I just noticed, are there any red coins in these boxes? I wonder. No red, no red coins in the boxes. Oh, there's a red coin back there, behind the tree. Wow. Good thing I turned that camera around. I would have never noticed that one. Okay, and there's at least one on top of the big tree. And there was one on top of those clouds, if I remember correctly, as well. I didn't check these leaves over here, too. Any red coin? Coin? I see a little platform over there. That's not what I'm looking for. Is there potentially a red coin over here? Nope, don't think so. How about over here? Now, we already know about this. Oh, I need the... Do I actually need the rocket to get up there? I don't know. I never tried. Oh, I don't need the rocket. Sweet. I didn't need the rocket at all. Pretty awesome. There's a red coin up here. That's number five. Use my... Oh, I'm actually guessing that the sunshine... Sunshine? The shine sprite probably spawns up there. I mean, it does have a little shine sprite logo there. I could be wrong, though. It could throw me for a little bit of an alley-oop. Um, but there's also another one. Here, can I grab this one? Where will you take me? Uh, okay. You'll just go through the leaf, I guess. So, uh, you'll take me nowhere. I guess that's cool. Honestly, I don't know why I need the rocket nozzle. I don't think the rocket nozzle is really something that I need. Was there a red coin up on top of that? Uh, how would I even remember? I got five so far. Five so far. Ooh, look at that. Fluffy, fluffy. Okay, can I have? Can I have? Please, can I, can I touch? Yes, here we go. Let's fly on over. Yeah. I guess there wasn't really a red coin over here. There really wasn't a red coin over here. So if I do water on this thing, it expands and then contracts. It expands. And then it contracts. Yeah, I don't think there was a coin over here. Eh. Well, let's expand that for a moment. Just so I can go this way. And then... That's not gonna work as well as I thought it would. Please, hit the ground. Wow, that worked out better than I thought it would. Alright. Oh, there's a red coin over here. There's only two more to grab. Okay, okay. Curiouser and curiouser. Finding more and more red coins. I think there was another red coin in one of these little crevices that connect to the bottom area, though, however... I do not know for sure. Maybe there's a red coin in these boxes. Red coin in the boxes. I, I believe. I believe. I believe. I believe in the power. I believe in the... Wow, look at that. There is actually a red coin in there. I'll admit it. I said I believed, but I didn't really believe. Now I just need one more. There's only one more coin left. And then, uh, yeah. That's pretty cool. Maybe there's another red coin in here for all I know. Might as well break them all. Is there a red coin down here? In this little, little crevice over here? No, doesn't seem like it. Maybe it's in the river somewhere. 
Down here, perhaps? There's a blue coin. I like blue coin. Blue coins are very good. Maybe in the rest of the river. There's one more left. But where could you be? Oh, where, oh, where could my red coin be? Did I get the one underneath yet? I think I did. Did I? Well, now I gotta double check myself. I gotta double check myself. I don't remember if I died either. To be honest, I don't remember either. It's been so long. Let's check. Red coin? Yep, it appears I have. Alrighty then. So I did grab that one. I haven't died since then yet. That's pretty cool. Where would the last one be, though? I haven't checked this tree yet. This tree is definitely a tree that I have not yet climbed. Oh, there it is! Right over there. There's the red coin. All right! Oh my god! Okay, it's a thin one. Watch me die. Right here. Oh my god. My heart. That's a pretty thin leaf. Honestly, I can just come up like this, right? Can I? Can I actually come up? Nope. All right. Come up. Up onto the leaf. All right. That was definitely a smarter way of going about doing that. Ah, there it is. Way over there. You have to grab onto a fluff to get to the shine sprite. So if you never... If you were a player who never figured out that you could ride that fluff, so to speak, then you'd never know how to get the shine sprite. It was really relaxed and really frustrating. Couldn't have described it better myself. Nope, okay. We can throw, throw ourselves into the wall if we want to. We can dive if we wanna. We can leave all of our friends behind. Because your friends don't dive, and if they don't dive, well, they, they, they're probably better off, to be perfectly honest. And I just have to grab that fluff. And I can do so by doing that fancy little flippy trick over here and gliding my way over. Grabbing onto a fluff. Can I grab fluff? I want to grab fluff. Yep, here we go. Awesome. Awesome. Hey, that worked out rather well. That was really cool, honestly. Nice. Saving quit on out of there. 69 shine sprites. I'm going to skip on the teehee joke. But y'all get the idea. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to trade in the rest of my blue coins. And then I'm trying to remember, going to try to remember what other secrets there are around Delfino Plaza after I trade in those coins uh, while I take a little bit of a break. That needs a bit of a break. Yeah, you a chuckster? Will you chuck me? If I ask you to? Howdy! Throw me a coin and I'll throw you for a loop! A uh, single coin may have the power to change your destiny. I don't have a coin. Oh. I don't have any coins. Alright, well, uh, I'll try to remember you then. I'll come back for you. I know there's a ton of shine sprites around Delfino Plaza, things you can do with Yoshi, there's the blue coins thing as well. Obviously, I'm not going for a 100% here. I'm just going for, uh, however long I can, really. Ten blue coins. More blue coins? More blue coins. Yes, I want. I want blue coin. Oh, I got all- oh, I was able to trade them all in. Cool, now that's zero blue coins. I'll save and continue that. We're up to 76 right now. That's awesome. Plenty more blue coins to find. Um, but what I'll do in the meantime is I am going to take a quick repast and empty out the cocktail that I've put into my body. I will be back in a little bit, I assure you. See you then.
Not a very long break. Just a break that was enough to break the ice. I thought I'd be more proud of myself for that. I really wasn't. All in the making. Uh, Alright, let me check to see how many Shine Sprites I've got around here, as well as what other ones may be in the area. I know there's some Yoshi Sprites around here in Delfino Plaza. It seems I've gotten all the main Sprites in the different villages. 19 in Delfino Plaza, 1 at Delfino Airstrip. I know there's a way to go back to Delfino Airstrip. I don't exactly remember how to do that. But I know there's another one around there. I'm not sure how to rem uh, I don't remember how to go back. Do I have to talk to the princess? Who's the princess, anyway? Yo, princess, where you at? Toadsworth! Friends! Family! Lifelong comrades, where are you? I see the pipe over there. I haven't tried that pipe yet. I think you need Yoshi for that, don't you? Talk to the boat dude. But where is the boat dude? Where's boat dude? Is boat dude over here? Is there a dude with a boat? Dude, dude with the boat? Dude with the boat? Dude with the boat? Dude with the boat? Where's the boat dude? Hmm. Oh no, no, I know where the boat is. I think I gotta go this way. I think I gotta go that way. There's a person with a boat over there. I thought. It's 10 coin to advance the travel there. Are you boat dude? Will you take me? Can I take you to the airstrip? It's only 10 coins. Aha! Yeah, there we go. Boat dude. You right. Need some more coins. Where do I find coins around here? Oh, well, I guess the easiest way to find coins is to um, go underground. There's also other um, shine sprites around here, too. That I haven't collected yet. I know. And I will find them. There we go. That's 11 coins. You know what? Let's talk to uh, the dude who said he'll throw me for a dollar. Different, different things under here. There's more. You got a blue coin. Apparently I did. That's pretty cool. More blue coins. He appreciates that. Let's continue onwards then. Trying to get more. I have all the coins that I need. I could also try to get the 100 coins in uh, Delfino Plaza. But, uh, eh, whatever. Eh, whatever, whatever. Let's go inside of here. Um, actually, I'll come back for that sprite. That's one of the easier ones. Let's go to the airstrip. Can I go to the airstrip? Shall I take you to the airstrip? It's only 10 coins. Absolutely. Had to push off and head out. Don't expect any sea shanties from this captain, mate. Soon may the weathermen come to bring a sugar and tea and... R anyway. No more sea, sh sea shanties. And I think the only thing to do here is just to get coins, right? Oh, there's red coin. Uh, there's, uh, red coins here, too. Collect that red coins before the timer runs out. Let's do it. Oh, I need the turbo to get through there. Actually, is there anything up on top of this strip here? Nope. I didn't mean to do that. Mario squishes his way up the pole. It's two minutes to get all the red coins. I don't know what happened tomorrow. Is there a red coin up here? I might as well check myself. Well, I have the opportunity to. Okay, guess not. It's definitely not up there. Crash on through and grab a coin. Okay, crash on coin through and... Oh, look at that. Ice. That's cool. There we go. Crash through there. Crash on through. Uh, there's probably more red coins this way, too. I must find them all. There's another one. We did. You're right. We did play one of the Hat in Time levels that was based off of this. You're totally right. I remember that. Because I was like, wait a minute. I remember there being, like, flags that I can grab onto. Like, no, no, no. That was Hat in Time. That's one. Or, that's five, I guess. And I have a minute left for the other ones. I miss those days. We should play more Hat in Time levels, to be honest. I miss those days. We could play more Workshop levels if we wanted to. I see a red coin over here. And there's apparently one more left, so... And it's right there, so... You got it! You got it, you got it, you got it, you got it! Shall we continue, Mario? Yes, we shall. Go grab that Shine Sprite. Hell yeah, dude! And I'm at, actually at 73 coins right now, so I'm gonna come back, and I'm gonna do this again, and I'm gonna get the 100 coins. It's so easy to get the 100 coins in this level. Yahoo! 
the goal is to see how far, how much, how many storm spreads I can get, I guess, before I wind up feeling so tired. I guess we'll see how many I can get before I feel so tired that I can't possibly continue. And I still have 74 coins. I still have 74 coins. I guess. Okay. Well, if I have 74 coins here, then I'm really not that far off from getting the 100 coins of Delfino Plaza. So I might as well collect. Might as well collect the coins while I'm still here. So I'll do that. Because all the coins spawn back again. Actually, this this might be the... Um, let's see, I gotta go up this way and then that's 100, I think. Because there's 9 over here at least, right? Yep. Yeah. There we go. Alright, well that was... I don't think that could have been any easier to get the 100 coins in Delfino Plaza. Wow. I wasn't expecting to do that. Oh, not that way. That was pretty cool. I didn't know I could do that. <laughs> awesome. Did that better than you would have. You probably do a lot of things better than me anyway. We've all got our strengths and weaknesses. Mine is anything that's simple. I can't do anything that's simple because my brain overthinks. I'm not sure what your specialty is. Guess we'll have to figure that out. Alright, let's go find... Uh, the Shine Sprite. I went for the Shine Sprite. And then I'll go back to Delfino uh, Airstrip and get the 100 coins one. There you go, you're way out there. On the boots. I gotta go to the boots. If I just grab the rocket nozzle, that'll make things very easy. I feel like I've relived an entire section of my younger years just by playing through this game again. It, like, it feels so foreign, yet so familiar, because it's been so long. Wonderful things, wonderful things that streaming has motivated me to do. I'll admit, one of the reasons, one of the other reasons that I began streaming was because I wanted to motivate myself to do things that I don't normally do. And at the time, I didn't normally play video games. So I was like, if I stream it, that's a way to, like, kind of encourage myself to do that. Oh, look at that. Uh, so I have those coins now. Can I go back to Delfino Airstrip? I'll go back to Delfino Airstrip and collect 100 coins again. Can I go back? I'll go back. Shall I take you? Yes, you can. Here we go. You got ADHD, so for me, for you, it's being able to do, to be good at things that aren't needed in life, right? I, I get that, though. Sometimes I just want to be good at things that just, I mean quote-unquote don't matter they matter to you therefore they matter in general i i value a lot about the opinion of the individual so like if it matters to you then it matters to someone and you are swamp someone therefore it is totally important that's at least the way that i see it sometimes it just takes a little bit of motivation to really make things work like that well, that's a coin oh delfino airstrip apparently counts as well as delfino plaza i guess they all count to the same place but Oh, is that so? Really? I didn't know that. So does that count as Delfino Airstrip? Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. I didn't check that. Yeah, it counts as Delfino Airstrip. Oh, alright. Oh, I guess the combined... It's combined for the 100 coins, because I can see it. There we go, in the top, bottom right. 101 coins for Delfino Plaza, Delfino Airstrip, completely. But there's so many other Shine Sprites to get. I'll just take this and then I can go back to the other one. Because I don't know if there are any... Are there any other areas in Delphine Airstrip that offer a Shine Sprite? I'm not exactly sure. You know what I haven't tried? Nah, I don't think so. I was going to say, I haven't tried rocketing inside of that little building there. There might be something else there, but I'm not exactly sure. So, I'm not going to wind up taking those chances. We got the same shine again. I guess I'll save and continue. I guess I'll save. Nothing's changed. I like that. Like that a lot. So now there's what other things hidden in Delfino Plaza? There was a shine sprite over here. So I'm gonna go grab that. Grab a little shine sprite over here. Oh, the extra secrets. I see it in there. If I go down, and I make my way over over yonder, I should be able to... Can I not get up this way? Oh, I can't. I'll get in there, then. 
gotta do a little bit of investigating. I know there's plenty of blue coins around, of course. Got that. I know there's an individual who'd like me to break his boxes for a Shine Sprite, so I can do that too. Oh, you're the one who's gonna throw me inside, right? Yep, I'll uh, change my life. Change my life for one coin. Change my life. Howdy, throw me a coin and I'll throw you for a loop, please. Yeah, away you go into the building. Yep, and now I can get that Shine Sprite. That's what it needed. All right, nice, that's another one. I was gonna say, can I make it to 80? I can definitely make it to 80. Two shines for the box, dude. Oh, it was only two. I thought it was only three. I thought it was three. Huh. Oh, well. There's also different shine sprites for all the different uh, fruits that are going around town, of course. Like, um, let's see, what do you need over here, fruit girl? What do you want some fruits? What kind of fruits you want? What kind of fruits do you want? You want a fruit? Hello! You want to work for me a little bit? Sure. I'd love for you to bring me some fruit. Craving some? Pineapples. Three pineapples. Bring it here and put it in the basket. Can do. You want pineapples? I'll give you pineapples. No problem. Mario is a whore when it comes to shine sprites. He wants those. He wants those shine sprites. He'll do anything for shine sprites. Anything that bring him his, uh, his, uh, his freedom. Those police officers still aren't into it. Oh no! Why did you throw that so far? Mario, wait, wait! Grab the pineapple! Emergency pineapple duty! If I throw it from back here... Three points! How many points? Three points! Oh yeah! Record-breaking rains have receded. Oh, is that what was happening? The rains. Is that what caused the flood? Yeah, sure, sure, sure. Sounds good, Debs. Delfino... Something... Something... Something. D-E-B-S. Three points again. Oh, Mario on the courts. Oh, he missed it. He missed the things with the pineapples. He can do it again. I'll do it from here. A little bit closer. There you go. There you go. We likes that. We likes the pineapples. She likes the pineapples. I know the one chick on the other side wants a durian. I think. How many durians was it? I, I hope it's only one durian. You just need one durian, I think. Oh, there's a little, um... Here, throw that pineapple for a moment. I want to see what's inside of here. Anything fun? Eh, just a coin. That's always cool. Go up that way. Bring it over here, and, uh, one more pineapple. There we go. Are you happy now? Are you happy now? Oh, thanks, sweetums. You're welcome. Oh, blue coin. Oh, that was in a shine spread. Well, uh, Mario will whore himself out for blue coins, too. He will. That's what he'll do. Really, anything that gives him the potential for Shine Sprites. And I know you over there, I believe, require a durian. And it's pretty difficult to get a durian over to you, but not impossible. Right? That's what you want, durian? Bring me some fruits, durians. You want three of them. You see, that's pretty difficult. Just while I'm over here, let me check with Box Guy. Box Guy? Make all the crates. Now, nah, this is the same crates as before. That looks like the same crates as before. Hey, you know, let's do it again anyway. Let's do it again. Yeah, let's do it again. Not too bad. It's, it's not difficult anyway. Come on, get up there, Mario. And we got this one. And then this one. Oh, unless you miss it, I guess. I did it! What do I get? That was great! You're the best! Okay, yeah, you're right. You're right. Hey, at least it was fun to break some crates again. I love breaking crates. That's one of my favorite activities. I'm totally not kidding. I totally love breaking crates. Oh, hey, guys. Toadsworth, what do you got? Anything to say? I can't believe you were just like, yeah, blah, 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 blah. Oh, I hope nothing happens to our dear princess. Master Mario, please help her. Where is she? I guess she's up in the Corona area. Corona Mountain. I guess that's where she is and where will forever remain. Until 
to get all the shine sprites and then save the princess. I go after the durian, but uh, not that much effort for one blue coin. Instead, I'll go wake up Yoshi and accomplish some Yoshi things. A little coin comes from that. That's cute. That's very cute. That's very, very nice. Yoshi, what do you want? It looks like you want a pineapple from this distance. Yep, looks looks pretty pineapple to me. So I'll go get you a pineapple. Just as you would have wanted. Everybody seems to want pineapples today. Everybody wants those pineapples. Pineapples are incredibly popular. So uh, I'll take a pineapple over to my Yoshi. Don't forget to drop a pineapple to your Yosh on your journeys. Drop a coin to your Witcher, whatever it was. Drop a bit for your streamer. Drop a drop a pineapple for your Yosh. I don't know. Drop a coin for your bartender. Support those around you. Hi there, Yosh. I know there's at least one area over yonder that I need the Yoshi for. Bird, are you okay? Oh, you look like you were having a really fun time in that window. That little, that, uh, what was it? The green bird looked like he was having a really fun time hanging out that window. And was there anything over... Yoshi, please. Yoshi, please. Yoshi, please. There we go. Was there something inside of here? I thought there was. Oh, was I already in here? Oh, I was already in there. No, it was in the other one. No, there's definitely a... I hear something sparkling. But I don't think the sparkle's coming from there. Or if the sparkle's coming from anywhere, it's something that I already got. And I'm not gonna worry about it. I know Yoshi has something that can melt over here behind one of these buildings. So I'll do that. Get some of those. You got noodles and tomatoes? Anybody want some? Yeah, I want some nudes. I'll take some of those nudes if you're willing to share. Nudes and noodles, of course. I mean, obviously. I actually had some noodles the other day. That was lovely. We had some udon noodles that we got from the local Japanese place. Loved it. Came with some chili dumplings. Ah, beautiful. What a beautiful way to end the day. That was on Thursday, I think. I believe that was a Thursday thing. Oh, I see a little turbo area over there. Yoshi can't make it over there, but I need that turbo. I can also see if I can try to get Yoshi all the way over to that island over there, because I think Yoshi needs to get over there, I believe. I can eat one of the cabinet. Yeah, I know there's pasta in the cabinet. But why would I want to do that just yet? Oh, Durian's turn, Yoshi, uh, purple. Nice. Let's try to get Yoshi over to the area. Get Yoshi over to one of those islands. We don't have tomatoes. All I can always just buy tomatoes. That's easy. That's the easy part, buying tomatoes. Uh, you're coming back. I need that. Oh, Yoshi fell in the water. What a poor little creature. Okay. Whoops. Whoopsie daisy. Well, I guess I'll do the turbo, uh, turbo nozzle challenge then. That's what I'll do. I'll get the turbo nozzle thing out of the way. Oh, come here. Give me that. Here we go. Turbo went through town. Oh, and whacking into walls. But then again, turboing into walls. You got it, Mario. Dead set. Target locked. Here we go. Into the... I got a blue coin. Was that it? Have I ever had noodles and tomatoes together? Or has Disney Queen ever had them? I don't know. I love the way they taste, though. There's nothing I can accomplish over there. If I turbo over here... Tomato sauce and noodles? Eh, I've done that. Hi, everybody. Uh, yeah, I need Yoshi for that one. Oh, that's a Shine Sprite from the Sparrow. I'm gonna call them Shine Sprite Sparrows. Anyways, just hanging on the water. They'll be back on the water, I mean. Climb up this tree there, Mario. Yeah, I love anything with garlic and pasta, to be honest. Get that bird, get that bird. Mario will extinguish the Shine Sprite birds. The gold ones. There we go. And you're way hell over there. 
Good thing I got turbo ability. Here we go. Time to get another Shine Sprite. Here we go. Yeah. All right. All right. All right. All right. I need my hover nozzle, though. That'd make things easier. I'm gonna go grab my hover nozzle. And then I'll go get that Shine Sprite. It's easier with the hover. Mario like it to hover. I like it to hover. You like it to hover? I like it to pasta, too. Pasta and garlic. Oh, that sounds lovely right about now. Oh, well, not right about now. I'm actually rather satisfied. Satisfied with my meals for tonight. I mostly just had, like, um... Small fixings and fruits and stuff. But the fruits were honestly incredibly filling. I was surprised. Did I eat diner? No, I haven't eaten an entire diner. That's disgusting. I had some kiwis and fruit. I had fruit throughout the day. Lovely different I had some oranges. I had some kiwis. And they've honestly kept me over very, very well. I had an egg sandwich for, dinner, for uh, late lunch this morning. Very tasty. Very, very tasty. I mean, if I were any hungrier, I'd probably get myself some more food, but I'm not that hungry. I'm happy with this. Oh, I fell in the water. Unfortunately. You were trying to learn how to spell. That's totally fine, dude. Spell like magical spells. Like fire in your hands. A magical spell indeed. Or spell things like... Uh... Uh, what is it? Hippopotamonstrosis quipidaliophobia. I don't know how to spell that. Or anti disestablishmentarianism Or pseudo pseudo hyperparathyroidism. Yeah, Disney Queen's basically dyslexic. She can't spell for shit. It's hilarious. I mean, except when it's not. Except when it's important. Hey, we got 80 sprites. Yay. I think... Alright, new goal. I am trying to get... Either 85 sprites in the next hour... Or 90 sprites. Whatever comes first. And then I'll probably end things from there. That feels like a pretty good goal. I'm sure a lot of them will probably come from... I can't believe that... Let's see, I've got 80 now. There's 40 other sprites to get. It, that just seems like almost inconceivable. The fact that there are that many sprites just scattered about. That must mean there's a ton of... There, there are a lot of ton, ton of blue coins. I know that. And a lot of secret things too, like the special shine sprite birds. And stuff like that. That's going to get me the thing over there. I'm going to use my turbo to increase that. I'm going to get my way over here. Get that one. Swig! That's a blue coin. That's one shine sprite in the making. And I'll get that one and do the exact same, but in the other direction. Oh, okay. And then we'll do the same thing over here. Speed! I am speed! Iron Mario, obviously. What else we got over here? There's probably more blue coins on the ground, but I'm not gonna even bother myself with those. Uh, I wanna try Yoshi again. Hey Yoshi, what fruit you want? What fruit you want, buddy? You want a melon? Good thing we got melons down here. There's a shine spread in there, but I've already collected it. Up that way. And then up this way. This way, and then more... Honeydew. Alright, let's get you upon... Let's get you upon a boat. Yoshi needs a boat to survive. I'll wait for that. Hey, look, a boat, so the Yoshi can survive. Yoshi on a boat. Yoshi's on a boat, we say. Yoshi's on a boat. Yoshi's on a boat. Then Yoshi needs to get to the that island over there. As far as he possibly can to catch the other boat uh, that is currently coming over this way. Get onto there, don't touch the water. And then that boat cometh. Come hither, boat. Boat to me. I guess we'll just wait a little bit. We'll just we'll just vibe for a moment. Uh, what are you looking for, lady? Actually, I'm not actually that curious. I pretend that I care, but I don't. So, um, here. Have some fun with that. Ooh, you got smacked in the face by the goo. That tends to happen. People get gooed around here. People tend to get gooed around here. With the bile acids of Yoshi himself. Blech. 
Disgustingly beautiful. I mean, at least it's pink. You know, when I was a young lad, very, very young lad, I think I was with my grandfather at a doctor's office, and I was eating a lifesaver, and I started choking on the lightsaber, and I remember my puke being pink. That's it. That's the story. I just remember it being pink for some reason. And by the way, that lifesaver did not save my life. It actually put my life in jeopardy. So, ironic? Yeah, pretty ironic, I guess. But it doesn't matter how much irony there is. Yoshi's having a good time. Yoshi hanging on the boat. Boat, boat, Yoshi on a boat. Yo, boat, Yoshi on a boat. We're on a boat. Yoshi's on a boat. Everybody on a boat. Oh, Yoshi actually needs some sustenance to survive as well. That's why he needs that banana! Yoshi done need the bananas. So Yoshi can survive. You got it, Yoster. There we go. Eat banana. Survive. And now you will be able to survive uh, when that other boat comes over. So keep on eating that banana. How many bananas? That's two bananas. That's three bundles. Actually, technically that's nine bananas because there's three bananas in a bundle. And then that's... 12 bananas. How many more bananas can we get? That's 15 bananas. My god, Yoshi, you are such a glutton. 18 bananas. Can we make it to 20? We've made it to 21. How many more bananas can you stuff down your gullet? Oh my god, that's 24. That's a lot of bananas. Oh jeez. That's a lot more bananas. That's 30 bananas now. Yoshi, are you okay? Bro. Yoshi, bro. Get on that boat. There we go. We've gotten on that boat, and now we just need to make our way to that island over there. Which this boat will happily take us to. So, uh, let's vibe! We'll just dance for a little bit. Dance while we vibe. I wish I could showcase my dancing skills, but I don't have enough camera angles for that. And my fiance is a dancer. She taught me how to dance pretty well. Not really, but uh, I like to think I did. All right, Yoshi. How close we can we get to that island? I need to be as close as humanly possible. Actually, I guess I just kind of need to... Oh my god, Yoshi, wait. Wait, Yoshi! Oh, I guess I did it, so... I did it! Oh, there's another gold bird. Oh, I already got that one, though. I did it! That's time to get into the hole. Get in the hole. Into the hole, Mario. What do we got around here? And how many lives do I have? Because if I don't have enough lives to complete the... Oh, it's red coins. I have three lives to be able to do this. Oh, on the on the lily pad. I remember this one not being very pleasant, because the, the water is actually completely toxic. I mean, it's not too bad, right? No, I missed it! Oh my god! Oh my goodness! Mothy, how are you this fine, wonderful mo- uh, ap I it's morning? What am I talking about? It's not morning. Can I push myself backwards? No, I didn't want to go that way! I guess, can I restart afterwards? I wonder. I want a life. Okay, no lives for Mario, then. Oh, I guess if I- If I don't do it perfectly the first time, I guess I just- Oh, I'm going to suffer. Or I will absolutely survive and be totally okay. How have I been streaming this long? Because I love this game. I've been keeping myself hydrated. I've been keeping myself fed. I've been keeping myself active. And that's my secret. 100 push-ups and pull-ups every single day. 100 push-ups and sit-ups every single day. Just like One Punch Man. That's how I do it. That's how I get to this level. That or you just have... Such a love for a game that brings back that sort of nostalgia for you. Oh, you can make me do it again? Do I have to do it all at once? No way! I only get one shot? I've consumed. Wow, that is not worth all of that effort. That's not worth that effort at all. Goodness gracious. I think I'm going to wind up going in the 100 coins route. My goal is attempt to get 90 shine sprites by... I don't know. That's what I want to do. 
Uh, let's try doing 100 coins. Let's see if we can do that. There's coins, coins in everywhere, so we might as well. Red coins of the lake? Those give me coins. Good. I think... Did the red coins give me more than one coin at a time? I don't exactly remember. I guess we'll see. Anyway. <gasps> Yoshi! I can have your help in these trying times. I'd appreciate that, Yoshi. But you need a, you require a pineapple. Hey there, buddy. I know you were denying me my sunglasses for so long, but it's time for everyone to get some sunglasses. Oh, and I've got a Shine Sprite shirt, which is exactly why I wear my Flamingo shirt. Wow, my glasses don't want to stay on. That's cool, bro. Yeah, come see me again when you want to return them. Yeah, buddy. Sunglasses time. It is almost 12 o'clock in the morning and we're wearing sunglasses. Why? I don't know, there's probably something wrong with us. There's, there's probably something wrong with me. Alas, I would imagine that to be the case. If you're watching this, like, I guess on the YouTube after the fact, and you're like, oh, it's like, it's like, uh, 2 o'clock in the afternoon, of course the guy's wearing sunglasses, it's probably right up there. No, it's 12 o'clock in the morning over here. It's dark as hell outside. We just want to feel that, I just want to feel that vibe. I just want to feel that Mario Sunshine vibe. I need those, I need those red coins. I require those coins that are red. We're trying to get a hundred of them. We're gonna try to get as many coins as absolutely possible. The goal is 90 shine sprites. Alright, if I can't do that, then eh, it's alright. It's been a pretty good- honestly, been a very fun session so far. I've been having a great time. I didn't know how long I planned on streaming this in general, and I thought maybe it'd be like a little series or something like that that I wound up playing, but nah, apparently... My, uh, my mentality and my everything, decided that my body and mind could withstand ten and a half hours of playing Super Mario Sunshine Street. I like that. Alright, let's try to get this, uh... So, nah, honestly, I don't know if that's gonna work for- Yeah, we're gonna give it a try. Where's that at? I don't even know where that is. Is it over here? Where's the coin? Where is the coin?! Where is the coin? Yeah, it's 12. Yeah, it's sunglasses. 10, 12 o'clock in the morning. Where is this other coin? Oh, is it over here? Was it over here? I have no idea where that coin is. I'm not worried about it. It's a blue coin. That doesn't count for actual coins. I want it to count for actual coins, but it doesn't. Uh, actually, I can kill you for a coin. Yeah, first coin. That's one out of a hundred. Okay, well... I guess I'd say I'm almost there. Oh, look at that! 2% of the way there! That's wonderful. Open up all you flowers. Open up all you flowers. Give me your coins. There we go. Unleash your coins upon me. Yo, could you stop yelling at your children in public, please? You should stop yelling at your children. But you know, they never do. Children are just such little hoodlums. You know, some things just never change. Oh, okay, you're throwing me in the distance because of your anger, I guess? Dude, can you take your anger out on somebody else? Like your children? <laughs> hey, uh, no, please don't take your anger out on your children. They don't deserve it. They don't deserve that kind of trouble. Maybe you should just learn to take out your anger in constructive ways, such as painting, or drawing, or um, screaming profanities on the internet. I do that, but that just feels a little on the nose, you know? Why would I scream profanity in the internet when I can do other things? Oh, did I do it? I want to... I'm trying to make the... I'm trying to get that floppy thing all around me. I want to get all the coins. All the coins from the flowers. Flowers, please work with me. I've been at this for so long now. Don't you think I deserve at least this? Please open up for me. Open up for me. Open up for me, flowers. Flowers, open up. Open up your petals to me. Patience. Patience is key. That didn't work the way that I intended it to, but, you know. Usually, if I just 
run around the joystick a little bit, but we'll get a get a fiery blast of wonderfulness. There we go. Kind of like something like that. Wonderful. You know this whole situation here with the whole uh, keeping my shades on while well, it's 12 o'clock in the morning reminds me of a song by a band called The Vamps, and it's all about keeping your shades on. Especially, actually, exclusively in situations where you don't need to. And it's called Shades. It's called By the Vamps. Uh, give it a listen if you wanna. Can I ring those bells? Ring those bells, ring those bells. If I keep doing that, I'll ring those bells. Ring those bells good. And what do I get from ringing those bells? Is there anything that I gain from ringing those bells? There is nothing I gain from ringing those bells, but alas, we will consume them nonetheless. Oh, look, there's the other O. I found it. Everybody knows it's cooler to consume when you've got glasses on at 12 o'clock in the morning. Or other clocks in the morning, depending on your time zone. Everybody knows that it's cooler. <laughs> Duh. Am I cool yet? Am I cool? It's not really important for me to be cool, but I just want to know. I just want to see, like, like, I think I'm here, but I very well could be here, and I just need a second opinion on that. Maybe? You know what? I'll take that. Maybe if I say words like bussin', I'll be cooler. I'll be a hip young lad who knows the lingo of the youngins. Bussin'. Swag. Epic. Yeah. <laughs> Am I okay? I've been streaming this all day. I love this game. Hello, Neko. <laughs> Happy of you to pop in. I've got my shades on. And it's late. And uh, that's a sure sign of a good time, right? Am I okay? Yeah, I'm probably just fine. See, none of y'all know that what I, I sometimes take days where I just play video games. I haven't done it in a very, very long time. I need to stand and move around. I've been streaming since you left to go to work. Oh my god. Well, it has been ten and a half hours. It's a good time. Honestly, I stream because I'm enjoying myself. I, by the way, the sunglasses are not just for style because I know they look cool, obviously. But they also because the lights are hurting my eyes. Hey, I got all the coins. I'm almost a quarter of the way to a hundred. I haven't collected any other red ones yet. Oh, there are red coins on the lake. I haven't even been in the right location. I'm curious too, how was work? Was it okay? Was it better than whatever the hell we're doing over here? I guess how would we know? I did a little bit of work this morning. I felt productive for at least a couple hours this morning. Right after my shower, I did uh, at least a couple of responses on things. And then after that, I was like, you know what? One o'clock, time to go. Time to set this weird little capture device up. Any other enemies around here? Hello there. Game takes you back to the early 2000s McDonald's. Right? It just gives me that sense of nostalgia. I have such a nostalgia for this game. Like, there are like very early Mario games that every once in a while I have the urge to go back to. And one of the games is Super Mario Sunshine. Another one of the games is Super Mario 64 which I every so often have the urge to go back to. Um, I don't have uh, my N64 on me. Also, I don't even know how I would even capture... Actually, I could capture an N64 with the Roxia that I got here because it converts things. Um, thank you for dying for me. I could totally bring the N64 back to my apartment and play it. Come to think of it, if I wanted to. OG N64 on an original N64 controller. That could be really fun, actually. I could really enjoy that. Okay, do the red coins actually give me anything? No, they don't actually. So that there's actually no point in that. There's no point in collecting the red coins. There really isn't. I'm here for 100 coins. That's what I'm here for. That and blue coins, I guess. Oh, you got... On the bright side, at least work was good for at least a couple people around here. Can I get anything from killing those bees? 
don't really know. Is there any benefit to killing the bees? They're already endangered, but we all know that Mario is really, really into attempting to eradicate endangered species. Clearly. Oh, I didn't do that right. You need that little thing. Almost let your sales go. Nice. Almost, almost. Is your sales goal like on a on a scale of you have to accomplish it in like a week or or is that like in a particular other month span? Oh, so I have to spray you first and then I can hit you, right? Oh, I see. I'm almost halfway there. Almost halfway to 100 coins. Because I know, like, at least in my case, we have, um... We have, like, monthly goals, I guess. If we can't. If you can even manage it, that is. It's not always, um... It's not always feasible, though. Depending on how fast things are. Daily goal, weekly goal, and monthly goal. Oh, nice. That seems reasonable. Are they, like, realistic goals, I hope? Or... I hope they won't wind up, like... Holding you to the standards of unrealistic goals, because that'll happen, I guess. Because I guess there's really no way of determining how well your sales will go in a day. And I suppose some managers will be like, oh yeah, we totally get it. You can't always reach your sales goal in the day. But I guess some other ma some other managers will be like, oh no, no, like, I don't even care if the day's slow. You're going to reach your goal. And uh, I feel bad for that. I guess that, that must suck. I feel bad for shit like that. Oh, there's a little balcony over here. That's pretty cute. By... Nope, nothing in here. Oh, very realistic. Oh, that's at least good to hear. That's very positive, at least. And I think... What was it? I I can't remember what you mentioned last time. I know you got a different... Uh, I know you were at a different position than you were before. Was it um? It was some type of sales position. I, I can't remember exactly what it was. Um, I can't seem to pull it off the tip of my... It's on the tip of my tongue. I know it was something retail. Was it jewelry? Maybe? Was it a jewelry store? I might be getting that mixed up with somebody else. But I guess it really all depends on, like, how many people come in for the day. Sales associate. All right. Yeah, I wouldn't have guessed that one. Nice, nice, nice. I know at least for the stuff that I wind up doing, people wind up coming in and asking questions and whatnot for support. And there's really no way to tell, like, how many people are you going to come in and... Ask for questions, because it might be a day where people just don't have any questions, so you don't wind up getting anything. We have, like... I don't think we have quotas for stuff like that, but I'd say it's relatively realistic. And people are usually very understanding. I guess they wind up asking just to do at least as good as or better than the average of everybody else. High-end retail. Nice. Highly considering promoting you to the sales lead. Oh, you must be that good. Congratulations. And I'm sure that comes with a nice little pay benefit, too. That's always a plus. Always getting a little bit of benefit. We actually just had somebody that was uh, recently promoted. They do very, very good. They're very good at what they do, and they absolutely deserved it. Do I get any coins from this? If I uh, make this thing go? Get a little coin? Get a little coin. You're very, very welcome, dear noble Neko. And yes, the queen is around. Please hold. Oh, oh, I, I'm holding. Consider myself held. Consider myself held and did. Oh, look at that. I can actually go to this uh, closet over here. Oh, that didn't work. Wow. Okay. Wow. I didn't think I was going to die. I just lost all those coins. Wow. Wasn't expecting that. Um... Wow, not liking that. No, nope, that don't make me feel so good. What else have we got? <laughs> hmm, where else are there more Sam Sprites? Sam Sprites. Everybody's tired, but at least we understand more Neuro, right? Everybody gets to understand more Neuro. Uh, where else did I do well? Serena Beach? Serena Beach, I did pretty well on, on coins. I don't know, dude. Nogi Bay! Yeah, Anna's a very, uh, very entertaining person to have on stream. She's not here right now, otherwise I'd have her on screen right about now. 
I hope your work's going well, dearest. I miss you greatly, as I always do. But you'll be back soon. You're not gone for so long. It's not like it's inconceivable for you to ever come back to me, because I know you're coming back to me. You'll come back. They always come back. Anna's working? Yeah, that's right. Actually, she has her last day of work, technically, tomorrow. It's her last day of working as a lifeguard. Oh, look at that. Yoshi needs to come up here, too. Is there a coin up here? There's probably just... Yeah, there's just a coin up there. But, uh, Yoshi can take care of that. I'm still at 80 Shine Sprites. And it's almost 11 hours. I think perhaps I should change up my goals a little bit. Should probably think about other more realistic goals. See, if you don't set realistic goals for yourself, you wind up failing at your goals. I don't want to fail at my goals. Hey, look, blue bird. Time for Mario to extinct yet another beautiful species of Delvino Plaza. Nope, not like that. Where'd you go, bird? Bird, come back! Wait! Birdie, please! Birdie, come back. Birdie, come back. And I won't allow you to drop your coin over the water. There we go. That's another one. So at least I get another Shine Sprite. I'm gonna go 85 is my goal now. I, I'm making things a little more realistic. Not 90, 85. 85 is the goal. Hopefully I can reach 85 sprites by the time I... Oh, this. 11, 11, make a wish. I'm knocking on wood. I'm making my wish. I wish. I don't know, what do I wish for? I want to say I wish for the prosperity of all mankind and those who deserve it. Uh, that's a little unrealistic. There's no way to make that be the case. I wish. I wish. Let's see. I wish for. This is so difficult. When you have a wish, if you will, if like if I received the genie's lamp right now, I would be totally lost for anything. I would not even be able to conceive what it is that I want to wish for. It's got to be a realistic wish. It's got to be a nice wish. I wish. I wish for Anna to do well on her exams. Because I know she's been stressing a lot about them. So that's where my wish is going. My wish is for Anna to do, continue to do well in her classes, always and forever. Because I know she stresses out a lot about that. And there's not much that I can do to help for it. But at the very least, if everybody's smiling, at least I'm doing something. Yeah. Anna's going for the PT. Doctor specialized for musculoskeletal issues and neuro biases. Good health along with the court jester Cameron. Indeed, the court jester himself. You're very welcome, my dearest. I wish only for your success. And as always, if I can do anything to help you, anything to help really anybody, I just want people to be happy. And that is an incredibly unrealistic thing to, like, shoot for towards in life. But, like, honestly, if one person smiles, I'm cool with that. I'm totally cool with that. If that's how it needs to be. We, li we only live this life one day at a time, really. And that feels important. And it's important, if it's important to you, it's an important to someone. If becoming incredibly skilled at a video game you played is incredibly important to you, then that is important nonetheless. It matters to you, it matters to the world, because you're a part of the world. Making people smile miles, uh, matters to me, so that's fine. Cool. What's another place to get good coins? I know there's a bunch of blue coins over... I guess Corona Mountain has a bunch of blue coins. Honestly, you know what? I'm in the mood for Rico Harbor. I love that music so much, and I'm gonna try to get 100 coins over there, so that's what we're gonna go with. 100 coins in Rico Harbor. Funny how I started playing this game about 11 hours ago, thinking, this, I've got the world ahead of me. I can do as much as I want to in this game. And now I've reached that point that I reach in a lot of games where I'm just like, wow, I feel stagnant. What is there for me to do? How do I proceed? How can I proceed? Fruit Adventure, Shadow Mario, Red Coins on the Water, Goopa Bloopa Returns, Secret of Rico Tower, The Cage Shine Sprite. Which one do I want to go with? I want to go to the last one because I think that's got the most available coins for me. That's what we'll go with. And we'll try to get 100 coins in this level. Hopefully not dying. 
It certainly won't be as easy to die around here as I did apparently in Bianco Hills. I didn't realize you could fall in that little ditch over there, which is why I took the risk of trying to climb on those clouds. I was incorrect. I'll take care of these boxes. They got some boxes. Boxes got some coins in them. Oh, th that one didn't have coins. That's disappointing. But that one's got coins. And that's good. Coins are good. Currency is lovely. Currency allows us to purchase things in life. We like to purchase. I like to purchase. I like to purchase things. Purchasing is good. What would I purchase next? Probably a reflector. Cheap little reflector for my lights. That's what I'd put that towards. I made a little more filament. I'm not running low on filament for my 3D printer or anything, but uh... I can always use more colors. There's always a need for more colors. There can never not be enough colors. Oh, that wind dude's gonna try and come after me. That's not going very well. Please don't hurt me! Oh, you knocked me out of the air. You little bastard. Oh, there was a one-up over here. That's pretty cool. I know there's coins in the ground. There's also coins underwater. Go for as many coins as possible. Uh, were there any coins in this direction? Underneath the little sewer area? It... Oh, maybe there were. There's a couple of coins down here. I'm cool with that. Any coins is enough coins. Little coins to make little progress. Slowly but surely. Slowly but surely you make progress to 100 coins. Plus I like the music in Rico Harbor. So that's why we're here. Oh, there's more coins up there. There's more coins over here. Let's use that to our advantage. We're already almost a quarter of the way there. That's. I feel like this is going to be very advantageous. I may have picked one of the easier levels. Maybe. Not that I didn't know. How would I have known before this point? It's not like I've played this game before or anything. Up we go! We already have 40 coins, damn. That's pretty cool. But now my question is, where is the rocket nozzle for this level? It's not down there, it's not over there, it's not in the other location as well, so where is that rocket nozzle? Where could it be? Because you have to unlock it somewhere. The turbo nozzle would probably help me get that X in the wall. That X in the wall is just a blue coin, you have to get to the other side before the blue coin disappears. Some of us are familiar, some of us perhaps not. I think the ad begs to be explained. Hello, Blupa. Goodbye, Blupa. Blupa? Oh, your coins are falling to... Uh, I guess I have the chance to go down and grab them now. Oh, they disappeared. I guess the halfway point was the easy one. That was the easy one to get to, because I could just go through those tunnels all I wanted to. There's some coins over there? Nope, no coins over there. But there were some coins over here. Let's make our way on top of what? What? It looks like a tiny little cruise ship. That reminds me of rec uh, not recently, uh, last year. Uh, my dad does music stuff and whatnot, and he got invited to go on a cruise ship to perform and whatnot, and that was such a cool experience. I mostly, literally all I did on that cruise ship was drink tea and try a bunch of cocktails that they had on the menu. Try a bunch of cocktails that I hadn't tried before. That's what I was doing. Every time they'd ask, come by and be like, hey, do you want a drink? I'd be like, I want this. And whatever it was, they'd bring it right to us, and that was a wonderful, wonderful thing. Why did you throw me like that? Oh, I guess you were a chucker. Bit of a chuckster. Oh my god, that was perfect. You perfectly threw me all the way over here. That was pretty cool. That was a pretty nice chuck there, pal. Thanks for that. I appreciate that, Chuck. Uh, now I'm over here, I guess. So might as well accept this fate. And do something with that. I see a surface over there. Let's go see if there's anything on that tree. Tree? It seems that there's melons on that tree. Alrighty then. I guess that's relevant. There's no more coins. There must be more coins elsewhere. I must search for the coins. I will find the coins in this level. I have faith. I have faith. I have faith. Faith in the things that I cannot change. 
like, like, like stones. I cannot change stones. I cannot make stones any less stone or more stone. Unless I break them into pieces, I guess. Hmm. What do you got, pal? What do you have to say for yourself? The Doot Doot Sisters are here? The hell are the Doot Doot Sisters? Wow, I'm about to quit working early today. Oh. Well, the Doot Doot Sisters might be pretty damn important, I, I guess. In all my existence on this earth, I have never once heard of the Doot Doot Sisters. Maybe it's because I never took the chance to actually listen to that man speak before. Oh, blue coin. Sweet. That's progress to another shine sprite. Slow and steady progress. Oh, there's another blue coin. Opportunity. I'll grab that one. Got another one. Slow and steady progress. Ba, 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 da, 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 da. I'm like supremely happy this wind that this wind up working out today. Because now I know. Oh, that had a blue coin too. Because now I know if I want to play any other GameCube games, I totally can. Anna, when you get back, we should totally play some Mario Party. You know? Oh, I don't want that turbo nozzle, actually. Not right now. Oh, apparently all these things are blue coin. I didn't know that. Well, that's pretty good. That makes me think that actually there are a lot, a lot, a lot of blue coins that you can wind up collecting in this. There's a little Mario signal up there. I can go up on the walls, grab those coins, come back down, and everything's a wonderful hunky-dory. A couple of coins. Another blue coin. From that little Mario signal there. A little big ol' M. It's an M with umlauts over it. I don't know how to pronounce that. I know in German you can have the umlauts over the U, the O, or the A. And it slightly changes how you pronounce things. But over the M? I don't know about that. Maybe it's like... Nyan speak. Like Nyario. You pronounce it like that, like a Mjol. Like Mjolnir. Mjolnir. From uh, Greek mythology. Or Norse mythology. Not Greek. Mjolnir is Thor. Thor is Norse mythology. Not Greek. Don't get this messed up. More coins over here, slowly but surely collecting coins. I just want to reach a hot 85 sunshines. 85 sunshines, that is the goal. Can I make it? Can I make it up there? Uh, I was not able to make it, but I am on here now. I can go over here. Wait, why did I fall? Wait, why did I fall? That was weird. I must have actually jumped, well, accidentally jumped off. I did not mean to do that. I'd like for Mario to continue climbing up the cage if, if he'll let me. There's probably a bunch more coins up here, too. Oh, I want that. Thank you. Thank you, Mario. We really appreciate that. Uh, sorry. I'm gonna get up onto those girders there. I don't really care about those girders. Awesome! I landed that nice, quite nicely. A perfect landing for Mario! And now I can't see. There we go. Now I can see. There's some coins over here, there's coins down there. I'd rather take the coins down here. Oh, you went away. There's a coin there, and there's some coins over here. That's like seven-ish coins. That's good. That's enough coins for me. I like those odds. I like those coins. Oh, there's some coins over here, too. There's like four of them. Now we're up to 67. Almost 67. Almost 67. 67. Oh, I got... Got some evil wind monsters trying to come grab me. That's not gonna work. I'd rather go over here, up on top here, and then fly my way up. Perhaps over here. 
those Goopa bloopas, those little bloopers, do have coins, but they just kind of fall into the water, and then I can't grab them. I must find more coins. I find them. Oh, you knocked me off. I, I absolutely hate you. I absolutely despise you, wind monster things. I wonder if they have a proper name. They probably do. I just don't know what they're called. All I know is they are annoying, they knock me out of the air, and they make my life so difficult. My Mario life, at least. My gaming life? My Super Mario Sunshine life. Let's see if I can make it over there. Up on top of that girder. Oh, I didn't make that all right. That's not the way that I wanted to do that, but we got it. A little bit of perseverance? Nope. Oh, I thought. I thought I could make it up there. And I almost could, but not from that angle. There we go. Kind of like this angle. I'm gonna wait for you to spin. No, I can't believe you did that again. There are so many coins up there. I can see them. Ugh. Unfortunate. Just a lot of trial and error at this point. Just a lot of, uh... Just trying to accomplish what you can do. I can go over there. There's a bunch of coins over there. I just have to wait for that thing to... Nice! I was able to at least get that thing away. Bunch of coins over here. If I do my wall jump. No! I cannot believe- Mario! Buddy! Buddy! Oh my goodness, Mario! On the bright side, I am three quarters of the way there. You're correct. I was at 69 for a while. And it was a very funny number. It's the Teehee number. I was- uh, I didn't want to be the one to mention it. Because that would just be inappropriate. See, it's a very inappropriate number. I didn't want to be the one to mention it, but I'm happy that you pointed it out, because now, the world knows. And I can't be held responsible. No, please don't spook you with me. Oh, you're gone. There's some coins over here. I'll take at least two of those, or maybe all two of those. Oh, please don't knock me out of the air! I don't like that! Whoa! Whoa! I lost all my stuff. Not pleasant. Not very pleasant at all. Not a very pleasant experience with all trying to get all these coins with the wind enemies trying to do me up all nasty. Why you gotta do me all nasty like that, wind beasts? Why you gotta do me nasty? Why you gotta do me like this? What have I ever done to you? I've done nothing to you. All I've done is occupied your airspace. You can share. Come on, you can share. You can share. You can share. I know you can. Sharing is caring. Or at least, that, that's what they tell me. They tell me sharing is caring. And I'm sure you can commit to- Oh, there's a tiny little blue coin down there. There also seems to be a single yellow coin over here. One coin is all it takes. Oh, there's a couple of them there, actually. Yeah, that's worth it. That's worth it for a couple more coins. And a blue coin, too. And there's a blue coin way over here. And there's coins above the water, too. Can I, like... Can I, like, use this to grab coin? Can I... Can I use my hover to grab coin? No, clearly that is not a proper way to grab coin. But if I had the hover nozzle... If I had the hover nozzle... Or the... Not the hover nozzle. The turbo nozzle... I'd be able to easily get those coins. That looks like at least 10 of them. 10 coins? That's reason enough to go grab that turbo. We're going ultra maximum speed. Ultra maximum turbo wurbo speed. I'm talking full on. Full on. Do you have a blue coin? Do you have a blue coin? Blue coin? 
Blue coin. I don't know. Blue coin. Come off the wall. Will you come off the wall? Nope. Uh, can I? Can I? Sir, can I convince you to come off the wall? A little bit of hydratory encouragement? No. Okay, fine. I'll let it happen. I'll allow it. You get to live another day. But no, it was because of the mercy of Mario. Though Mario doesn't really have a bit of a... He's not very merciful in the long run of things. Mario kills. Mario kills. Alright, let's turbo. Turbo power activate. And now we're just kind of going to the water. There's coins to be found. And those coins are reason enough for me to go turbo. Oh, at least I thought they would be. Oh, they're really, really high up in the air. Okay. I can at least get one coin, I guess, through this method. They're really high up. Is there a better way to go about doing this? There must be a better way. There must be a better way. I believe that there's a better way. I cannot see. Like, I cannot even see the trajectory of where I'm supposed to be to get these coins. That's just difficult. Wow, I thought this would be an easy way to get coins. Nope. Oh, there's one. That's cool. If I turn around just a little bit. Just a little bit. A little bit. That's at least the blue coin. That's good. We like the blue coin. I've almost got enough blue coins for another Shine Sprite. Oh my goodness. I feel like... I feel like I'm like in a jet ski. And I'm attempting to like dodge little little boobies in the water. Like I need to go around them like very, very carefully or else I'm gonna hit. Alright, that I don't think is worth my patience. Anything else in the water? Any other coins in the water? Something to, to help me. Something to help me succeed. I need about 15 more coins in this level. Oh, I thought that'd be a coin. Nope. That's... Alright, 15. Officially 15 more. 15 more Eureka Harbor. I just have to accomplish that without dying. If I don't perish, it'll be okay. So long as I don't perish. I do not want to perish. Perishing is sad. Perishing would be very sad at the time. Now is not the time for perishable. Now is not the time for perishable goods and services. Can a service be perishable? No, certainly not. Only goods. Goods can be perishable. I mean, I suppose, if you are human, and you are offering service, you yourself are perishable. Perish Mabel. Perish maybe a bull. I need my hover nozzle. I want my hover nozzle. My hover nozzle. My hover nozzle. My hover nozzle. Hey, words. The hover nozzle is back and here to stay. I can use this to get up on top of the girders. Maybe. Yeah, that totally worked. And now I'm up here. And now the wind dude is going to try to totally mess up my steez again. I don't appreciate when people mess up that. It's a very private thing. Yeah, nice steez. Oh, look, the, the rocket nozzle. If I unlock that over here, I unlock it everywhere. Or at least in this particular area. This will help me get up to wherever it is I need to be. And I know now that I have a rocket nozzle, there is a certain area over there that there's a blue cone up on top of, and I should be able to access that now. And that's a wonderful, wonderful thing. Because blue coins give us the power to, I don't know, read mines? Yeah, probably. They probably give us the power to read mines. Oh my god, why? It's okay. I have the ro I have the rocket nozzle. That allows me to go up. And the coins that are currently on top of that tower. Can I please go up? There we go. The coins on top of that tower should bring me to at least the 90 mark. Oh, I want to go up. I want to. I'm gonna do this the easy way. Like that. 
Easy. Easy. Do you like that and collect more coins. There we, oh, I didn't do that correctly. I have to jump and I have to go up. And then I have to inch forward a little bit to land on the platform. And then I do the same thing again. There we go. Inch onto platform. And then we're going to do that again. To get on top of Lighthouse, we're going to get all those coins. Please. Please let me grab those coins. There we go. Power action. We're at 93. There's only seven more left. And I see two over there, meaning there's only five more after that. Hi there, wind dude. Gonna try to mess me up again? I won't let you! I won't let you mess me up! I'll just run away before you have a chance to come and get me! I won't let it happen. Okay, there's five more coins around here somewhere. The question is where? Where can I find them? Where can I find the coins? How long have I spent them? At least a half hour. Wow. Hey, I managed to get up here. And then fall. Unfortunate. I feel like that could have worked. I feel like that totally could have worked. But I don't think the game wanted it to work for me. The game's working against me. Okay, now everybody's got access to Rocket Nozzle. That's cool. I like that. I could use Rocket Nozzle down there, but why bother? Yep. Everybody rocket nozzle! Everybody do the rocket nozzle! Or don't. It's, it's really your prerogative. It's late. I wouldn't want to force anybody to do anything. Okay, so I see you there. If I hit you, you'll, you'll release a coin down there. Oh, whack me with the goo, I see. But the coins fly down there and that's not fun! I don't think there's anything inside of there. I don't think there's any need to go in there. Oh, those are the coins. I don't see any of the coins over here. Maybe there are some coins in here. That would be nice. Any coins? Oh, there was a red coin, apparently. Uh, uh, blue. The color is blue. The color is definitely blue. I can't play myself like that. Where else could there possibly be coins in here? I just need five more. Honestly, even the little bits of coins help now. Like the ones that are over top of the water. But I can get that with the rocket nozzle. I feel like that's actually even easier to get now. Because I can just blast my way up to the coin that I want it to be. Easy mode. Just inch my way over here. Adjust my camera so I can actually see where the coins are. When my shadow lines up with that coin, I know... That I can grab it. Oh, come on. Okay, that's not gonna matter, it seems. Because when I use the rocket nozzle, it actually propels me a little bit. One coin? Alright, 96. That's a number. That's a number, alright. If I slow down a little bit, I'll be able to get that next one. How many blue coins do I have? I have 10 blue coins right now. So, after I get this Shine Sprite, I should be able to trade in some more blue coins for another one. Then I'll be at 83, and then there will be only one, two more Shine Sprites that I plan on receiving tonight. And then after that, I'll end this. After that, I'll, I'll, I'll end it. That, that'll be where I stop things. Mario, can you please swim, swim straight? I think we could all use a little less of your BS. Coin? Yes, there's 98. I don't see any other coins over the water over here, so let's go find coins elsewhere. Where, though? I really don't know. I feel like those bloopers definitely had some coins. Oh, you know what? I bet the underwater, uh, the underground sewage pathways maybe have a little bit more. There must be at least one area that I haven't checked yet. Okay, well, we can do that. That's fine, too. Got that one. Up we go! To the greats! To the greatest show of all time. Any coins up here? Hey, you got coins? You got coins, bro? You got coins, bro? You got any coins you want to spare, little fella? Any coins? Two coins. I just need two coins. Two coins? Two coins. You don't have two coins. That's fine. 
That's fine. I go Elsewhere for, for coin then. I also see the fact that the rocket nozzle is up here. But why would it be up here? If not, that there's something above us. Maybe. Uh, apparently not. Nothing of their interest. There might be two more coins down here. And if there's at least two more, I will be a very, very happy individual. Nope. Wow. Alright. No coins there. Give me back my husband. My hover nozzle. My nozzle that hovers. My nozzle that hovers is my favorite nozzle. Any coins down here? Hello? Anybody got some coins underneath these fruit machines? I'll do anything for coins, really. Anything you want. What do you got? Let me have it. I'll do that for coins. Y'all got any coins over here? Y'all, uh, y'all want to spare some coins? Want to spare some coins for your pal Mario? Maybe some of these windows are open. Because I know I can spray into some windows. And every once in a while, coins come out. Mm. Nope. There might be some posters of Shadow Mario over there. But if I spray, we'll give the coin that I require. I can honestly be totally incorrect about that. It seems that I may have actually had to rely upon those enemies to get those other coins. Because I don't see any coins anywhere. Or they might be in some really strange and obscure location. Did I actually ever get that coin over there? That's number 99. I'm going for number 99. Wow, can't believe I missed that. Watch that be the actual last coin. Oh, that would be very sad. That would be very, very sad. Any coins over here? Maybe on the side of the boat? I like boat coins. I like boat coins. I'm not averse to boat, boat coins. You want to get coins on your boat? I'm fine with that. We're cool with that around here. Uh, I want to go up. Let's go over here on this crane. Crane coins? No crane coins? No crane coins. Can I come up on top of it? Nope. I was not able to get up on top of it. I'll admit, this is taking all of my patience. I'm still awake, though. Despite the fact that it's now almost 1 o'clock in the morning. It's okay. I'm feeling a little peckish, though. Might need to grab me some more fruit. New fruit, more fruit for this journey. Crane. Crane. Thank you, Crane. There's at least one more coin up there, and there must be at least one more elsewhere. If I can find one more enemy that I actually search, that I actually get the coin for, it'll actually work out. There's one more enemy up there. I see one more coin over there. Okay, and I see actually one more enemy over here. You are... Where, though? Where are you? I definitely just saw a blooper thing. I definitely did. Where did it go? There you are. Right over there. Pop your coin. That's a hundred, baby! Ooh, mama! There we go. Got it. That took... Way too long. But we got it. Now I just... Must not perish. Don't perish, Mario. There's that shine sprite. That and the one waiting for me at the little harbor shop will make 83. I want to get 85. Once I reach 85, that's it. That's all I'll play of uh, Super Mario Sunshine for now. Honestly, at this point, would it even be worth playing it again? I don't even know. I don't know. Probably other games. Other GameCube games. I'll replace it with other GameCube games. I know Metroid Prime is something that 
would be pretty cool. I've never played Metroid Prime. That would be a totally new experience for me. That'd be really, really cool. Yes, I would indeed. Oh yeah! Oh, oh yeah! I really want it all right. Yes, I do. Yes, I do. That's 83. So I need to go to at least one, at least one or two more levels to get the 100 coins in that area. I do not want to do Bianco Hills. What's the other place that I apparently got a lot of coins on before, aside from Bianco Hills? What have I gotten? 47 at Serena Beach. Probably inside the casino area, so that one doesn't really seem that cool. Gelato Beach, I feel like there's a lot of that. And probably other coins that I haven't found yet. That, and also in Pina Park as well, but that is really, really tall, so I might fall to my doom. There's also a lot of opportunities to fall to my doom in Pianta Village. There are also a lot of places in Noki Bay. I actually, I'm gonna go to Noki Bay. Because I think Noki Bay has everything I could ever want. Everything that I could ever want. Truly, Noki Bay is Bay. So we'll go there. And I'll go to, not the red coin fish, I don't want that. Hold it, Shadow Mario, the shell's secret, no. Not the surf swim. Ely Mouth's Dentist. Actually, I want to go as far as I can around here because I don't want the water to be gooey. I want to be able to go into the water and not die. See, the water's beautifully clear. It's not always like that. It is not always like that and clear. But I see plenty of fishies around here. Yeah, now I've got this, so I can breathe underwater a little bit better. Any more coins in the water over here? And so it begins. I see a blue coin over there. We're already off to a great start. There we go. We'll continue onward. And there appears to be another one over there. This it's beautiful. I love that. I love that. Maybe I should get the just get those other blue um those other shine sprites just from blue coins alone. That might be better off. I might save myself the trouble. I mean, after all, I have collected absolutely no regular coins so far in this level, but I've already gotten two new coins. We'll see. We'll go with the blow. Let's see what we find. Is there anything over here? Is there anything actually over here? Can I go this way? Oh, it kind of points points me backwards. I don't think I ever tried to go that way. Clearly because there's nothing over there. Obviously. But I know that there are a lot of secrets in these little, uh, little interstices over here. Just gotta find them. Like, for example, in there, apparently. Oh, look, coins. I like that. We're already up to 20. I like that. I like that a lot. Actually, there's probably something blue right there. What do we got over here? There's, there's nothing there. There's, there's nothing here. Okay, that's fine. You almost got me. I thought there was something special there. Something secret. What's over here? Oh, I got bounced all the way. Whoa, here we are up here. And there's a shine sprite bird up here. If I kill that bird, make it go extincty, I will get a shine sprite. I'm okay with that. There we go. That's a shine sprite. Awesome! Maybe I will be able to end this before 12 hours is hit. That's 84. And I'm gonna come back here and actually do to do that again because I like this level and I think there are more things to be found. So it's either 100 coins or 10 blue coins. That's what's gonna call this. So we'll see. We'll see what we can wind up getting to. Noki Bay, we're coming back again. I feel revitalized. I'll admit, I was feeling a little, uh... Just feeling a little, uh... Because it's getting late, I'm tired. I'm jumping right into bed after this. Oh, you know it. Brushing my teeth, putting my pajamas on, and going straight to bed. And then, uh, we'll see what time I wake up in the morning. I don't know. I'm turning my alarm off. I'm just gonna let my body decide when I'm waking up. The body can tell me. Or if I wake up... I guess late enough. Maybe, maybe I'll be woken up by my fiance returning to me. Oh, that'd be a lovely, wonderful thing. Oh, this is a cute little area up here. Oh, didn't know this was a thing. Oh, da 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 da. 
Oh, that's a little thing over there. Nice. That's pretty cool. Didn't know that was there. There was nothing in there, though. There was nothing of consequence in there. Not really. I wanted to go in here. There we go. Go through these little things over here. That should give me about 20 coins. Just about 20. Awesome. I'll go over here. I'll bounce upwards. Go over here. I know there's at least one coin in that tree. Coin in the tree. Coin in the tree. Coin in the tree. Coin in the tree. All right. Uh, what else? I see a bunch of little crevices over there. So I'll come over here and see what I can find. What's in this little hole? What's in the hole, pal? Oh, I've fallen all the way down. That was interesting. What do I gain from that? Oh. Oh, maybe I have to do it in a particular order. Oh, didn't mean to do that. No, 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 no. I always like this it. I always like this level. There was just a lot of things to discover. I've always loved games that actually allow you to discover things. Always like that. So there must be a particular order I have to spray these things in, right? That's one. That's some more. Oh, there's a blue coin here. Wow, so look at that. There's a blue coin there. And there's a blue coin up there, too. It pays to explore. We're at five, halfway there. Or, I'm sorry, that's four. I can't count. I'm tired. I'm a tired. That means I can't count. Oh, there's little interstices over there, too. Incredible. Anything over here? It looked like it had a purpose. It did not indeed have a purpose. There's a blue coin over there. Oh, I didn't get that. Didn't get that jump. Blue coin. All right. That's number five. Plenty of things over here. Plenty of things to discover. Uh, and there's a little thing over here, too. Uh, was there? It looked like there was. Oh, okay. Maybe not. Oh, maybe it needs to unlock. For I don't really know. If I go over here, maybe I'll find something new. Oh, please. Yes. Anything in there? No. What about in here? That's one. Another blue coin. Incredible. Blue coins, blue coins everywhere. I love it. Oh, there was... Is that another one? Is that another blue coin? It's another blue coin. Oh my god. My god, look at all these blue coins everywhere. I only need three more. Wow. That's pretty cool. Hey, that's pretty good. Is there something in here? Oh, there's a little passageway this way. No actual coins, though. But I can go back this way. And there's a little thing here that I should be able to... Oh, wait, that was here before, actually. Oh, that actually does something. Okay. Well, now that means I can actually go up this way. And keep going. And going. And going. And going. Oh my god, Mario, where is he going? I I literally can't tell. I literally cannot... Whoa, okay. Wow, there's a lot of little interstices over here. I, I literally can't see what's going on, Mario. I, I cannot tell. Oh, I managed to get my way all the way up back up here. That's actually really convenient, because there's some places down there that I really wanted to check out. Like down here. More blue co- Of course there is. Why wouldn't there be? Of course there'd be another blue coin. Now there's only two more left. Two more left until 85. I can feel my bed calling me. I can feel the power of my bed calling forth to me. Now I see a little interstice there. And can I- uh, I, can't, I can't go inside. Okay. Well, there's also a little interstice over... Oh, that wasn't gonna work. I'm falling. Oh, bye-bye. Down we go. I'm out of water. Need some more water. I need some more agua. Needs more agua vite. To bring myself the water of life. And I can go this way again. I can go back up again. I can come back down again to see if there's anything I missed. 
Actually, I'm really glad I came to this level. It's a good thing I didn't pick any others. It probably would have taken me a lot longer to find more blue coins. Who's that? Birdie. Birdie, 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 birdie. Can I go into this little hole over? Oh, there was a blue coin there. That could have been cool. That could have been pretty cool. Oh, I need to go down here. To this area here. Uh, actually, that wasn't what I wanted it to be. Oh, I've done that though. Because then I can go down here and go up here and then click that to allow me the opportunity to bounce my way all the way back up again. There's a bunch of little areas to go to. And I'm sure a lot of them have coins. They've got to have coins. Coins, coins, coins. I wonder if you can actually go into those areas if it's any use. Ah, I'm not worried about it right now. I know there was a blue coin over yonder. There you go. No! Okay, I didn't have my right nozzle on. I played myself. I gotta go back down here. Wait for that to go and get the thing again. As soon as everything pushes itself back into the mountain, I can do this again. Right? There we go. Hey, I found something in here. Oh, is that the place where I was at before? Oh, I haven't been over here before. I haven't been up. No, what are you doing? Oh my gosh, you fell. I can't believe it. I mean, I totally blame myself for this. Because I'm the one with the hands in the controller. But even still, I gotta be a little, at least a little disappointed. I gotta be at least a little disappointed in Mario. Okie dokie. We'll have to wait for that to happen again. Alright, let's push this wall back up again. Can I, can I push wall back up? Yes. I'm going back to that area. Oh, can't do that yet. There we go. There's a little area over here that I can come on over to and not launch myself out of. Okay, now I'm here. And I can access these. Okay, cool. Kind of like that. There we go. And what do I have here? Alas, what do we have here? They both go back, and of course, one of them has a blue coin. There's only one more left to get, and I know exactly which one it's gonna be. And I think it'll be the one that's sorta kinda over there. Oh, that didn't kinda work at all. Well, I know which one it's going to be, and it shouldn't be very difficult to get to. Okay. I guess I gotta go back this way again. I gotta go back this way again. Doing the same shit over and over again. I will succeed. I will succeed. Bounce all the way up to the top, and I should give myself- That should give me enough altitude to be able to get down to where I need to be. It's that little crevice down there. That's the little crevice I want. That's the final... Oh, and there's also stuff back there, too. But I got that blue coin. That's number 10. Which means it's Shine Sprite number 85. Meaning I am going to end this within the next few minutes. There is just no need for me to continue. Oh, I hit a wall. Yep, there is no need for me to continue here. I will exit this area. I've got my 10 blue coins. I am a happy, happy fella. Who really wants to go to bed? I'm so tired. So I'm going to do that. I'll just exchange this for my number 85, and that'll be where I end things. Man, what an adventure. What a big old nostalgia trip, too. That was lovely. That was a lovely, lovely time. Before I grab that sprite, I want to thank everybody for joining me so far. Sticking around to the very end. To the bitter, bitter end. I appreciate that. Happy to the newbies who came along as well. Newbies. Is it called them newbies? Doesn't matter whether you're new or old, you're always welcome here no matter what. And I'll save and continue that, and that's where I'll leave that save file. Probably for a long while. I don't foresee myself. I think any 
urge that I had to play Super Mario Sunshine has been completely satisfied. Like, completely. I don't think I need to play that again for a while. So, that's where I'm gonna end it. Thanks everybody for coming along. That was really, really enjoyable for me. This was like a special little treat for me. I usually don't take entire days to play games like this and just kind of just kind of pal around with anybody who happens to come by. And we're going to do one last hopscotch. And we got the hopscotch. I get to make up for my hopscotch from before. I had to take my socks off, actually. I have to take my socks off because I will wind up slipping on the floor if I do hopscotch with my socks on. But um, it's like... That's how we do it. I, I gotta move my chair out of the way. Let's move the chair out of the way so I don't hurt myself. Now we'll do one hopscotch before I go. As I bop along to Delfino Plaza's music, a little bit more. How many of these do I gotta do again? Hopscotch calls for 30. All right, I'd say this is a 10 so far. I'll just keep on going for a little bit. Honestly, my hopscotch winds up being a little bit of a dance anyway. So I get the two a little bit of a jive. I feel bad for Debbie who lives downstairs because she can probably hear my feet against the ground, unfortunately. Thanks for that little exercise. That'll get me ready for bed. Now I'll be exhausted for by the time I go to bed. Do a little dancing and flopping around. This is what we do around here. We have a little bit of a good old time and we enjoy ourselves. And that feels like at least 30. So I'll bring my chair back and thank everybody once more again for the fun that you've allowed me to endure tonight. And I'm gonna call it quits. Gonna finally send things away. Mario's gone to sleep. I'm gonna wind up going to sleep. I hope everybody has a wonderful, wonderful rest of their evening or your afternoon, wherever you may be viewing from. It seems that everybody's kind of in the in the darkness right now in terms of where the sun is, so I'm going with that. But to block out any of the sun where you are, peace out, y'all. I'll see y'all next time. I really appreciated it. Strike a JoJo pose. Yeah. Bye, everybody. Toodaloo.